broadly speaking? So anyone that's seen my shows before knows that I, one, I live in the middle of nowhere. I live in the country, so I'm, I'm inspired by nature anyway. And I love museum visits. Mm. So most of what's on the counter is my inspiration from museums and entomology, butterflies, bugs. Beatles. Yeah, making your own labels. Signs, labels. And it, yeah. 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 <laughs> and it is fantastic. She's had this behind the scene visits at Oxford Museum, do you mind? Was it yes. Oxford? Yeah. It was Oxford, yeah. Mm. yeah. So we'll tell you all about that as we go along. <laughs> so let's introduce the first uh, collection, our book kit. This is absolutely jam packed with gorgeousness. And just check out that price. I know, it doesn't make any sense to me whatsoever. I think she's lost the plot, but anyway. Uh, what are we getting in this kit? Then, <laughs> Most Jane? people think I've lost the plot for, <laughs> for other reasons. <laughs> well, I think you have, and it's fourteen ninety nine for everything you get. Tell me, what do I get in this kit? So you've got your prints for your outside covers. Mm -hmm. You've got additional prints for um, inside ephemera and, and decoration. Yeah. You've got a choice of two fabrics for your spine. Ooh. Um, so you've got a decorative fabric and a planar fabric. So it's your choice. You can use both one or the other. Righty ho. You've got your husband's favourites, which are the dangles, Fee. I don't know dangles? if you realise your husband likes no, a nice dangle. No, he's a dangler. Yeah. <laughs> so, no, I always put in mixed fibres so that you can make tassels and dangles on the side of your spine. Fabulous. Um, Scott's got, favourite dangles, yeah. Yeah, we've got uh, metal book corners in this Ooh, one. Oh, love these. You've got a plastic capsule which you can Ooh, stick onto yes. the front, which I've done on the um, sample piece, so okay. you can put a little bug or butterfly, or you can put anything you want oh, in there, really. Oh, I've put a little bit of glitter in inside mine as well. And yeah, lots of beads. You've got your wax thread. Yeah. You've even got your book binding needle. So oh, yes. the only thing really you need to add to it is glue and scissors and um, to cut your pages down, um, a safety knife Ooh. and a cutting mat. So we've got some other papers there as well for inside and then obviously our lovely um, paper here for, for inside the book. There's a go there is a gorgeous sample. I'm about to show everybody it here just to give you inspiration and, and I know Janie's going to be working with more because there is a heap that's actually yes. on Janie's yes. side of the, of the table here. This is all the, the leftovers. So this is the, that was the little, it's almost like a little, it sort of reminds me of a magnifying glass kind of yeah. thing, but it's almost like yeah. magnifies, so that moves. So you've got the glitter in there, and that's for the spine, and that lovely, you've got a bit of the danglage there. <laughs> yeah, the bees, isn't that beautiful? Yeah, so I've not decorated this book on the inside, which is what I'm going to do on the first demo. I'm going to show you some of the other prints that you get in it and, and what you can do with it. Beautiful. So, so that's, we've got... that's in its plain state. Plain, but isn't that gorgeous? <laughs> There's, there was loads left over. Loads left over, so if you even wanted to leave it like that and then use everything for your craft making or journaling, um, it's just absolutely brilliant. A great kit, a great present for someone. I mean, fourteen ninety nine. Superb price. Brand new today. Please don't miss out. 428251. I'm going to move now to some sheets on different textures now. So what's, what's the idea behind uh, 40 of these, Jamie? Yeah. So print packs. 45, sorry, 45. Um, yeah, I couldn't remember how many it's I put in there. It's, 45. <laughs> it's been a busy week. Um, yeah, so normally on my print packs, I always print on 90 GSM smooth yeah. paper. But this one, I thought, let's put some different textures in. So we've got the vellum that you've yeah. got there. We've got some uh, 220 GSM card. Ooh. We've got recycled cartridge paper as well and your 90 GSM. Lovely. So you've got your different weights and textures there. Gorgeous. So a lot of these are from previous collections that I've done. So that one was launched uh, last month. But then you've also got printouts from Beautiful. antique um, books and things like Originals, that. Originals, yeah. Oh, look, there's a, there's a, you're talking about the cartridge paper. Let me just show it. Because I love all the different weights. And yeah. Wow. Is another reason that I've Beautiful. printed these on cartridge is because then it gives it that feel of like an old book page. Oh, so you do have the different lovely. textures for your... And those are all labels from Oxford Museum as well. Ooh, there. So, so they, actual originals. Yeah, <gasps> so they've given me permission to use those. That's so. lovely. Look at the anatomy in that. Isn't that fantastic? Oh, look at these fellas. Aren't they brilliant? And I always think, just in case I have Janice as a presenter, there are no spiders. <laughs> <laughs> There's bugs, but no oh, spiders. Oh, I always forget about that, Janice. <laughs> and she's such a nature lover as well. Know. You know, all the birds and what have you and the animals and... <laughs> but she, yeah, you're right about the spiders. Yeah, I love all the different textures that you've printed it onto. These are just, they're all original. They're so beautiful. The vellum is just gorgeous. Let me yeah, dig so out some... those are really nice yeah. for layering. Aren't they beautiful? Um, yeah, to cut those out and to layer. So then they look like real specimens because they, oh, they're kind of delicate. Yeah, that is beautiful. Really, really lovely. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, 
I mean, everyone's a doozy. Um, <laughs> yeah, so, so, I mean, do you repeat any in here? I mean, no. Gosh, no. wow, I can't no. get through all 45. I'm trying to grab as many <laughs> as I can here, everybody. Um, but, yeah, 14 99 Oh, look, there's so many. Everyone's a corker. These are just fantastic. You're going to have fun. We're all on the stage. You're going to have fun rifling through this lot. Um, just amazing. Yeah, 14 99 Works out 33 pence each. 4 6 2 2 6, six absolutely lovely i've made a right mess of that now i'll sign that up later um that is fantastic price point 45 sheets there right we're going to move on to your beautiful stamps and i was having a rummage through these because i said to janie is that pretty much the size of the, and it is to a degree and that is because i because basically i got it out of measure so basically that is roughly the size of the printing yeah. stamps yeah isn't not it? far off yeah not far off and when we say not far off i'm basically it might just be a little bit more rounded there that is the extent of it so these are very impressive let me just show you that fella there look at him isn't he handsome oh gorgeous look at him oh that's like some superheroes just landed and they are oh my goodness this this is quite true to size as well because i did see a stag beetle this size i think it was even bigger than that isn't he handsome yeah you, oh yeah you can get some some massive, yeah. massive it's probably ones, more yeah. like this one there on this on this sheet so these are your beautiful stamps tell me about these then Janie. yeah so the entomology this is volume one so yeah. we have seen these before oh, rubbish, um but yeah, I've done these larger because you've got some samples there that I've embroidered into as well. Ooh, um, I like to now. stamp onto fabric and then embroider and bead into. So these are a perfect size for that. Also a perfect size for your mixed media. If you're doing canvases, anything like that. Um, yeah, they're really versatile. Lovely detail. Let me show you that embroidery. I'll pop that back, but this is gorgeous. Look at the butterfly. Isn't that beautiful? I hadn't thought about the embroidery. Yeah, so that is stamped gorgeous. directly onto fabric, and then wow. I've gone in with free motion and then beaded. So, Isn't that that, you know, it's a nice kind of framework to start your soft crafting. Oh, that's gorgeous. And just on the box here, just, you know, a little wooden yeah, box. Yeah, so that's pyrography onto that one. That was awesome. My niece did that one. <gasps> oh, look at it. Isn't that fantastic? That is so beautiful. These are gorgeous samples. Look at how fantastic these are. And these are fifteen ninety nine, volume one. Oh, just gorgeous. Really, really beautiful. Fabulous, fabulous stamps. Zero five one zero eight three. Let me pop that back. Now moving on to the next set. Uh, museum labels. You were telling me about these, Janie. Tell me again. Yeah, well, we've kind of got a whole series of, of labels with us today. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, again, inspired by my uh, museum visits. I just thought it's, it's really handy to have these things when you're putting them together with the print packs or the builder bug stamps that we're going to get onto. Yes. Um, you know, to make your own ephemera in your journals and your mixed media and things like that. They're just really handy. Just fantastic. Look at those, they just, oh, they look so good, don't so, they? So, again, stamped on uh, different surfaces. Some of those are stamped on to tea-stained paper to make them look old, onto yeah. vellum. So, yeah, they look like those kind of oldie-worldie labels they that, really you do. know, people might have done out in the field sort of thing, you know. I absolutely love them. Are they gorgeous? I'm thinking for the journal, and these are brilliant. $9.99. Um, they are fantastic. So much in that, that pack there. Uh, 745-507-999 for the museum label set. Going to move on to another set of labels. So again, these differ again, Janie, don't they? Yes, they do. So that was the first set of labels that I did. So you've got your basic shapes, which you can see on the example you've got there. Just very simple, yeah. um, but effective. So you can, you know, like I said, that was the first set that I did. So that's your basic set. You've got your numbers in there to do your samples and your figures and, and things like that. So, yeah, and they look really nice um, overlaid onto maps and things like that as well. So it's kind of like, you know, you can have your stamp of your, of your butterfly onto a map with a label and it looks like that's where you spotted it, you know. Or I you could indeed, idea. you know, actually do your own yes. so this is where i you know if you go out with the kids or whatever and you're spotting butterflies in the summer and yeah you label where There's you found where them you and think, yeah. yeah isn't that fantastic doesn't that look gorgeous so these are the stamp set labels three six zero four zero six nine ninety nine so much gorgeous choice uh we're going to move along now who we've we got now oh another set of labels so how do these differ then Jamie? so these again this is um after my visit to Oxford yeah so you see so this is a little bit more detailed so you've got like your scale your 10 millimeter there um identification collected by so that it just goes into a little bit more detail but then you've got your borders there as well ah is this um, from on this one is it have I got the right one um 
No, I think no. that your oh, sample has been up. put That's in the wrong else. place there. Have so, I? <laughs> yeah, I'm not what sure. Have I, mixed up? I think it's I think it's gone awry somewhere. Oh, I don't think sorry, you've got really? one for that. Sorry. Um, but yeah, the like the co-type and all that sort of thing, those are seen on um, actual examples. So it, where people have discovered, um, say, a butterfly or, or whatever, um, it's to do with the labelling system. So it just makes wow. things look a little bit more realistic when you're making your samples. Absolutely gorgeous. Nine ninety nine for your specimen labels there. Three nine four seven two zero. Uh, moving down to Bilderbug now. Um, Yes, so this is the Beatles, which is the one I was just looking at. We'll find where the other thing went. Um, yeah, this is genius. Now, I've not. What's the concept behind Bilderbug then? So, um, people always use things like your um, dragonflies, your butterflies, very often to to cover a thumbprint or something like that. That's, that's what all crafters do. But I thought sometimes I'm looking for a specific sort of butterfly or a shape of wing or beetle that I can't find. So I thought, well, let's build our own. It also goes with the idea of the label, so you can literally make your own little creature. So you've got your bodies and your legs and the antenna and things like that. Um, so yeah, literally build your own the way that you like it and label it up with whatever name you choose to give it. And look at the variations you can create. I mean, it's astounding. Yeah, Absolutely so once astounding. you start playing, the, you know, I don't even know how to work out how many possible combinations no, many there are, but, that but a lot, be. yeah. And especially <laughs> with your, your other sets down the yeah. counter, I mean, the, yeah. you know, the configuration goes on and on and on. So this is our Build a Bug the Beatles set, 12.99, There's a few beautiful examples, but there are so many more. Such a great idea. Uh, we've now got our lovely, lovely butterfly. So again, same concept. Yes. Yeah, but with yeah, butterflies. Yeah, so the, the butterfly and the dragonfly were the first ones I came up with. But again, oh. they work together and with the beetles as well. So oh. if you are a beetle shell that's got a different type of wing, yeah. then obviously you can dip into the butterfly set. You're almost creating so your own that, creatures. Um, yeah, make, make yes. your own creatures, yeah. And again, okay. that's something fun if you want to do with the children because they can make their Ooh, own yeah. creatures and, and name them whatever they want to, you know. Could be incredibly fantastical, couldn't they? And then, then again, with your lovely labels, beautiful here. Is that like on the acetate wings? Isn't yes. Isn't gorgeous? Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? So again, you can see with the, um, you know, with the specimen labels and yeah. things there just to make them look a little bit more realistic. Just fantastic. So many beautiful samples here. And again, under the, under the microscope there, really beautiful. There's a couple of boards here. I'll just show you so you get the idea of just the wealth of incredible variations. And again, so many more than just this. But yeah, having a play, changing the abdomen, changing the, the wings there. Um, the antennae, just, just gorgeous. That is your build a bug butterfly set, 999 021205. So let's move on to those dragonflies. So exactly the same as Janie said, uh, with the concept being obviously the dragonflies. So this interacts, as you said, beautifully with your bugs yeah. or your, um, yeah. your beetles or your butterflies there. So uh, yeah, let's have a little look at these. Wow, who knew there were so many different ones? And they're all done from my hand-drawn images as well. So most of my stamps, wow. apart from some of the labels, which I have to do, like the, the straight lines and things on the computer, anything like this is all from my hand-drawn images. And wow. that is the old-fashioned pen on paper. So Gosh. I don't use an iPad or anything like that How for it. How they would have recorded it's, it back yeah. in the day. Yeah. Yeah. So when oh. you're doing wings like that, you can, you can go a little bit cross-eyed when you're drawing. Can't you just? That's incredible <laughs> detail, isn't it? <laughs> But how fabulous is that? Just beautiful. I think that's another one. Oh, there we go. Look at this one. Isn't that beautiful? It's like we just captured it in flight. So again, if we have a look on the boards, the variations. But obviously you can go very different ways because, I mean, the, the theme of the show is kind of entomology and the museum theme. Yeah. But obviously you can go bright and bold and, you know, because obviously when I'm thinking of museums, you've kind of got that aged look and, yeah. and you know, it's, it, it's more kind of brown colours. But obviously dragonflies are very bright. You can go, go crazy with it. Gorgeous with the butterflies as well. Lovely partnership there. 9.99 for the build a bug dragonfly. 015-901. Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. Now moving down, one of my favourites. Uh, now is this a delayed dispatch on this one? The yes. Yes. Yeah. By week. It was sold out. And I can see why, because it was one of my favourites. Uh, so it will be dispatched on the 25th, just to highlight that. Not to put you off, but I can see it being a popular one. Love that postcard, the writing there. 
Um, why do you think this one is just such a hot seller? Well, I think it's, I, we've not seen this for a while. So although I released this, um, I don't know, maybe almost a year ago, um, we've not seen it for a while. Right. But again, this is really handy if you're doing journaling. Yes. Because you've got the postcard there, the ticket, the, you know, you can tickets. just start building your own ephemera. Yeah. Um, and in the first demo, as long as I don't forget, I'm going to show you how to make the faux wax seals as well. Oh, brilliant. I was looking at those. Yeah, because all of these stamps ah. like that, you can go into um, either hot wax or hot glue, which is what I'm going to use today. That's brilliant. Um, to well, make your faux wax Christmas, seals. It's, quite, it's yeah. going to be quite expensive buying a seal kit, can't yeah. it? Yeah, but you can use oh, your brilliant. stamps to do it, yeah. They're perfectly fine to use for that. Isn't that fantastic? This is so beautiful, isn't it, for your journal? It just makes them look like... Beautiful by, from a bygone era. Love, just love that. And then the stamp. Oh, it's just fab fabulous. So don't miss out. They sold out before. Back on extended. You've only got like a week to wait. I'll just know you're going to use those over and over again. 999 235027. Um, and I've not seen this. I know it's been on before, but I haven't seen it. So we're thinking the cabinet of curiosities, aren't yes. we? Yes, <laughs> yes. So again, inspired from my museum visit, um, there were. Out of the whole museum, there was one display that fascinated me, yeah. and it was a lot of um, oh, things that look. people used to use in the field when they were collecting insects and things like this. And there, so the top drawer is yeah. like a is it's like a drying shelf. So when people collect the insects, they go into a drawer, you know. Um, so these are built up with vellum and prints to make them look realistic and you've got the pins in there as well so basically everything you see in this you've got in the kit and you were telling me about the cork yeah so that when i was talking to the uh, the people in the museum they were saying originally they would have been pinned into cork so that's what Isn't i sourced fantastic. to put in there Just all of that is in the kit and then our bottom drawer so yeah you've got very thick acetate to make your faux um, microscope slides as well. Oh, let me take And the little out. black circles in there. These are brilliant. And then you can make a little book to go in the front as well. Isn't that brilliant? Like your slides. But again, you don't have to use the prints that I've put in there. You could put something else in there if you wanted to. Lovely. It's absolutely delightful. It's just it's so beautiful. Um, and then the, there's a book in here as well. Let's show you that. Let's You've got all, your, all of your instructions there as well on <sighs> covering the cabinet, even making the So the bits that you were putting oh. the slides in and out of, you even got the instructions to do that. Isn't that fantastic? Um, but then the book is kind of decorate as you choose. As really. you choose, yeah. That is brilliant. So we've got all the instructions in there as well. Isn't that fantastic? So everything that you're seeing that I've just pulled out of this lovely cabinet is included in the kit. And again, oh, look at the price point. Bonkers. Absolutely bonkers. In a nice way. In a nice way. Um, so like all it, your bugs are upside down there. For I, I, have I? Oh. <laughs> They're all going to go flying out, aren't they? Uh, oh, come here. There we go. So there's going to be so much left over. I mean, gosh, we've got the vellum yeah. there, as you said. All the love, love these labels. Aren't they gorgeous? Uh, and then obviously you've got, you said the acetate, the lovely thick acetate. So if you want to make those slides, uh, you've got the card there. You've got the coverings, almost like a, it's like a. Would you say is it like a snake skin? Kind yeah, of foam, almost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but it's, that it's got that texture to it. Yeah, yeah. You've, you've got a large print and a small and print a there one. as well. That's yeah. lovely to have the contrast there. Beautifully thought through. Um, and then all your lovely cartridge paper that is just gorgeous fantastic kit what fun we could have um 1999 313086 right let's head over to the website to have a quick look at uh, the brand we can shop by brand now obviously Janie's new company we love Janie and uh, you can shop ahead on everything you've seen or anything you want to have another closer look at and let's go. And don't forget, at 11 o'clock with Janie, it's going to be a completely different counter. So uh, book kits later. Um, you can obviously shop ahead. Yeah, they're already on the website. But please leave me something. Please leave me something for, for me and Janie <laughs> at 11. I mean, I know you are already shopping ahead because we love everything she brings us. But uh, just, just leave us something to talk about at 11. Five-star <laughs> reviews, as always. Lots of fantastic detail, gorgeousness, originality and uh, authenticity. I love the fact that it's all taken from the museums and what have you. Oh, I love the animal antics. That's a brilliant kit because I was... Well, is, it really? yeah, is that what the elephants are on the box? Yeah, oh, they caught you've my got eye a sneak earlier. peek down there behind. I did have a sneak peek. <laughs> oh, and I should mention, <clears throat> we've got your glue bundle there. Uh, that, that £10.98, that is too 
brilliant pots, but Jenny took more about that. If you want them individually, they're available as an ender call, as are the spatulas as well. But you'll see Jenny using these. Right, my darling, take it away. So I'm going to start off by, we were saying um, right at the top of the show yes, about book the uh, book kit and the fact that I hadn't decorated inside it. So these are the printed elements that go with the book that I haven't used on the book. So obviously you've got your completed book and you've got these as additions. So I thought we'd do um, a simple tag and just show you how you can build it up. Gorgeous. So um, this is printed on card. Um, so, you know, it's already at the thickness that you need for making your tags. You'll also have some extra fabric left over. So with that, I mean, you could use it on another project. You could um, make some pockets that go on the inside of the covers. Mm -hmm. So that's quite nice for putting these tags in. But you've also got a couple of um, paper clips as well to secure them. You've got more fibres than you you may choose to use on your dangle, um, so they could go through. Yeah, if, you know, punch the hole and they can go through. So let's just punch the hole in there now. So there we go. And then before I do anything, I'm going to ink up. So it is printed with a with a faux inky edge, but uh -huh. where I've cut it, you do get that white edge. So I'm just going to go around there to start with. What colour are you using there? Uh, this is walnut stain. Walnut, lovely. And I'm just going to go around the back as yeah. well. Okay, so that's our base ready for whatever we want. So again, you've got a print here. Although obviously we've got the uh, stamps that we were looking at earlier for your labels. Yeah. I thought, you know, if anyone hasn't got that, these are different to the stamps. Right. Um, but work in a similar way. So, and these were um, actually typed out. I bought myself an old typewriter. Oh. Um, and I did it on there and then, and then scanned How it lovely. in. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> so again, we're inking up because the idea is this is aged samples from the museum brilliant okay oh, love them. now we've got so you've got some bugs printed on paper mm -hmm. and this is what so you've got two circles there as well and that's what can cut out just to go into the capsule which you've got in your book kit as well yeah and um, but you've also got other items and you've got some on card as well oh so what textures, bugs yeah. should we go with? Let's go with this one actually because this is something that hasn't been seen in my kits before. So sometimes you'll see uh, similar bugs or butterflies that might appear kit to kit. Um, but then it just means that everything kind of goes together because I have got yeah. people that are creating a collection of, of book kits and print packs. And then, you know, I like everything to kind of work together. Mm -hmm. So just cutting this one out with the scissors that everyone laughs at because I do all my fussy cutting with these big scissors. <laughs> <laughs> and then what I'll do is I'll show you how to do the faux wax seals. Oh, yes, yeah. So let's just cut around the legs. If I happen to snip a leg off, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> and then we'll ink around again, just because you get that little white halo around where you've cut it mm. out. Let's just pop him down just to go around the legs. And sometimes I do it from the back as well, because that's enough to catch the edge. Right. Because obviously where you've cut around, the legs are quite delicate now. Yeah. So then I'm going to bring in... So obviously you could write in here whatever you fancy, but I'm going to bring in one of the stamp sets, I think. So let's go with the museum labels Lovely. because I've got some writing in here, my very dirty stamps. These um, are so good for your journaling, aren't they, and card making and everything really. These are so fantastic. And I love the fact they're originals, going. they're just hand-drawn originals. Let's just Brilliant. get... Um, a coloured ink pad. So I often ink up in blue. 
-huh. And I'm not looking for a perfect print here. I'm no. probably going to do it a little bit wonky. Yeah. And if it misses and it doesn't print Authentic. everything, it's fine because, yeah. yeah, we're going for that age look. But I'm going with the blue ink so it looks more yeah. kind of handwritten like yeah. out of a fountain pen. Oh, that's um, a great stamp. So Me too. we need to go with a number. So we've also got, let's find my tiny little. Yes, what are the tiny diddy ones? So we've got little numbers here. Oh, numbers, they're beautiful. So if you want to put in um, dates or yeah. obviously most examples have numbers a on number, them. Yeah. Um, so that they're, they're being recorded. Okay, so That's again, fantastic. doing it in the blue so it looks like, and these numbers were actually taken, so I've got a little collection of antique ledgers. Oh, so I went through and I scanned some through and, and literally so that, extracted different well, numbers to get them all the like the, pen yeah. It's yeah. captured. Oh, yeah. how lovely. Um, and then let's go with, I'm not sure if I've got a different date on another one. No, let's just go with, I'm going to, I'm going to do this in red, actually. Oh, no, it was so much elegant in years gone by, wasn't it? It's do you know what? I've got now. some ledgers, nice. which are old um, engineering ledgers. Ooh. And the handwriting is so it's lovely. Stunning, and you can, you can almost smell the oil in the books. <laughs> and I think, and yet this you is know, exquisite writing. Yeah, yeah, but I think also the fact that I'm using them now in this sort of thing. Oh. And I think in the early 1900s when wow. someone was writing those did they thought? ever have any clue no. <laughs> that we would be doing yeah. this with their writing <laughs> over a century later you know 19 that's so lovely um let's go with 1904 <laughs> that just looks so authentic like that okay so Let's just pop that to one side. Now, what I'm going to do is, let's just screw it up. Oh, <laughs> it's lived. Yeah. And then we'll go over with our ink again. So again, it's got that aged look. It is quite funny how we try and make everything look <laughs> older now. Isn't Less it? pristine, yeah. <laughs> So I'm gonna. I think I want something in behind here yeah. as well. Um, let's go with. Sorry, very disorganised, but it's very early in the morning for me. <laughs> very early in the morning. Let's go with. Right. So this is from the print pack. And this is from the print pack with the 45 sheets. So that's uh, brand new today as well. This is the one on the different papers: the cartridge, the uh, the vellum. Um, the different GSMs. Yeah, so this print is just on the 90 GSM. Beautiful. And again, okay. this is all writing from the museum archives, wow. which I've layered up um, with different things just to get the background. Fantastic. It's got that on the screen now, your mixed papers there, 14.99. That's such a great one for, for your, not just card making or tag making, journaling, scrapbook making, fantastic. 4.62.266. So stick the label down there and I'm going to leave the edges coming up. Like that. And then I'm just going to stick the bug down at the body. Like that. And then I'm going to take, um, these are the fibres that come in the book kit. So you wouldn't have to use all of them for a dangle if you didn't want to. Mm -hmm. But I'm just going to snip off the end of this one. And we'll pop it through the top. It says I might need to punch a larger hole. Come on, oh, I was determined there to get it through. <laughs> it will go through. My mind was saying punch a larger hole, but I was willing it through. <laughs> it's like it will happen. So, that inside, could I just have the, the book. book? Yes, yeah. indeed, the beautiful book. Yes. So, you can see here, this is where I put the capsule, and I just cut out one of the printouts so that it's floating around in there, hmm. and I put some glitter. But then you can see with this, if you had, this is the fabric that I had left over, mm -hmm. okay? Um, so you could pop a little pocket in there and then things like that 
can just slip inside mm -hmm. um, or they can stick on I like to do them at a slightly jaunty angle <laughs> um, and another thing that we can do I've got you've got a couple of uh, paper clips in here oh yes yeah in the so sense. obviously they're they're quite handy as they are but whenever we're doing this sort of thing we always get scraps of paper left over and most crafters won't even get rid of little scraps no. so if I pop this I've got to think about this for this time in the morning this is testing my brain even doing this <laughs> So I'm going to wrap it round mm -hmm. so that the back of the paper clip is still showing. Yeah. Let's just snip that off and glue it in place like that. So we're leaving a little bit at the top and then let's go into another bug. Which one should we go with? Well, let's have let's have this one with a bit of colour in. I'm not going to bother cutting around the antenna because that would just be silly. So these are included in the entomology book kit? Yep. These are all the bits left over that we haven't decorated on the inside yet. So there's loads in there. Probably wouldn't get but through But again, it all. I mean, you could put some of this on the cover. Yeah. Um, either just stuck down or you could have 3D elements on your cover. Why not? It's a book cover, but why not have 3D elements? And I'm just going to stick that one in the center again. Ah, oh, that's lovely. And we'll go in with one more little fiber. Let's go in with this sari silk again. If I've left myself enough space to. Oh, there we go. Pop that in there. And then you've got yourself a fancy little paper clip. Oh, is that beautiful? So, <laughs> so yeah, you've, you've still got your paper clip bit on the back, yeah. so it still functions. So you can put that on the um, insert but on it's, the page. Yeah, it's just so um, if you pop it, pop it on the edge of your page <laughs> as a so page cool. tab, something like that. Um, but it's just to show you out of little scraps. That's you lovely. Can, you can, I'll have yeah. a quick recap then, Jane. Okay. Is that all right? Yeah. We can get ready cool. for another demonstration. Isn't that brilliant? So those lovely paper clips uh, Janie mentioned are in the kit, the beautiful kit. I can see three of them there. This is brand new today. You get everything you need. A quarter of the stock's already gone. So you're getting your sheets there. I love this, the fact that we've got the, the spine template there as well. So we know where we're putting in our, our wax cord. You're, you're even getting the, the, the needle as, as well to be able to do that. You've got all the different different uh, sheets there for layering and decorating and adding to there's the stamps that Jane was talking about the label we've just cut one out of and then a few of the bugs there as well as the butterflies you're getting the cartridge paper for the inside as well uh, obviously the gray board uh, for the, and, and for the inlay and uh, within to separate the notelets inside you get the material all the lovely sort of embroidery ephemera there as well um, all you need is glue all you need is glue. Isn't that beautiful? No, I love that with the sari silk in there. Isn't that gorgeous? Um, beautiful. So there you decorate it, and then there's enough in there to make three separate um, inserts into your book, and then have the fun of decorating. I love the little, the little gold um, corners there as well that we're getting, and also the, the little uh, disc there as well that we can magnify an element with brand new today and what a cracking price i know 14.99 428251 jenny also used the 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 yeah the print pack all on different gsms vellums cartridge paper you know card stock all different all with beautiful i mean some you can use as background papers some you can actually cut out the the bugs the vellum the overlay um that it's just just beautiful i mean there's a sheet of the vellum it's just gorgeous isn't it i mean look at that for a sheet if you were just doing your scrapbooking how beautiful is that or your card making these are just gorgeous and no none are repeated you know all the different textures there's 45 in there different gsms uh different sort of ways in which you can go it's not all just bugs i mean you've got oh yeah there's a, there's a good sheet of them there look at that with the anatomy look at that all taken from genuine museums archives and books and just beautiful oh they're upside down isn't that gorgeous fabulous they're just tremendous aren't they there's the 45 sheets in there lots to play with lots to have fun with uh in terms of rooting through all of those 
gorgeous. Um, so don't miss out. 14.99 for six two two six six brand new today let's mention those stamps then because uh, our 11 o'clock show Janie's going to be different again so <clears throat> excuse me these are quite true to life and uh, in terms of the size of the stamps inside you're getting all those beautiful dragonfly butterflies and your gorgeous stag beetles there as well aren't they fabulous so and you can embroider as well don't forget with them as Janie was telling us yeah isn't that fantastic junior cards could have a little takeaway brooch then that they could actually wear or um just stamp in your boxes your card making not beautiful it's fabulous i love it uh 1599 and that is entomology volume one the museum labels fantastic big fan of these and then just seeing janie use the different colors there um, inking that uh, fabulous writing on there and then the numbers I love these are they fantastic didn't it, it looks so authentic and it's given a bit of a scrunch up all on different surfaces they're tea stained and what have you that and a bit of I can see a bit of um, what do you call it when you get the heat gun on it um, thank you embossing yeah 999 <laughs> 745507 love the museum labels they're all great that's a favourite of mine with the postage ones. Uh, moving on to another set of labels, yes. So we've got some more numbers here. These are giving authenticity to your samples, aren't they? Aren't these fantastic? These are your more labels, 9.99. So just, just the different shapes there, more you can do with it. Again, great for your journal in 360406. Moving on to Bilderberg. Let's start with our fabulous... Oh, sorry, one more. Yes, this is the one where I can't find the sample for. I do apologise, everybody. But it's a cracking label. Uh, field specimen uh, collected by Ent type. And again, all taken from original museum logs. Uh, isn't that fantastic? They're so beautiful. Love these shapes. Love the framing. I mean, these are lovely just for any of your sentiments, aren't they? If you're just card making. Gorgeous. They're 9 394 I'm just very excited about Bilderbug. Never mind, but build a bear, build a bug. Now, once you've got these, there is an endless possibility to the bugs and the wings and the thorax and the abdomens and everything else that you can have and legs and goodness or what else. Uh, it's just, yeah, you have, as Jane would say, have fun with the kids. They can create their own specimen. You can have seven wings. Do you know, who, who's to say? But aren't they fantastic? It's just an example. Isn't that beautiful, that calligraphy in the background? 12 429 Then we're going to build a butterfly. Yeah, let's build a butterfly. Definitely. And again, endless spot. I mean, look how they, they work in conjunction with the labels. Isn't that beautiful? Love, who, who thought there were so many? We can go bright, we can keep it very black and white and sepia and almost like a, uh, a log in an ancient book. Ah, isn't that beautiful? Lovely card. Again, if you really want to be bright, isn't that beautiful? On the tag there, we just saw. And again, look at that specimen label. We need those in our life. Isn't they fantastic? Oh, love that. Oh, isn't that lovely? Gorgeous. The slides, beautiful. 999-021-205. So let's move on to those beautiful dragonfly that you just saw in conjunction with the butterfly there. Handsome though they are. Um, just gorgeous. So this is, again, so you can see how this can work with your butterflies and you can create even more on your bugs. Just tremendously beautiful. And the detail on the wings, all hand-drawn originally and taken from that and replicated for the stamps i just think that's amazing isn't it yeah isn't that incredible look at that you'd be boggled eyed by the end wouldn't you but thankfully Janie, janie's done it so we don't have to worry 9.99015901 now my favorite one of my favorites it's it with me museum labels them are two and then i want build a bug oh they're all really uh 25th it's extended dispatch because it's sold out before so this is really giving authenticity to your tickets and we're going to be looking at the wax seals as well love the postcard stamp oh i just think again popular because obviously you're journaling and what have you but isn't that great i mean those tickets look like they've genuinely been given you to, from the odeon in the 1920s or something i mean it's crazy you know you've been watching a charlie chapman film or something i know i wasn't born then uh isn't that amazing it's just fantastic look at that gorgeous <laughs> fantastic i love it 9.99 for that set of stamps there 235027 and last but not least our museum cabinet as well the cabinet of curiosities so again you get everything that you can see in the cabinet to make so you're getting all the lovely sheets with the bugs to cut out and decorate and your stamps the different textures 
um, the background papers there as well, and then to, to the, you've got the, 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 the thick acetate there to create the slides, you've got your card, you've got the two different um, sizes of the, uh, it's almost like a snakeskin, uh, sort of faux snakeskin I should say, to, to, to create the covering of your box, you've got your cork, and you've got all the little wrinkles and the full instructions on how to make this amazing uh, cabinet of curiosity. So it looks so authentic. The book there and the, the, the slides, the museum slides, just beautiful. I mean, it's quite fantastic. And then the bugs and even the pins there so it stands up and they look, a they look like they're just drying out there, ready to be observed. At 1999-313-086. You're all shopping ahead for the 11 o'clock. You're leaving me nothing. That's okay. We still love you. Um, but let's have a look at that website because you know there's lots of goodies coming at 11 o'clock as well. All brand new as well. Loads of fabulous bundles. If you're like me, look at those amazing prices for these incredible bundles. It's just craziness, but I can't stop her. She's on a roll. She just wants to give it away. I know. Well, good for you because uh, Janie will be demonstrating all of those at um, 11 o'clock this morning with my, my good self. So we'll have, we'll have some fun together. Right, well, we've got time to join our Janie again and see what else. Uh, oh, we're going to look at wax seals, Yes, we? I'm quickly going to do the wax seal because yeah. we'll have to do it and then come back to it because it needs to cool a okay. little bit. Um, so um, I've just got one of the um, stamps from the postal and ticket. Lovely. Um, now, ideally, I would be using red, but I already had black loaded into my glue gun, so ah. I had too much in there. So you use just so, the, the glue sticks, yeah? Yeah, so oh, it's just sweet. coloured glue sticks. Um, you can get wax wax sticks as well oh, in, a, in a cool melt, yeah. um, but this is just a, a coloured wax. Okay. Um, so because it is black, what I'm going to do, and there's, there's no way of knowing if this is going to work until afterwards, so I'm just stamping up into some white. Okay, so we've got white on our stamp. I'm just going to put just over one squeeze of the glue. And you're putting like that, that onto just tissue paper, is it? Yeah, I, well, I've got it onto like a wax paper. Oh, wax so, paper. So it'll, yeah. it'll peel off it'll easily. Yeah. Okay, I'm actually going to take it off of there. It was easier to um, ink up while it was Ooh. on there. And I'm just going to push that in. Wow. So I'm not pushing it right down, no, um, because then it will splay out too much and you'll, you'll lose actually lose some of the detail. Yeah. And I'm just going to let that sit until it cools. Okay. I'm also going to do the same with, um, this is from the label set. Mm -hmm. So this is the one that just says sample. So I'm just going to go, just do a little... I couldn't think of another word. I was thinking it's a little worm of glue. <laughs> I don't know why a I was thinking worm of glue. a little worm of glue. And then I'm very Pamir is that? Just gonna, yeah. Where a was she worm from? Worm of glue. Uh, um, West Country somewhere. Yeah, which, West Country, as, yeah. as am I. So that's where. Yeah, that's probably why. <laughs> Thank you. Don't ask me anything this morning, Jenny. So, okay. Okay. So I'm just going to let those cool. Lovely. So they need to be. Um, they don't have to be absolutely cold, but they need to be cooler to the touch than that oh. before you peel it off. Because if you were to peel it off now, you'd just have a gooey mess. Okay. okay? So we'll just set those aside to mm -hmm. cool down. And then let's go in and show you. So you were saying about some of the labels on the tea stained paper. Mm. Okay. Mm. So what I'm going to do is stamp. Let's go with the specimen labels yes, because for some reason we don't from. seem to have no. the samples for those and I'm sure that's entirely my fault but I don't know where they are. So let's go in with one of the surrounds. And you literally just have got some cold tea and stained your paper. Um, yeah, so what I do is uh, I'm, I actually need to do a new batch. When I say I, I might mean my husband <laughs> needs to do. He he's he's probably do watching from the hotel room. <laughs> 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 he needs to do some more. So um, what I, I do it in big batches because sometimes they go into kits. So I, oh, yeah, I do like whole reams of paper at a time. Right. So I boil up loads of just cheap tea bags, yeah. chuck a little bit of coffee in there as well, yeah. soak it right in. Oh. I then put it in the oven Ooh. to dry it out, oh, yeah. and then I iron it. It's about the only thing that I ever iron, <laughs> to be yes, fair. It's my tea stained paper. <laughs> so let's go over with that one. 
Now, if you want oh, to, this looks lovely. really nice if you were to put, say, a gold embossing powder on mm. that, which I'm not going to do because I'm going to clear emboss the whole thing right. in a minute. Okay, so um, I'm not going to do double embossing. So let's go with uh, 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 filled specimen. Let's pop that on there. Right, keep it to the lines, Janey. That's what they're there for. <laughs> So we'll pop filled specimen there, like that. And what else have we got? Let's put, let's see if I can ink part of this up. I'm going to go in with the blue again. So I'm going to ink up the writing because this is Department of Beautiful Curiosities. Oh, it sounds splendid. That's where I'd I love to work. <laughs> department of Beautiful that's, Curiosities. That's my studio, the Department of Beautiful <laughs> Curiosities. <laughs> so I'm just going to wipe away the line around the outside. Because that one's there if you want to use that as a standard own label, but I'm putting it into a surround. Again, look at that lovely so writing. That's going in there. Again, it doesn't oh. matter if it's perfect stamping or not, because you know old writing is not it's 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 worn out isn't it <laughs> that's how we both felt this morning when we came in a bit oh, worn I out know, after the drive <laughs> oh. so i am now going to go in with a versa mark okay so just makes it sticky go over the whole thing mm -hmm. I'm then going to go in with my clear embossing powder, and when I say clear, it's probably got some glitter and all sorts of things in there as well. Got those beautiful <laughs> curiosities in there. We've got yes. about 10 minutes, Janie, just so you okay. know, darling. Cool. Like Janie's back with us at 11 as well, so. And then I'm just going to heat that. Mm -hmm. Don't tell Leonie I've got her heat gun. No. <laughs> <laughs> Mine was broken, <laughs> wasn't it? I went to turn it on just before the show and nothing. I know, it just didn't work, did it? Oh, that looks so good. That looks so good. So you see, I heated it slightly from the back as well. Um, now, sometimes, depending on the thickness of your paper, and you're better to do this with a thinner paper to get this effect, to be honest, um, because I wanted it to go transparent. Oh. So you could also use, so mine is a clear gloss, yeah. but you could use a matte one as well. So, if I bring that in, I don't know if you can see, but oh, yes, that, yes, it does make yeah. it transparent. We'll so just hold that there for me, darling. We're just getting a little shot. If you can, yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't know yeah, if you yeah. can see it coming yeah. through. Um, so, yeah, if you were to do another layer, I'd probably do it from the back heat again, and then it would go properly transparent. Really? Is that what happens? Yeah. So oh, you can also that. do it with, with a wax. I very often use a beeswax. You can rub it over, heat it up, and it, it almost turns it into vellum. Wow. Um, so that's, that's a thing, it, isn't it? And that smells really nice as well. <laughs> so I'm quickly going to, don't let me forget to... Oh yes, the seals, the wax. Just going to leave works. it to cool a little bit more. Yeah. So I'm just going to, how long did you say we've got? We've got eight minutes. Okay. Are we building something? Yeah, so Yay! what I thought I'd do is, it might not all come together by the end, but I'm going to show okay. you the different elements. Yes, it's the principle, so isn't I'm it? So I'm going to stamp a dragonfly body um, just and these are all taken from proper so this uh, is the build a bug dragonfly yeah they're all one. taken from proper books though aren't they you said yeah 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 so all hand drawn so the only thing on these I use a computer for is to mirror image the wings ah oh, so, so you get the I will draw one, yeah. one wing yeah. And then I scan it in and I'll flip it because yeah. there's no way I could get two exactly Identity. the same. No. And they don't have to be identical, no. but if they're off, then it just it just doesn't look right, no. basically. So I'm going to just very quickly colour that in with green and blue. I'm not going to be too particular about where the colours go. It's just really to give it 
a little bit of colour for the next bit that I'm going to show you. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to do the wings onto acetate. Okay, Ooh. so if I put, put the acetate over that so we can see it. And then let's go in with, let's have the big wings. And what I'm going to do is actually stamp them together like that. So obviously you can do them separately. Um, let's find my stays on. So the stays on for the acetate, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Although this ink pad can be a bit temperamental. So I did re-ink it yesterday, so we'll see. See what it's like. And the one thing I did forget to do was put the anti-static oh. uh, wipe on wow, it. Wow, that, 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 that's it. really come out clear, hasn't it? And then I'm going to do the next set as well at the same time. And then I'm going to put, as long as it hasn't dried too quickly, I'm going to put some um, holographic embossing powder on it. Mm. So this is where I should have put my anti-static bag, okay. but as soon as I stamped, I then remembered. <laughs> <laughs> because obviously being acetate, there is a lot of uh, static, static in it. Yeah. But we are going to cut around the wings anyway. Okay. So I'm just going to... This is why I end up with glitter everywhere. <laughs> everywhere I go. <laughs> so we'll just heat that. We've got five minutes, Jenny. Okay. Ooh, lovely. You can see that holographic glitter take, take there, yeah. So the top one, I actually shook it off a little bit too much and most of the glitter has come off, but you get the idea. And then I'm going to just... You'll spend more time than me doing this. I just wanted to show you the technique. Mm -hmm. So I'm cutting straight across so that the wings are joined. Ah, okay. yes, okay. So I probably should have lined it up a little bit better, but we know what it's like when you're rushing and doing it. We, we get the yeah. <laughs> You can take your time and do it properly at home. So I'm not going to have time to cut this out as well, so I'm just going to show you on here. I'm going to put just a little bit of glue on the back so this glue will dry clear and I'm just using a gel um, because it's acetate and obviously my glue is for porous oh yeah you can really see that holographic Actually, there. do you know what I am gonna cut that because they're not quite at the angle that I want them at like that so when the glue dries you can obviously angle those up. Yeah. Um, if I find, if that I looks so push good. that down slightly, I might be able to get the. Yeah, I need to wait for it to dry, but then you can angle those up. Yeah. And obviously, if you've cut out, either you've done a background or you've cut the dragonfly body out. Yes. Yeah. Looks really effective, and then you know it could overlay onto that one. So let's just bring this in and so hope, that it's, do, hope yeah. that it's worked so you can see that that peels straight off of there I don't know if that's going to show up on screen because not all the white oh no I can see that yeah not all the white has come out yes yeah, so I probably should have used a different um, ink pad but you can kind of get the idea you could also I haven't got any gilding wax with me yeah but you could also oh, go over with a bit of it. gilding yeah. wax and it'd bring up the detail, the detail in there so um, and like I said ideally it would be red but Ooh, that's what, although that's postage fantastic. and this doesn't necessarily make sense together I think I, they look quite I'm still cool. happy <laughs> I still like it so you I can like put it. a little I bit of ribbon coming out from under there as well I realise there's just, no reason yeah. they should be there there isn't yeah you just, do, just do your creation what, yeah Exactly. Yeah, I love exactly. it. Absolutely but love it's it. It's just all about the different textures and, yeah. you know. 
gorgeous. Yeah. Thank you, Janie. Isn't that, isn't that brilliant? Now, Janie's going to be back with us again at 11 o'clock. Completely different counter. You've already found it on the web. But let me tell you, they also brand new is the entomology kit. You get everything that you need and plus some extra to make this beautiful, beautiful handmade booklet with the three notelet inserts there, the covering. You've got the spine template there. You've got all those fabulous entomology elements there to decorate with the material, the ephemera, the needle, the, the, the lovely gold gilded corner edges, the waxed thread there, uh, your paper clips, a little magnifier there as well. Um, all in there and these, you know, instructions plus all your sheets as well to, to, to decorate with your labels and your bugs. All you need is the glue and that is an ender call if you want to get uh, your smooth stick or your, your glue stick. Um, I have got the glue bundle on the show as well if you want to add that in. Um, just because it's it's perfect for a stronger for the binding, isn't it? For your yeah, your so spine. It is, it is actually a book binding glue. So yeah. It's archival. It's yeah. It's designed for that purpose. There we go. So it, it'll uh, it's adhere properly for the for the spine there as well. So if you want those separate, they're an end of call. But if you want them as a partnership for ten pounds ninety eight eight one seven six four six, we've also got the spatulas as an end of call as well. When you're uh, logging out on the website, checking out, don't forget to check out your baskets or if you're finishing your call with the customer service. Uh, print pack as well, brand new today, 45 sheets, all the different textures and GSMs, I should say, in terms of vellum and cartridge paper and 90 GSM and 250 GSM. All, no, no repeats, just all beautiful different images on there as well. Background papers, bugs, details, wings, fantastic. Great, great set there. Brilliant price point. 14 99 Thank you so much, Janie. Just brilliant. Love it as always. So, animal antics at 11 Animal antics, yeah. elephants is all I'm going to say because that's what I can see down there. <laughs> There's more than just the elephants. Uh, we'll see you at 11 o'clock. Thank you, darling. Thank you. Uh, she's going to have a cup of tea now. Uh, let's see what's coming up next. Uh, grab that kettle and stay watching. Yeah, we better return that heat gun to our uh, Leone because she's got the All in Crate One Day special with Haley. Then I'll join Lucy for Sweet Poppy Stencils. And then it's the Paper Shop Pastel Paper Weekends. Did you know you can watch the Craft Store 24 hours a day, seven days a week, using the Craft Store app on your Amazon Fire Stick for free? Just like your smartphone accesses an app store to add new applications, your Amazon Fire Stick accesses the Amazon App Store to add new applications. By downloading the Craft Store app, you'll be able to access your favorite craft channel on your TV anytime you want to watch. Here's how to do it. Turn on your TV and connect your Amazon Fire Stick. If this is your first time using the device, Follow the on-screen instructions to connect it to the internet and log into your Amazon account. Once set up, you'll need to open the search bar. To do this, simply use your remote circular directional dial to scroll to the search icon and select it. Now simply type the Craft Store into the search bar and this will take you to the Craft Store app. All you need to do now is select download and remember it's free. Once this is added to your Fire Stick, you can move the app for easy access. Press and hold your home button on any app and then select the apps from the menu that appears. Scroll to the Craft Store app and then press the button with the three horizontal lines on your remote and select Move to Front. And that's it. You can now watch, purchase and catch up with your favourite shows 24 hours a day, 7 days a week on your TV whenever you feel crafty. there my name is Stephanie Waitman I'm going right back to my grassroots where I started with fabric we're going to be manufacturing not just fabric by the meter but also beautiful fabric kits it's printed in Derbyshire it's designed by our team of in-house designers so you are gonna get some amazing exclusive designs imagine being able to cover everything from apparel to home decor that's what it's about <music> 
So watch out for the individually designed exclusive fabrics that we're going to be bringing to you. And gosh, it's going to be an exciting journey. So please join me and watch out for the shows. Welcome, welcome to our first live hour with our latest one day special. Now this was a deal that was launched at six o'clock last night. You may well have seen that show. And of course at eight o'clock we had a repeat, um, a live show that's been repeated through the night. But this is our first time to have a fresh look at this one. And we're talking All and Create. And we're talking one of my favorite designers from the All and Create um, uh, range, the lovely um, uh, Janet Klein, who comes up with so many amazing ideas. And of course, perfect for our lovely Rioni to be working with them. Yeah, you right, love thanks. these little characters. Just, uh, yeah. I love them. And, and <laughs> you know what I love? Um, yeah, my name. Um, what I love is the way that they work with all their other collections. Yes. Because they're all Janet, so you can immediately identify them as Janet's. Uh, but when you start digging out the old collection, it's like, oh my gosh, I can do this. I yes. Can do this. Yeah. And that for me makes it super special yeah. because it's an investment and it allows you to dig out your other collection so and create something different again. Um, this is the storybook range. Okay. So so we're delving into the realms of proper fairy tales oh, I love and it. I love that because they're immediately identifiable yes. but also so you can start making your own little fairy tales and also sort of crossing them over. Could, do you remember Into the Woods? Into the Woods, Into the Woods. No. It was a film. Yeah. It was a <laughs> Um, <laughs> and I think they did a, did a stage play. I loved it because oh, it was a mashup of all fairy tales. A bit dark, oh, I like actually. That. Um, but I loved it. So this, when I it's like when you have the spin-offs, isn't it, from a series where yeah. some of the main characters go off and do their own yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. A bit like that. Yeah. It were, it, honestly, it is a bit dark, <laughs> but it's well funny. I'm going to have to watch that when I get home tonight. But I had all the characters there, and it really reminded me of that because it were a proper <laughs> mashup of all of them. I love uh, it. But yeah, they're fabulous. And can I say an amazing thank you to Debbie Martin. I've just looked at from here at the finished samples and it looks like Debbie Martin has made all the finished samples. She's had a whale of a time. I mean, it might not all be all Debbie's, but the ones I'm looking no, I've got at so, all I was gonna say, I've got quite a few here that uh, it might be just the way that they've kind of laid out. Yeah, um, yeah, I maybe. don't know, but we'll show you show you loads more. But yeah, I mean, so many different styles with these. I think that's the key thing. She only said they're going to work with other characters that you've got. They're going to work with some of those different bits and pieces. I mean, it might be the case that you're looking at doing some of these characters and you're thinking that they're having a day off, so they're sitting on the sofa and they've got the fridge stamp that of course you'd be able to collect from the range overall so what have we got within the one day special well let me introduce you to all the different elements well there's a lot in here but already over half of the stock has gone don't forget this stock is designed to run right the way through to six o'clock tonight but it could sell out prior to that which sadly we have to say goodbye to the one day special but you've got nine stamp sets with these so there's a lot of content where should we start let's start at the top with the bears the bears oh the bears oh these are adorable You've got your bears featuring with regards to this one um, and you can see there you've got a series of four of those. These are brilliant because when you're actually working with these you can use them in a traditional style of story um, I must admit with things like your, your mama bear and your, your papa bear and your baby bear and three bowls of porridge and all of that. Um, so it's one of those ones that's a beautiful kind of collection that you've got with the different characters they're featuring. Then of course you can start building up the scenes with the characters in loads of other different ways. Different sizes of cards with these Leo. Yeah, well. absolutely. And um, they're just they're just so as usual because of Janet. Yes. They're just so adaptable and friendly and cool. They are. Um, I do absolutely adore the bears because obviously with something like that, um, you can create so many different stories. Do you want me to show them on the overhead? Well, that was just wondering that. Could yeah, I the overhead that? might be a good idea. Yes. That yeah. Might be so a let's bit have a little easier. chat about these. So, um, let me show you on the on overhead, uh, because that always, that's always an option. So I'll just pile everything up, because you know what I mean, I always dodge you. So this is your first one, these are your fantastic little bears. Um, and if, yeah, we're getting nice and close for you. So these are your, oh, love, love, love them. So with your little bears, obviously, you've got mummy and daddy and baby bear. Um, and of course you've got your sentiments. Somebody has been sitting on my chair, which is fab. <laughs> 
<laughs> you've got mama bear, papa bear, baby bear. Um, I love the detail. You know, like look a little bear, um, a little bear slippers, which is fabulous. And when you colour them in, you can colour them in how you want. However, what I love about this brand new collection, the storybook collection, normally on Janet Klein stamps, the black and white. Okay, yeah. But what oh, she's done with this yes. coloured in. So it already gives you a bit of a guide on how to work with them, which is really good. Now, obviously, with um, with our wonderful bears, we had to have Goldilocks. Oh, definitely. The rules. The rules. So we've got <laughs> little Goldilocks. We've got the table full of porridge. This porridge is just I right. I love that. Which I love. <laughs> so you've got, sorry, when you look at them like this, because the, I'll tell you why it always looks a bit wobbly. It's not your eyes. Don't think you've, you know, you're, it's going wobbly. <laughs> it's because your stamp goes on to your acetate, so it always looks a bit wobbly. But the detail of that image, absolutely fabulous. And a stripey stock, a uh, stock, uh, uh, stock. Is that a cross between stockings and socks? I don't know what it was. It's a new fashion accessory. I don't know what it was, um, but, but I couldn't change tell you. the colours out there. If you gave her kind of, you could give her rainbow hair, regular, um, a brown hair, whatever you want. She yeah. ne isn't necessarily the character then. Absolutely. Oh, As this ever, one's interesting. They are whatever you want them to be. <laughs> Love this one um you've got little red riding hood with of course the scary i mean is he scary the lovely little he looks like i'm trying cute? to be scary this hello. is as scary as i get he's like hello <laughs> hello um and yeah i just again absolutely adorable and of course the detail of the stamps lovely and what a big eyes you have <laughs> says um red riding hood to the wolf as he runs away um, so that's red riding hood we then have four for you um, the fantastic Peter Pan and love 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 Pan um, and in Pan we've got let's go to Neverland and never come back until tomorrow never ends oh, fabulous that's just nice. fabulous um, I'm not young enough to know everything I love that and then you've got um, Lost Boys Hideout and of course your wonderful map of Nevermind uh, never mind that's, that's <laughs> Neverland uh, never yeah. mind it's Neverland <laughs> Yeah, I'm going a little bit Kurt Cobain as opposed to, <laughs> as opposed to um, <laughs> this little geezer. Oh, no, that, that's the wrong, yeah, the wrong person who never grew up. Um, and this is just beautiful. Obviously, there's so much you can do. And, of course, if you've got Peter Pan, you have to have a oh, hook. Captain um, hook. Our lovely captain. The captain Boo. is in the building. Um, and this is so fabulous. See, look, to me, this is Hook. Um, crossed with um, what's his name who did the the um, shows with the big uh, sleeves and he used to do the the house shows fixing up the rooms. Oh, Lawrence Llewellyn. It's, yeah, it's Captain Hook. <laughs> it's basically Lawrence Llewellyn Bowen dressed up as Captain Hook. That's what it looked like in Panto. Yeah, yes. There you go. This is him in Panto <laughs> for me. But his face looks like someone you know, but I can't recognize. I can't. But anyway, uh, so you've got Captain Hook. You've got the brilliant barrel. You've got her. <laughs> um, Hey, hi, Captain. Um, and then, hi, matey. Um, absolutely fabulous. So, we're going from the seas to the wonderful castle. And we've got Beauty and the Beast. Now, with wonderful Beauty and the Beast, um, absolutely gorgeous. I love And again, this. it's that detail. Because what you've got with this one is, of course, um, the Beast. Uh, but then, that gorgeous Beauty with her wonderful dress. And he is a friendly beast. I mean, look at his face and his fabulous, fabulous um, outfit. And they all have got amazing outfits. I mean, there's so much you can do to colour these in. Absolutely beautiful. And, of course, she becomes whoever you want her to be. You know, it's completely up to you. So we've got gorgeous beauty in the beast. Uh, let's move on to Jack and the Beanstalk. I love this one. The face of the cow is just fabulous. <laughs> I mean, that is so ridiculously cute. Little Jack... Oh, you've been on my mind. Um, you've got the little... Now, these ones are proper handy. Okay. You use them over and over again because that's the kind of stamp that works with so many ah, others. Ah, yes. And it's great for scene building. Love it. The cow's face is my favourite, though. It's just ridiculously fabulous. So that's our little uh, Jack and the Beanstalk. We've then got... 
Oh, I love oh. Puss in Boots. Puss in Boots. I love Puss in Boots because look at his face. It's almost <laughs> like, why are you following me? Why are you following? Because he's got all these fantastic little animals I love that look like his me. best friends. I was saying last night, though, I mean, what are you doing following a cat? Yes, you know, yeah. move away from the did, cat. Yeah, did you not read the book did, on yeah. what cats do? It's like <laughs> you, you've not evolved to realise what cats, <laughs> what cats are about. An attitude such as mine it can only be taught, not inherited. And I love this. We are all like, ain't that fabulous? I love that. I want Absolutely a hat like that. Absolutely fabulous. Um, and then we've got, I think we've only got one more, haven't we? The tree. Now, I'm going to start the demonstrations with the tree because this is such a cracking stamp. Now, this will fit with so many others. It'll be, to me, it looks like it could be spooky. It could be cute. It could be whatever you want it to be. We've got the gorgeous little birdies on there. Um, home is where the heart is. Really like this one. And, and if you wanted to, you know from, um, where has he gone? Do, 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 do. This one. So, oh, yes, your yes. little Lost Boys hideout, that stamp fits oh, beautifully on clever. there. So, you'll be able to mix and match it. Really like that one, though. In fact, I was playing with this yesterday. Let me just show you. I don't colour these ones in. These are just ones that I were setting up. And with my little tree yesterday, look, mixing it with some of the gnomes. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. <laughs> Obviously, these are on your pick and mix. Yes. Please check the pick and mix because I know Abs has added extra goodies to that and there are some really cool stamps. And uh, this, this is me having a lovely time. I <laughs> love, look, look at her weird sock. Her so slippers. you can have a fabulous time and not even add any colour to these, couldn't you? Because you just Cushcam. get lost in the whole story. I mean, look at that. Off. Look at that one. How cool is that? Oh, <laughs> look at this. I mean, how oh, cute is that? That, that just, honestly, once you start rummaging and mixing and matching with all your other stamps, seriously, these are the kind of stamps that you get lost in. I love it. Now, talking of mixing and matching, I've got a little bit to add into that one day special. So, of course, you want your one day special, you can get hold of that one, the details that are um, obviously on your screen there with your two flexi buys. But we've also got an additional bundle that work alongside these, again, from the lovely Janet, and they work beautifully, and they are part of a complete collection so change the details around so you are going to be able to get hold of these by themselves if you're wanting them but then there is a way of getting them all, all together obviously with that bigger saving so here you've got a series of stamps these are going to be those additional stamps that are going to help you with your scene building not necessarily just with your one day special but with lots of those other characters that you've got within your stash as well so you've got your buildings you've got your modes of transport you've got some really quirky trees there and foliage fabulous stencil included in this one and you've got 10 pound savings just 44 pounds and 90 five pence and there's absolutely loads that you can do with this one and that saving that you've got there is carried forward to the complete collection which I'll be telling you about in a few moments as well so of course if you're wanting to get hold of these to work with many of those other things that you've been chatting about there and oh, we've been chatting about not you well you might have been I don't know maybe you are at home having yeah. a chat about these but these are brilliant to work with other things that I'm sure you will have within your stash as well so if you've got things like the little cars that we've seen if you're wanting to build up your little scenes maybe for new homes and things like that I absolutely love this one here from Debbie. I mean, Debbie's had a whale of a time with these, hasn't she? That's how it looks like on the M6 some days. <laughs> Not going to lie. <laughs> Not going to lie at all. Just, uh, just kind of just stuck there. This is a nice idea as well, isn't it? That curve that there gorge. with the buildings oh, as I well. Did, that. did you? Yeah. Oh, you want to put your name what? on the back? Isn't it funny you sometimes? Put your name on the back. <laughs> sometimes it's like, oh, that was me, that. <laughs> That could have been a bit, been a bit embarrassing. She said, oh, I love that one. That's my yeah. favourite. Yeah, yeah. It? And then revealed you I didn't did it. say something like that yesterday and then realised it was mine, which it is a bit. My, <laughs> and mind you, Paula did exactly the same. I was going through one of my, um, my books, my, my little old um, oh, art yes, journals. Oh, yeah. And on one of the pages, she went, oh, that's lovely. I'm like, you did that one, love. <laughs> <laughs> we forget, though, don't we? That's yeah. a nice one again. And again, those little mounds. Obviously, you've got some of the mounds that are featuring within the One Day Special. So, of course, they're going to work alongside this. I love this with the washing line on there as well um, and it just gives you a little so insight cute. in how these are so fabulous to work with as well there as you can see so that's a little insight into what you can do with that secondary set of stamps but I mentioned the fact that you've got the saving on those of £10 being carried forward to the larger bundle that's where you'll keep the saving from your one day special as well so that means when you're getting both of them together although it says £7 on the screen you're actually having £16 um, carried over so it works out £23 saving overall Unless you are a Freedom member, because I think we've got a bigger saving with this one, haven't we? 
Oh, now we have. So, if you are a Freedom member, then that saving that was mentioned there, £23. Oh, no, it's not on this one. I'm getting myself confused. I do apologise. So, yeah, everybody's saving with this one, but it's the savings that have been carried forward from everything there. 441353. Now, you've got your three flexi buys there of £35.95. and pence. But the beauty of this one is that opens up your flexi order, which means if you do want to go and have a rummage in the picker mix, very much advised by our lovely Leone, it means that you can check out some of those additional um, elements that you seen and then I know she's been working with some of those as time have gone on so um, 441353 that will get you one day special with all of your fabulous storybook characters and then of course those additional stamps and that beautiful stencil over the far side there as well 441353 now if you've not shopped for a pick and mix before it's so easy our website is so easy to find your way around and what all and create do in their brand section is they put everything into kind of little departments so it depends on the size of the stamps so the stamps that we're looking at within the one day special or a seven so here they all are individually if you're wanting to go for them but you will find a pick and mix with lots more a seven size stamps which of course are going to coordinate perfectly size wise then you'll find them for the larger sizes as well you'll also find the fabulous stencils there and some amazing reviews for all of the products so it's definitely worth you having a little look at those as you can see there loads and loads of choice and the style of some of these may encourage you to have a little go yourself pick up your pen and perhaps do a few little doodles of stars of your own i love those teddy bears as well just think they're brilliant one of the original ones so don't forget if you are collecting janet klein's artwork which i know many of you are these are the latest in the collection so if you're wanting to get hold of them please do so but do check out some of those pick and mixes as well like the way they do the pick and mix where there's a kind of you can go for a couple you can go for five six or whatever size you want to with lots of savings there so it's worth having a little look at there now talking about having a rummage with a pick and mix i can hear leone it sounds like she's having a bag of crisps she's not <laughs> having a bag of crisps she's rummaging for cards. i'm stock. rummaging <laughs> i like using on my scrap card you see <laughs> right um this is one that i wanted to have a play with i am literally going to indulge myself so i do apologize sort of um i had to use this because this stamp, and I'm actually going to work on bigger car stock in case I get carried away. Right, this stamp is amazing. You have got this stamp on the show. It does come in a bundle. Ooh, okay. Oh, yes, I oh, remember this gosh. one. <laughs> these are busy last night. These are my favourite favourites. I love these stamps. So what you've got, you've got the um, the um, thingy. Thingy. Pumpkin. The, yes, thank you. The pumpkin, the lovely ghosty, but then you've got all the fantastic These faces. Are <laughs> and obviously you do get this in a bundle, so we have got other stamps that you get with this. Absolutely love these. Um, the thing is with these, I wanted to use them in conjunction with my tree. So, because I want to make a spooky tree. And I oh. kind of apologise because I'm literally... I'm playing now because this is but you this know is what? me doing what I, I want to do. <laughs> but I think this is good because it's kind of it's, it's not structured as such, and you're kind of just going with the flow. And that's how many yeah. of us do. We might start off, and I know I certainly do. I look at something, and I think I really have no idea where I'm going here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's a good yeah. way to start. And it. you'll see something, and then go. Now that will work with that. I don't yes. know, but it's going yeah. to work with it. Um, now, what I'm going to do? I'll bring this in, so I want to see which face is going to fit, okay? Now, actually, if you take the tree off like that, you can oh, put it on yes. and you can see which face is going to fit like this, okay? So see, and now I love that one. That one's going to be the best one. Perfect. Right. Incidentally, if you want this stamp set, the details are on the screen for the bundle. You get 33 stamps, including the ones that we're looking at here, which is your spooks. Um, and uh, nice little bundle, that one. So oh, lots, again, Honestly, the artwork, isn't it, works so well with the one day special? It's fabulous. It's fabulous. And it's one of them, um, when you see it in real life, and the finished samples the are amazing. Yeah. When you do see those, they are absolutely sensational. Definitely, definitely one you do not want to miss out on. They are fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Um, so what I'm going to do is, I think the gorgeous face up, he's going to go here like so. Okay. Now. What I need to do is mask the face off because obviously if I don't mask him off, I'm going to just get the tree over the top. So what I'm going to do is, uh, now the, the mask, it doesn't need to be perfect because it's going to go over this face, but obviously I'm going to be taking quite a bit of tree out. So I'm going to have it a bit wobbly, okay? Now, look at your tree stamp. Bring this back in again. 
So if I put my mask there, if I stamp over that tree, you can see now over that mask, it's way too big. I'll take out way too much of that image. So I'll bring it in a little bit, but also bring it down a little bit. And I don't want it to be perfect, and you'll see why in a second. So again, making sure it covers my little face, but then putting it on there like so. And that's much better. So now I'm covering the the um, the window. I don't want the window, but I do want to see the home. So I need to take off a little bit more like this. Now, normally we'd stamp the face on here. There's no point me stamping the face on there, really, because it's the tree that I'm I'm looking at. So there, that's good. I'm happy with that. So if I put that little mask on over my face like that, I can see the face under the mask so I know where the face is going to sit and then get my little stamp. Now, I must admit, this um, my ink pad is super juicy and sometimes it does go through this masking paper. I found this before with my Verse Fine Claire. So I have a little go on different masking papers. I know um, obviously Pink Frog do some masking paper. I do need to get hold of some of that. So just I need to get, it actually it's reminded me, I need to get some as well. I, I really, really <laughs> need some. So pop over the top like that. So you hover over, pop over the top of the tree so then when we release that you can see and i should have done a bit with this way but that's okay oh look i've got my scary face <laughs> now now the lovely thing is you will absolutely have a drawing pen get your drawing pen and this is easy okay because all you need to do is where it's gone a bit wobbly so there it went a bit wobbly literally just draw these back in again and you know what is lovely about this? Drawing these bits back in again is easy. So look at your tree. Look at where the line should go. Having a few lines down here. This is when having your different fine liners is a really good idea. Because that, that is the perfect, perfect size. So you're just drawing some of those lines back in again. So it's coming in so it looks like it's still part of that stamped image like so i love doing things like this because <laughs> this for me it's playing but i've created something completely different and it, for, like i mean that is super scary you know me i mean i love the, the scary so for me that is brilliant having a scary tree that's like welcome home <laughs> hello i just think i mean i mean is that not the best burger uh, you got keep you know, away, wouldn't it? i mean yeah. that that is not going to entice anybody into the house but obviously you've got that but why not have um some of the the wonderful pumpkins because let me just, I weren't going to start putting pumpkins on as well, but why not? Because you could then bring in your spooky pumpkin. If you masked off your tree, it'd be even better. So you're going to have to pretend I masked off my tree. But bring in your spooky pumpkins next to your fantastic little tree. Because this is your tiny little tree that's um, owned by the elves. But then, because the elves want to protect the little house... They've also got spooky, magical pumpkins. <laughs> Look at that. How cool is that? Isn't that just fabulous? Love it. Those faces are amazing. Oh, isn't that? And the way they work together. See, things like that just make me super happy. And then all I do, I'm going to pop a little... See, if you've got a little bat... I can't remember how to draw bats now, something like this. If you have a little bat stamp as well... Have little bats flying in the in there as well, because that'd look well cool, wouldn't I it? Love it? And maybe a little moon. How fabulous! <laughs> I had to do that because I was thinking about it last night, um, and I thought I'm going to have to do that because because they just fit together Can and they're I absolutely give you those? gorgeous. Yeah, they're gorgeous. I think these are a brilliant idea. Those faces, those faces, just so useful Aren't in so many fabulous. different scenarios. Seriously, these this stamp set is one of my favourite. Who did these? I'm not sure who did these. I love that and the colouring in is amazing who left the bag of idiots open <laughs> i love it isn't aren't it they aren't they <laughs> fantastic these honestly it. and the thing is with this whole collection so you've got the um you've got your spooky um your spooky uh your, your actual uh, ghost with your pumpkin you've then got oh brilliant thank you Haley. um oh look 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 you've then got 
I mean, I mean, these just make me smile. Because look, oh, you've got your monsters. It could either be the front or the back. He could be scratching his bum or he could be scratching his belly. Up to you. <laughs> if it's his belly, you've got his little face that will go on. Same with that one. And then look, look, look. They've got a moustache and they've got a little hat as well. Oh, my gosh. I wonder if, oh, my gosh, I wonder if our wonderful, um, our wonderful. See, I think you could put the moustache on it, Yeah. So, it's like in disguise. So we're not... in yeah. a cunning disguise. <laughs> so yeah. it's like I'm, I'm just. Oh my gosh, how cool would that be? Is I've that, got a cunning disguise. Mr. Mr. Fox, did he have a top hat? I can't remember. Yeah, oh, it might have. Yeah. yeah. And this is good as well. Very beast friend. So actually, that that could be with these two. You could have my my very beast friend. <laughs> so it looks ah. like the best of friends. I love it. Absolutely oh. adorable. Now, this is a popular set. Now, there is another set of stamps with this one. Oh, John, not only only just to show. Um, and they are brilliant. I mean, the finished samples that we've got with these are amazing as well. But this is a yeah. lovely little one. Honestly. I love the front and the back of these. Very I clever. Do, but look, look, look again, the faces. Look at the faces. Yes. So you've got hap um, scared, well, scared cat, maybe shock cat. You've got very happy cat. And then you've got really disgruntled grumpy cat. cat. Grumpy, cat. grumpy cat. There's grumpy cat, isn't grumpy there? Grumpy cat, because grumpy cat has got... Um, a pigeon on its head. Do you know what I mean? And yes. this is the thing. Yeah. This is when you mix and match them. Shall I stamp... Shall, no, no, Leonie, don't stamp Grumpy Cat with pigeon on its head. Shall I stamp Grumpy Cat with pigeon on its head? Oh, go on, let's have a look. <laughs> now, rapidly approaching 60% of the stock of these have gone. We've got the details on the screen. And, of course, you can add them in alongside your complete bundle. Spread the cost over three payments. It makes it a very affordable way for you to get those additional elements, which mean you can kind of further extend the usability of your complete collection. Those little top hats and the moustache I mean on the fox there absolutely perfect but you can imagine adding that to any of the others so you've got that obviously um, with um, Little Red Riding Hood and, and, um, and the wolf it could be again could be a little disguise in there couldn't it it might be well you can play around they're your stamps it's your story you can put them on anything you could put it on Beast couldn't you and he's getting ready for that ball it could be all sorts of different things you're doing with these but the beauty is you are getting them with that fabulous £12 saving there so if you fancy adding these in 210882 you've got 33 stamps Stamps. But think about how you're going to use them with all your other different elements as well. I know we're not thinking about Christmas, but you've got your little Santa hat there. So that means that you can turn your fox into a little Santa. It means that you can t turn any of the characters from your one day special into your little characters, um, your little kind of Santas as well. Over 60% of the stock of this one has gone there. And they're just useful in so many different ways. And those little top hats, you'll be adding them to other characters that you've got in your stash. Obviously, the design work from Jan um, Janet Klein, so any of those characters, but I think you'll be using them in lots Lots of other different um, character scenarios as well. A very, very useful set. You need to be quick with these, though. It's the first time that we've kind of concentrated on these ones. And lots of you are loving them and getting them into your basket. But don't forget, check your basket out, because you might miss out on them if you just leave them there for 10 minutes, because they'll fall back into our stock um, kind of availability. But the details are there on your screen, 210882. How are you getting on over oh, there? fabulous. So, got my little cat. So, what you want to do is, um, and I'd always suggest using an acrylic block that fits better um that that fits properly so you pop you want to pop his little face in oh man see that makes me happy straight away that's just ain't that fabulous isn't that fabulous right <laughs> now it's like you said what oh, he's like <laughs> what on earth is happening so let me just move these how can I run out of space when I, I, I Do take you want me to hold them? something? <laughs> Honestly. So I'm after, I'm after, I'm after, I'm after. Where are you? There you are. Puss in boots, right? So your puss in boots is going to work beautifully with this one. Um, so I've got my puss in boots. And I've got on my puss in boots, we've got our little... Look how cool this will be. <laughs> Doesn't it work well? How good is that? Uh, and there's nothing boots. he can do because his legs aren't long enough to swat him away. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> In fact, I mean, I mean, you could have as well. See how good will Puss in Boots be with this one? Because, right, you've got your two different cats. So, this is your story here. So you've got, you've got your 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 regular cat meeting fairy tale cat <laughs> so fairy tale cat is going what is that cat doing say glamorous yeah 
<laughs> there's a furry tail cat going, that cat has no clothes on. Yeah. What is it doing? <laughs> it's naked. And that cat is going, what on earth are you wearing? <laughs> That's it, yeah. It's like, for goodness sake, who do you think you are? And this is why I love these. The stories that you can come up with are quite fabulous. And I've got this one. I've got this one. Story so when you've got those stamps, you know, about like, like, like shining and being bright and things like that. I mean, that little story yeah. that you created there are perfect for those kind of sentiment scenarios, aren't yes. they? When they just say, be bright and sparkle and all that kind yeah. of thing. Just be who yeah. you want to be. Yes. That kind of scenario, those stamps support that kind of sentiment. Absolutely. And uh, what I love about these is the way you get one of these stamps. And this is the beautiful thing about working with all and create Janet Klein. Because you get a stamp like this, but it's where it'll go. Yes. Where are you going to take it? Yeah. You know, like with this one, let's bring in the top hat. So, and I love this because obviously in the book he dressed up as a grandma. This oh, time, gosh, yeah. <laughs> this time he's dressing up as um, Lord of the Manor. <laughs> So this time, oh, that is fabulous. <laughs> it's fabulous. <laughs> and then you've got your um, your very beast friend. It's my very beast friend because he's my little little beastie. But then, obviously, you've got that fantastic. Let's see. We're going oh, to. Oh, he's got to have a moustache. Oh, I'm so glad that you've added the moustache because it needs to be just under. But you look. know what? That moustache. If you turned it round the other way and did it with like a bright pink or something, almost like a bow in somebody's hair. Yeah, yeah, it would be. Would it? <laughs> look at that. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello, little lady. And she'd be like, "Hello." <laughs> but it's okay because you're my very best friend. I love it. Isn't oh it my goodness! Isn't yeah, it everybody's loving these as oh, much as we are. Do you know what? Uh, this very is. Busy. I, I adore these. I adore these. They work together so well. And this is the thing. Look how many different th looks you can get yeah. with all of the stamps by yeah. combining them. It's it's like the joy never ends. It is. It's a very useful set to have. But over 80% of the stock has gone. So, yes, if you're liking the look of those, and let's face it, Leonie's just shown in a few moments just how useful these are going to be within your stash, not just necessarily with regards to, um, obviously, the characters from your one-day special, but so much further than that, so much more than that. You will have absolutely loads of fun with these. 210882. Very affordable at £23.97, and pence, especially if you're spreading the cost by adding them in alongside your bumper bundle. But of course, you can spread the cost if you're popping them in alongside your one day special as well. 210882 if you're wanting to get hold of those. Now, we've just given you a little insight into one of the sets that we've got here. Imagine the insight you could have with all those other little um, kind of pick and mixes that you've got. Now, obviously, your one day special, they are the A7 size. So, all of the characters that we're looking at the moment are very much in a similar sort of vein size wise so anything that you see within this pick and mix will work with the characters that we've just been looking at as well there's absolutely loads now there's different ways you can get these so your set of three will cost you 17 pounds and 97p and you're saving six pounds i think they're usually about 7.99 each so that's almost like you're getting one of those sets as a bonus but when you start looking at the larger bundles then you'll find that those savings kind of accrue so if you're wanting to go for the larger bundle this one will give you eight of them but this time you can see you are saving a whopping great 30 £32. So it makes sense. I mean, we were looking at, what was it, £17? And was it, I forgot what the fence was. 17.97 so you can see by going for these okay your two flexi buys will be a similar sort of price a little they come down a little bit don't they but it means that you are more than doubling the quantity that you are getting it's almost like you're tripling it aren't you so with the first set we were looking at 17.97 you get three but with this one you are getting eight including those three you may have already chosen with that brilliant saving so if you can stretch to this one and open up that flexi order potentially this way then you can see it makes sense to go for these because they're collectibles that's what you'll find with these you'll be collecting them and extending that usability as time goes on 259564 if you're wanting those now obviously you've got a7 there but we've got your larger stamp set so many of these will work alongside what we're looking at because of course you're getting a lot of content within those a6 stamps so if you fancy these ones um, you're looking at two of these for 17 pounds and 98 pence and again you could be using these characters to build your story up but again we've got another way that you can get hold 
mould of um, a similar sort of sizes. And you'll see there's all sorts of different variations. They're not all the little characters with these. But with your pick and mix of five, you're getting a bigger saving. Look at this. You're saving more than you're spending. £29.95. So again, if you're wanting to go for these and you want the best value for money, then do try and go for those larger bundles. And of course, you can spread the cost to make it a little more affordable with those flexi orders if you've got them in there. So um, 907998 if you're wanting to get hold of those. But let's give you a bit of an update on where we kind of, we've kind of gone off on a bit of a, a we've kind of gone off on a little path, haven't we, down some fairy tale um, mm. woodland? Um, let's come back to the reason that we're here. 8 a.m. is an hour that we dedicate to our current one day special, and that is what we've got here. So you've got your fabulous storybook characters, which you will have an absolute blast with. But rapidly approaching 60% of the stock of your one day special has gone. So it's featuring these nine sets of stamps, as you can see here, featuring characters like Goldilocks, the three bears, Beauty and the Beast. You can see Little Red Riding Hood there. Say Little Red Riding Hood, but you could turn her into whatever you like, really, couldn't you? She's holding her little basket there, but she could be holding anything that you so choose. Then you've got the likes of Peter Pan in there, obviously Captain Hook, Jack and the Beanstalk making an appearance as well. There's lots of different characters and lots of different stories you can create with these. So the storybook collection, new for 2022, you can get hold of these with that saving there of £69.91. Now that £6 saving is going to come on a journey with us as well, a little storybook journey. Um, but I need to tell you about some other stamps first because these are part of the story as well. So we've got a lovely transport set that will work with your little stories as you're building them up. Again, they work very much independently. They are available by themselves if you're wanting to go for those as well. But here you can see the details are on your screen. £44.95 will get you your four sets of stamps that you're looking at and your fabulous stencil there. £10 saving with these, so you can see the details on your screen. But remember the £6 saving that we've got with a one-day special? We're going to bundle that up with that £10 saving and put them all in one big box. Here you go. You can see this is your complete collection. So all of these are brand new for 2022, um, and that means that the saving overall, your £16 saving and that £7 saving on your screen, means that overall you are saving £23. And when you think about those eight, um, seven stamps there being, $7.99 each. You're getting quite a few of those, really, aren't you, with that saving? So 441353, um, obviously the one-day special is incredibly busy, but we are busy with this one as well, and 40% of the stock has gone. Again, this opens up your flexi order, which means that you can spread your cost over three payments if you so choose as well. Now, the trio that we were looking at with Leone, this one has been flying out, and I'm glad that you're embracing it as much as we've been loving it. Um, it's now limited stock, though. So if you're adding this in with your complete bundle, means you can spread the cost over three payments, um, which means it's a very affordable way for you to get hold of these. So if you fancy them, then you need to be quick. If they're in your basket, then well done. You've got them in your basket, but they're not yours till you check your basket out. So 210882. If you fancy adding those in as well. Busy out this morning, look. Lots of people getting involved. I'm glad because they're fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do this time, let me get one of my chic little sponges. Um, because let's start on a background first of all. Oh, okay. So I'm going to um, bring in, I'll use my one day special. Um, and this time I just want to create a bit of a, a bit of intense background mm. but i want to get it so we're looking into the card so i'm just going to take i've got an um my wonderful brushes i've left them in a carrier bag do you know ever do you know where the carrier bag is this I is do, the more I important do. thing well yeah it's at home <laughs> oh fair enough yeah, <laughs> standard um ever <laughs> since i was a kid i've always walked around with stuff in carrier bags oh really yeah, oh, and that's fabulous. not changed yet, <laughs> and it's really annoying because it's like, oh, it's in a carrier. And my house, you know, when you think, why have I got so many carrier bags? <laughs> I mean, they're not carrier bags; they're bags for life. Let's face it. You know, got, gone are the days of the the, the humble carrier well, bag. That's true. Yeah. All right, now our beautiful bags for life. They're brilliant for laundry and everything, aren't they? Using for all sorts. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. So. We've got that. Now, where I'm aiming with this one, I'm sure that isn't Salty Ocean. It is. Where I'm aiming with this one is building up my little scene 
um, with these two. Oh, okay. okay, yeah. So, that, so I know where I'm aiming, I know where I'm going, but before I get there, I want to, to build up a bit of a background. I'm going to bring in the stencil. Now, this is really cute. I know we've got these on the show. I think there's a pick and mix for stencils as well, isn't um, there? Yeah. Probably, probably. I know we've got a set of four, I think, just oh, behind it. Okay. I love this one, because obviously I'm going to use it stenciling through, but if you put the ink on and print with it, it looks super, super cool. And with this one, I'm taking a darker blue now and again I'm building up um, a little bit of texture a little bit of intensity so what I love about this look I can be quite specific which little elements I pick out so I can pick out that little element there oh nice doesn't that look cool yeah I can take this little element here like so like that one nice move it round I love this one so let's bring in that one and then what I can do, rather than have it that way, oh, okay, it yeah. that way. It's a really cool little stencil, is this? So look at that. Doesn't that look that cool? That looks really good, and yeah. It's, and what I love is the way that just by twisting and turning it, you get something completely different. Yes, yeah. You know, and the way you do your ink as well, have it so it fades out. So mm -hmm. it's not, they're not having a, you know, a harsh it's not line hard, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. not a harsh finish. With these. Also on your screen, as you can see, you're going to get four fabulous stencils. Um, they're only £15.96, £12 pounds saving with regards to these. And of course, it comes, let's call it £16, because it's easy for my um, brain to work with. Um, you can pop this in alongside your Flexi order. It works out, is it £8? Eight, eight, eight? No, that's not. <laughs> 7 pounds <98. laughs> <laughs> you do it properly, yes. Yeah, do it properly, Hayley. Ask, ask for a calculator. Um, 515085, if you fancy getting hold of your fabulous bundle, as you can see here. Um, and they are really... Is I love the way you've got so many ed edges to these. Yes. They're brilliant. It's one of them, again, and I say this with papers, looking into it, do that with your stencil. Yeah. Because look how cool that background that is. That looks amazing. You know, and that is just mixing and matching, um, mixing and matching matching the different elements <laughs> <laughs> sorry i'm trying to get you to see this trying to explain. there's something going on over here there you uh, go <laughs> thank you um so it's just mixing and matching these different things thank you Haley. and <laughs> trying to bring that. these in so it, you look at it though you look at your borders you don't look at it as a full stencil you pick out those gorgeous borders and that's how you'll use that that wonderful stencil nice. obviously the lovely thing is then You've got a mucky stencil. So with a mucky stencil, of course, you don't use it and leave it as oh, such. No. Take your piece of paper, put water on that piece of paper, bob my little old stencil down. There might not be enough ink on there to get a print because I was quite gentle with ink this it's time. It's almost like a, a watermark effect then, isn't yeah. it? When you just got that subtle backdrop. Yeah, but look, oh, look, yeah, good. plenty, yeah. plenty of ink. And in Can fact, we pop these to our die cutting machines yes. as well and get like a and boss finish? And these will be lovely yeah, through the die cutting thinking. machine, actually. So that one, do a print there. Let's see if there's any more ink. So that, I mean, it's really faded and quite pretty. But that, I see, you know I love doing things like that. If you've watched me more than once, because I do it every single time, because I'm not wasting the ink and I'm getting a really cool little print. Right, so that's that, and this is this. So that's where I'm going with that, which I really, really, really like. Um, love that stencil, love that stencil. And it's one of those that you're creating a beautiful uh, frame. Yes. And, I mean, look at that. It is an amazing frame, whichever way you look at it as yeah. well it's funny because you'll quirkiness. you'll spin it and it'll be like oh no not that way it has to be that way it's really funny so we're like that now what we want to do i want to create a base i want to create some ground now with your pick and mix you've got a lot of stamps on your pick and mix that have got little extras now this one and i used this yesterday uh, whatever is good for your soul do that i love that but this grassy one okay. that is a cracking little stamp useful because this one becomes a really really um versatile stamp for all sorts of scene building um and it's one of those you'll get a lot with janet's that you'll get some really really handy little scene builders things like that are fabulous because look, I, I've grounded it. So before, like within seconds, 
I've created oh, yes. a lovely little yeah. branding. And this is why I urge you to look at that pick and mix. Because if you've missed out on any of those, there'll be something that it's like, oh, that's a cracker. Like with this one, you've got little butterflies on, so I'm going to use some of that as well. Now, what I have got, so if I take my pencils. Lovely. Now, those smaller stamp sets that Leona's just bought in, being from that A7 range, they're all on the pick and mix. And, of course, the most affordable way to get hold of them is to get hold of that eight there. Um, £32 saving with regards to these ones. So if you're wanting these, please do so. Um, talking about the A6 stamps, as, uh, sorry, A7 stamps, you know the ones that we had earlier on that went limited stock with the, the little ghosty faces and everything? They did sell out. Um, but Abs is watching. Good morning, Abs. Oh, um, and he's been in touch to say that we, he is able to bring us more, but they need to be on extended delivery. So they are still available now. It's only a couple of days, um, so the 21st, which is no time at all, really, isn't it? Just to give them the opportunity to get those orders gathered and out on their way. So if you thought that you'd missed out on them, if you tried on the website and you couldn't get hold of them, they are now available again, but on extended delivery of just a couple of days. Um, at 210882 if you want to know. Thanks, Abs. Ah, oh, thanks, love. It's Andy when they're watching, isn't it? It's useful. I like that. <laughs> right, so just coloured that in quickly. A little bit of green. I love the way that it fades into the, the inky background. Mm, I yeah. think that looks absolutely gorgeous. Now, what I'm going to bring in is a tree stamp. I've already uh, more or less coloured all this in. They're ridiculously easy to colour in. I'll just, I thought I'd only do a tiny bit of colouring. Um, so I'm bringing in my watercolour pencils. Just bringing this round like this. What does it remind you of? Gingerbread house. Oh, I don't know. Oh, is it Shrek? Is it, I, see, I was thinking Hansel and Gretel, but I don't know. Was there a tree in Hansel and Gretel? I don't know. Oh, no. See, this I is what think... This is what happens when you when you get older. You forget yeah. about the stories. They all merge together, which is why the, you need a set like this. Literally, everything <laughs> merges together. But, but I think there's magic trees just about in everything anyway. That's isn't it. There? And there's there should be. There's something about a tree that looks like that. I mean, if you're out on a walk and you see yeah. one of those, you kind of... Spooky different trees. Yeah, different times of the day. In the daytime, it's like, it looks amazing. And then nighttime, it's like, oh, it's a little bit yeah. spooky now. Huh? Yeah. I mean, um, the thing is as well, like, with your, your little trees, that like, you can always see faces in them, can't you? Yes. And that's why they are magical that. trees. Well, I love that idea that you showed with the first demo. If you have just jo joined, have you got your little tree with the face on handy? Yes. If you have just joined us, do go back and watch because Leonie's been showing how useful these different Spooky stamps are in so many different scenarios. So the stamp set I was just telling you about with the faces, that's <laughs> the one that she different. used to create this, but totally different look to the tree, as you can see. Um, and of course, that's earlier it. in this hour. So go back and watch the 8 o'clock show on Rewind and you'll see her do that. Um, and those stamps that she used are now back in stock. So you can see on your screen there, if you want those, you can get hold of them as well. I, I absolutely. See, for me, I'm terrible because I go off piece as well, you know. <laughs> but the lovely thing is the, the way these all work together, it makes you do that. Yes. And that's what you want a stamp set to do. You want a stamp set to make you They're drag looking up your gingerbread old trees out. somewhere. I can hear it. What, what? I think they're still looking for a gingerbread tree. <laughs> that sounds a bit of me, yeah. <laughs> See, so I'm just doing a bit of pen because my lovely gel pen, this is, um, it'll add a little bit of intensity into it. So rather than doing drop shadows, I'm actually using the gel pen because that'll just create a little bit of darkness around those to create a beautiful bit of depth into my and the, image. And the outstretched arms that you've got there of the tree as yes. well. Yes. If you've got things like little swings and things like that, or you yeah. could even draw a little swing, couldn't yeah. you, if you wanted to? Yeah, I that. mean, yeah. they're perfect for yeah. putting things on. They're perfect for, like, sitting your little birdies in as yes. well. Yes. You know, you yeah. can do all sorts like that. The, the re yeah. It's one of those... I love this. Very useful That one. is one of these stamps that will work with so many things in your stash. Mm -hmm. It's a proper... It's one of those that, that you'll need. It's a need, is this. Along with those wonderful faces, it's an absolute... I, I, mind you, I mean, Janet's collection, I love everything she's done, everything she's done. Well, there's so fabulous. many different characters, and each time she brings out a new collection, you think, gosh, I, I wouldn't have even thought of that, but yeah. it works. Oh, man. And it is, it's, yeah, it's using them all together. Sorry, I'm, I've nearly finished this. It's, it's uh, that attention to detail. <laughs> Lose yourself. You I said I'd only left a little bit of colouring. You can tell 
There's um, there's a lot of detail, but you'll get carried away. And I, I was saying this yesterday, so I was coming in <coughs> yesterday during my prep, and literally before I came to work, I had to have loads of coffee. So I sent myself <laughs> asleep. <coughs> Because it chills you out, doesn't it? It does, yeah, it does. I was really, that. really tired. It was like, oh my gosh, I can't go into work. I can't even open my eyes. I didn't but realise there were so many different additional little stamps in with that tree as well. Because yes. obviously the main focus yeah, was like little hearts and tiny little the, birds. And the little hearts are well cute. Mm. And the teeny tiny little birdies are fabulous. And, and then you've got your sentiments, of course. And your sentiments, home is where the heart is. Oh, is that beautiful? Which is quite fabulous. And, it, and this is it. And I think it's such, it is a, a really, it's a brilliant stamp set. Now, luckily I've already coloured these in, so all I need to do is stick these down. So we've got, before I stick, I will just get my, my um, composition. So I've got my little tree, because I wanted my little tree in this one. I mean, as soon as you start bringing these in, how ridiculously gorgeous are they? Because he is hiding, see, I think I'm going to put him here hiding. Behind the tree. Ah. <laughs> like so. It looks a little bit like the gruffalo. Doesn't he just? Yeah, yeah. See. My um, little doggy, she saw a sign oh, I saw that. of the gruffalo. <laughs> I was so it, sweet. it was a, a sign on a walk. She couldn't work out that it was a sign. She spent ages barking at the sign. She protected me from the gruffalo. Yeah, That's she knew. We... Now this, this is the little, um, the little sort of the hill from the um, the thingy, Jack and the Beanstalk. Like a little man. But again, you can put that on as well. That just adds even more dimension. And then we're going to have to, aren't we? We're going to have to put the little pa uh, pigeon in there as well because that's just amazing. Isn't <laughs> that's it? Fabulous. And then all I do with this one is, and again, using my pick em. In fact, no, I'm going to stick. Oh, gosh. <laughs> you are arguing with yourself again. It's like, Yeah, it's like, do I do butterflies or do I do hearts <laughs> or do I do them both? <laughs> so I can do, do it all. from the pick em mix, I can do a couple of lovely little butterflies directly on there. I will stop, I promise, in a minute. So a couple of little butterflies, and then look, from the tree, you've got those lovely little hearts. And the hearts are super cute, and they're really handy of them, because those, you can start bringing those into that border, and it looks... Ooh, dinky, aren't they it cute? Just, yeah, yeah, they're really handy You could almost stamps. make like little heart-shaped flowers as well, couldn't you, with yes. the, the first stamp that you had? You That's could draw in your own idea. little stalks and do all sorts. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. That's lovely. Okay, I will stop. I will stick this together <coughs> in your You let me know time. when you've stopped, because you're still going from what I'm I can say. I'm still going. <laughs> I'm not very good at that, am I? I'm not very good at actually saying I'm going to stop and actually doing that thing <laughs> of stopping. But there, look, how cute is that? Beautiful. So I built up my little scene. Um, and this is when, you know, the my my, my beastie friend? Yes. This is where, what that is, because she's my beastie friend and she's it just It is one of those, those faces. Um, and I remember when my, my kids were little, they, um, well, it was Matthew especially, because he was on his own at his time. And you go to places and you go up to people and he'd be like in the playground, like, will you be my friend? Friend. And he's got yeah. like one of those little faces, hasn't he? That little one. Uh, yeah. Will you be my friend? Yes, he has. Um, thank I'm not you, going Leonie. to eat you, I promise. That's it, yeah, please be my friend. Um, <laughs> we've only got five, five minutes. minutes. My goodness, where did that happen? Um, I don't know if I showed you these finished samples or not, but we've got a few little ideas of how you can work with these as well. I'll take you through all the stamps that you're getting with these, but of course, Leonie's been having a whale of a time, and I'm just glad that we've been there on that journey, to be honest, because it's been real fun. Um, and here you go. Obviously, you can work with these in the scenarios that you've got with the different um, fairy tale stories if you're wanting to. You've got all the additional little characters. Think about your Easter cards with those fabulous little bunnies there as well. They're going to look adorable. Jack and the Beanstalk, of course he's featuring within here, but he, although he's clinging to his beanstalk there, you've got obviously the little cow, you've got the ca um, little kind of, um, what's it called? Um, barn. Barn. I nearly said a cow house. Barn. <laughs> a cow house. It'd be the cow house. The cow house where all the cows live. <laughs> but again, you can have loads of fun with these. And of course, use the additional stamps that you've got as well. Of course, Beauty and the Beast featuring in here, or it could be that you're using them and mixing up the different characters. It could be that you're, you're having almost like a, a beastie off, where you've got the wolf standing uh, uh -huh. and eyeing up the beast that you've got from this one as well. There's loads of different ways you can work with these and have absolutely loads of fun in the meantime as well. Of course, with this collection, this is your one-day special, the details of which are on your screen as well. But if you want 
to get hold of the complete collection and the details are there as well, which include the transport stamps that we were looking at previously as well. So there you go. If you're wanting the complete bundle, 441353. Um, it's the best way to shop for these, to be honest. Um, and uh, lots of other things to consider as well. So check these out. That little trio that we saw earlier on. Oh, my goodness. You've been loving these. Now, you're going to get your three sets of stamps with these. Leone's been using these to kind of extend the usability of the one-day special and the characters in there. And they work so well. She's done a cracking job. Go back and watch the top of the show. The first demonstration, she was shown how you can use these. And we've gone on to extended delivery because they have sold out, but approaching 20% of the stock has gone. Abs was kind enough to um, allow us to have some extended stock of this one, extended delivery. It's only extended by a couple of days. But there isn't a bountiful supply, so we haven't got huge quantities of these. So if you are wanting them and you're wanting them for certain, then get them in your basket, but get your basket checked out. 210882 if you're liking those. We've only got a few minutes left, uh, Leone. Is there anything else you can show us? Yes. I was just rummaging for card stock. Let me just get a bit of card. Um, because and I, oh, I was chatting about this yesterday. Do you know what? I have so much card. Why can't... <laughs> it's all got something on one side of it. Seriously, <laughs> there's a bit. Um, right, because this is Hook, but one of the, the stamps that you've got on that pick and mix, and I was chatting about these yesterday because I thought this would be funny. So you've got fabulous Hook there. But when I use it, absolutely marvellous. So we've got our lovely little Hook, brilliant little stamp there. Okay. We've then got, obviously with Hook, we've got the barrel. So let's stamp the little barrel there as well. I'm trying to figure out where you're going with this one. <laughs> so we got the little <coughs> barrel. Let me see. I must admit, I was looking at this and thinking you could ma um, mask out. Is it the cutlass that he's got, the, the, the sword? And you could almost have him holding anything, couldn't you, yeah, really? Yeah, you could. Yeah, you could. <laughs> and uh, because of like... It, it, well, with the barrels, I should have masked one of these off because these would be good to build up the scenes. Yes, yeah. Like if you've masked it off to put yeah, loads that's of a little good point, barrels. Yeah. It's a nice easy one to cut out as well as you mask it. It is. It, yeah. And it's one of them as well. If you've cut the barrel out, I'll do some more with these, but if you've cut the top of the barrel, you can put some inside course, the barrel. Yeah. So it's, it is really good, is that one. You can do tons with this. I'm going to have that R because <laughs> the R is great. Like talking like a pirate. Yes. Arr. So that one's going around there like that because that's fab. And I've made it quite a long, a long one is this one. But... So that's, that is a straight stamp. Have you just kind of moulded it? Yes. Ah, oh, clever. Um, now, now, these, now, look. Okay, what we've got here. Because <laughs> I looked at these and I thought, oh my gosh, <laughs> the pirate has got his parrot. Oh my goodness. How it, funny is, is a, that? A big and parrot. I, I just thought that is hilarious because you can have the scariest, biggest parrot ever. Hey, and look, it's what's like... What's this set called if anybody's looking for it? Yeah, so, they? if anyone's looking for these ones, these are called Strange Birds. Strange love Birds. It. Absolutely. That's what it is. That's what the title is. Yeah, it says what it is, doesn't it? Look, look, look. So, my lovely little... Look at it. <laughs> Do you know what? This, this is just... Doesn't that make you smile? Oh, so, and you will, This is why I love my job. Because <laughs> you can create so many different looks. You can create something that's just ridiculously cool. It's easy. I think it's fun. This, this reminds me of it. It looks like it's... Is it from one of the A6 what? sets, that one, I think? Um, is that's it's one, one of the A6, the not A6 A7. pick and mix. Yeah, yep, you'll probably yep, yep. find that one in there. Um, do you, I don't know if you ever played a game when you, when you were kids and you kind of, you'd have a piece of paper and you'd draw a head and you'd fold it yes. over and the next person would do something. This is one of those ones that if you're having a bit of a crafty session, you don't really know what you're doing or where you're going, build up some of these yeah. scenes and then make a story to connect them together at a later stage. Absolutely. Day. We're down to 20 seconds. Leone, my it's goodness. A, isn't that crazy? <laughs> so happy with these I love and it. thank you so much don't miss out because they are amazing it's just another collection that just brings all your others to life loads and of so fun. Much fun um we're going to be back at 12 o'clock with the one day special hope you can join us then see you later Love it. She's still in mind. That looks fabulous. Oh, Sweet yeah. Poppy Stencils. Oh, that's going to be a good show. Then a paper shoppy um, parcel. That's me. I don't know if you pronounced it right there. Hmm?
What is Flexi Order? When you place an item on Flexibuy in your basket, you qualify for Flexi Order, which means any other items you add to your basket will also be included in your Flexibuy payments. So you can spread the cost over multiple monthly payments. After your first payment is made, your entire order will be dispatched. When you add at least £60 worth of any items to your shopping basket, either online or on the phone, you'll qualify for our Flexi Order offer. This means you can spread the cost of your order over equal monthly Flexi Buy payments, offering you extra flexibility when you shop with us. Flexi Order, making your shopping experience with the craft store easier. Hello, I'm Sue Trangmar and I started Daisy Chain Designs 20 years ago. Back in the day there were very few quilt patterns in the marketplace and so uh, I started to bring patterns into the UK from America and Australia and along the way I've been lucky enough to work with some fantastic British designers and that is what really the essence of Daisy Chain Designs are. At Daisy Chain Designs, we're passionate about sewing and quilting. We design projects that hopefully will inspire you to pick up your needle and thread and have a go. Uh, we have great fun in designing things from the very start, and then the end product is always very exciting when you actually see it made. So don't miss the Daisy Chain Design shows. Good morning to you. Now you need to stay in, stay safe and stay crafting because we have got a fabulous hour for you. You've already found it online. They are brand new. We haven't seen this gorgeous lady since November. And I'll tell you something else, we don't know when we're going to see her again. <laughs> it's not because she's disappearing on us, but we just don't know. Uh, good morning, Lucy. Good morning, Pete. I can't believe it was last November last I know, year. It's quite scary, isn't it? Very scary. Yeah. We want more of you, not less. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> But at the moment, everything's up in the air. We don't know, so we, we need know. to take advantage of Trying it today. Trying to work it all out when... Yes, yeah. that's, that's fair enough. But we've got brand new. Brand new across the entire counter here with the stencils. With, know, the, with the lovely stencils, are not we? Oh, they are stunning. Tell me about this collection then, Lucy. Okay, so we try and bring something for everybody. Mm -hmm. and not everybody loves flowers. And it's trying to make it attractive for everyone. So this is the new 2022 release, mm -hmm. or part of it. Um, so we've got florals, we've got back plates, um, we've got the beautiful uh, designs by Amelia Stamps as well, we've brought as well. And we're quite excited about the apertures. These are the start of something that's coming. Um, so you'll see more of this style with the apertures. We're really excited. Fabulous. Mm. Fabulous. Well, let's take you through all of them. Uh, we are starting with the cherry blossom, which is exquisite. Yes. Um, choose kindness and laugh often. Ah, now these are on the stamps. Are there, are there sentiments on the stamps? I'm or? not sure if that particular one okay, is. Maybe that might have been on pre the previous stuff, yeah. release. It's yeah, the girls have no rules. Yeah, um, just to create beautiful something with yeah, uh, yeah, and like stretch. That. So there's about eighteen, I think, sixteen oh. or eighteen on design team, and they're all different. Well, I've got and they're brought in different for the reasons. I've got to congratulate that design they team because what they've you know what they've given you is exquisite. So I'll try and name check everyone. I apologise in <laughs> advance if I don't. So is this this is Julie. This is yeah, how, isn't that exquisite. I think this is. Eileen's. Eileen. How yeah. beautiful is Eileen. Eileen's well known oh. for her layers. Dots. Oh, dots. Oh, lo look at this. Isn't it beautiful, Tracy? Tracy, what's going on there with Tracy? What's, what's this? So, that is um, using the black glossy, which we've just brought back oh. to you as well. End so, of call. Yeah, end of call. That's so, amazing. It's a small pot. We don't do a big pot because it's one of those 
thought of you'll want it but not all the time right and then what's going on here so that is mixing Dot. the black and the gold oh, which so, will come to your mediums yeah so just wow. putting a scoop of black scoop of gold at the top and dragging it down isn't it beautiful is, how beautiful oh and that's just using one element of the cherry, cherry blossom isn't yeah, that gorgeous yeah. that's it exactly isn't that clever that reminds me of sweet peas my favorite Doesn't flower it? Mm. yeah that is so and look at it just in the negative isn't yeah. that beautiful oh, honestly these are just gorgeous sorry i've stopped name checking everybody that was liz um just stunning so this is your cherry blossom i've got to get through the counter here but i, I will try and rotate because there's so many beautiful samples the designs are amazing they're doubly proud they really have i give them i don't give them rules but every single time they just create the most beautiful samples and um, we're a good company we've got the most amazing products but yeah. without a good design team I'm very much that you know you you've just got stencils so yeah. you need the the creativity behind you and that's what the girls give us I mean I just every, everyone's a doozy beautiful. Look at Leanne's. Um, I should mention as well, just before we move on to our next one, the Sweet Poppy stencils. Now, yours are different because they are mm. stainless steel. So what, actually, what is that going to bring to the party? OK, so it gives you a very good quality product um, to start off with. So we're not the cheapest company, mm -hmm. but we believe that we have got the best product for the designs from so we have designs that are licensed we have um, an in-house designer Emma Cronin and then we work with Lavinia Stamps as well yes, and yes. Emma and Lavinia Stamps have the most delicate detail to their uh, designs and it allows us with the metal to have this so we're not linking bridges yeah. um, the laser cuts just perfectly mm. and gives you that beautiful fine detail which we're going to see mm. uh, well we are seeing it I mean look at the stamens on that, those, those those cherry blossoms I have stunning. got the original um, stencils from Sweet Poppy started 11 years ago. Yeah, I've got the originals from there. They're perfect and I've got um, yeah, I started where, working yeah. with metal stencils about 16 years ago mm. uh, from an American company and we kept getting asked different designs. Did we have this? Did we have that? So we started Sweet Poppy because we were being asked by customers at shows if we had a certain design mm. and that's how we grew that's and grew and grew and worked with Lavinia stamps um, and I remember the first 15 designs that she gave us. They were stunning fairies. Um, and she keeps on giving us these beautiful designs. And then Emma came on board about seven, eight years ago, about Gosh. seven years ago. So we are growing, growing, growing. I still believe we're a small company, family business, yeah. but we are growing and bringing different designs all the time. And beautiful designs. Mm. Your cherry blossom is very popular, 10.99590522. I'm going to move it on now. Um, the lotus flower, so oh, just lotus. feast your eyes on this beautiful lotus flower. Already 10% has gone. That's you are nice. getting that longevity. You are you investing are. in the quality, but I'm um, the price. I mean, this is a this is the two frames here, yeah. isn't it? So that That's is Eileen's. the Bloom's frame. Uh, this is by Eileen, and she loves to layer and put depth of colour into her uh, creations. Um, that is I Leanne. Think that's Leanne. Leanne Love is it, Leanne. new guest designer, um, and she has used the translucent medium over inks, but also <gasps> mixing it with gilding flakes to give you that, that is, little oh, that's hint. So clever. Isn't it good? She's clever, Suzanne. There's Susan. Oh, Susan yeah, sorry. Susan's well known for painting with uh, distress ink reinkers and getting She's depth of colour. Huge. So beautiful. There's another one of Suzanne's. I love that idea of put the gilding flakes in. And we'll talk about those mediums uh, as well. They're on a pick and mix. Uh, there's Julie's again. Look at this. This is absolutely exquisite. So this is your lotus flower stencil. And of isn't course, because beautiful? you've got... That is absolutely beautiful, isn't, isn't it? it? Again, another one Just of Julie's. Showing, if you've only oh, got a little Linda. bit of ink, a couple of yeah. ink pads, it shows that you can still create beautiful, really beautiful. designs. Look at this on the black card. I've never seen it for the black card. I believe, Linda. I could be wrong, but I believe that's the white ink to give the base, and then it could be oxides. I know oxides so work clever. on black, but um, <gasps> Linda will so have to clever. correct me. So beautiful. 403462, 10.99, 15% has gone. Forgive me, I've got to get down this counter. Uh, I could stay just looking at all of these. Uh, you've just look to Eileen's there as we progress down the counter um, beautiful 15% already gone proving very popular and I'm, 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 I was being genuine I said I'm not sure when we're going to see our lovely Lucy again um, it's, she's not, she's not <laughs> departing the earth or anything I, 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 I just mean 
it's not at all. I'm not going it? anywhere yet. It's just the, 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 we've got the date in, that's all I meant. The, these are all brand new. Right, uh, let me dig myself out of the hole and let's talk about the lotus um, flower stencil. Lotus sorry, flower. not lotus flowers, the, um, the, the aperture, sorry. The aperture. So this is a lace circle lace, aperture. Um, I wanted something to frame your sentiments. There are so many people that have sentiments or cute little... Um, stamps or things like that and they don't know what to do with them so I wanted something that would frame it um, and this is the start of a collection and it just shows that you can have the most beautiful stamps in the middle of it and I love that oh, look at these just, just a little gorgeous. bit of ink they're so easy <gasps> to use look at this Linda isn't again. it good isn't that good oh look at this this is all I did this morning Janet Janet, yeah. so you're that on is fire. now that will be a tricky one because she'll have pasted over, and it's it's <gasps> a big aperture, so she's pasted over um, with the glossy white. Yeah. She loves using the glossy white. Leave it bone dry, and then she's coloured over with pens. Unbelievable! Isn't it that good? is so clever, and that black. Gloss. Is that the black in the middle there? Uh, that is just black ink, so oh, it'll be the white paste oh, and then it's black the black ink. ink on top of it. <gasps> you are clever, Janet. They're all fabulous. Mm. Now, we should point out as well, look at this! Uh, once it's gone, it's gone, I'm afraid, for the lace aperture. Yeah. We have twisted her arm. We have yeah, said, can we have more? Lace we were short on. No, big fat no. Just simply because, not because she doesn't love you, it's just... <laughs> Just, just no, Fiona, no. Enough's enough. Um, yeah, so once it's gone, it's gone. And we love Sweet Pop. Over 20% gone, over 20% gone. I know. And didn't that look beautiful with the Lotus Blossom as well? Just gorgeous. There's Linda's there we're looking at. Right, we're going to move across to the square aperture. You mentioned the name of this one earlier because I saw it in conjunction with our Cherry uh, Blossom. So we've got, what have we got? We, so we've got the Lace Square and Circle. Lace Square. Then, and then we have is, the yeah. Bloom Square and Circle. Ah, oh, it was the Blooms earlier. The so Blooms this is a Lace yeah. square so equally it's exquisite I and just again just this this card just keep it very simple with your lovely very, stamp yeah, in the middle yeah i do i don't do over complicated yeah one because when i finish it i look at it and think so we're always the worst person for liking our work aren't we i got no oh, put very it away critical. very self-critical yeah, so i keep it very simple i try not to make it difficult when i'm demoing because i could do complicated but you scare people away yes. to keep it nice and simple. simple. Yes, exactly. Lovely one there from Susan. Oh, <gasps> oh my goodness. Honestly, this is no word of a lie. This is That's all I've dots. done all morning. I've got that the way around. There's dots. I mean, that is... Isn't it beautiful? Yeah, that, breathtaking is the word. Used with our, our lotus blossom here. Mm. There's Julie's. Isn't that gorgeous, keeping Isn't all those it? blues together? And one of the lovely stamps we've got later on in the show, Rosemary. <gasps> yeah. Oh, wow. And here it is with the... Uh, the, the cherry blossom there, Eileen. Isn't that oh, gorgeous? Oh, my goodness. Absolutely breathtaking. Just showing you don't have to use all of it. Just no, use just a section for your corner that. just to frame love your that. artwork. Yeah, it's beautiful. Love that. That is beautiful. Uh, again, another once it's gone, it's gone. 10.99, third of the stock already gone. Wow. Congratulations. Thank you for being so swift to act because I'd hate you to miss out. Uh, 61700. Moving on to the blooms, just when you think you can't get any more gorgeous, <laughs> it does. So this was the one we saw right at the start with the cherry this blossoms. This is it. So this, <gasps> is, this one in particular, so um, all the ones we've seen so far are licensed designs. This particular one is designed by Emma Cronin, our in-house designer. And she, I will give her tasks and she just creates the most amazing oh. work. Um, you know, she, gorgeous. I don't know how she does it sometimes because she pulls and I, I'd sort of tell her what I've got in my head, and she just creates. I don't know how she does it? it. Linda, and this one's Dot, and this one's Julie. I mean, oh, 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 look, you see? One of your own there, is it loose? No, no, no. that is Aliri. Aliri works in the office. She oh. joined us three months ago. She's my um, oh. soon to be daughter in law, hopefully. Um, oh. And she. Um, oh, does she know that? <laughs> she does. She's with my, my son's partner, bless her. And she has to put up with me. And <laughs> she has just found a love of crafting. That's gorgeous. Yeah, she's, she just creates beautiful work. That is beautiful. Oh, my word. That is gorgeous. I think this is possibly one of my favourites there. That is the, the Blooms aperture there. 10.99 to circle, sorry. Bloom. Uh, 411975. <laughs> Fortunately for you, it's on the screen, so you don't have to listen to me. Uh, and then, of course, we have its counterpart in the square. So we have the lace, and now we're on the Blooms. And again, I love this idea you were just referring to, Lucy, where you don't need to use the whole yeah. aperture 
just that fading out. It's, exactly. It's ele so elegant. Yeah, sometimes you need a little bit extra on a card um, and it's just beautiful. Eileen just seems to do it every oh, time. Doesn't she? Um, and the colours, <gasps> I just love the colours. Oh, Susan. Isn't it gorgeous? Unbelievable. Just gorgeous. And, and again, Julie, the team are phenomenal. And oh, my God. How it frames. <gasps> you know, you wouldn't think they would go together, but they go together. They, they do. work. <gasps> but then you look at Leanne's. I know. Oh, it's gorgeous. Unbelievable. Oh, I say. Look at this with the cherry blossom. And that's Debbie. Now she's that's put on Debbie. the back here, Distress Oxides. Um, and then lovely and simple and those beautiful colours. Oh, now how how on earth has this happened? Janet, what's what's Janet done now? Again, Janet's pasted <gasps> and then she's coloured over with pens and um, the background. Idea. Such a clever it. idea. Do it on the black. So if you're going to do that, I find it's kinder to do it on the black card. So do it on black card because if you go over the edge, it doesn't show up. And we're not right. all perfect when we colour. So if you go over on black card, it doesn't show up your, your inks. We'll Top show tips. you a technique of that after. Liz is there as well. Isn't that 10 99 there for the Blooms Aperture. 717285. These are all brand new. Once it's gone, it's gone for the apertures as well, just to highlight that again. Very busy today. We have got our later show, but of course, don't rest on your laurels on that one. Oh, I'm, I'm muddling up my circles and my, 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 my squares now, Fiona. Um, that's all right. Even I can tell the difference. Um, right, let's go to the lovely tropicals. Yes, indeed. Um, again, it's a big stencil. That's it's, a big stencil. It's the biggest we go to with metal. Metal is very expensive for us yes. to produce. Um, so it is the biggest stencil that we do. And it is just perfect as a standalone or as a back. Um, we call them back plates because they were designed to um, do like a back plate for your work. Oh. But the girls just use them as, the, as they are. They're just stunning. Oh, Isn't that just gorgeous? Two of Liz is there. It's, it's such a fabulous stencil. You'd love getting oh. a gift like that, wouldn't you? Oh, definitely. Yeah. Look at that and the rainbows, Julie. Oh, hello. Oh, this is honestly, I'm so sorry. These are my genu genuine reactions to these samples. <laughs> you should have heard me earlier. It was exactly the same. Janet there. That's gold paste, oh. that one is. So oh, that my is goodness. We've got the show, haven't we? The pick and mix. Yeah, yeah. That Get one a bit is. of that in your basket. Uh, oh, Linda. Linda, Linda. Um, oh, Debbie. Oh, gosh, it's just so gorgeous. Look at Janet. Isn't it? Janet. She does colour well. What she did. What she, oh it's my. exactly the same. The glossy white. Yes. And then just using your Pro markers, your Copics, um, your watercolours on the top God. of them. Wow. Beautiful. Look at these. Oh, I say. Dot. I love, I love. Oh, look. Hey. <laughs> eh? Over the top? Yeah. Stencil yeah. on stencil? Stencil on stencils. So doing your back first and Gosh. then either stamping or stenciling on top. So clever. Look at that with the cherry blossom. Beautiful. I've beautiful. ceased telling everybody who's doing it. These are just phenomenal. Please don't miss out. Twelve ninety nine. the biggest one, as uh, Lucy said, that they do. Um, yeah, just stunning. The, 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 the tropical back plate there, 639014. Amazing. One more stencil. The 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 damask. The damask. Do you say damask? Damask. damask. I say damask. Damask. Yeah. Potato potato. Uh, <laughs> damask. Let me just um there we go. That now that is it's crikey. Rainbow. What machine cut that out? Unbelievable. Our manufacturer is amazing. We really do push them and they wow. are just they create the most beautiful work. That and if it cannot, if so we get nice. a design and it cannot be done, we don't compromise the design. No. It will go back and Trace or Emma will rework it if they have to. Um, we won't just put bridges and things just for the sake of it. God. So important the design is. So very delicacy there mm. and the faint and, and just using part of it. Just using it. In, in almost bit. like a circular die there. Um, lovely because it could be so dramatic but very subtly used here yes. by Susan. Oh my gosh, is that the translucent paste there, um, Tracy? It's got. I a, believe it might be. Oh, it's lovely. Oh wow, around the edges here, Debbie. There's lovely stamps we've got coming up, and again used as the centerpiece here uh, by our Julie. 
Oh, oh, hang fire, but we need to see this. Hang fire. <laughs> Look at this. This is amazing. Look at this. Look at that. So that's, that's doing so it and cool. then die cutting it. That's so cool. That is so cool. <gasps> oh, these are so beautiful. And so this is, yeah, with these to come up, there's Debbie and there's Eileen's. Twelve ninety nine for the Damask. Uh, 763 Damask, 763 927. Just beautiful. And again, once it's gone, it has gone. So please don't miss out. Right, now, we've seen uh, some stamps there, didn't we? We've got our beautiful, beautiful stamps. We've seen the dragonfly feature several times. Um, this is the poppy and the dragonfly, four blooms, four stamps, I should say, on this set. Tell me about this set. Then, so, um, Designs by Amelia. Amelia is a new designer to Sweet Poppy and we brought um, a couple of her collections last year and she has created the beautiful flowers now. With the flowers they've got a little hint, they've got some jewels on there but if Ooh. you don't like the jewels then you can mask them off. It is, you are able to mask them off, off as you can see. Um, she's just an amazing designer oh and gosh. we are just so lucky to have, you know, she She's been in the background for years because Rosemary, um, one of our design ladies, it's her daughter-in-law. And I only happened to see one of the creations last wow. year. I don't Has know where Rosemary's hidden light under a bushel? E exactly. And she is just, she's <gasps> amazing. Rosemary. And she, she draws so quickly. Beautiful. Absolutely so quickly. Look at this. Liz, how simply perfect is that card? <gasps> Oh, they're quite big flowers as well. You know, they are statement pieces. Yeah. But aren't they stunning? Oh, I love them. Oh. Her work is amazing. And the girls, Gosh. they just compliment oh. it. Oh, look at this, Debbie. Look at that, Debbie. Like Debbie doesn't know. I'm just sorry, Debbie. That's just stunning. <laughs> beautiful. This is your poppy and your dragonfly blooms. That beautiful. Beautiful sentiment. Over 20% has gone. That, they really are exquisite. Just stunning. Absolutely stunning. Uh, 299851. And then we have the daisies. Oh, the yeah. daisies. And again, I said to um, Amy, I said, could you? And this is what she created. Wow. Um, what she sent back, it was, oh my. You know, and she sent lots of individual flowers and it was trying to work out what would complement, you know, the dragonfly went with that and this went with that and we'll bring others. We have two other ones which we will bring with you with us next time. But they are just stunning, beautiful oh, big flowers. Just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Look at this with the with with the uh, the tropical stencil. <laughs> Bit of shrink plastic. Oh, just so good. Seventeen ninety nine. You're getting four stamps in total. I love that. That's all our new today's on the show. Five six six four nine one. But we have a stock update on the lace aperture square. Eighty five percent gone. Oh wow. 85, oh my gosh. There's so many beautiful samples. I know you're using it, so I feel like I need to get to you, and we'll get to all that <laughs> mediums just while there's some of it left. You get that in the circle in the lace, but you're loving the, the square as well. Eighty five percent's gone. I. Once it's gone, it's gone. I don't expect these to be with me for 60% of the circle's gone. I just, I don't think we're going to have these at uh, okay. one o'clock. So but, we'll do um, it first then. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, we'll get that one first. Okay. So. Over to you, so, yeah. yeah. Okay, so we'll use the lace square. So I'm going to use the daisy as well, one of the daisies as well. So pop that to one side. So I'll always work on a magnetic sheet. And that holds, because they're a stainless steel mix, that will hold the stencil nice and tight. And because I've cut the square, I don't need to mask it off. I can just work oh. with it without wasting my um, yeah. stencil tape. Yeah. So we're going to use Distress Inks. We're limited on the square now. We may have to go to the circle. <laughs> <laughs> you may have to. It's now sold out. But okay. thank you for showing us. Should we do the circle? Shall we? Shall we? <laughs> I love the fact she's so we'll good at the flow. <laughs> we have got, so well done if you got that. Don't forget to check out your baskets. If any bounce back, I will let you know. Two thirds of the lace circle, that's the blooms there I'm showing you. Uh, here okay. it comes. Um, there we go. Two thirds of the lace so, circle has gone. But we do have on. the bloom square. And we do have the bloom circle as well. Right. If you're keen on the square. To me, 
all the apertures that we bring, they're tools. They will um, frame your work, you will pick them out and you will use them all the time. Um, you know, they're just, there's something you've got to have in your, your stash always. So we've got the, we brought the blending brushes we, again we with have? us. Yeah. And our blending brushes, they're not, um, they're not loosely packed. They're yeah. really densely packed yes. to work with our metal stencils. We'll get those on the screen now and bottom of the screen there, they're 11 .99. You end up with three, the three different sizes. Yeah. Uh, 11 99 so we've got sizes one two and three which which one are you using there is that the medium? this is number two that's number two yep yeah. so number three is slightly bigger yeah and then number one i tend to use my number one for my black yes yes yeah. i screen. always have one for my black and it's always kept in oh, as okay. my black Lovely. and they can beautifully boxed as well so they're perfect Great gift value. as well yeah and they're so and of they're, yeah, really good quality. Amazing. We had the worst manufacturer. They're a nightmare to deal with, but they're the best. <laughs> I love the honesty. Out of, yeah, they, it's they, the quality. You put up with yeah, them being a nightmare I because have the quality to put up so with good. this manufacturer just because um, the the brushes were the best. The best of the best. We're all dying so, to know why they're a nightmare now, but we haven't got time oh to talk gosh. about that. We have to tell me when we're off Just air. chasing all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like everybody. I want stuff now. If I, yes, if I want it yesterday. It, I want it today, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm the most impatient person, but I do expect excellent quality. That's that's well, that's me. We can see yeah. that in the, in the Sweet Poppy products, the stencils, the, the stunning and the stamps in your team. So this is the lace aperture circle. Uh, please, again, if, if you, I wouldn't rest on your laurels on this one. With the, with the apertures, once they're gone, they're gone. Two thirds of this has actually gone now because the, the square's sold out. But we have got the square and the blooms, 247859. So you're just doing just, a lovely bit of blend, blend in there with the yeah, upsides. Yeah, just blending it through. So it will just again. So with your brushes, I would recommend try and keep um, buy a couple of sets yeah. and keep your colours. Um, for your oxides, you will need a complete separate set. Yeah. The oxides do not like mixing, oh. but all your dye, your permanents, you can have a set for those yeah. and keep them in the colour family. Yeah. And I did say last year I was going to clean my brushes off and I haven't had a chance. Um, since November, it's been non-stop. We've been so busy getting the new collections yeah. and everything. So, you know, what I said I was going to do, and I still haven't done, I haven't cleaned all my brushes yet. <laughs> so we're just picking up our colour. I've got a bit of a darker blue on here. It's not the blue that I expected on there, but it'll work. So if you're going to clean your brushes, the best way of cleaning through your colours is just get them oh, okay. I wonder and on the kitchen roll. Yeah. If you wet them, if you, um, I mixed one of my yellows up the other day, all I did is I got um, a baby wipe or a wet cloth and I kept rubbing it yeah. or you could uh, wash it with um, warm soapy water or shampoo, give them a good uh, wash, good rinse and then you have to leave them for days drying to dry because they're so tightly packed aren't they yeah, yeah if the you leave them like it. that it'll sink into the glue oh, so you have to leave bristles down. down yeah so let, really let gravity important. take the uh, yeah. moisture out 80 percent now of the lace circle has gone just to highlight that to everybody okay. at home so we're just not the colors i expected but it's fine we're winging it today so beautiful we're gonna take off Oh, look colour. at that perfect detail. Yeah, it's so crisp and clean, and that's what you're going to get with a metal stencil crisp and clean yes, all the time. Yes, no sort of smudging. No. Because sometimes it can go underneath, can't it? Seep underneath and slip and slide. Magnetic sheet every single mm. time. Mm. If, that's a top um, tip. Yeah, definitely. Whether I'm inking, pasting, magnetic sheet. I'd never not use it. Yeah. So if someone comes to a show and says, oh, they're, they're struggling, we straight away go, what, what, explain how you're using it. Are you using a magnetic sheet? No. Are you using a spreader when you spread your medium? No. Oh, we'll talk about your spreader, yeah. 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 So, got the mediums you know, on the show your tools, as well. the right tools for the right job. Absolutely, especially with your beautiful stencils. Limited stock now on the lace aperture circle. Okay, so, pop that to one side. So we're gonna stamp in the middle. Mm -hmm. Hopefully it'll work on these colours. Are we using the daisies, are we? Are we using we're going to use the yeah, daisies, lovely. beautiful daisies. Oh, they're fabulous. 
Who doesn't love a daisy? Oh, they just make you smile. They don't do. They? They They're like the sunflowers. Flowers, yeah. The daisies, yeah. So pop him in the middle. Now that lace aperture circle has now gone, so do remember to check out your baskets. Uh, but we still have, um, equally as beautiful, the blooms oh, in the square the and the circle. Yeah, I absolutely yeah. love the blooms. That's stunning as well, absolutely. I, th I think the hardest part is making a choice. Yeah. <laughs> oh, don't. Buy them both. Buy them both. Because <laughs> I never know. I love your, your, <laughs> your thought pattern there, yeah. Well, I never know what I'm going to bring next. Am mm -hmm. I going to bring it back? Um, is it going to, are you going to see it this this well, side of you yeah, know, once he's gone, they're gone. Yeah. We don't know when we're going to see her next. That's the thing. I keep That's trying it. to warn everybody. I we know we're going to see her at one. I we're working leave, on but... Christmas. So, I know oh it's goodness. horrible, isn't it? I mean, it's, it's over three months ago since we've seen you. So yeah, yeah. So this is the brand new twenty-two collection. Well, part of it. So yeah. So I use um, Burst Fine Claire. I just I love it. Since we brought the stamps on, up until we brought the stamps on, I didn't own a single Versafine Claire. Okay. Now we've got the stamps, the detail that um, Amy creates yeah. is so fine that you need a good quality you stamp. You need to match stamps. Yeah, yeah. and so a stamp best, ink, yeah. yeah. And I'm not the best stamper, so 99% of the time it's always a platform that I'll use. So move that to one side. See, I said I'd spread out, didn't I? A bit more and more and more. So. Embossing powder, the clear. Because I want a raised line for okay. colouring. Yep. So tap that off. So you've got your beautiful fine detail. Mm -hmm. uh, let's go with the stronger gun. So gonna heat it because it's clear embossing powder. Right. Hmm. We just. Heating, chasing along. Beautiful. So to get a bit of colour behind, my favourite choice is uh, the clean colours. Okay. I just love them. Um, they're easy to use and anything that makes it easy for me, I'm quite happy with that. <laughs> <laughs> and like everybody, you know, for years all I've stuck with is like stenciling and you tend not to especially when I'm at shows non-stop, mm. I look at products and I think, unless I'm going to use it, no, I'm not going to buy it. I'm going to be really good. I'm not going to buy it. Now I'm thinking, no, I am going to treat myself. I am going to buy it. I'm going to experiment. I'm going to give it a go. Yeah, yes, I'm experimenting now. It. So um, I'm now starting to do workshops with um, like Eileen. I'll do the most amazing workshops. Because I want to learn as, and grow yes, as well yep, as a crafter. Um, Try different and, things. Yeah, and I think that's what lockdowns allowed us. Instead of having to trawl the road doing all the shows, it's allowed me to have a play and enjoy yeah, crafting good. from a different side, from the other side, more or less, yeah. isn't it? It's an, an, an enforced break in many ways for a lot of people, yeah. Because it's true, you've got to keep playing and playing and playing. And you're going to have your bad days and your good days yeah. and experiment. And, and even with stenciling, when I'm stenciling, I'll have my bad days, but I sort of don't let it and put it away and never ever use it again. I think, right, okay, walk away from it, have a cup of tea, OK? 
cake, come back <laughs> and it'll all be better again. So we're just moving colours around, just building up your colour. And with the clean colours, they're just so easy to use. And with depth of colour, you can add your pencils over the top if you want, Ooh, or yeah. you can watercolour. It's whatever your bag of tricks is. You know, just because I use something doesn't mean that's the right way of doing it. And this is why we love on the Facebook groups when people show us what they've done. Mm -hmm. And you go, oh, that's amazing. How? Tell and me how. How can we find your Facebook group? Um, right, so we have the, the proper one, which is, simple, uh, which is Sweet Poppy Stencils. Okay. But we have the very interactive one where we do all the challenges and things like that. And that is simply Sweet Poppy Stencils. Okay. Um, and that's where we keep our eyes open as well for guest DT members, which we bring in every six months. Oh, um, and we've just had four new ladies, amazing ladies, join us. Um, and sh you know, showcasing their work and things like that. So it, it's great. Fabulous. So we're just moving it all the way around. Zoom along. So and t once you're happy and you've got all your colour, mm -hmm. okay, we'll fast forward it because we've already got one, although it's on the square. So you would build it all up until you're happy. Yeah. And then a little bit of matting and layering, okay. So nice and simple, and I'm very much, I do keep it very plain and simple. Yeah. So um, lovely Mel's from Crafty Devil, her, oh, her wet glue. glue. It's brilliant. Yeah, it's I'm stuff, not, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not a wet glue lover at all. Oh, okay. I normally do tape. But tape or something. Yeah, yeah the red but liner. her, I have to say her glue is, it's, it's, it's brilliant. It's notch, isn't it? Yeah, yeah she gave me some at um, yeah. the show. And they, know, they know their glue, they know yeah, their stuff with it. Definitely, don't they? definitely. So, pop him down. Gorgeous. So, we're just building up your layers, clean and simple. Nothing, nothing complicated. Mm. There we go. Pop him on. And then, a little sentiment from. I think it's from Believe You Can and You're Halfway There. Ah. Nothing too over sweet. <laughs> <laughs> How beautiful. <laughs> and there you go. Gorgeous, Lucy. Absolutely yeah. gorgeous. All right, to have a quick recap and we'll come straight back. Definitely. I just yeah. want to mention Lucy's mediums. Do you know that card I held up? Uh, dots. Uh, it's only because we were talking about it and Lucy was telling me the method of dragging the gold and the black through. Uh, is that right? You're, you're yes, sort of dragging so. it through. Dollop at the top, Dollop a couple at the top. of dollops at couple the top. <laughs> you can mix it, which we call marbling, yeah. and then just drag it down with your spreader. With your spreader, which yeah. we've got on the show as well. Exactly. At the end of the counter. So, well, I'm going to mention these power. mediums. They're a pick and mix, you pick any two, and they're big, big pots. So here we've got the gold. There we go. So if you want that lovely shimmering gold effect, the black we've got as a as a as an extra um, when you end a call when you check out. It's a, it's a 450 pot, uh, so it's, it's about that size. So, um, but it's because as, as um, four pounds fifty, sorry, not 450 pot. Four, hold on a sec, everybody, just stay there, stay there. Look, basically, it's this. <laughs> it's this. It's just there we go. It's four pounds fifty, but that's why it's an indicator. Right, I'll get back to the plot. Uh, so it's a bigger mix. You can choose from your gold. Uh, you've got your lovely, um, which one's that? That's the translucent, which we've seen on the cards. Then we've got the daisy white. So we were talking about glossy white, but then we were talking about um, um, Janet. Likes Janet. Glossy white. Yeah. She likes to colour on on top with yes. your pens, your clean colours, your permanent markers. It is brilliant. You can oh, do that with all the whites. Yeah. Um, and then with translucent, you can ink through first, then use your translucent on top. Ooh. So you can reverse it. So which which do you, which you gonna get? We all wanna. I wanna try Janet's technique. Uh, so the, uh, pick a mix, pick any two, for eighteen ninety nine. 150 mil pots there, 741231, and the black one is an end of call, just to highlight those. We have got the, um, the, uh, the stainless steel scraper, it's not called a scraper, the sort of 
Spreader. Spreader, thank you, <laughs> in the Essentials Toolkit. But let me take you through these very quickly uh, because we've been so busy and I, I, I know for certain stock it is once it's gone, it's gone. These are all brand new. So this is the, the, this is the cherry blossom and that, I mean, it's so simple, Lucy. What, what's what's so going simple. on there? So um, you can either mask off or you could use an aperture square. Colour over first yeah. with your blue, say, or yeah. your, whatever your back plate colour is. Oh. And then it's putting your stencil back on and just blacking it's through. Simple. I'm saying just blacking. It's beautiful. It's, it's But it shows simplicity is yeah. sometimes the most the elegant. Best. Yeah, so the most effective. There we've got our gold again there with a, with a kind of almost like a spritzing effect. Um, again... Lovely Julie there, and this is the cherry blossom. Forty percent of it's gone. Love this in the singular colour there, um, rosemary. That is exquisite rose. Oh my goodness, look at this one, rosemary again. Beautiful. I'm, I'm desperately trying to uh, rotate these. So this is your cher cherry blossom there, and there's Linda's to finish. Ten ninety nine for the cherry blossom. Five nine zero five two two. The team really are wonderful. Right, let's move on to the lotus flower as well. Really, really popular one. This one. Um, so let's have a little look at some of these gorgeous, gorgeous samples with the lotus flower. This is Susan's. Um, yeah, because you've got those three blooms there, haven't you? Oh, I've no idea how this happened, but it is amazing. Uh, that one is our Susan's. Now, hold on, hold the front page. Susan, how is she, how? The chickadee chickadee? So imagine you've got what, that is what we call a played background. So it is played. again layering. So imagine that you've got yeah. a back plate stencil Placing that over ah, the top, stencil under the stenciling stencil, stenciling through. That's yeah, so, so you'll then get the back. That's the so clever. Color. Isn't it beautiful? Susan, you clever devil, you. 60% uh, gone. Look at this, the drama. Beautiful. I love this as well. Look at these with the Embossing different colors. colors. <gasps> 1099 I've got to rattle on because. Uh, well, but just because. Uh, right, <laughs> let's move on now. If you love the lace circle and the lace square, we've got it in the blooms, uh, which it was the one I went for first, but you love what you love. And they're equally beautiful. 45% of the blooms has gone as well. And uh, it really is. It, for the apertures, once these have gone, they've gone. Yeah. This was Emma Cronin's. Emma, Emma Cronin designed yeah, the blooms for us. Designed yeah. This one for us. So I throw Beautiful, the idea at her and then expect her to make magic, and Gorgeous. she certainly does. I love that. Beautiful. Absolutely love Emma. that one. 1099 for the circle, 411975. Let's move on to the square. Half the stock of the square has gone, so whatever you do, please don't miss out. Again, this is just using the sides there. Leanne, very dramatic in the black and the white. Equally beautiful to use the whole thing there. It is with a lotus. Again, with a lotus, isn't that beautiful? And then just using a fraction of it there, as Eileen has with our lotus blossom flower. Just very simple as well. 1099 717285. Once the apertures are gone, they've gone. Big favourite of mine as well is, of course, the tropical. Oh my goodness me. It's just out of this world. Um, there we go, just to show you, because I didn't show you it's Tracy's card here. Uh, you're just looking at Linda's there. Very tropical, deep jungle there. Um, isn't that pretty again with another stencil? It goes from being very male to being very female. So yeah. it's, it's you know, for anything really. Isn't I just love lovely? it. Lovely. <gasps> you see, you love the, if you love that gold paste, oh, I'm just saying, twelve ninety nine for the tropical. 639014. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And then we move on to the damask. Yes, the damask. I'm going to start with the one I really do love. Uh, our, 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 I mean, look at that for stents. Look at that intricacy. Nothing is compromised there in terms of that beautiful, beautiful detail. Julie's here with the uh, the die cut in in it. Yeah, it is like an optical illusion. Love it there as well. Fam fabulous with the deception and there's with our dragonfly eileen's there again and the beautiful poppies i know isn't that fabulous it's very subtle around the outside there 1299 then we move on to the stamps the dragonfly oh the dragonfly is amazing the dragonfly is amazing so please don't miss out as is the beautiful poppy and then those two beautiful sentiments never wait for the perfect moment take the moment and make it Perfect. Well, these samples are perfect. Susan. Oh, the team are phenomenal. Look at these. 
gorgeous, yes. isn't it? On vellum. That's Martine. Yes, that's Martine, Martine, Martine. Gorgeous rose ring. 1799-299-851. Moving on. We've got our fabulous daisies. We saw Lucy using these. There's James. I mean, how pretty is that card? Look at this on the what was the one for the black card? Look at that. Isn't that fabulous? Out of this world, Tracy. Oh gosh. Oh, I love this. Just using it very subtly in the background there as well. Ooh. Gorgeous. 1799, four stamps there. Five, six, six, four, nine, one. As you pass by Linda's there, and you have got those beautiful sentiments as well. Truly, truly gorgeous. Don't forget you have got the blending brushes. Yes, all three sizes, one, two, and three. Um, this is what a beautiful packaging is, right? Look at those, aren't they gorgeous? So stylish. What a fab present for somebody. Because you need more than one set, don't you? Aren't they fabulous? Just, oh, and they're just, oh, softy. Oh, just love them, love them. Uh, so you get all three of those for an amazing 11 399 and the Essentials Tool Set. Now, it, it, the spreader. It's not called the scraper, Fiona, the spatula. It's the spread. <laughs> it's the spread. I'm hoping at some point we might see a bit of spreading. We're we'll going to spread. We're going to spread yeah, now. We're gonna spread. Uh, 12 99 you get that. You get the stencil tape as well, because we need that, so potentially. 25 metres per roll if we haven't got a magnetic sheet. But we are getting the magnetic sheet anyway as well. So we've got, we've got all bases covered there. 683 Two. That works in perfect conjunction with your stainless steel stencils. Right, back to Lucy. We've got about 13 minutes, but I know okay. we're together. Right, so we've got some prep, so we'll sort of whiz ahead. So let's show magnetic sheet, and then we're going to pop on the cherry blossoms. And I'm going to mask off. I'm using black card because I want to show how to colour over. So we're going a long strip so you're about an inch wider than what you need and again a long strip ah so this is our okay. tape yeah. yeah so let me take my glass off so i can see what i'm doing lovely so i'm going to use i'm going to wing it a little bit mm. and i'm just going to change it normally i do two top two bottom down sides but my card is slightly off mm -hmm. so i need to go about there will do me for that one uh, pop that at the top, no waste, and then down the sides, down the side. So it looks a bit OTT with your tape, but it will work. <laughs> there. So we're all secure down. Magnetic sheet is hugging it nice and tight. Yeah. That's what we need. And we're going in with pearl white. Ooh. You can use um, glossy white, but I like pearl white. Um, it is one of my favourite colours. So I have a newish, well, newish pot. It's one of the old TV ones. So it looks like it's set. Right. Do not make a mistake of giving it a good Don't stir. Don't give it a good stir. No. Right. For the first three or four times, leave it as is, and then stir Why it. Why is that then? It makes it too runny or sloppy, and oh. then it'll start dripping everywhere. Oh. So it, it loosens it, it up too much. Yeah. yeah. So just dollops, dollops. along the top. Ah. We're oh, coming this generous way. Dollops. Generous dollops. It's quite scary how much you think you're going to use, but it's not. It's all coming off. So your spreader is about 45 degree angles. Uh -huh. Hands, really important, are in the middle. Mm -hmm. If you do them at the end, you put the pressure in the wrong place. Yeah. So you're on. Oh, look at that. That's so satisfying. It is. That was so satisfying. What you're doing is screen printing. Oh, so yes, yes, I understand. Oh, why yeah. would you not have a spread yeah. if you're screen printing? Yeah. Complete contact, you're not pushing down, no. you're pulling towards you. Yeah. And again, and up. And then that goes back in. It's all uh, water base, so, so it'll all come off with um, ideally warm, soapy water. Mm -hmm. Um, and a nail brush. I cannot stress enough, do not wash your stencils with your hands. You will cut yourself. Because they're stainless steel, aren't they? They're you knives. Know. Yeah, they're yeah. as sharp as knives. Yeah. So, um, you know, think about what you're doing. So I tend to drop them into warm soapy water. And then when I'm ready to clean them, oh, get my nail under there. When I'm ready to clean them, oops, there we go. I will put them flat on the table 
good old nail brush over and then pat them dry with not with tea towels i pat them dry with um especially my brand new ones with kitchen roll because tea towels are fluffy and yeah. they'll snag and catch now we best not to put them into any sort of washing appliances oh definitely not no no, no. <laughs> I'll ask the daft question. <laughs> so you've got your body. Yeah. So you pop into one side and then you would -da. do it again. So you would just oh. wash a stencil, pop him on and do it again. So beautiful. If when you're on black card you get any bleeds, yeah. don't think that's it, throw it away. Go, go around with a fine liner, ah. just around the edges. Yeah. And you can clean it up. Okay. So yeah. don't think that's it, that's it's ruined. World, it? Yeah. You know, it's not perfect. Yeah. Just go around the edges. So exactly. be kind to yourself. So we're going to go over the top. So if you wanted to use your distress inks or anything like that, or your permanent inks, yeah. stencil back on and then go over. Ah. If you're going to use your the colouring pens, like uh, Janet. If you're going to use like Janet uses, yeah. then she'll use Copics or Pro Markers or Permanent Markers. Right. Um, I use clean colours, I just like those, you they're my flavour. Yeah. <laughs> so all you're doing is... Wow, and that's on the per lesson. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's just... God, that's, uh, I and just then, wouldn't have thought of it. I don't know why, I just wouldn't have. It is just, and this is where your black card comes into its own because yeah. you don't have to be perfect. If you were doing it on white cards, oh, yes. it, you would see where you've gone yeah. over. So you're trying to be a little bit kind to yourself and just... It takes the colour so well, doesn't it? So brilliant, yeah, it really does. And then you, you'll have that pearly finish. You'll have the beautiful pearly finish, whereas if you did it on glossy white, yeah. you would have the true colour of what you your pencil. You some more of those other ones we were looking at. Oh, there's just the pure gold. There, there's the matte black. I'm trying to find a pearly one. I'll have a room while you so it's the whites are the best for you yeah. so if someone says well what color shall i go with it's really difficult because i do love them all we used to have a lot more colors yeah but we've gone back to the old school of showing you how to make your colors because if you buy a big pot of pink and blue greens that's all you've got whereas if you buy a white with a translucent uh, sorry with a mica powder or brushos or even three drops of acrylic paint you can create your own colours. So what do we say was this one? This one's Leanne, that's gilding flakes on it. So, them. ink through the stencil, Yeah. stencil off, let it um, blast it with the heat gun, and then I believe she's mixed a little bit of um, gilding flakes she with has, a translucent, yeah. the translucent and spread it over. And she's coloured then. Yeah, because if she'd laid it on top, I think it would feel slightly rough. Right. And then that's the gold. I could be wrong. <gasps> Just talking Just about the mediums. plain old gold, that is. And look yep. at one of my favourites, the end of call. Yeah. You've got to go with the black. Um, you've got Worth to have adding a, it. We put the black into a small pot because mm. it's an afterthought. It's, shall I, can I afford it? So we said, right, we'll do a black in a small pot. Mm -hmm. You won't use it as often as what you would a white. No. But it's not going to break the bank. No. So... Imagine oh, that I've look. already done, oh. okay, already created. Expensive. We're going to have an upside down card. So cold. good on the black card. So good, isn't it? It's oh, so vibrant. Just the best. So we're going to take our tapes off. And then. And you can just go to town on it. You can, you know, take your time. Oh, so pretty. Hopefully it's straight. I think it's straight. And then we're going with uh, Happiness Blooms From Within. Ah. And this is your Cherry Blossom Stencil, 1099-590522. And the pick and mix of the uh, mediums, I think it's 18, we'll get it on the bottom of the screen, it's 1899 for any two there. I think when you look at your stencils, what do you make the most cards with? If, you're, if it's a considered purchase, what are you going to make the most cards with? Yeah. Flowers. You yeah. seem to always make your home decor, um, you know, your cards. It tends to be flowers are the biggest sellers. Yes, um, because they cover all occasions, don't exactly, they? Exactly, that's it. Yeah. Occasion, and really. When we're looking, when we're putting collection together, we try and always do flowers, at least a flower in the collection. Yeah, did some, uh, some jewels there, are you? Some little bling in it. Ah. There we go. And there you go. Oh, nice. stunning, Lucy. Nice and simple. Uh, absolutely Achievable. gorgeous. Gorgeous. Mm.
Um, just let me quickly recap, and I'll ask Lucy, is there, any other thing, is there anything else we need to um, look out for when we, you know, you, you mentioned about the... Um, Right, so... Is there anything else in terms of what happens when we're going with our stencils, pitfalls, when we're using our medium? Because you mentioned so about sticking it down. They, they always... People think they've got to push it in. Yeah. Push it down. It's not. The pressure it's, is very gentle. You, you just, just let it glide against and you're mm -hmm. pulling it towards you. Yeah. Use your spreaders. Yeah. I only use my palette knife to dollop it on. Yeah. Very rarely will I spread with a palette knife. Um, use your tape. There's nothing worse than creating something beautiful and then ripping. Mm. So it's not masking tape, it's stencil tape that we've put in there um, and we don't even have to promote it. it it's got its own name yeah. in the crafting industry because of the quality of it Gorgeous, um, yeah. it's using quality products yeah you can use your inks you can use anybody's mediums with our stencils um, you know if you've got a medium in your stash try it have yeah a play with I it. like that idea yeah definitely fabulous um, thank you, Lucy. Cherry blossoms, over half the stock has gone. It's proving very popular, and I am not the slightest bit surprised because it's gorgeous. Um, 10 99 for your cherry blossom there, 590-522. Moving on to the lotus flower. Uh, again, our most popular, one of the most popular is there. Over 70% gone. And we did have a, a large stock. I mean, we were after it with our lovely Lucy because we don't know when we're going to see her again. After 1 o'clock, I mean. Um, <laughs> I mean, she will come back to us. It's just, she, she, you know, she's not committed. She's not committed. She's, she's a very busy lady. So we need to grab these beautiful, beautiful stencils and apertures while we can. Four zero three four six two ten ninety nine, and there it is with the bloom square, which I'm coming up to next. Yeah, don't miss out. Beautiful. So let's talk about those apertures. Let's do the circle first. Equally is exquisite. We sold out of the lace ones. Um, this is uh, Emma Cronin's gorgeous design, and um, I do do look at that detail. I mean, this is with one of the mediums, the pearlescent there, and then the colouring over the top. Uh, this is um, Lisa. Uh, is, isn't that isn't that lovely? And that's with the dragonfly stamp that we showed you earlier. Half the stock has gone of the Bloom's Aperture Circle there. Ten. 99 once the apertures have gone they have gone let's stay with those lovely cherry blossoms and let's put them in the bloom square aperture half the stock has gone as well so yeah once these are gone like i said they have gone that's it there it is in conjunction with the lovely cherry blossom there it is in conjunction with the lotus blossom here it is, maybe with the previous uh, stamp that, uh, or maybe somebody else's stamp. There's Lucy. I think this must be it's one a of the stencil we brought. A stencil last we brought. Day, yeah. Ah, that's still a Janet's. You see, that was just what we were talking about with Lucy. Just gorgeous. So please don't miss out. Seven one seven two eight five ten ninety nine for the Blooms Square. And then we have the drama. Ah, oh, the drama. I'm just going to hold up this one. Janet and a colouring. It's unbelievable, isn't it? It's Look at that. If that doesn't show off the stencil, beauty. That is drama, isn't that it? That is drama. <laughs> They're probably drawn to it. A little bit of drama, mate. Yeah. Uh, isn't that stunning? They're all stunning. Please, I don't want your lovely designers at home to think, oh, she doesn't talk about mine like that. They're all amazing. That, but it's just the colouring. 12 639 Something about that pink. I love it. Um, and then we've also got uh, the, the, yeah, the damask. The beautiful damask. Just gorgeous. It's Love very it's soft and gentle, isn't soft. it? If you yeah. want something very soft behind your stamps or stencils, it's the perfect one to go for. It is. And so much beautiful detail. I mean, that simplicity of it you said earlier. I love it. Twelve ninety nine, and that is Lay Your Dreams, Let Your Dreams Blossom. 763927. Beautiful. Right, let's jump to the website. You can see the stamps. You can see the mediums. You can see the lovely blending brushes. You can see the Essentials Toolkit there that we were just talking about with Lucy in terms of your stencil tape and your... Spreader. Spreader. I just can't <laughs> get that word in my head, can I? And the mediums pick a mix as well, so do shop ahead. Now, the good news is... Although we don't know where she, when, when she's going or what she's doing. Uh, she'll be back with us at one for definite. <laughs> what are we going to be doing? <laughs> um, I'll keep hold of her till then. We'll do the lotus. Hopefully we'll be able to if do the lotus. the lotus left, yeah, uh, good. Tropical, hopefully. Oh, yes, well. please. And I think we'll do the blooms as well. That sounds like a plan. Yeah. That sounds yeah. gorgeous. We'll try and do as many as possible. Yeah. 
Sounds yeah. lovely. Thank you very much, You're Lucy. You're welcome. Thanks, Phil. Absolutely stunning, as always. Don't forget to check out your baskets. Uh, we've edited since last November the new collection for 2022. We've had sellouts already this morning, so I wouldn't want you to miss out because obviously you love the quality and the designs as much as we do here. So we, Lucy will be back with us at one. You know what we're up to. Don't want you to go anywhere, though. Stay in, stay safe, and stay crafting with us because it's just windy and gusto out there with Eunice. Is it Eunice or Eugene? It's Eunice, isn't it? Eunice, isn't it? It's Eunice. Naughty Eunice. Now we'll join our lovely Haley up for the paper shop pastel paper weekend, then mixed media with Janie, then the all and create one day special with Leonie. I'm Trisha from So Totally Trisha. I've been sewing since I was about eight years old. I carried on through my teens, and when I had children, I've sewn for them. And now I love nothing more than to design fabric-based kits for patchwork, for bags and home decor. Make sure you don't miss the Sew Totally Trisha shows. I'm John Lockwood from John Next Door and Crafts 2. My crafting journey's taken me through all different types of crafting, from stamping and die cutting to colouring and inking, and loads of different things. I designed the brand myself to make sure that every product that comes out to you is the best quality, has an individual design, and also is versatile. I like everything to match, so if you've got a product from the very beginning of the John Next Door brand, it will match with something that you buy right up to the minute. Everything working together, which makes things more versatile and easier for everyone. I really hope you can join me and continue your crafting journey with me and we can see all the new ideas, tips and techniques that we can do together. Shopping online with the Craft Store has just got easier with PayPal's Pay in 3 plan. Spread the cost of your basket, whether there is one item or many, with three interest-free payments. Simply choose Pay in 3 at checkout and pay for purchases between £30 and £2,000 over three equal instalments for the next three months. No fees and no interest. Spread the cost of your shopping with PayPal's Pay in 3 plan at the Craft Store. Hello there and welcome, 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 welcome. Very exciting hour we've got because not only have we got a brand new company, I've got a brand new guest to introduce to you, but before I do that, the details are on the screen for the deal that we've got. And this is a phenomenal deal that I know you'll want to take advantage of. And it is what we call our weekend wow. Launched here live at the craft store at this very moment, running right the way through the weekend, if stock permits us to run that long. Because what can often happen when it's a deal as, as good as this one, it can sell out well ahead of that expiry date. Now, I mentioned to your brand new company, well, I've got the perfect person to tell us about it. And that's our brand new guest for the hour. Um, this is the lovely Amanda. Welcome, Amanda. Good morning, Hayley. <laughs> How are you doing? Um, really good. I'm a little bit nervous. Oh, you need safe first hands. I'll, I'll look after you. Don't <laughs> worry. You. Don't worry at Thank all. You. Has everybody been nice to you? That's the first it's thing. It's fabulous. Yeah, everybody's very, very welcoming. It's just like being in a family, so it is marvellous. Good, good. That's what I like, because I, I, can, I can make wheels turn, you know, if necessary. <laughs> <laughs> now, obviously, you joined us for the first time, so because we work with you the first time today, tell us a little bit about yourself and well, how you come to be here. Um, I'm just like all the other mad crafters out there. I am the stereotypical mad crafter. Okay. Um, it started out, I was really, really little. My mum 
handed down all her crafting skills, knitting okay. and things. So I started out in soft crafts. Oh, I love you already. Uh, <laughs> and then it progressed and it just it just like scaled it out of control. Yeah, and then when familiar. I found the paper crafting, that was it. It was just it was it was just um, when kind of it always, just went from all there. exploded. I love yeah. it. Now you're working with a brand new company to us here at the craft store. Yes, They've brought us these amazing papers. It's um, paper beautiful. shop. It is paper shop it's absolutely delightful it really is gorgeous um, we've got so much on here the pricing is incredible and it's for everybody which is wonderful so it's for that brand new crafter that's just dipping your toe in to somebody that's really seasoned and maybe even does it as a business that's so true. Yeah. It, it's it really is something fabulous for it. everybody now i know you're going to take us through all the papers and everything yeah, that's on the usb yeah. stick yeah. so i'm just going to let people know what they're getting for yeah. the money when i'll head back over to you in a okay, minute yeah. so what have we got well a weekend wow i've explained to you it's a limited offer deal um limited not only by time but also by pr um, kind of a, well quantity yeah, um, if it goes, it goes. So what have you got? Well, you've actually got th well, four elements actually within here. Straight away, you will have noticed this gorgeous array of papers. And as Amanda said, they're absolutely beautiful. So if you can see your paper crafting, my goodness, that certainly ticks that box three times over. Now you've got three different color combinations with regards to these. You've got your gorgeous blues. Those lavender tones are absolutely incredible. And of course, that gorgeous pink as well. Beautiful array of paper. We'll talk about the quality of these in a few months because they are so thick. They're amazing. But within those, you're also going to get templates. Now, Amanda, I know, is going to show us one of these templates in her first demo. Um, and each one of those paper packs comes with its own individual template. Incidentally, these are a consumable. You will use them. And we have got them available by themselves, those paper pads. So if you want extras of those, you can do. Or you might want to kind of just go for two of the pink because you've got something coming up. And pink would be the perfect one. Well, pink perfection, as you can see there. So you can go for those individually and increase those quantities with your bundle. Now, each one of those paper pads has got a saving, and the £8 saving is brought forward to that fabulous Weekend Wow price. But I'll tell you about that in a few moments, because in addition to those paper pads, you have got a little USB stick. Little by name, but not little by nature. It is cram-packed full of content in there. So in here, you've got lots of different elements, which we are going to be seeing. You've got um, basic plain cardstock colours with regards to these. You've got sentiments in there as well. Um, there's templates in there. They're absolutely beautiful, but within that gorgeous pastel perfection range that we've been looking as well. But if you think to yourself, wow, that's a good deal, you wait till I tell you about the next bit. You've got a Zoom class. This is incredible. Now, on the 11th of um, April, at um, 3 o'clock in the afternoon, for a couple of hours, you are going to be able to craft alongside our fabulous Amanda. She knows this range inside out, so I know you're going to have a whale of a time. And that is included within this bundle. Now, don't worry if you can't make it, because you will get the information so she can watch it at a later stage, should you need to. And the beauty is you'll get a special link which will allow you to go back and watch that so even if you do take part, you can still go back and watch it afterwards as well. I know some people like to sit back and watch, don't they? Not necessarily craft at the same time. Well, you can do that. It's all about choice, isn't it? So what you've got here is a brilliant bundle. And I mentioned to you about the £8 savings to start with. So let's go through everything and break it down, as we say. So you've got an £8 saving on each one of these paper pads. So if you do want to go for extras of them, you can at 9 99 So you've got all of those different savings with the different item numbers and obviously the different names of them. So we're looking at Cool Breeze with those beautiful blues. I have to say, Amanda, blue is one of my favourite colours. And this is a gorgeous selection. It's stunning, yeah. And it's luxury as well. Yeah. Because we're even getting that silver foiling That's on true. all the different colourways, but that silver foiling really does make it pop. So true, and we'll have a look at that in a few moments. So that one is your cool breeze. You can see there you're getting a lot, your texture colours, your backing papers, your topper sheets as well. Lots in there, as well as those templates that we were speaking of. So there you go. That is your cool breeze. Next layer down, as an £8 saving. You're keeping a tally of these. Because I've got my thumb up now, because my thumb represents eight pounds now, so I've got that in my head. Um, then you've got your lilac collection. Now this one is called your stylish. Um, stylish. <laughs> Try again. I need new teeth. I need new teeth, Amanda. <laughs> stylish spring. Again, a beautiful collection. People like their purples and lilacs, do. don't they? Yeah, yeah. 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 
absolutely gorgeous with your backgrounds your solids your toppers and all those different elements featuring in there as well beautiful cards be created with these we'll have a look at these a little bit later on so that is another eight pounds so we're up to 16 pounds now aren't we with that one as well um, and then you've got your pinks as well now your pink perfection this is a beautiful bundle of papers and cards you've got your kind of ombre almost going from that pastel right the way through to the deep that's a useful set to have it's fabulous yeah because you don't have to think about it you haven't got to go and look Look for that collection of paper to go with your toppers. Everything is all in there ready for you. So all you've got to do is open it up, lay it out and play. Talking about opening up and laying it out, should we have a look? We have, yeah, shall we? Shall we? we? Shall shall we? we? Shall we? Have a look at this one, I think. So you've got the information on your screen. Obviously, you can shop online if you're wanting to. Um, we'll come back to this in a few moments, but I think we need to have a look at, especially some of that foiling. It is, it's stunning. So these are the three paper packs. They're all different. They're all in the same format. So okay. we're going to get, obviously, you're going to get your lilac, your pink, and the beautiful blue colour. So I'm going to pop these two to one side just so I can go through. Because, like I say, they're all the same format. So this is our cover, and this Perfect. is our lovely new brand, Paper Shop, which I is fabulous. See, that's pretty in its own right. I, I mean, the way it says Paper Shop, you could put a different sentiment there, yeah, couldn't you? Keep it's that. stunning. Mm. And then also, don't forget, use your packaging. Good point. This could be a topper in itself. Nice. So let's start oh, in. Wow. I know. I know. Isn't oh it stunning? Goodness. It's beautiful. So on this topper, if I just hold it and go look at that. I'll tell you what. Foiling. I'll tell you. I'll, we, we, this is what we call on the job training because this is your first it time is, on there. Yeah. So if hold you it hold it in front. No, no, that's fine. Hold it in front of you. And then if you tip it away towards your camera in front of you, what you'll see is the further you tip it away and then you wiggle it back to yourself and you will see the foil. Oh, there we go. There you go. So you can see the foiling come through. There you go. go. Doesn't and that it, it look really amazing? Look, it's, it's beautiful. It really is beautiful. I love it. Love so it. You can on get this one, papers. we've got the um, actual. Uh, so we've got a, a font. Lovely. Then going through, this is where we've then got. It's like a patchwork, so you can actually use this as a patchwork piece, just as it is. That's but a good then point, we can yeah. also use our toppers, so we can cut then, into yeah, this. Nice. Then, nice if you're just getting started with your card making. It's absolutely. almost like an instant card, that, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. yeah, absolutely. So, and also using your fundamentals. So we've got squares and rectangles. Just literally cutting these out, matting, layering them up, and it's an instant card. It. So it's fabulous. Then we've got a different um, topper. So again, we step it. It was still same with the same kind of configuration. We're going to get the long strips like a ribbon. We've got these lovely square toppers as well. Then this is where we come into the beautiful colourways. Gorgeous. So these are the tones and tints. So this is going to go with everything else that you've that already is got. So good, yeah. So if you just lay it all out, and let me just spread it out for you so you can see. So you can see across there that all of those tones gonna work. is going to work together perfectly. It, it doesn't matter which one you pick up, uh, which, which, uh, uh, how, what configuration you it know that you get. Yeah, it is I fabulous. It. Um, I didn't ask, do you know the weight of the cardstock at all with this? This is 240. This? Oh, that's a good weight as well, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So it's a 240 gram cardstock and it's so, it's just beautiful. It's got it's a lovely sheen to it's, it, yeah. yeah. And it's silky. I love it. So you're going to get a, your three pads in there. Now, I, I, I'm going to admit something. I forgot to take my shoes and socks off to do my additions earlier on. So I will apologise you. I kind of got my maths wrong a little bit there. So let me just explain to you again. We're going to go back over to Amanda in a minute to talk about that USB stick. But the paper crafting kit, each one of those, this is what I needed to do. Bring the detail out. Three pounds saving on each one of those. So um, $9.99 if you're going for those by themselves. And that includes that three pounds saving. So those three pounds, so three lots of three. Still nine, isn't it? Yeah, you're going to get that nine pounds carried forward to your weekend wow price. And then you've actually got a saving on top of that because, of course, we've got the USB stick as well, um, which is included with this. And the workshop as well, because you've got a ten pounds saving on that one as well. So overall, when we bundle everything up, including the saving on your screen, you're looking at a £54 saving. That's what I was trying to get across to you, but I got a little bit excited. Um, details on the screen. If you want to go for your weekend wow, then please do so. And, of course, you can spread the cost over two payments, making it very 
very affordable. Now you can go for each of those elements individually, including the USB stick, but don't forget the biggest saving is with the big bundle. And that USB stick, I mean, that unlocks a whole range uh, of different yeah, papers. Absolutely. I mean, this is incredible. That little box, who'd have thought you can fit all of that in there? I know, when you open it up, it's all sealed. You open it up and it's got, it's just beautiful. The packaging itself is lovely, isn't See, it? See, that's nice on your shelf. You can go straight to that USB yeah. stick, yeah. So we've got the pastel, per pastel perfections. I've got your trouble now. <laughs> that's what they teeth are. You can borrow them. So <laughs> these are... We've printed out the thumbnails, so you've got, got um, an, an understanding. There's just so much on there. I can't tell you how much we're giving you. Now, anybody that's not used to computer, uh, let's just say USB sticks, each one of these would print off as an A4 sheet. It's yes. kind of like a, a little miniature that you've yes. got done this, here. This is your library. This okay. is your full library of colours. So you're getting 14 colourways in all of these. And that all your colours that you've got here are included in here. So once you've actually used oh, up your okay. stash, print off some more. Can still print off some more, so you haven't got to worry. Oh, I can't use that. That's my favourite colour. That's my that's my favourite sheet. You're getting it all included within your USB, Love it. so you can return to it again and again and again, which is just fabulous. Wonderful. So the colourways, oh, they're just delicious. Aren't they brilliant? So Look many different these. variations because obviously we just saw somewhere there's like an aperture here. You've yeah. got more of a kind of solid um, page, and also with all the florals, it's just it just really is beautiful. So it's just you've got a rainbow going on. On here look at all these oh, so and again nice different hues and different densities yes, absolutely all all changing all work together and when we get to oh we're still going look we've got more <laughs> so we're still going we're more. still going we've got more wow look, look at all this these. and this is all for you to print again and again and again so they're the paper, they're the toppers. Okay. So they're where you've got the rice paper effect. Lovely. These, these are, sorry, they're your uh, backing papers. Okay. These are your toppers. So this, again, is the same. It's got the same. So like uh, that patchwork you were yes, talking about. Yeah. Right, okay. So each one of these you cut out again and again and again cut out all your different toppers and this is where you don't have to be sparing with what you're using mm -hmm. once you've printed you can really be quite you don't have to be frugal you can go to town on you your project you like can't you because that's the thing is when you've only got one or two sheets then you kind of rein yourself in a bit don't you so now we're at the end of the toppers which Ooh. again there's lots but look at these <gasps> now these look nice this this is yummy all of the paper kit is yummy but you're going to get 160 different colourways for your actual wow. solid colours. Now, look, it's, it is just a fabulous rainbow and it just keeps going and it goes from all your brights, your pastels, which are fabulous, obviously, and then when you're thinking about what we've got with this actual paper pack, think about the events that we've got coming up. That's true. We've got Mother's Day coming yes, up, so is. this would be wonderful for doing that. And also, hopefully, we've got events and things we can start going to, so Ooh. to make and sell, this is here? wonderful. So I'm going to pop that to one side. You're also going to get 29 sheets of sentiments. My goodness, so I wow. Know, I know. And overall, once we've counted all, you're getting over 200 different sentiments. Wow. All so what sorts of things are these saying? So we've got aunt and uncle. Um, we've also got be kind. So you've got your generic Aww. ones, which are your family members, etc. Um, you know, happy birthday, well done, you know, get well. So it is, it is quite, you know, a, a, a large... Um, Kind of like library almost, yes, isn't it? it? Is. Yes, it is. It's a library of sentiments yeah. as well. And then these are Ooh. the... Yeah, I know. Templates. Templates. So are these the, the same as the templates that we've got in the paper pack? Addition, we've got additional extras. ones. We've got extras in Ooh. here as well. So it's fabulous. So if you love a tag, we've got the tags and everything in there. We've got envelopes for you to create. We've actually got um, card shapes for you to use as well, which is going to be my first demo. So ah. if you're struggling with your card shapes, the templates are fabulous. You just literally trim round them and where you've got a dash line, you score. When you've got a straight line, you cut and just fold on the dash lines. Oh, it's that. brilliant. Really and if you can your with your computer, you can actually print those templates on the back of a printed page, can't you? Yeah. Just put them out from there. Yeah. You don't even need to trace them. Right, I'll let you get ready for your first demo, if Thank that's okay, you. Amanda. Um, but you've seen that. What an amazing collection. Every single one of those paper pads, you're getting similar elements. So you're going to get your solids, or they might have a little bit of texture, as you can see on the cool breeze here. But you don't forget, you've got all four of those and more on your USB stick to print off at your leisure as well. Don't forget, with your paper pads, you are getting your foiling. Now
Now, obviously, this is something you can't achieve on your printer unless you've got a very fancy one that I've never heard of. But you can go back in and add your foiling, add your sparkle, add that glamour as you so choose. Take inspiration from those pages. Those patchwork pages, of course, you're going to be able to reprint those over and over again. And again, those solid elements. There really is an amazing array of different papers and cards that you are going to be able to use those. So that one is a cool breeze. This one is available by itself, and the details are on your screen there with your £3 saving. All of the other um, colour palettes are a similar sort of idea where you're going to get your solids, you're going to get that patchwork, you're going to get those gorgeous rice paper effects. But within the bumper bundle, you will get all three of these. Don't forget you're going to get all three of the templates. You are also going to get additional templates on your USB stick as well. And talking of those gorgeous papers, you can print those off to your heart's content over and over again and find even more of them on that USB stick. And then when you've got all of that to play with, what are you going to do with it? Well, you may get inspiration from your Zoom class, which you're going to be able to take part in on the 11th of April at 3 o'clock in the afternoon with our lovely Amanda. So if you fancy getting involved, the details are there on your screen and you can see your weekend where you've got that incredible saving of £30 in addition to all of the extra savings that we're speaking of all overall. So what that means is that you're actually saving £54 with regards to this one. That is a huge saving. And you can see with your weekend, wow, you are saving way more than you are spending. Talking of your spends, do you go for it all in one go or do you spread it over two payments? That is certainly down to your own choice. If you're wanting to go for it over two payments, then you can do. £22.48 being each one of those. And what you could do if you wanted to is add in an additional paper pad for just an extra fiver on there. And so if you've got a favourite choice of colour and you want to kind of have a go-to pack then it may be an idea to add one of those in now it's been a very popular launch for paper shop so uh, yes rapidly approaching 10 percent of the stock has gone um but this is this is supposed to be here for the whole weekend but when you look at the finished samples, taking the ideas from the templates, taking some of those ideas that you'll have from your own kind of um, kind of thoughts, your own designs, bags, boxes, you name it, you can be creating with these and making some beautiful pieces as time goes on. Absolutely is an amazing collection and you are embracing it, which I love. I love the fact that you love it as much as we do. Now, don't forget, if you've got any questions or you'd like to welcome our lovely Amanda, get your emails in. If you're watching from home and you, I don't, you know Amanda, because you've seen it down the supermarket or you, you're a friend or a relative <laughs> don't mind a few kind of little secrets and stories <laughs> then do get in touch studio at thecraftstore.com but the details on your screen for your weekend wow so what would you like to show us Amanda so like you said Hayley the first demo we're going to use the actual template and the templates I've printed one off on um, a uh, A4 sheet and I've snipped away around the edge so it fits on there like so. So when you print it off, it has an edge all the way around the, the side. So I've marked it down, I've snipped it away off so you can <coughs> see here um, it fits lovely on our A4. And then I'm going to transfer it across to my actual one that I did. So where I've got the dash line, this is where I've used my scoring tool and scored across. And then where I've got a solid line, I've gone in with my knife and cut down the edges. So it's literally folding on the score lines and cutting on the solid lines. It's super, super easy to follow. So we're going to create this stepper and it's fabulous. All I've added to these paper kits is just white cardstock. And I know that you've all got stashed of ribbons and buttons and embellishments out there. So this is a fabulous thing to be able to get those out the cupboard finally and use them. So I've already gone ahead and done my card blank. So if, let me fold that up. So I've literally done mountain and valley folds and mountain folds at the back Lovely. so that is then creating my actual card it's nice, yeah, no measurements or anything. no measurements yeah. no no measurements no fussing. no chance of getting it wrong no <laughs> no it's it's all been done for us which is marvelous and especially when you're first time crafter trying to do a stepper card or an easel card it getting those numbers right and measuring right so you, true. It, it's it's yeah. yeah it's it's really does hold your hand it's incredible so on this I've already gone ahead and used my wonderful papers <laughs> so we brought out our lilacs for this one so as you can see I've used one of those actual strips at the bottom and this is going to fit perfectly across the base of my card Lovely. and then again on our toppers we've got all these little um, like rectangles and squares mm -hmm. and all I've done for this is literally 
chopped one of those toppers to pieces, oh, cut okay. into every trimmed one. Down, yeah. I trimmed them all down, and they're going to be fit perfectly on my actual um, card blank straight away, no measuring. Could you have actually used uh, one of the solid colours to make your card base if you wanted absolutely, to as well? Absolutely, yeah, oh, because right, okay. it's, you know, it's 240 GSM, it's got great, yeah, it has, absolutely. So I'm going to start by popping, building from the back forward. So we're going to do the middle centrepiece first. Wonderful. And you could have chosen any of those solid colours because yes. they all work beautifully, It doesn't they? matter where you work, you can go with your darks first. It's just, it, it really is so easy. It's super, super, it's super easy crafting. And the thing but, is, because it's the same quality in a similar sort of style, that if you wanted to kind of cross-pollinate and maybe mix up your lilacs with your pinks or your pinks with your blues, it doesn't matter because they're no. all very similar. Yeah, mm. it's absolutely. So that's why we've done the thumbnails as it is. We've not we've not said um, number one, two and three has got to go with four, five and six. Yes. Do you know what I mean? It's entirely your choice. So if you're liking the blue colour, and you're wanting to mix it up with um, some of the lilacs etc it's entirely up to you there's no format and no discipline with this no you just rules no I like no rules no crafting. rules I like no rules although it can get me into trouble sometimes so like I say the only thing I've added to this kit is my white paper stock that's uh, that's it so on this one I'm going to do a little bit of a shabby on my edge okay with my scissors like so and this is, where, again, where we can use, go back to using our techniques. Um, so when we've got something that's it's so easy to use. Mm. I bet you're looking forward to the Zoom class, aren't I, you? I am, actually. Yeah, I really do like doing the meet and greets. Yes. I, uh, I love crafting live, doing doing all of that and the, uh, the videos and things. It's fabulous, yeah. That's one of my favourite oh. things, doing the meet and greets. I love it. And can, we, can we find you on social media? I mean, have you been crafting with the papers and kind of uploaded images and things they like that? They are on highlight, yeah. Everything's on highlight. I, didn't, I haven't got a bin. I wouldn't, I'm not going to make a mess. <laughs> <laughs> so... Finishing off this, it's super easy. So we've literally got squares. That's all it is. And then I know you at home, you'll have all got your preferred uh, medium for sticking, whether it is tape, your foam tape, um, your 3D glue gel. That's true. It, actually. You know, use your preferred really. medium. So you can make these quite 3D, mm -hmm. or you could even, you know, if you're going to pop them through the post, because I know we're all all aware how much the postage is yes yeah, um, that's true just do them as flats because all the tones and everything match beautifully they do. so they're going to be um such easy cards it really is an easy card and it's nice because you don't need to take a lot from that paper stash that, no. or the card stash that you're getting with your weekend. No, not at all. I love that topper in the centre there of your, si um, your size stepper because I mean, it looks beautiful because you've got the foiled kind of script in there and it's it's one of those classy looks, isn't it? it? A little is, bit foiled. Yeah. So on all of your three actual paper packs, they are your luxury elements. So that's where you're going to find your foiling and this beautiful, super smooth sheen on everything. And then or for yourselves at home obviously because you've got your usb mm -hmm. this is where if you've got that paper stash at home that you're wanting to have a go at print it on your rice paper print oh, it on your vellums point, yeah. it's beautiful on vellums because well, fabrics and, rice and things like that can be making your own fabrics with these yes you can mm. yeah yeah absolutely so when so, you come to print them off are they they're like simple pdf so things that we're familiar with we've given you both options on okay. the usb so you've got a pdf clip print go so you literally print off what you're seeing on your That's screen just like an a4 yeah. shape or if you've got my craft studio or another way of doing whichever package it is that you've got I like a graphic we've package, got yeah, yeah we've got the jpeg oh. so you can go in and alter everything so it's in, it's so usable so versatile and sometimes when you've got i mean you don't even have to take them into a graphics program to resize them because quite often when you come to print um, an image, a, a photograph or something, it will ask you, do you want it as an A4 sheet? Do you want two panels as A5s? Or do you want lots of little pieces? So you can kind of change the sizes without actually taking them into any graphics programs. Now, if you do want to go for the USB um, by itself, you can do. Absolutely chock full of fabulous papers there. Your gorgeous printed papers. You've got those templates, uh, well, additional templates, should I say, on there. You've also got the solid colours in there. So this is going to be a go-to USB stick, not only for your pastel 
confections, but for many other paper crafting collections that you've got, because you will find, especially those solid colours, there's going to be a perfect paper or card every single time, whatever you choose to, um, to print on. So if you're wanting yours, 426395 is that item number, and you've got a £5 saving. But don't forget that £5 saving is carried forward to your weekend wow. And let's talk about that, because if you're thinking about the USB stick by itself, then that's $24.99, isn't it? But the first Flexi Buy payment on your complete bundle, including that USB stick, is, as you can see there, half of your $44.95, which means they're just £22.48, which is less than what you were planning on paying for the USB stick. You'll still get that, and you'll get everything else. Now, I know you've got a second payment in a month's time, but when you think about it, it's well worth going for both of those together, because that's where you are getting the biggest saving. But 10% of the weekend, wow, has gone 074929. I'm sorry, Amanda, I kind of got a bit distracted then when I started thinking about that saving. I know it's a incredible saving mm. it really is for everything you get in all of the actual paper packs the amount that's on the USB that again it, it is a fabulous library for you to have and don't forget you've got all those sentiments as well so you can just print all these off and just it's like going into a shop and picking off the shelf every, and then going back the day after and saying I want it all again so you can eat there's so much value here for this so I've almost completed my card that and how easy beautiful. was that it's so simple but the actual papers have done all the work for me so in addition all I've got is again using your stash get out what you've already got that you use your favorites that you love that you've put away in a cupboard and you forgotten see? about a little bit and you, you want to, you know it, it's fabulous to do all of that I love crafting like this now what have you got here flowers that you're making just a few flowers okay just to finish off on the embellishments um, just pop, in fact, let's get our glue, 3D glue gel. And all we're going to do is pop a few flowers on. Oh, isn't that pretty? To finish off a card. So this could be for your auntie. Mm -hmm. It could be a Mother's Day card. It could be a Get Well Soon card. Okay. So then it's entirely up to you. Now, can I ask you about printing off? Because obviously we've been talking about the USB stick. And if you're printing off onto cards, I mean, um, what sort of card stock should you use? What do you suggest? Um, anything from your photocopy paper okay um, right through to what we've got on here is the 240 oh is it's, this your printable pay uh, the um, printable paper we've got, pack that we've yeah got, right. we've got printable paper pack okay I've got some at the side of me I'll just finish this off and then I can just quickly pull that out and oh, show you the you. difference of what it looks you, like we've popped the details up on the screen for the 140 GSM which of course if you want to go for that paper um, 100 sheets they're 999 works out an extra fiver in your basket if you're spreading the cost with your weekend wear um, so 704354 we've also got a weightier cardstock as well so we've got um, a 250 GSM if you wanted to go for that particular one we have got 300 as well um, but if you're wanting your 250 then the details are on your screen there again 999 75 sheets very very affordable so if you're wanting those you can do but if you do want to go to your 300 you can do as well so this is almost like your construction card stock for doing things like your boxes and of course don't forget everything on the USB stick can be printed on all of the different card stocks what you need to be aware of is your printer how your printer copes with those weightier pages quite often print will have two feeds um, it might be that your paper pad goes underneath your printer and it comes out in kind of like a u-shape you often will have an alternative though to allow you to work with that heavier weightier cardstock so check out your printer settings and I'm sure you'll be able to use all three of those different options but your 300 details there 9.99 on your screen 512.970 um, and that's the thing though isn't it there's only different mediums out there you can print absolutely. on absolutely yeah and that's the joy of having it all on a USB yeah. so that is my little um, Oh, isn't that pretty? Uh, it, they really are beautiful papers to work with. Isn't so it just gorgeous? makes it so easy. So I'm going to pop that to one side. Lovely. And this is the actual uh, cardstock that you were talking about. This oh, is so how, is this where you printed the pages off from the USB? This is, this, oh, these right, are okay. printed pages from the USB. So you can see they're in exactly the same format. Yes. And this is where I've, I've, I've been able to be you know go into that library and choose the ones that I wanted so you're still going to get your toppers you're still going to get all those beautiful papers mm -hmm. that have got like the um, rice paper effect yes, on them yeah. then going through to all your tones and all on this again you get this beautiful tech almost like a, a textured finish which is a linen but um, 
I mean, those these... rice papers, that we, I know we've got the um, the vellum, but you could actually get that translucent look, couldn't you? Well, yeah. I've brought, oh, 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 there we so go. Oh, I knew there was a reason <laughs> why. As if, why as if by I'd love magic. to be in a guest. <laughs> but look at these vellums. Oh, wow. Aren't they spectacular? The colours are just fabulous. So then, m marrying them up with your actual papers. So let's take one of the darker ones that I've printed. Okay. And then pop the vellum over the top. Oh, look how look it just it just makes it so subtle. Beautiful. So again, you can then layer up with your additional papers. There's so many ways oh, of using got, like, these. A haziness about it. It Beautiful. is. It's gorgeous. It's so so versatile. Absolutely love all of this. So and again, you like you say the incredible value for money. Well, that's it. Now, if you want the vellum sheets, you're going to get 20 of those for 9.99. Um, it's worth taking a pack of each of those, Ruby, isn't it? Those prices because you're use them not only with this USB stick but many others that I'm sure you will have in your collection as well so if you're wanting the vellum this is what it looks like which isn't most exciting but of course I'm not like Amanda's looked way more exciting than this one but you could do exactly as Amanda has shown us so 061 um, 548 now obviously when you're making your fabulous card bases using the templates you need your envelopes aren't you this gives you the means for actually your own kind of post these if you're wanting to now these are brilliant because you've got an assortment of sizes you're going to get six envelopes sorry six envelopes in total and these are the kind of envelopes that you kind of fold in as you go so they're not like your standard envelopes these are going to be able to accommodate any embellishments that you're popping on there as well so you're going to get your five by sevens in here your six by sixes your seven by sevens and then your DLs as well so some of those really popular sizes that we work with um, over and over again again nine um, 9.99 very affordable I'd be tempted to go for a couple of sets of those to be honest um, and uh, yeah if you like the idea of those you could ink those up and do all sorts of things couldn't you so if I Zero five um, seven nine nine. Now, of course, when you're working with your gorgeous card stock and you've got such a wide array of different um, kind of uh, pieces to work with, then you can't go far wrong if you're wanting to invest in some dies to work with these. Now, I've got them upside down, back to front. I was I was handed these. <laughs> I'll let you into see. I was handed these while Amanda was doing a demonstration, and I was that enthralled watching. I didn't even pay attention to see they were somewhere upside down. So. We're all right now. We're okay. So um, these ones, you've got your fundamental dies. Now these are brilliant because what you've got in here are your multiple dies, and these are perfect, aren't they, Amanda, to work with all those different colours that you've just been showing us? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, definitely. They go hand in hand, and so it just again it makes it even easier crafting. So all of that you've got here, your paperways and everything, you know, with your fundamentals, you can do all your mats and layers. Like I say, on some of my demos, all I've used is white paper uh, brought in white card stock okay. but you don't even have to do that because everything is there at your hand Beautiful. you just print it all out and away you go well you could actually use some of these to make card bases couldn't yeah, you yeah. yeah fold your card after you've printed it off and overhang them now with these you're going to choose any two now which two are you going to go for circles are always useful they're one of the tricky shapes to cut out to perfection but i must admit i am a bit partial to an oval um so maybe you're going to go down that route i don't know ovals i like them because they're portrait or landscape same with the rectangles but all of them come to you under the same item number as choices you can choose any two um, incredible saving with these 16 and um, 16 pounds exactly I was just checking out a squint then for a moment um, but uh, yeah you could if you've not got any of these you could go for both kind of choices so go for two go for the other two pop them in with your weekend wow and what you'd actually do is you could spread the cost so that means that this month you'd be paying 29.99 for one set and then obviously the second payment is paying the cost for the second set but they're all coming to you with your weekend wow it's one way of doing it, isn't it? So, um, 433295, don't forget you're going to get multiple dies, a lot of dies within there, giving you the ability to do all your mats and layers as you go with those. So, a brilliant bundle to go for, a very affordable price as well. But of course, your weekend wow is the reason that we are here. We are launching an amazing deal. Brand new paper range from Paper Shop, as you can see, and a gorgeous palette of different colours. You've got your blues, you've got your lilacs, you've got your pinks. Now, with these paper pads, you are going to get a template included. That's a bit of a bonus with these, so very, very useful. You've actually got more than the templates on here, but I'll explain about that in a few moments. Now, within the paper pads, you've got a nice collection of different papers featuring in here. Um, you've got your solid tones in a kind of ombre, four different tones there going from your playlist right the way through to your darkest, and then you've got your gorgeous pages. Now, the pages that you've got within these are going to give you the ability to have your textured colours. You've got your backing papers, your topper sheets, and um, you've got two each of those two, and then you've got um, three of your designs with 
regards to um, your elements there. Card shapes, templates. There's even an envelope template in there as well. Just looking here. There's absolutely loads in here. And you've got that gorgeous foiling feature with these as well. And that goes across all of them. So you've got your lilac there as you start, um, your gorgeous um, spring collection there. The gorgeous pinks there with that foiling. You can see there, they haven't scrimped on that foiling at all, have they, with these? No, and the texture is beautiful. Aren't they gorgeous? It really is stunning. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful uh, throughout. And that playing card in there as well. Well, I say plain, it's almost got like a linen look to it, the way that it's kind of been um, printed. Absolutely beautiful. And of course, you can get repeats of those as you go. But you're going to have the ability to print all of those pages off because you're going to get your USB stick. Now, your USB stick will have all three of those collections in there, but lots more content as well, which gives you the ability to reprint what you've got physically within this bundle, but equally give you even more scope. You've got um, JPEGs in here. You've also got your um, PDFs. So whether you just want to click and print and print them off or whether you want to take them into your graphics programs, perhaps like Minecraft Studio, and adapt them to whatever colour tone you want, but you going to get a lot of different color tones in there you're also going to get your sentiments in there as well which you can print off there's loads of those in there and then of course when you've got all this gorgeous paper around you and you just don't know where to start you've got that zoom class on the 11th of april three o'clock in the afternoon with our lovely amanda taking you through some projects now if you can't make it don't worry you can go back and watch it um, at a later stage because you'll have the information so you can go and watch the recording and if you do choose to take part you might just want to sit back and relax and watch what's going on well you'll again can go back and watch that at a later stage you don't have to get involved if you don't want to because you might feel a little bit shy and that's okay it's okay to feel shy but the details are on your screen and all of those elements are available individually if you choose to go down that route but don't forget the biggest saving with the deal on your screen means you're actually saving 54 pounds overall so that 30 pounds saving is an additional to the um, kind of elements that have got with their own independent savings as well i've left amanda on her own for far too long i wonder what she's got up to are you behaving yourself over there amanda yeah, yeah. i'm trying to <laughs> okay fair <laughs> enough so my next demo is with the blue and this Ooh, okay. I, I must admit out of the three i think the blue might be my favorite ah, okay. you can't, it's not it's like being a parent you can't really have a favorite you can't have one. favorites on different days don't yeah, you? yeah 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 <laughs> so this is a super quick easy card so if you've got that one friend that you think oh now i've got a birthday i've forgotten a birthday what am i going to do i've literally used my fundamentals my rectangles i've gone through picked my papers that i wanted i've picked um obviously teamed it with my white card stock and it's super super quick so i'm just going to do a little bit of shabby edging and again when you look at the detail that's actually within the papers it is wonderful so all i do there is i just pinch out of the, the actual card okay. and run my scissors across so then that is showing this beautiful oh, white okay, fluffy edge yeah. now that is what it's it, that's the core of the card because it's printed on this it's snow white when oh, you open it nice. up it's stunning so then when we've done this inking it your inks are going to be fabulous on this so super quick just a few take off my backing off my tape and I've literally created um, three simple toppers and then I'm going to offset them really quickly like so. So that's the first topper. Lovely. And then on this one I'm going to use a little bit of foam tape and again use the mediums that you're comfortable with because okay. I know with that we've all got our um, 3D foam tape, our glue gel, even if it's your own just normal wet uh, PVA glue, uh, PVA glue yes, that yeah. you like to use. Do so you that's the second. Work on top of these and things like when you mix medias and you paste and your stencils yes. and things. Oh, yeah, okay. absolutely. Stenciling through on these with your inks yeah. would be fabulous, especially if you're adding. I mean, uh, one of my demos I've got that I'm going to do um, scoring. I'm going to score into it with a scoreboard. So oh. that is, again, such a simple technique, but it packs a wow, doesn't it? When yeah, you, especially when does. you sand it back. And again, all these simple techniques you can use because everything is in the paper. Well, this the is The paper's it. And doing all the work. we've got the advantage that we've got our lovely Amanda all weekend, because it's a weekend wow. So, obviously, we've got a couple of shows today. Uh, Amanda's going to be back with us on Saturday, and we'll see you back again on Sunday. And that, don't forget, it's Sunday that the deal draws to a close. 
if there is any stock left that is the key thing so i would suggest you get involved as early as you possibly can to guarantee your weekend wear because that's a huge saving overall isn't it 54 pounds my goodness that's a whopping great saving it is massive saving in fact i was quite surprised i think oh i meant to have to have that <laughs> so again so i've put my two toppers on all i've done it's really simple technique i've shabbied some of the edges using my scissors i'm going to layer offset my toppers so i've got my big topper in the background nice. creating that wow effect yeah. I've broken it up with that beautiful solid color mm -hmm. and again I've used another solid color mirrored from the back and then use that fabulous rice paper on front again we're giving you everything so even down to my sentiment that's going on there oh, and then lovely. so we've got happy retirement and they're, they're, like, they've got 29 sheets of sentiments. Well, this is it. I mean, I'm very much at the moment. I've got fortunate, I've got laser printer. Laser printers are so affordable nowadays as yeah. well. And I use it alongside um, foil to actually foil sentiments and things like that. So these would look incredible. Oh, gosh, yes. Because you can do that quite yeah, easily. Because you do the whole sheet yeah. and then send it through and foil it. Yeah. So again, everything is all about the papers the papers have done all the work for me on this one everything's blended beautifully and it's just such a lovely simple it's, it's, it really does speak and to so itself. effective I mean these yeah. are perfect pages for anybody that wants to kind of elaborate and add their own paper flowers that you've created and things like that or if you are just getting started you might well have just stumbled across us and if you have then this is the perfect kit for you Amanda thank you really enjoyed that You're very thank welcome. you very much so again all those gorgeous papers that you've got within here but equally so you could have actually printed those off so don't forget with these you're okay to make and sell with these as you heard from Amanda earlier on so you've got literally it's like a little kind of craft shop in a USB stick and the paper pad really isn't it well, I say paper pad it's 250 GSM so it's cardstock really isn't it but what you've got in here is your three different color combinations which are beautiful so these are the core elements don't forget you can get them by themselves at the bottom of your screen that 9.99 has got a three pound saving on there but don't worry each of those three pound savings are being carried forward and each of the paper pads have got templates so if you are new to card making or you just don't like doing your measuring if you don't like doing the maths and you just want to get involved with the paper crafting then those um, templates are so useful you're going to get more templates as well on that usb stick along with more color combinations but when you start looking at what the design team have done with these packs when they've got them home you can see that they are not just about simple basic cards they can be as elaborate as you so choose get your dies involved make those pockets make those memory books use all of those skills that you will have gathered over the years and um, perhaps watching some of the shows here with our fabulous guests like our Amanda giving you the insight into how you can work with these and as Amanda said all those things that you've got in your stash those odd little buttons or little bits of um, ribbon that you don't want to throw away but you haven't got anything to go with them then do go through those paper pads because you will find a color I am sure that will match with them to perfection and if you don't find it within the pad you will certainly find it on the USB stick so you can see here all all of these created being used in that gorgeous blue but let's look at the lilac because the lilac again works with the blue perfectly so if you want to cross pollinate you can do but again get your dyes involved with these print out those pages if you so choose or take the 250 GSM cardstock from the pad and die cut it itself there you go another variation of that fabulous little sidestep card that you can see there or pick up those little toppers from the topper sheets cut into them simply with a pair of scissors and start creating some fabulous cards knowing that you've got the perfect sentiment on that USB stick to um, work alongside it my goodness look at this it's almost like an Eiffel Tower absolutely gorgeous there with those beautiful that's very fabulous Fancy. This is an Eiffel Tower. The lovely Mel Heaton's made that for wow. us. Wow! Isn't that fabulous? It really does showcase those those actual papers. Lovely Mel. It's stunning, isn't it? It Absolutely really is gorgeous beautiful um, so those are your, your purples and you can see we've got all sorts of boxes there's cards there and then you've got those beautiful pinks I mean these are romance personified aren't they They're gorgeous pinks in there absolutely beautiful don't forget Mother's Day coming up so you might be taking inspiration from the different projects here for your Mother's Day projects your cards your gifts or perhaps the weekend Wow, well, I mean let's face it it's not a bad Mother's Day gift is it if you're gonna get some decent flowers you'd be uh, spending way over that first payment wouldn't you that you can see there and I know any mum would be thrilled to work with these and to have the opportunity to print off those papers over and over again and that is the beauty of a weekend well it's giving you an amazing deal um, a fabulous investment that you'll be able to use over 
and over again. Now I've been very, very busy with this one. I think a lot of you realizing the content that you're getting in here and what incredible value for money um, it is. Because don't forget, not only have you got the elements I've just spoken about, you will get that Zoom class as well. On the 11th of April at three o'clock in the afternoon for a couple of hours, you will have the attention of our fabulous Amanda who's joined us over for the shows. And she's gonna take you through some ideas, maybe with the templates, maybe additional things, I don't know. I don't know, she's not gonna let us know. It's a bit of a surprise. Um, so maybe Make sure that you get involved with that, whether you're watching it live and getting involved or watch it, just getting involved, sitting there with a cup of tea and watching, you can do. And then, of course, you will go be, be able to go back with that link that you'll get emailed so as you can go back and watch it time and time again. Now, if you're wanting to add additional bits and pieces and maybe you've not got a die cutting machine to add um, your own little flowers and florals and things like that, we've got a lovely bundle here. Now, these are all sorts of wonderful little embellishments that you could be utilising. Um, as you can see there, it's your Blue Rose Embellishment Collection. Um, Contents may vary. So um, again, you can see with these, it's kind of like that blue theme I'm guessing with these, but you might not get exactly as you're looking at. But that's kind of the fun, isn't it, in the uh, aspect that you've got knowing that you've got the paper pads and the USB stick so you can get matching colours, whatever you receive. Twelve ninety nine for those with a £6 saving, definitely worth adding in. And of course, you could spread that over two payments as well. Now, of course, you've got your sentiments on your USB stick, but if you want to personalise even more, then you might want to do it with your dies. Well, you can do that with your uppercase and your lower case and you've got those numbers there as well which are going to be brilliant for those kind of uh, yeah, what I like to call humiliation cards when you just remind people just how old they are <laughs> um, £14.96 incredibly affordable at that price half price deal with those and again it's one of those sets that if you're just getting started with your die cutting I cannot recommend an alphabet set a anymore it's absolutely incredible to go for way up there with your circles which I know sounds a bit odd but it's one of the first sets you'll get um, 694154 if you want to those. Now, one more thing I just need to mention to you before we head over and see our Amanda again is this brilliant set. Now, this is fabulous because you've got all sorts of different pieces in here. You've got your toolkit, so that's going to be perfect when you're doing your, your cutting out. And then you've got those gorgeous shimmer and um, sparkle pots there. I nearly said shimmer and sparkle. Um, and then, of course, you've got those gorgeous pens as well, which you'll be able to work with. Now, because of the knife in this one, it's over 18s only when you're placing your order for this one. And you have got a £10 saving on top of this one. So a brilliant one to go for at £37.97. 948824. Oh, you've bought us some fabulous things to chat about in this I hour, know. Amanda. We have. We've got some incredible things. I've actually been using some of the tools here. Okay. I've been getting, I was very lucky. I was gifted them. Oh. And they really really are wonderful fabulous weight to them the ergonomic they, they really are a dream to use I know we're all we all like us tools and things like that Definitely. don't we um, so uh, can I just go back through with what was on By the actual means, um, USB yeah. um, so obviously it, the USB beautiful packaging and we get all of that on this little USB stick so to actually store this it's brilliant it really is and then the value for money is in, is just incredible. So like I said, we've got 14 different colourways really going through the rainbow. And they are stunning, stunning patterns. So you're going to get all of your um, actual backing papers, these beautiful backing papers. And these have got the rice paper effect. So if we have a look at this, you can see in the background we've got layer upon layer where it's all been placed on top of one another in the design. And it does... it it's there's just so much on there that when you look at it first off, there's going to be something you miss, yeah, and you're going to look see, again yeah, and think, oh yeah, there's something well, else there. I missed there. the script the first time round, because yeah. I was that busy looking at those gorgeous flowers. And there? that's across all of them. Yes. So the layering on these is just phenomenal. It's, it, I, just, I just, just love it. Who doesn't love a paper stash? Exactly. Then we go on to the toppers. So the toppers, again, we've got all of this rainbow of colour to work with, and it's going to match everything everything that we've got previously all of those beautiful rice paper um, type toppers that we've got back in papers everything's going to be seamless it's all going to be blend blended and it's going to make crafting just a pleasure to do it's going to take all the um, oh I haven't got have I got that pink have I got that pink and the frustration out of crafting like that when you just haven't got the one That's that you're thing. looking for well, sometimes you've got odd little bits haven't you and odd little bits that won't make anything but when you can add in a paper or card that you've printed yourself Print then all again. of a sudden it's a project and then if you do go wrong and you make something upside down or stick it on the right way <laughs> you just print it again we've because all we've all there. done it we have <laughs> all done it absolutely so look at, again the 160 
of these solid wow. colours from brights all the way through to your pastels. So you've, you, you really have got such a versatile library yeah, here huge. on the USB and then all of these sentiments. And like Hayley said, that wonderful idea of printing off your sentiments and foiling. So again, you're adding in even mm. more luxury to your cards. So it's going to make your crafting super easy, especially if you like to do make and sell yes. or for those charity things. Really I mean, point. all, the, yeah. sco all uh, the school events that you go to, fan you can see your craft store laid out with all of these beautiful, beautiful pa pattern Definitely. papers yeah. and it will all flow because it all matches. Well, this is it. Now we're going through the USB um, contact, um, content here. I'll just explain to you as well, obviously those of what we call thumbnails are little kind of almost like menu sheets showing the content of the USB stick. So if you're looking at those sentiments and thinking, well, they're very little, I might be cards don't worry you'll print them off on an A4 sheet on your USB stick you've got your PDF so um, each of those that you probably notice numbers where it said um, I don't know 14 PDF then you can print that off over and over again as an A4 sheet but you've also got JPEGs on there now JPEGs are image files just like the photos that you take on your camera um, which means that you can actually print those off and quite often your printer will allow you to print those off in a variety of different sizes without even taking them into a graphics program but if you do have a graphics program then you can say take the content here with those images and make all sorts of amazing things with them. Um, it might be that you're using some of the templates that are on there because don't forget you've got those templates. You can print those off on your plain cardstock, flip your cardstock over and pass it through your printer with the coloured papers and there you go, just cut along those lines and create those fabulous card bases. Now of course you are going to get templates included with this because they are alongside those paper pads or the card pads should I say that we've got here. Your Cool Breeze, your Stylish Spring and your Pink Perfection. Now each one of those normally be paying 9.99 and that's with a three pound saving and indeed if you want to go for those individually or add extras in you can do um, the details are at the bottom of the screen for your pink um, perfection but there are other item numbers for the others as well but you've got three pounds saving on each one of those so that's nine pounds across all three of those the reason I mentioned that is because it's coming forward with the bundle on your screen so that's a nine pound saving then you've got your USB stick now your USB stick that has got a saving on there as well it's available by itself if you want but it's got a five pound saving on there that, that's been carried forward. Now, if you go for it by yourself, you can see at the bottom of your screen that 24 pounds and 99 pence is your price. Do check out the flexi buy that you've got on the screen there because you will get your USB stick for just £22.48 pence being your first um, payment, but everything will be sent to you. You'll have a second payment in exactly a month's time, but you will have all three of those paper pads, all three of those templates, as well as all of the content that you've got on that USB stick. And you'll have that fabulous invitation for you to join the lovely Amanda on the 11th of April for that class, that Zoom class. And if you've never done a class before, it's a nice easy way you don't have to have a video camera you don't have to look at yourself you can kind of blank out that um, video and just sit back and watch you don't even have to craft along if you don't want to but you will get a link emailed to you so then you can craft along at your leisure pausing as you go if you so choose it's as little or as much as you want with regard to the involvement there but it's all included and you've got a saving on that as well so if we bundle up all of those savings and the saving on your weekend well you're actually saving 54 pounds with this one which means it's such an incredible saving because you are saving more than you are spending 074929 now um, we've only got about four minutes or so left I'm looking across to Amanda what, what do you reckon is that I've got a really quick demo you you could do yeah, it? absolutely yes let's do it there's nothing like throwing them into the water and letting them <laughs> swim is there Amanda's <laughs> first time with us here go for it Amanda so really really simple I've created um, I've used my square fundamentals okay I've created this fabulous little easel card I've already popped together and it's so easy just to pop um, all I've done is gone um, pattern paper plain pa pa pattern oh, paper pattern paper oh ok that's it is there's easy. a lot of peas in that yeah, sentence yeah exactly <laughs> and I'm using somebody else's teeth so that didn't that, you know that's not not a good idea so that is my base already done lovely so I'm going to pop that in there I've done this one foam tape so I've lifted that up so that's going to create my stopper then we can go in and create the topper. So, again, I've used my fundamentals, so I've got my circles out. Lovely. And I'm going to offset this and pop it down here like this. Oh, you chose I'm the not, foil card this yeah, time. Yeah, I'm not hiding my foiling. Oh, I no. want that foiling to pop. I want it to be on show. So then my second square on there. And then I've gone with a flat mat. 
okay. which is your finger lift tape, your tissue tape. Okay. Is oh, going. That pink background. I know. And it's doing all the work for me. I'm yeah. not having to think about any of this. It's so easy to craft with. So, and it's nice because you are able to make and sell these cards as well. Absolutely, yeah. yeah, absolutely. So then that is going to be the topper on there. And then if I wanted to, I could bring in again using all those that stash of dyes that we've got our flowers, we'll have got um, our paper roses, etc. Yes. Um, I've buried everything under here. I've got another <laughs> oh, <bless> flower. <laughs> So it's just like crafting at home. It is. Doing oh, it here. My, my space. And I am that very typical crafter. I start out with all good intentions, Hayley, of keeping everything neat and tidy. And by the end of the day, when I've finished, I'm crafting on a little space about <laughs> this big. So, but we like to see it all, don't we? Don't I am we a very just. visual crafter. I have to have Beautiful. everything out on my desk. But again, let the papers do all the work for I you. Love it. So, I just now, a do you want to turn that to the card. camera and we can have a proper so, look at that from the there front. There we go. Look at that. How pretty, pretty little is that? easel card. And it's so quick and easy. That was super easy. Can you do another one? We've got. No, I'm only joking. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. I wouldn't do that to you. Now, you're going to join us a little bit later on. I am. You're back yes. at one o'clock? Um, one, yeah, one, two o'clock. Oh, was it two? Two? I don't, know. One, I don't know. I'll have finished by then. Is it two o'clock? Two o'clock. Lovely. But you'll be Thank an hour you, early Hayley. listening to me. You're going to be with the lovely Paula. Oh, another. She's going to be fabulous. She's going to love this. Um, so, yes, another hour with your fabulous weekend winner. But a quarter of the stock has gone. We've got busier and busier as the hour has progressed. Um, and so I do hope that if you have placed your order for this, you will be rejoining us at two o'clock with Paula and Amanda to see even more from this collection. Not placed your order yet? Why not? What an amazing deal. You are saving £54 overall. And, of course, you're going to have the ability to print off those elements over over and over again with that USB stick and if you're not necessarily into USB sticks then that's going to make a, ma a fabulous gift to somebody um, but don't be afraid of it. it's nice and easy and um, thank you for joining us during this hour as I say check out your baskets while you've got the opportunity take advantage of that weekend wow with 25% of the stock having gone in the first hour we are in for a very busy weekend with this one so it could actually sell out before we get to that final hour of it on Sunday evening so take advantage of details on your screen there I will see you a little bit later on. I'm back up with Leone later, but we've got another beautiful hour coming up straight after the break. See you soon. Oh, yes, Jane is in with her amazing artwork. Talking mixed media with Janie in just a few moments. Then we're back with the current one day special. That's going to be a laugh again. And then sweet poppy stencils. Oh. Tickets are on sale now for Crafting Live at Sandown Racecourse. Featuring exclusive offers and competitions. Over 800 make and takes. Stock up from over 50 exhibitors. And meet and greet our craft presenters. Plus, craft members save 25% off their tickets. Book your tickets now at creatingcraft.com and search for Crafting Live. Hello, I'm Barbara and I'm Julie and together we're Scarlet Rose Crafts. We're a family run business and our aim is to bring new and innovative new products to the crafting industry. The Easy Mat Plate is our flagship product uh, followed by our innovative Easy Shim product. Have you heard of Freedom? Did you know that as a Freedom member, you could be making savings on every order you place? For just £7.97 a month, you will benefit from selected Freedom member discounts and complimentary standard delivery on every order you place. You will also receive our exclusive Freedom members badge, giveaways and crafty updates. If you shop with a craft store more than twice a month, then Freedom is for you. Don't forget, your Freedom membership is flexible, so you can pause if you're going away or you can cancel at any time you decide. So what are you waiting for? Give us a call or go to our website, quoting the item number 888888 and join Freedom today.
my name's Stuart and I'm the Managing Director of Oakwood Archer. We specialise in high quality items brought into the UK from all over the world, including brands like Kaisercraft, Stampendous and Impression Obsession. Our products include stamps, dies, papers, buttons, trimmings, ribbons and album making kits. Just about everything you need to be a good crafter. Hello and a very good morning to you. Now, we had a lovely show this morning, Janie and I, at 7 o'clock. So do watch that on Rewind, because uh, there were two brand new products, including one of the books that was empty on it. Em, em, I said it wrong. <laughs> Entomology. <laughs> I was practising as well. Entomology. 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 I didn't yes. have that problem this morning, did no. I? Um, so, so do have a little look. Shop ahead on the web, as you were for these brand new kits. So we're going to talk about the complete collection. Now, you've put this together uh, because you keep getting asked, don't you? Yeah, so when I'm... Um, putting the orders together yeah. I very often notice that people tend to buy more, more than one more. book kit yeah so I thought let's put the four together and we'll put a saving on there so Excellent. if people want all four they're gonna save some money so and they're making two TNs which I found out uh, means tall and narrow or or travel notebook and then you've got the a6 as well so for the visual amongst you as uh, like myself it's it's basically these so with the journals themselves you, you've got the hardback to make two books and within it um, three notelets if, if I look uh, inside yes you've got you. three what we call signatures signatures three signatures yeah. inside it's the same binding technique for the TN as it is for the A6 yeah. it's just obviously different dimensions so your paper is cut to size all you need to do is trim because once you fold it you'll see in my demo uh, once you fold it you just need to trim the edges yeah but brilliant. everything is sized for you you've got full instructions and um, so as we were saying earlier all you need really is glue a knife and some scissors beautiful notice the zebra could I just ask you to step back oh. a bit we do need to appreciate <laughs> yes, this in our, for the in our journey there you go you see well, if you look close up to the counter we can see the fabulous dress <laughs> yes. and I think we all needed to see that um, so this is the complete collection we do do them individually but we just wanted to highlight that to you there is a five pound saving there and we got it split on two flexi buy payments they have 27 pounds 48 to spread the cost over February and March 968177 we'll say of oh, the complete collection you're absolutely right Janie and this is why she did it further the stocks all already gone once it's gone <laughs> it's gone yes. um, I mean yes it makes the three signatures and the booklet but I, if I know you Janie there's loads left over isn't there yeah you've got our... some extra printed papers in there as well to yeah. either decorate within um, I think I've done a couple of pages in there yeah um, look but also you can use them for other projects I mean you could make something else as it all ties in together yeah absolutely so I love the the, the Diddy prints and we're going to talk about more about these prints in a moment because uh, yeah, Jenny's got some extra ones yeah um, so uh, sorry I was gonna say with these so this one and the next one so yeah. they're sized for your outer covers but obviously there's nothing to stop you using one of the other prints as your cover if you want to. It's yeah. just I've scaled these down so that the animals fit nicely onto oh, the cover. How but yeah, you lovely. Can, you can use whatever you, whatever you fancy. Gorgeous. I like people to have choice. Lovely. So that is our giraffe. So as in every kit, we're getting the beautiful sari silks. We're getting the lovely textured wools and threads. We get our, our yeah, book, binding, book needle. binding needle. You get two meters of thread. So that's waxed books book binding threads so it yeah. makes it easier to use because it's waxed and then you get a selection of beads so these charms you've got a lot of bright beads. colored beads you've got yeah. some um, metal charms in there yeah, as well absolutely beautiful so you've got a nice tree of life you get the spine template yeah there it is the tree of life indeed there it is so pretty and then obviously you get as you said Janie you, you get our gray board to cover yeah our, our lovely papers there to make our signatures inside and then this is all cut to size yeah so you've got 24 sheets of the recycled cartridge paper which oh, is lovely. a lovely weight for the books because yeah. you can use them as a sketchbook if you want oh, to and yeah. um, and the way we bind it as well it leaves room so if you want to use it to collage into it gives you that room for, for it to open up if it starts thickening out with collage yes. and things like that nice and then the signatures there. you've got the three colored sugar paper Mm -hmm. And I use sugar paper because again, it's got that nice texture. It's got—I know we use it at school, yeah. but it's—it's it's not too harsh. No, it's, do you know what I mean? It's soft. I don't want to say the word soft, but it's just a lovely 
I guess the only way I can describe it, softer, yeah. less harsh. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. It's just gorgeous. So this is the establishing of all the kits. So it's really which is your favourite, but you're loving all of them. That's the draft. If you want to buy that individually, it's at the bottom of the screen, 637-635-1499. And again, like the ent ent entomology. 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 I think it's on the screen to read it. Entomology <laughs> one. This morning was 1499. If you love your bugs and your ladybirds and what have you, uh, do look on the web. Let's move over now to the zebra, uh, which our lovely Janie is wearing. So I'll take you through the gorgeous sheets here. So again, this is T in size. We've got it individually at the bottom of the screen. And we will talk about these images because actually Jamie, and I didn't realize this, puts these all together herself personally, don't yes, you? Yes, I do. Many, many hours on my computer. <laughs> and how does it work while I'm having a look? Cause, so, uh, yeah, same as the images in the print pack. So basically, I research and find antique public domain images. Yeah. And then, so every item you see on that page is from a different image. And wow. then I recolor them, I crop them, extract them from the, you know, it could be from an old, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Encyclopedia, uh -huh. that sort of thing, which is now public domain. So then I'll take it out of the background. Every single image you see on there is from a different um, source. Fabulous. So yeah, I, I collage them together. So there's a, a lot, lot of, of layers. work, <laughs> a lot of work to make the original artwork. And we're going to have a look at the the, the 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 packs in a bit with Janie because she does things like puts little snails on giraffes' heads and things like that, which is just absolutely <laughs> delightful. So in this, you've got again all the lovely bright beads. You've got the wax blue thread because you've got the the lovely corduroy blue spine. You've got the what the uh, the, the book binding, book binding needle, needle yeah, yeah. and the sugar paper and the cardstock paper, obviously, to carry on and make your lovely uh, TN book there. Bottom of the screen individually, but all part of the complete collection. Move across to the A6s. So here is our A6. And again, this one I really caught my eye because the um, tropical birds has the lovely... Yes, it's got a variegated, variegated yeah, yeah, wax yeah. thread. I so, love that. Yeah, you can see on the spine there. Um, if you just move, move your dangle out of move the way. Move your dangle out the way, so you can see the. <laughs> and then you can see the different colours. So yeah. depending on um, where it is in the thread and where you stitch, you get your different colours there. Love yeah. that paper on the inside. Isn't that gorgeous? It's just beautiful. But I always think these book kits, I mean, they're lovely to make for yourself, but it's yeah. also nice to enjoy making them and then gifting the books. Ah, um, that's a they, lovely... I think they look really oh, professional when they're so made. Different. And, you yeah. know, you've got full instructions, so you don't have to be a professional to make them, but I think you get a really nice finish with them. You do. Look at these, and there's your cover papers there. Just beautiful, aren't they? But again, you've got the choices. So I've sized the cover papers for you, yeah. but you've got the choice there of which one you want on ah. the front and which one you want on the back. Yeah, front or back. And individually, at the bottom of the screen, get me dangles out of the way there. Nine six eight one seven seven for the complete, but six six two one nine three for the individual at fourteen ninety nine. Which leaves us with my favourite, the elephants. And again, <laughs> you put individual charms in there. Look at this lovely charm here. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Look at that with the hand. That's an unusual one. It's, yeah. So uh, yeah, I, I put that one in because I thought it went with the elephants. A lot of people really like elephants, and they have significant meanings to them and that's the hand of Fatima which also has oh. specific meanings so I, I just yeah. thought that that was a, a nice charm Isn't to put in there. Gorgeous and it's really beautifully thought out in terms of the colourways uh, for, for your you, you know you're embellishing the sides there your dangles and then we've got the beautiful beautiful elephants on here and then again you see look at that this is the detail this fabulous detail that um, Janie puts in and the garlands around the heads and the draping vines. They're just beautiful. Oh, this is just the most delightful page ever. <laughs> it's the elephants in the background. I just love it. Honestly, I just love the elephants. Um, which is your favorite? Most of you are going for all of them. Look at the birdie. And the elephant and the has to have beautiful. the trunk up because that's good luck, apparently. Ah, I did not know that. <laughs> that is good luck. Ah, oh, well. And then, oh, that's just beautiful. I love the mini images. It really take so these, Although you've got, you know, you've got foliage and stuff in there, these are slightly more subtle colours, slightly more earthy yes. colours in this Hence set. Yes, hence the tones that you've picked for yeah. the sari silk and the walls yeah. there. So, so really, really beautiful. Like you said, oh, sorry, everything's falling down. Uh, lovely, lovely gift idea. Isn't that beautiful? And again, your three signatures in there. Just, just gorgeous. What fun to make. And you can cut out the individual ones. Matt and Leia there. Really beautiful. 
So individually at the bottom of the screen, 662193, 1499. But the majority of you are going for all four because you're thinking, I'll keep one, I want to gift one. <laughs> you know, everybody well, they, in the family They make would love a really one. nice set Don't as well. Just, I mean, yeah, you've got the two different sizes, but all together yes. they make a really nice collection. They do, and yeah. you've got the five pound saving. Fifty-four pounds ninety-six nine six eight one seven seven. Um We've got the papers now. If it's all right with you, Mr. Christopher, um, I, uh, Janie's going to show some of these on the overhead. Is that all right? Because I want her to pick out that detail we were just talking about. So in this, we're getting how many? 50? 50 of the A4 already printed images. So take it away, Janie. Yeah, so they're in the print pack, they're all printed on a nice 90 GSM uh, smooth touch paper yeah um, so you've got things like this with you with your two flamingos together um, I mean that in itself all of these could you could all just frame those if you wanted to I know. Or you said make a down. story weren't you with the, with the children yeah I was thinking you know you could put these throughout a book yeah. um, and then make your own little story because you'll see as we go through there's lots of characters so you've got a little two little cheeky monkeys yeah, look and um, you've got the parrot you've got the caterpillar and the snail on That's their head so brilliant. You know, you could make up a little story to go with that. What are their names? What are they, what is he laughing at? You know, yeah. things like that. Um, and he's got a very funny look on his very face as well. Um, but yeah, like this I was is, this saying, oh, hilarious! Look at the Luna. I don't, is, is it, it a Luna? No, it's, it's, it's I a, was calling it a bush baby, but bush, I don't know yes, if it is. It is. It, is. it um, looks like a bush baby. Yeah. But where I was saying yeah. about the different elements, so even in her flower crown. Gorgeous. All of these separate flowers were from different images. I mean, that's a lot of work. Yeah, you have even got element. a snail on her tail and things like that. Um, some butterflies. I'm going to try it. So this is um, like we've got in one of the kits. Yeah. So you've got the little lizard there poking his tongue out and like the little <laughs> monkey's face. Like, what's he doing on my head? What's good? You know, so... It's just all those little elements. I'm just going to see if I can find something that we haven't, haven't together, seen yet. It's yeah. quite exquisite. It's a lot oh, of work. There, there. So, yeah, you've got your... Although I'm not a fan of snakes, I, I put the monkey up there and I thought, actually, it needs something. Yeah. So I managed to collage that together so he's behind and in Amazing. front. And then you've got, you know, so they're kind of having a little conversation there. So, yeah, it's all, all oh. little things like that. And you've even got your caterpillar. So there's lots of hidden elements in there. It's and the more you look, the more you see. Yeah. A lot yeah. of work's gone into these, and you're getting 50 of these, 12 99 These are very popular. Thank you for taking the time That's to show okay. us. Actually, when you look at them, it's, it's all very well me flicking through, but uh, I, I, there were things I hadn't seen, and to think that you pick out every single image, you clean it up, like you said, you then collage it all. I mean, there's some here that are so extensive and so full. I mean, look at, I mean, look at this. There's so much going on. So much going on. The trouble is, when I start as well, I'll start yeah. doing a few designs, then it'll give me more ideas. And I, oh, I could do this and that, and then it's, right. it's kind of a every, bit never-ending, really. Every leaf, every flower, every bulb, every... I mean, it's just quite tremendous. Beautiful. It's working out at... And they're all individual artworks there, created by our Janie. Uh, they're working out at 25 pence a sheet. Now... If you love these and would want to print them out yourself, at the bottom of the screen, we've got the Animal Antics digital download. So how do we access that? If we want, once we buy it, do we just want so to do? So once you buy it, you log into your account and it'll be sitting there to download. Yeah. Um, the only difference is, I don't know if we can go over yeah, here again. Yeah, The only yeah. difference in what I've already printed and what you get in the digi kit is you've got a few extra in the print pack because I've already scaled some down. Okay. Um, so you've got some like this, whereas when you've got your digi download, you can print them at whatever size you want. Brilliant. So I think that's why I think there's 40, if I remember correctly, in images, the digi yeah. download. Yeah. So you've, you've got all the images. Um, it's just that you print them off to the size that you want on what you want. So depending on your printer, you could print on fabric, wow. vellum, oh, wow. you know, whatever. So it really opens it up, which is why I do the digi as well as the print packs. Nice yeah. to have that option. Thank yeah. you. 699 details on the screen then, 956409. We're just... Going to go back to the 50 pages there because a third of the stock has already gone. So these are already beautifully printed on 90 GSM uh, paper stock there. Just absolutely stunning. And you will be overawed by the, by the beautiful detail. Um, each one tells a story and you find so much going on in each page. They really are um, absolutely exquisite. 819-917-1299. Look at that detail. If you missed the earlier show, which I can't pronounce, can I? Um, <laughs> They're all on there. There it is. Entomology. There, I can do it now because it's there. Entomology. 
There's a lovely book kit there. It was beautiful for $14.99. You've got, again, the mixed papers. Again, these are images from authentic museums and catalogues, museum stamps. We've got some of the stamps there as well. Just remember, once they're gone, they're gone. Uh, we've got the, um, the postcard stamp set back. That's the only one that's on extended because it sold out the last time. You've got the Builder Bug, Builder Dragonfly, Builder Butterfly. They are exquisite. And so some of them, you know, just so brilliant for your... Um, scrapbooking as well and the journaling there's the entomology the museum cabinet as well is, is really brilliant don't forget seven day savers i know because they'll change tomorrow morning won't they so if you're looking for some more craft card oh sorry do you know what i keep thinking it's saturday <laughs> uh, sunday morning so we've got a bit of time there but uh, don't miss out there's the complete collection for 54 pounds 96 five pounds saving that's what everybody's loving two flexi buy payments for you so that allows us to make the four booklets plus all the added extra images we will be allowed to use elsewhere with our crafted projects. Yes. Right, so you get asked a lot to, where do I start with my book binding? How yeah. do I, so that's where we're going to start, isn't it? It is, because normally, um, we were saying off air, you can be quite limited as to what I can show on yeah. a demo, but because we're working with all book kits, um, exactly. I thought we'll try and show it start to finish. Absolutely. If possible. Lovely. So the only thing I've prepped in advance is cutting down the papers. I thought you don't need to see me cutting out papers so, <laughs> so these are the ones that are sized for your front and backs and then you get your inside covers as well okay so again if we I know we've got a lot of uh, new viewers now um, so I'll talk about the glue as well yes yeah so this is um, I call it smooth stick and quick stick um, just because I'm not very imaginative with my naming <laughs> at all but it is a book binding glue now the one thing that I find is people always use too much. I teach ah. a lot of workshops and I'm always saying to people, scrape a lot of that off. You're putting it on and then and you're scraping, scraping it, it off with again. your spatulas. Yeah. Yeah. So you can see that you, you want to make sure that you haven't got any gaps in it mm -hmm. um, because that could create air bubbles, but ah. you don't want it to be thick no. white. It, it needs to be clear. Okay, so we'll pop that down. We've so got both can, those glues on the show, and uh, I know individually they're available as an endocall, as are the spatulas. Yeah. So you can see the way it's sized. You've mm -hmm. got your even gap all the way around. I normally go in with a bone folder or similar just to smooth it out before the glue dries, just to make sure you've got no little air bubbles or anything like that in there. So we'll do that on the other side as well. So like I said, you've got the choice of which image you want on the front and which you want on the back. Ah. You might want to save one image for something else and use one of your repeat yeah. patterns for the yeah, back. Yeah, absolutely. You could do that as well. So like I said, I like people to have a bit of versatility that, you know, not all kits will end up looking the same. So we'll pop that down as well. Now, when we come to um, covering the edges and the corners, mm -hmm. we cut the corners off... And as a general rule, the gap you leave here mm -hmm. is about the same thickness as the board. So when I cover it, you'll see what I mean and ah. why we do that. Okay. Okay, so I'll go around and cut all corners off first. And then I'll show you what I mean. So this is where I go in with the quick stick. So it's the same glue in the bottle as in the tub, yeah. but it's just the this has applicator. got your, yeah. yeah. So I will use this for general crafting as well. Mm -hmm. And I tend to pop my bone folder underneath so you get a nice sharp fold and pull it over. Ah. And I always start with the shorter edges first. No real reason other than I, I just find it a little bit easier. Yeah. Okay, so where we cut the corners and we left um, a couple of millimetres, you'll see we've got an overlap here now. So all I do is go in and push that round like that. And the reason is, if we had cut that corner off completely flush, when we pull this up, you might get a little gap there. Gotcha. So by pushing that round with your bone folder, ah. we've literally covered that corner there. Yeah. Yeah. So then when this sticks around, uh -huh. it gives us that nice, neat corner. Ah. And you can see how quickly the glue grabs yeah. as well. super duper. So, and I'm not putting too much on there. Just a little wiggle, wiggle of glue. 
And do we get the instructions in the kits? Yeah, you've got books? full step-by-step -step instructions. Lovely. Um, the only things that I leave to you is when it comes to additional decorations. Yeah. So you've got your instructions about how to cover this, and I tell you about cutting off the corners, mm -hmm. um, and then how to do your spines. Basically, every stage that you need to be you kind of right and Lovely. precision. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. And individually, so. an amazing fourteen ninety nine. This is the elephant one. We've got the drafts, we've got the birds, and zebra. Yeah, how could I forget the lovely zebra? <laughs> Zebras and flamingos are my favourite. Ah. And peacocks. I need to do something else with a peacock again soon. <laughs> and the, the reason I, I cannot remember the lady's name, but yeah. the reason this came about is I was doing a live on Facebook. Yeah. Uh, I was doing a live sale. And someone asked if I had any prints with drafts on. And I remembered that I'd done one a couple of years ago, and I was like, do you know what? I think I need to revisit that. And then this is where this whole collection came from. Oh, wow, from. just from that, so, one, <laughs> yeah. that one conversation. Yeah. Gosh, amazing. So, um, yeah, because obviously I'm always about. looking for different ideas yeah, and whimsical ways of putting things together. Yeah. So then I thought, well, yeah, I've not done kind of jungle animals for yeah. a while. So, yeah. So that's your covers done. Okay. So before we cover the inside like this, what I'm going to do is put the spine on so that I can tuck it around oh. and then this, when we put it on, we'll almost Cover. enclose it. Yeah. So you have, with all of them, you have two fabrics and they're going to be different and a lot of them have this lovely patterned fabric, mm -hmm. uh, but depending on the book, you've got a different colour. So what I did on the other one was I used this, which has just got a stripe, but it's a nice olive green on the outside mm -hmm. and the patterned on the inside. So what I'll do is do it in reverse this time and we'll oh, have a we'll have okay. a pattern on the outside. So again, you've got that choice. Lovely. So I'm just going to trim. I like on the outside to have a frayed edge. Um, now, you might want to cut it straight and not have that fray. But again, I like that texture. So you need to cut them down to approximately five and a half centimetres. So I'm just going to nip that there and I'm going to rip it. So it gives me that nice soft edge. But like I said, if you don't want that showing, um, then you can cut it down. Okay. So you've got your spine template as well, which goes into the center. So any of the fabric that shows either side of that spine is what is going to stick to the front of your book. Okay. So which one did I use for the front of the one that you've got in front of you? Because I'll use the opposite. I use that uh, one. So I use that one. Yeah. So that will go down on the left hand side. Because we're looking at this from the back now. So I've got a bead of glue and then I'm just going to smooth that out with my finger to try and make sure that we don't get any coming through the fabric. So I'll pop that down so it comes up to the edge of the spine template mm -hmm. and give it a push. What I'm going to do now is bring my ruler in mm -hmm. so that when we line up the second board, if we butt it up against there, we know it's going to be level. Because what right. you don't want to do is stick the second one on and it'll be at a different height. Because then when your book's closed, it's all going to be wonky. Oh, right. Top okay. Then. Yeah. So another bead of glue down the edge here. Smooth it out. So go up to the edge of the ruler and to the edge of the template. Mm. And then that's the perfect width of your spine. Gotcha. OK, now, again, you've got choices here. You can cut that off so you've got a frayed edge. Yeah. Or we've got enough that we can tuck it over, which right. is what I'm going to do here. OK. And just push that in. Pop a little bit of glue there. Now, it doesn't matter if that doesn't sit down straight away. This is what I tend to do at home, as I'll put something in just to weight it down yeah. while I'm cutting the next bit. OK, so now we'll go in with the plane. So I'm not too bothered if that doesn't stick because we are covering it over. Yeah. So I'm going to cut this um, with the rotary cutter. And again, I need it a, approximately five and a half. Would help if I went up to the edge there. 
and here. We've got that glue bundle now up on the bottom of the screen, the quick stick and the smooth stick um, for, for the um, book binding there, you see, because it's super, it's perfect for it, isn't it? Yes. Yeah, it's formulated yeah. especially. Yeah, it's acid free. Um, it's archival. It is basically a, a glue that's devised for um, book restoration. Right, so it's, lovely. It hasn't got anything in there that you don't want in there. Yeah. <laughs> and vice versa. So, on um, the screen there. So this here is going to cover the inside. Yeah. So I'm just going to trim it down to size. Again, mm -hmm. if you wanted a frayed edge top and bottom, you oh, could do yeah. that. Okay. So then I'm going to go in with my spatula and just put the glue down through the centre. Like that. And push that in. And then again, a bead down through the side. So you can see that the, the idea is that the fabric is sandwiching the board. Yes. So that's creating our spine. Yeah. Ooh. So yeah, I have spatulas. I use my fingers. <laughs> 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 but no, the spatulas are really handy when you're doing the covering of the yeah, board. Yeah, I saw that for scraping yeah, it off. Yeah. Apply liberally, but then scrape off, yeah. So in the instructions, I tell you not to move this too much until the glue is dry. And how long would that be, roughly? Um, go and make a cup of tea. Oh, quite quick then, <laughs> It's yeah. just to make sure that if it hasn't quite grabbed, that um, you know, you're not jiggling it around because you don't yeah, want things to get out of position. position. Yeah. But also, um, I'm just going to do this with the quick stick. You could use the smooth stick again, but just for speed. This will then go in here, so it's nice and neat here, but yes. it also covers up that edge. So again, tidy finish. it's another part of the structure, it's sandwiching it in together. Mm. And that is your cover structure done before we get to the binding. So would it be all right if I had a quick recap, yeah. uh, just because we Perfect reached time. a nice yeah. impasse there before yes. we do the binding? Yeah. Lovely. I'm just going to mention those papers again, because you are loving the, the papers. Um, how many was it? Sorry, 50 on the 90 GSM. Remember the collage, all done individually. They're all individual elements that Janie has put together. Beautiful, innovative. I mean, you just look at it, you see more little caterpillars on heads and birdies and uh, just little monkeys peeping out of here there and everywhere i mean they're so characterful it's just it's just brilliant and they're so vibrant two-thirds of the stock gone and when it's gone it's gone when it's gone it's gone eight one nine nine one seven twelve ninety nine fifty sheets there 90 gsm let me take you through all of the booklets we'll do them individually but of course you can get them as a big bundle so let's start very quickly uh with the lovely giraffe yeah so this is the the dn uh, the tn sorry uh, tall notebook there you go, and this is our beautiful giraffe, proven very, very popular. I mean, look at that the monkey on the back, it's hilarious. There's sort of lovely, you have a lovely uh, comical side to you there, Janie. And uh, <laughs> there she is, it's beautiful. So on the inside, and then you can choose to decoupage there with, uh, you know, the giraffe again, absolutely beautiful. Three individual signatures. So you are getting everything you need to create that beautiful, beautiful booklet. You've got your um, embellishments here, beautiful bright beads and the tree of life and your wax thread and your butterfly, and your paper clip there. You've got the sari silk and tassels and wool. You've got the, um, I keep forgetting the name, they're just the needle. It's just a book binding needle. Binding needle Fiona. It's just a book binding <laughs> needle. You've got the spine template. You've got your sugar paper. You've got your grey board. You've got the two beautiful materials there, you know, tying in with those giraffe colours and then the lovely already pre-cut cartridge paper to make those three signatures. And then the images, which are so vibrant and beautiful, aren't they? Just gorgeous. Look at that. Really beautiful. And there's our monkey. <laughs> ah, look at him there. Just gorgeous. It's the butterfly on the nose. She doesn't care, does she? Fourteen ninety nine six three seven six three five for the T N giraffe notebook set. Now, under the same item number, you can go for the zebra, our Janie's favourite. Now, this is where you've got that beautiful brightness of the sari silks. There, you've got that deep royal 
deep dark navy blue there your your binding uh, needle there um, you've got the tree of life you've got the wax thread and then obviously those gorgeous images for your zebra yeah your zebra your zebra look at that I, fi I find the uh, the smaller one just absolutely delightful really beautiful and here Janie has decorated the individual sugar paper the individual signatures there as well with images from because there's going to be so much left over as well it's fantastic isn't it so that is your zebra there proven very very popular as as well there we go that's your tn size yeah a little quick flick through there love these beautiful that's your TN size, and that is 637635. So you choose which one you want. Let's move on to the A6 size. So again, this is where the, this is the variegated wax thread there. We, again, we've got our little charms in there, our dragonfly, our bright rainbow beads, beautiful bright colors, the red corduroy, and then the lovely navy blue book binding needle there. So pretty. This is tropical birds. Isn't that beautiful? Tropical colors to match. That is just, that is just beautiful. Janie's put that together. Every individual item. I think it's just exquisite. Imagine doing that. Oh, <laughs> Robbie Doolally, but she's got the patience of a saint. Lots um, of late nights. <laughs> lots of late nights. But that, they're individual artworks, all of these pages. That's what I love about it. I mean, look at those. It's just, it's just so much energy and vibrancy and color. It just lifts your spirits on a unisy day like today i mean ah <laughs> oh, that's what we need look at the butterflies i know look at snailies down there he's not on somebody's head for a change uh look ah oh, i want a wallpaper made of that it needs to be a wallpaper that I'm just going to wallpaper not that you haven't got enough to do um <laughs> isn't that gorgeous 14.99 and again all the components in there including your instructions so this is a different item number because it makes your a6 book kit and the elephants which Jenny's working with at the moment so we've seen them so that also is your choice within the number 662193 also a choice for you there on the elephants the elephants is the most popular I knew it I said the elephants forget <laughs> me not they always remember don't they they never forget so don't forget me here things you don't want to forget maybe maybe you write them in your notebook book endless lists that just it's just beautiful and I love the fact that we now know with the trunk up means it's good luck just beautiful yeah just lovely um so that's them all individually what did i do with the, the big sheet there what did i do with it let's put them at the front but i want them all absolutely we want them all so let's have them all let's have a five pound saving let's have all of those lovely notebooks everything you see here and don't forget there'll be so much left over as well in terms of those lovely images 54 pounds 96 968 177 for the complete bundle now you are loving these, we're loving these images. We're loving these images. So we've got <laughs> the choice you. of the DG download. 80% gone once it's gone, another print packet has gone. It has she's, indeed. She's off, off and away. She can't be doing any more. So once it's gone, it's gone. <laughs> That's it, kaput, finito. 819917, you are getting 50 of these beautiful images. I mean, look at them. They, they, they deserve a good close up because there's so much going on. So much fun stuff going on. We've got, look at the snakes, look at them there. He's having a dingle dangle down there. <laughs> He's, they're just beautiful. You have a little close up, you see a little monkey face hiding, or look at this fella. What's going on? Oh, this one, this one reminds me of Yoda. Very wise. With his, uh, he's got a carrot. Hold on, let me show you. There he is with his carrot. Don't put that carrot down. It's brilliant. Anyone with the download will see I've literally just called that my carrot. <laughs> my carrot is the expression. <laughs> Nobody else is getting that carrot. They are fantastic, are they? I mean, look at the, what's going on in his head. He is a dapper dude, isn't he? <laughs> Just delightful. So much going on in these images. They really are exquisite. Um, she's such an artist, isn't she? Twelve ninety nine. <laughs> We're approaching limited. Check out your baskets. Eight one nine nine one seven. If you do miss out, we have the digi download, but um, as well for six ninety nine as well. Forty images on there. Then you can print to whatever size you like. So uh, maybe get both because you're loving the papers and you're thinking, well, once they're used, I want some more. Got the digi download nine five six four zero nine. But we are getting limited on the fifty already printed pack there for twelve ninety nine. Right, Janie, back to you. Okay. So we need to start our binding now. Okay. So we need to know where the holes are going to go to help us. So this is where your spine template comes in. And all you need to do is just pierce through where I've got the dots. 
okay and then line it back up again centrally and then I tend to go in with a pen just to mark them just pull it back to make sure that your marks have gone through before you move the template there we go so now we know where we need to pierce through and it's always easier to pierce through now because when we do our binding you'll see when we do it we come in from the outside as well so you need to see where the where the holes are through. yeah what would you use at home if you haven't got a piercing tool um i think most crafters have got some kind some, of, some of kind piercing of tool skewer. you could use the needle that's in the kit the book needle, yeah. um, but you might want to put something on the end to make it easier to push yeah. through I'll just mention um, Jenny the papers are now sold out okay and well done to you if uh, we have still got the download but they have now officially sold out so do remember to check out your baskets if any bounce back I'll let you know but I doubt that will happen because you clearly love them as much as we do um, the digi download is still available 40 of those images there 699 thank you Jenny yes there are no more because I'm Awaiting She's away. for five weeks. She's so, where, are you, where are you going, Janie? Um, nowhere you want to go to, Phil. Where would we all rather be rather than here with Hurricane Eunice? She's off to the Caribbean. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so she can go off someone really quickly. Teach a bit quickly. of binding in the Caribbean. Just, so well, jealous. En route so to the jealous. Caribbean. <laughs> yeah. She'll be working if that makes you feel any better. I will, yeah. And so this is why you've got to get everything now because I literally have to pack all your orders and pack up for... 20 workshops oh, a busy and, lady <laughs> and get my head into summer clothing mode <laughs> <laughs> are you bringing the zebra so, dress you should yeah yeah Lovely. i might do yeah yeah so i should really explain what i'm doing so we also need to get the holes in the correct place in our signatures so ah. all i've done with these papers is i've just folded them yes so you have eight pages and then your cover page Sugar page per yeah. signature yeah and then the only other thing I've done off cameras, when you fold them, if you see, we've now created a thickness mm. of a spine here, yeah. which means your center pages will poke out slightly. Oh. So all you need to do is just pop a steel edge ruler down through. And give a bit of that. I remember doing that, that with you when off. we made a book together. Yeah. yeah, yeah, because like I said, I mean, if it's just pushing it out. Slightly, if you don't it? want to do that precision cutting, if you can live with it, all it is is that the centre ones will poke out very slightly. But like I said, yeah. it's just because we've created that thickness. That's the yeah. only reason. So I've folded my spine template in half, and I've lined up where the dots are ah, with the nice. um, fold. Yeah. I've just popped a little dot, so Not. I know that if I pierce my holes through there, things will line up. Great. So the way I'm doing it is almost at a right angle, mm -hmm. and then I kind of push down with my awl, and then push through and slightly twist as I'm doing it okay. to make sure it comes right the way out the back. Okay? Yeah. So do that on all three, kind of push and twist. Now you could, some people have got piercing cradles, which is ideal for this, mm -hmm. but also if you've got an old, um, you know, if anyone's got any of the old telephone books or an, an old thick book oh, that is, yeah. you know, an old catalogue or something, you can open that up into the centre, yeah. That's put this tip. in and then stab down into it because yeah. it gives you that support because some people do struggle doing this bit to get it lined up. Yeah. So yeah, if you've got an old catalogue of, mm. of some description. Finally a use for it. Exactly. Yeah. So just yeah, just open it up, pop that into the um the hinge of it. Yeah. And then you can just stab straight down into it. Fab. So I wouldn't advise stabbing straight down into one of these cutting mats because even though they're self healing, that's the cutting, not yeah, you not know a deep piercing. Well, if you were going to I would turn it over and do it on the back just right. so just so it doesn't matter. Right, so we've got all our holes ready for binding and then you can choose in which order you want your colours doesn't really matter so in your kit your wax thread will be nicely wrapped around a little bobbin <laughs> is your wax thread so yeah I say measure off three times the height of your book for each piece of thread mm -hmm. what I might do depending on time I might just bind one of these so that we can yes, have a look at something nice else because it, it's the same for all three basically yeah. so you've also got a needle in your kit 
I use my little travelling binding kit. <laughs> <laughs> you need to pack all this when you go. Oh, I'm going to need to pack a lot when I go. It'll be very busy. <laughs> <Thank you. Yeah. laughs> I'm going to try and get some designing done while I'm away as well. So, you start off in the centre hole. Okay? And then what I'm going to do, I normally start at this side and work my way across, but I'm only going to bind one, so I'm just going to show you in the centre. I okay? see. Okay? So, pull that all the way through. And then you want to leave a tail in here so it's long enough for you to grab hold of to tie off when we get back there. Right. Okay? Mm -hmm. So you'll get into your own method of doing this. And I always think I look a little bit um, cat candid when I'm doing it on air because I'm trying to get you to see what I'm doing. As so I'm kind of moving technique. it around yeah. in a different way. So, yeah, you need to make sure you come back through all the way through. Mm -hmm. You skip your centre hole, ah. go back into the base hole, and back through, like that. Now, if anyone has trouble pulling the needle through, um, an easy way to do it is if you've got some little pliers. So if you can't grip it very well, you yeah. could put some pliers on there and just give it a tug, which, yeah. which helps. If it's you a fair struggle. size needle, to be fair, isn't yeah. it? It's not it a bit is a proper book thin, binding yeah. needle, yes, yeah, size yeah. 18 one. So back through the centre and back through this hole. So the thing that you need to try and be careful of, I'm trying not to get my head in the way, mm -hmm. is when you come through, just try not to stitch through. Well, I've moved it now because I'm trying to jiggle it around so you can see and I've moved it. Um, try not to stitch back through this thread. Now, I've come out one either side, which yeah. is which is ideal, but if right. you happen to come out two on one side, you just tuck one underneath. Uh, okay. This allows you to pull, so you give it a Good kind of gentle tug. but firm. Yeah. So you don't, you don't want to, what I mean is you don't want to like rip it open no. like that, no. but you need to give it a tug because before you tie it off, you make sure there's no loops here yeah. and that it's nice and tight here. Right. Okay, so just, and then you go left over right, mm. and then right over left, which helps to lock the knot, and you can see we've got this excess here to mm. make it easier for you to do that. Snip off the excess, and then you nice. just repeat that with the other two, and then you'll get your nice three stitches in the spine. Fabulous, fantastic. And then now all the fun comes with the decorating, doesn't it? Exactly, yeah. So, you know, if you were gifting it, you could gift it like that, mm -hmm. use it yourself and start filling it with all sorts of things. I mean, if you've, you know, if people have started travelling again and yeah. you've got your own photos to put in there, yeah, mm -hmm. anything you want, use it for anything, but use it. <laughs> Trisha sent us in an image. This is her first attempt at making ah. a book, and this is using your entomology. Yes, or something and one similar. Of, and one of the deluxe uh, book binding kits as well, oh. which has got the fabric and it's like a faux suede spine. Oh. And it looks really good. And an extra tassel that's been put on there as well. That looks Isn't really that good. gorgeous? Yeah. She says she's, uh, oh, and she's done your paperclip thing there as well. Yeah. She says uh, she's absolutely delighted with the result and she's on her second project now. Absolutely Brilliant. loving it. She says the quality um, and value for money is amazing. I, I, I agree wholeheartedly because I think that price well, point... Well, thank you for sending that in. I do, I do like it when people send in images Aww. or put them on my Facebook group as well because it gives other people inspiration as well. Absolutely. Um, and, you know, people can see it is achievable. Absolutely. You you says, thank you, Jamie, be, for yeah. encouraging people to have a go. You're welcome. Yes. I have had people say that buy like one of every kit and they're like, I'm addicted. I'm like, I'm not even sorry. <laughs> I'm not even sorry that you're now addicted. Well, we need to, we need to go for the, the full kit and have a little look on the web because you missed the entomology kit this morning, uh, which was fabulous as well with the bugs and the butterflies. Now the full kit, I will say we're about three quarters gone. And remember, once it's gone, it has gone. So we've sold out of the papers now. So really what you're doing is you're getting a selection of all those lovely papers because you're getting your zebras, your giraffes, your, your lovely gorgeous birds there and your fabulous elephants so there'll be plenty of uh, lovely images left over as well we've got on two flexi by payments of 27 pounds 48 or a one-off payment of 54 pounds 96 968177 we do have the digi images still as well 699 bottom of the screen so what can we show me now well i'm going to show i know the time. print packs have gone but obviously we've got the digi kits and yes. the, it's the same images same images so Great. you can print them at whatever size you want so it depends on your printer settings 
um, as to what size and what you can actually print them onto. So I'm just going to show yeah, you how to do... Yeah, same material and all sorts. Yeah, so about that. again, yeah. it depends on your printer and what you can feed through it. Yeah. Um, you can print on tissue paper, so... Ooh. I will try and talk and cut at the same time. Mm. Um, I'm just trimming this down, basically. Um, yes, yeah, so it's if you're going to try different media, obviously check with your printer settings yes, course, what, yeah. what it suggests you can put through. But when it comes to things like tissue paper, obviously you can't really feed tissue paper through a printer. No. But what you can do is attach it to freezer paper. So mm. if you get freezer paper, yeah. you can iron it onto the back and it will adhere it. Oh. Enough to go through your... Look, I said I'm going to talk and do, and then I'm just standing here chatting. Now. No, this is a top tip. <laughs> I didn't know this was a thing you could do. So, or oh. you can just... Let me take a bit more off of the side here. Um, or you can use some low-tack masking tape to attach it to a, a thicker paper. Mm -hmm. So, again, it will run through. Just make sure there are no oh. loose ends that will catch on your printer. Yeah. Or you can use a temporary spray adhesive. Yeah, great. But Good like ideas. I said, just just double check uh, what will go through your printer and what won't. Um, fabrics are the same. You can back them using a freezer paper, that sort of thing. Great. So it just really opens up, um, you know, what you can do with the images, really. So all I'm doing is just going around the edge with some walnut stain. It just gives it a little bit of an edge, and what I'm doing is just overlaying it onto one of the repeat patterns. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to stick it down, and then I'll trim. But yeah, depending on... I did have... So I had a surprise gift come to me in, um, in the mail. Ooh. Opened it up. I mean, I get a lot of deliveries at home for products and, and all yeah. sorts of things. So I thought, I don't remember ordering anything. Opened it up and I thought, what is this? And there was a couple of printed mugs and a, and a mouse mat and it all oh. had my images on oh. with, a, with an anonymous um, oh note in there. So I did find out who it, who it was. Um, but yeah, she had bought one of the digi kits and she had printed them. Well, like, yeah, of course herself you can do all that. And That's sent them to me. Yeah. So the only thing is with the uh, digi kits, you can print off as many as you want. You can sell items as long as they're handmade. So when it comes to things like the mugs and everything, that would be for gifting and for yourself. Yeah. Okay. Rather than rather selling than selling and, them. Yeah, gotcha. um, but yeah, it was just, it was lovely. I just opened it up and I was, it's not very oh, often, gorgeous. you can probably tell it's not very often I'm speechless, but <laughs> I was like, <laughs> really taken I was back. literally ah. trying, right, do I recognise the handwriting? Ah, Who lovely. is this from? <laughs> the, the, the anonymous, yeah, gifter. So I'm just going to back this with um, black. Lovely. Just to show it off. And I've put a little bit too much glue on here because I'm just not really paying attention to what I'm doing. <laughs> So you can see how quickly you can make a card front. Yeah. Um, I've just got some. But We've you got can ten see. Minutes, Janie, oh, so have we? Yeah, We've still got ten minutes. minutes. Yeah. Okay. So let's see if I've let's see if I've sized it correctly or not, because really bad folding there. <laughs> because what I'll do as well then. Oh, look at that for guesswork. That's not hey, bad, is it? She's a professional, isn't she? <laughs> <laughs> And then what I'll do is I'll see if I can find That's a lovely. butterfly in there. Because I did actually pack away my stamps from this morning, otherwise I could use my build yeah, butterfly. You could. Part of the entomology. Um, so we'll have a in look through morning. and see what we've got here. Do you know what? I might take that one out of there. So and this is, I'm sure, like a lot of people, this is my type of crafting. I'll start one thing and then go, oh, I could do that. Or well, <laughs> let's put that tangent. in there. So what I'm going to do is cut out, but I'm not going to waste the rest of it. I'm going to no. cut out the butterfly. And I always say, if anyone watches back from this morning or did watch this morning, you yeah. see like the little paper clip that I did because oh, it was delightful. even little elements of paper... Not you can make it. use of them, and if you yeah. do journaling, it's all little things like that um, that make a difference. 
you know, we had the lovely um, we had the lovely paperbacks this morning with the, the with the tags and the bugs and then but they were all different. You had vellum, you had 90 GSM, you had cartridge, you had card. Um, it was it was a lovely pack, and I think that was 45 in the pack. So that had a sort of the bugs and the entomology theme. It was just delightful. So if you want to have a little look on the web, there it is there, 14.99. Yeah, really beautiful. Just while we're on the subject of butterflies and dragonflies and beetles and bugs. Uh, 462266. It had some lovely um, signs on there. Not signs. What was it? The labels. The labels. Yeah. Museum labels. It's really yeah. lovely. Lovely pack, that one as well. So, yeah, different kind of um, feel the, to, yeah. to this. And you can tell that I'm kind of getting myself ready for the Caribbean as well. Yeah, all these, yes, it's all, all these the colours now. You know, not to rub it in or anything. No. I, well, I wouldn't want to do that. It. No, I don't think I have mentioned it. Have I? <laughs> 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 so, I like this. Yeah, I'm just I'm making use it. of this, and let's see what I can if I can get another layer out as well, because this is also kind of how I work when I'm designing them. Mm -hmm. It's like how many layers because you've got so see this layer of ferns here yeah. it's repeated there and then what I've done is I've put it behind the background color so then it yeah. pushes it back so you know there's there's loads of layers in there so I Gives might that depth. go yeah. that way or right I'm gonna stick this side down and I'm gonna lift it slightly I think so Lift it slightly like that, mm -hmm. and then let's go in with, let's cut around this bit, so there's another little butterfly in there as well, and we'll overlay that one, let's go around here, so you could get your glue gel on here and get some real dimension in. Hmm. And then again, you could do you could do another layer, another layer there. But it just shows you if you you know if you've done some prints, yeah. you might have done another project and you've got a few bits left over. You can always make use of them. And Beautiful. I mean, how quick was that? That was. Cool. A, I know. We've still got a good five minutes. Yes. <laughs> what else will we well, I'll up? tell you what we'll do then. Let's find. I'll have a the quickest recap while you have a quick think. Then. Okay. Um, so we've got the four beautiful notelet kits. Most of you now are going for all four. That gives you two of the TN, the tall notebooks, and two of the A6. We've got the elephants, we've got the beautiful birds, we've got the zebra, and we've got the giraffes. And you get everything in there to make an individual kit. Your charms, your sari silks, your material, your bookbinding needle, your grey board, your sugar paper, and then the cartridge paper there as, as well. Eight sheets, so that folds into, you know, 16 sheets, if you, if you like, 16 sides there. For, well, more than that, isn't it? So... 16 sheets there in each of those uh, signature notelets. So beautiful. And then you'll have loads left over as well. You can get them individually at the bottom of the screen, 14 99 They're paired in um, tall notebook or A6. So it's choosing which option you want then for 14 99 At the moment, individually, the busiest one, all the elephants. Well, that was my favourite, the elephants. It really was. That's beautiful. But majority now are going for all of them. Um, don't forget as well, we have some availability of all of these images that sold out on the printed papers on the digital download for 6 99 So if you're loving them, and then you can just print, as Janie was explaining to us, on different um, material surfaces and what have you, and then you can also choose the size and what have you as well. 6 99 Got about four and a half minutes now, Janie. Okay, so what I'm going to do is we'll go back to, to a book kit. Um, and just show you, so had I have bound all of those together, you'll have a good amount of your wax thread left over. Yes. So let's Ooh. let's make a dangle, shall we? A lovely dangle, yes. Because so, I was looking at how we touch that uh, sort of paper clip on yeah, the corner. Yeah, it's ideal as well just to give you a, a rough idea of what you get. So you've got three sari silks in each kit. Obviously the colours vary depending on the kit. Yeah. And then you get three mixed fibres as well. Again, they all vary depending on the kit and the colours that we go for. Mm. Um, you've got in here a bulb clip as well. So that's oh. what we attach the dangle 
to the book to the with. Book. Yeah. Because also, if you were gifting this and someone's using it, they might not want the dangle flapping oh. around while they're right. using it. Removable dangle. But because you've not stitched it on, oh. you could use that on something else. It could go Lovely. on a bag. It could it could yeah. go on whatever you want. Options. So, easiest way I find of doing it is there's glue all over my fingers is we just tie a knot into the wax thread and again mm -hmm. this is this is you I mean you can do it however however you want so we've got a little hanger there mm -hmm. which that one will loop through okay right. we'll now just find roughly the center point and we will tie it off like that and then I'm going to do another I'm assuming it's called an overhand knot don't know that's what I'm calling it anyway if it, even if it's not <laughs> it's my overhand knot so that they hang down rather than kind of splitting out sideways okay so that's the the basic dangle what I would then do is cut off a bit of one of your fibers and we'll wrap round here so it becomes a bit more like a tassel top yeah and we'll just tie that off do a double knot just so it doesn't slip off and then i'll just trim some of the excess okay so that's your basic dangle yeah and then i'll just show you some of the embellishments yeah. some of the charms that you get so you've got two silver colored beads i've got fluff and glue all over the place uh -huh. uh, three silver colored charms and then you've got your beads as well so i'm just going to show you with this one which is what you mentioned earlier yeah, well, um, a minute and a half okay so this one has got if you can see right. um quite a wide feed on it yeah which is perfect for feeding on to go on sideways like that and you just need to tie a knot to make oh. sure it doesn't slip off nice and simple but again you might just want you just might want the fibers and yeah. use the beads for something, something else, else. Yeah. or if you were doing um one of the paper clips that we did earlier yes you can pop a bead or a little yeah. dangle on the top of that so you can make things go further or the lady earlier who's the lady that did earlier was it pamela yeah. or pat um uh, she did a tassel, lovely yeah. tassel, gorgeous. Yeah, uh, Janie, do you know when you're back when when you're back from your travels? Um, you see, when I'm when away for we... five weeks, so I need to get another date. So I'm not sure yet. We're not sure, but, but um... we look forward to it, my darling. <laughs> Can I just say a massive thank you? It's been absolutely thank you. gorgeous to have you yes, with us. It's been a while. Yeah, I know. And we're so grateful to have you back. And a lovely, lovely, gorgeous kits, and we've really enjoyed. And I, it I am doing a bookbinding retreat in June as well. It's the <gasps> oh. first time I'm hosting my own weekend retreat. And so. how do we find out about that? Uh, you can just uh, look up on my website or on Facebook. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah. Book binding treat there in June. Sounds like splendid fun. Uh, so don't miss out on that. We'll have a look on that, uh, uh, the website and uh, Janie's uh, Facebook page. Right. Thank you so much. Thank you. Don't forget to enjoy the Caribbean. I will try. Mm. It's a chore. Someone's got to do know. it. I know. It's a dirty job. Somebody's got to do it. <laughs> uh, don't forget to check out your baskets. We've got lots more coming up. Uh, let's just see what's on in store today. Well, we're going to join Leonie now and Hayley for the All In Create One Day special. And then I'll join Lucy for another hour of the sweet poppy stencils. And then we will return to the Paper Shop Pastel Paper Weekend. Hi, I'm Lou from Studio Light. Studio Light has been around for about 40 years now. They're based in the Netherlands. It's a family run business with a great heritage. Over the 40 years, Studio Light have evolved. They listen to me, the demonstrator, and you, the customers, and really take our ideas on board. So make sure you don't miss the Studio Light shows. Hi, I'm Sarah from White Gecko Craft Lounge. We have a little shop in Dinners Powers, which is between Cardiff and Barry, so right by the seaside, and we were established six years ago. There's three of us that run the business. It's myself, Sarah Jane and Sean, 
and we have a host of uh, volunteers and community members that help out too. So don't miss the White Gecko shows. Exciting news! For the fifth year in a row, the craft store has been awarded the top accolade of the Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences, as rated by you, our customers, and we are honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence, based on the reviews from over 60,000 the craft store customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. Hello then and welcome back. Well, it's midday, 12 o'clock, another fresh look at our one day special. And it's been an amazing deal. It's been one that you have been loving. We've been very busy with this one. 60% um, of the stock has gone, but don't forget the price is going to go up at six o'clock regardless. But to be honest, when so much of the stock has gone already, it could potentially be that it sells out before we get to that point. But I need to let you know, one day special it will go up at six o'clock this evening. Um, and I don't know if you caught the show earlier on eight o'clock. We didn't have a major plant, which I probably shouldn't say out loud really, but it was kind of the way that you craft. That's the thing, isn't it? Many of us will get items out. Sometimes we have a plan, sometimes we don't. Sometimes we just want to spend a crafty hour and that's exactly what we did at eight o'clock. So if you do get the chance, do go back and have a little look and you will see just how very useful these are, not only in their own little bundle as a one day special, but also as kind of adding in along the range. And this is the thing, I mean, obviously I'm back here with Leone. Um, and uh, I have to say, um, yeah, we had a lovely time just uh, chatting is, about them. Yeah, and this is what I love about these collections, the versatility. Yes. So obviously um, you can just use them as they are, you know, mm. which is amazing because they're brand new. Um, it's Janet uh, going into the, the realms of proper storytelling yes. and loads of those characters that we immediately recognise. But for me, what makes these really cool is I can then go back to my old collection. Yeah. I can start digging those out and make making them completely different totally and for, I love going oh my gosh that works with that so well oh yes. my gosh look when you do this I yeah. love that yeah. then because it, it just it makes them all come to life again all it the old stamps it makes them new again I it think. really does yeah. and it just it means you're creating something different for you yes you're not just using the stamps as they are you are actually becoming the storyteller That's for me that that is what it's all about I and the images it. are Yes. They are so I much love fun. this one. I think this is the one where she's brought the chair. There's one of them oh, that okay. she smashed the chair up, and it just makes me laugh because the poor Brett look, look, oh, she, she smashed is. the chair up. <laughs> Ooh. Goldilocks is having a bad day. She is. She, she had is. lumpy porridge. <laughs> she did indeed. Now you will recognise many of the stories I am sure from those characters, but of course they can be tradi traditional stories. They could be your own slant on these. Mix up those stories. Get Beauty and the Beast involved with the bears. That will be a very interesting story, I'm sure. <laughs> And of course, you've got Puss in Boots there with the little characters. You've got Jack and his beanstalk feature in there. Now, they are available in the individually, but I will warn you, if that's the way you're choosing to shop with these, then some of them are um, limited in stock. So, of course, you're not going to get the saving if you go for them individually. But if you go for them all together, you can see what an amazing saving. Now, you'd normally be paying $7.99 for each one of these. So, of course, that brings us up to the price that you can see on your screen. But with the Freedom, not Freedom, the one-day special price, mm -hmm. should I say, um, you have got that fabulous saving of six pounds with these ones um so it's almost like you're getting one of those as a bonus now the one day special that we've got is amazing 
brilliant deal, been very popular too, Flexi Buys. But what we have got is a bumper bundle, including you one day special, um, and another bump and a bigger saving as well. So do check out the complete section um, of these because lots of you have gone for these all together. Because with these, you're going to get the savings from the one day special, you're going to get your savings from the transportation bundle as well, and then you are going to get that additional £7 saving. But look at the price on this one three Flexi Buys of £35.95, which opens up your Flexi order which means you can add lots of other elements in which you were doing because we were looking at some fabulous stamps earlier on but just meant you got even more top hats moustaches all sorts mm. of fabulous things but we'll chat about that in a little while let's have a look at that fabulous deal to start with so one day special taking it back to that Leone what have you got planned right I want to play again because as I said this is why for me um that everything's so fabulous. I'm rummaging because obviously I've put it in a safe place already. Uh, so you will find on the website um, an amazing pick and mix. Now your pick and mix, uh, uh, you've got the A6s and you've got the A7. So these are Janet Klein's that have been brought out in the past. So please do have a look because it's a really good deal. What I love about the pick and mixes, if you've missed any of the old collections, or maybe it has been a big collection, but you only really want two of them out of that collection. Yeah. So it's put you off getting the full collection. The pick and mix allows you to go in and cherry pick. So you make your own bundle. So I've been looking at that. This is one of the A7 ones. I must admit, when these came out, this I love this one. Yeah, I, I just it's think useful. it's one of them that is super useful. Yeah. So as soon as I saw this collection, it was like having that. Because <laughs> this, this goes so well with this collection. So... What I'm going to do is bring in, first of all, my free advice stand. Um, this has been a really well-used and well-loved stamp. It's one of those that you can you bring it out with every, you, literally every collection you, that you know, Janet brings. You can tell a good stamp because there's usually a mask attached to it. Because yeah. it's one of those ones that you use a lot. Yeah. So having the mask there is a useful one. Now, um, pick a mix on your screen there. You've got two Flexi Buys there, um, £15.96. Just as Leonie's stamping this up. Obviously, you've got different options. This one that we're chatting to you about, you're going to choose any eight. A phenomenal saving of 32 pounds on these but of course if you want to go for a smaller bundle we do have an option for you to get hold of three and those are any three that you choose there's quite a selection there now 17 pounds and 97 pence will get you three now think about that with your bigger bundle you're actually paying less than that and you will actually get eight stamps in total that's your first flexi buy for 15 pounds and 96 pence but the second payment will be in a month's time so you're actually spending less than you would have if you were just choosing three to start with i know you've got your second payment but it is worth going for that bumper bundle because you will buy more of these um, and it's a huge saving uh, similar sort of idea with regards to your a6s we've got pick and mixes on there as well pricing differs obviously because of the size of the stuff we're still looking at a7s so here it might be a while we need some elevator music really yeah. while we're going to this. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah you'll keep going you might yeah oh, hey, we're at the bottom there. Um, so there's lots there that you could be going for and some brilliant reviews and again you'll know that there's some kind of stories in there as well we saw obviously um i think it was the wizard of oz series wasn't it you could actually bring those in with these as well um you can have loads of fun oh there's and this is a beautiful thing about it it's endless yes you know and you keep digging them out you keep digging out those classics right as our Haley says i have indeed got a mask with this one that's getting a bit battered really it's about time <laughs> i created a new mask um but pop that little mask on there like so Bob it on like this. Really, I only need the bottom of it for now. There. Okay, so got my little mask. Now, with this one, what I decided was um, I'm going to bring in my fabulous little bears. Okay. So my bear is actually going to be working um, the, the little stall. Right. Okay, now... I feel, I feel that, um, let's see if I see, I think Mama Bear is going to be um, working the stall. Um, mm. And it's, uh, what I, I wonder go, what she'll be selling. Actually, actually, you could do it like this. Now, this is where, obviously, I, I'm off on my little tangents again. Because <laughs> it's like, to. oh, you could do this, but then you could do this. And, oh, there's so many things, so many things. <laughs> so, bring in Daddy Bear. Okay. Like this. So, he's going to be like this. And I've masked it, so it's fine. Okay, boom. Now, I might just get a bit of scrap cardstock. In fact, I'll cut it on here. Because okay. what you could actually do, let me have a little thing. You could actually oh, stamp his little arm. 
Stamp his little... I love his little bow tie. They're very decoportable. Yes. I mean, realistically, rather than stamping it directly on, you could just decoportion him and pop um, his little arm over the top. But see what I'm doing here? So okay. I've stamped that like so. Right. I'm just going to cut out his little arm like this. Okay. Okay. Like this one. My goodness, nearly two-thirds of the stock has gone of this one. Um, so don't forget, it's the deal or the quantity, really, isn't that the key thing with this one? So the deal is there right the way through until 6 o'clock this evening. You've got nine stamp sets. Um, there's a lot of content in each one of those um, sent, um, sets as well, because that's the beauty with regards to this one. You've got the supportive elements. So you kind of got little nods and references to the different stories that you've got with here. And then you've got some quirky ones, because that's what Janet does. And do check out some of the other things that we've got on the show as well well um there's some brilliant things as well as the pick and mix but i'll show you those in a little while how are you getting on over there oh, fabulous so i've chopped his little arm off because that can come over the top you see oh like i that. see right yeah um i think i think i'm okay there i think that's all i'm gonna do with that one so there he is <laughs> behind his it. little stand which is marvelous what i've already stamped and this is from our little goldilocks so obviously a wonderful goldilocks she's there okay. she's also got this porridge is just right <laughs> and then she's got a table with all three porridges on so what i've already cut out is this porridge is just right. The oh, size of that, though, fabulous. The, the size of that, I don't actually need to cut that out. So the size of it, I could just, if I wanted to, take that and actually, oh, do you know what would look cool? See, now this is why it's cool. You start just going yeah. off, don't you? You start with one idea and then it, it just expands and expands and expands. So you've got this porridge is just right, but then, look, the stand is Papa Bear stand. Oh, so look. it's going to have a little sign, Papa Bear. So the the little stand, I could have <laughs> it. I could have it as an extra little um, thing coming down like yeah. this. So I'll glue it on like that, and like then a have a little string <laughs> like this. Oh, perfect. So it's Papa Bear stand. I would have to glue it down. How cute is that? <laughs> I, I really, really like that. Oh, see. If oh, this doesn't just... It could be cinnamon porridge. Could it? it could be raisin porridge. And then, porridge. obviously, the little porridge. So I've already cut out some of the little porridge bowls. <laughs> I haven't coloured them in yet. So the little porridge bowls are there. Where have I put his arm? Oh, I've lost his arm. Sorry, Papa Bear. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, there it is. <laughs> There's his arm. And then he's got his little arm like that. <laughs> and he's serving, he's serving one of the porridge bowls. Like Fabulous. This. So he's got his little porridge bowl yeah, like that. Brilliant. Now, I haven't cut out Goldilocks yet. I was going to cut out Goldilocks. Um, so instead of Goldilocks, it's Puss in Boots. As it would be. Coming to well, buy he's, he's some porridge. He's got a long journey. He's got a long journey to go on, hasn't he? He needs his porridge yeah. to get started. <laughs> he needs his porridge. And, I mean, you could have... You could have like one of the the crazy birds on top there. <laughs> I do like those crazy birds. They're good for you. Aren't they If you didn't want anything quite that huge, you could easily pop just one of your little pigeons <laughs> who comes with. That's the that. way. Isn't that fabulous? And then bring in one of your little bunny rabbits. In oh, it, what they in, have in now. And these would be brilliant. If you've got those little tiny googly eyes as well, you could be adding those yeah. to those characters as well. So you? This is Loads this is what I love. The the fact that I'm gonna glue these down so they don't go missing. The fact that every single time I can create something different. Yeah. Every single time I can bring in other lovely little elements, they're gonna go, they're gonna they're gonna allow me to create something different every single time. Like and you're I making your own stamps, that. isn't yeah. it, with the elements that you there. literally you you are creating you are are literally designing you know and it's fun <laughs> and it's sweet and it's just uh it's addictive that's what this is it's really really addictive it's hours and hours <laughs> yeah and it's i mean look i mean this is i think this is lovely because papa bear imagine that as like your your little father's day card <laughs> papa bear with his lovely little porridge stand that's fabulous how cute is that, that? 
that. really cute, Arlie. Only thank you. Oh, I'm so oh, happy. That is brilliant. <laughs> Love this. And you know what? She's not even added any colour to that. So that's the yeah. thing. You can just play around with these, build up your concept, build up your idea, and then go back to them at later stage. So that's why this is proving to be so popular. Your one day special, nearly two thirds of the stock has gone. You are going to have so much fun with this. And I can't wait to see those stories that you create with these. Now, if you wanted to go for them as individuals, you can see at the bottom of your screen, you've got the A7 ones there at $7.99. So that is your price, but you don't get a saving if you're going for those individually. If you do go for them in the bundle, well, you can see your £6 saving is pretty much covering the cost of that one. Now, if you're going for the larger stamp, because your A6 stamp being the three bears, that is normally $11.99. So that's your standard price for um, your A6. Um, but so you can see all coming together just so as you know the prices with regards to these individually so when you bundle them all together and you take the saving um, of six pounds off there it makes it a very affordable way for you to get hold of these um, it's pretty much that you're paying half price really for the very best one when you think about it really isn't it six pounds twelve pounds um, and yeah makes sense now if you're wanting to go for these these are the latest collection from Janet Klein um, February 2022 she's released these ones if you are a collector of her work you will love these straight away but so many Many of you have been loving them and because you can use them in loads of different ways it doesn't have to be a reference to the story at all if you don't want to but I do love the fact that you have got some very quirky little sent sentiments there you've been on my mind and there's Jack climbing up his beanstalk as you've got there I love this one um, we were looking at Puss in Boots earlier on and I love that the bird on his hat there you see, possibly they could have had a hat stand, couldn't they, rather yeah. than being a uh, father of the bear there with the, the porridge. Oh, um, my gosh. Do you know what you have got as well on one of the um, the extra stamps? Okay, what is um, it, Picky Mix? All the hats. Oh, So you could there? have some boots with just an amazing collection of hats. Oh, mm. I love it. Yeah, oh, I see. Did you get to even realise that was the thing? Oh, it's the thing. I, must admit, I do love this one because it's always like the, the pigeons got kind of caught up with like the, the rabbits. <laughs> Wondering and what's like, going what, on. Yeah, what's happening? <laughs> why, why, I don't know what the queue's about, but I better join. Yeah, we, we do like a good queue. We love we? a queue. Uh, and I love this one because this, <laughs> the wolf, is the least scary wolf you could possibly yeah. come across. I love that. Uh, and it's almost like a Little Red Riding, uh, riding Hood is saying, actually say there, what big eyes you have. <laughs> I love these absolutely brilliant so you're gonna have loads of fun with these making your own stories using them in their scenarios that are the traditional scenarios as well but also alongside other things do check out those hats go look for that hat stamp now sounds good and uh, details on your screen if you're wanting your one day special but of course I mentioned that bigger bundle not had a chance to show you these stamps during this hour so let me introduce you to the transportation set or the transport set you're going to get a set of four stamps and you are getting a stencil in addition to these again these are Janet's work and again they are brilliant for you to work with alongside the fabulous bundle that we've got and they're just in keeping with everything that um, Janet brings to us size wise absolutely perfect sizes to work alongside the characters but it's just a lovely quirky little set this one and obviously her artwork you just recognize it a mile off don't you um, love the personalities I love the washing line and things like that and there's just so much you can do with these you can have absolutely loads of fun um, love the little, the, the little camper. I think it's the camper van and the little yeah. buses. They're just fabulous. Oh, I love these. When I first saw them, it, it was another one of them. You know, when you just, it's like, oh my gosh, they yes. are amazing. And there's so much you can do with these, but they extend your range. Yes. So they allow you to, to go into the city. They allow you to build up um, such an incredible collection. I mean, look at them. The camper vans they're are cute. ace. They're absolutely <laughs> The finished samples are just adorable, and there's oh, it's easy to cut out. They're easy to colour in, but yeah, they they fit so many different, um, so I many this. different. I just looks. have the urge to do it, all the is. sounds. Beep honk go. Yeah. Beep traffic jam. That's a M6. Stop <laughs> jam. <laughs> <laughs> the hall it. of the M6. <laughs> uh, I love the buildings as well. And I have to say, this is such a clever idea. I don't know who's made this on Philippa. I have to say hats and off to you. That is a brilliant, mm. but, and I love the way that you've kind of put the little washing lines kind of hung between the different buildings as well. Really clever design. So much you can do with these. Lots of you are going to have fun with this. And I must admit, this is going to be a useful one. I mean, Jo, you're a woman of your own heart. If you've got to get that washing dry, just exactly. do it whichever way you can. <laughs> whichever way you that. can. I love that. I love that. It's just, it's a genius collection, is that? Brilliant. And it's, it's, it's a proper Janet one. 
one. You know, it's cute and funky and fabulous. I love it. There you go. If you fancy getting hold of your complete bundle, obviously it's going to incorporate the transport that we've just been looking at, but you can get hold of it by itself at the bottom of the screen. But again, you won't have any savings when you're... Oh, sorry, not at the... Yes, it is the transportation. Is it? It's not the whole bundle, though, is it? It's now that each... Right, OK. So it, that's if you're going for one of those stamp sets because of it being an A6 $11.99. But if you're wanting the four of them together, then there is a way that you can get hold of these. So this is separate to the one-day special. This is separate to the larger bundle, but it has got a little bit of a saving attached to it. Yeah, this one, if you wanted to get hold of it, you've got your seven... Uh, set a, try again. Your A6 stamps, mm -hmm. and you've got your stencil as well, all coming to you for that price with a £10 saving. But you don't lose that saving if you're going for the larger bundle as well. So, right, okay, so you've got £6 from the one day special saving, you've got a £10 saving from this bundle, £16. Put it all together, so you've got your £16 saving plus the saving as the larger bundle. So that £7 saving is in addition to the £16. You're saving £23 overall, giving you a phenomenal price of £107.86, but then you can spread the cost. And that is the beauty, making it a very affordable way to get hold of this over three flexi-buy payments. First payment will go out of your account today, um, straight away. Everything will be sent on its way to you, and it is a brilliant deal. Now, bear in mind, if you were going for your one-day special and you were going to spread the cost, you've got two flexis on that one. But that flexi buy payment, the first payment would be how much was it? Like £34.95. So you're actually paying less for the initial flexi buy on the big bundle. It's only a pound extra. Now you have got three payments, so just bear that in mind, but you are getting everything and it's giving you the scope as well. Um, and of course that gives you the ability to get hold of everything. So maybe that's your budget for today. Then why not invest your budget in such a fabulous set that we've got here as well and expand that range because I know that you'll be fans of Janet's already as well. Um, 441353. Now obviously this is Janet's work and I have to say the next set of stamps works along alongside it brilliantly but a different artist so sometimes they kind of come together and I love this because I think it's Tracy Evans that's if I remember rightly is it Tracy Evans it is Tracy Evans on these two but they don't look out of place alongside the one day special that we've been looking at and this little toadstool has I mean this is beautiful it's a lovely little set incredibly affordable at 9.98 you've got a six pound saving on this this is a really good saving. Oh, I love this. Isn't and it cute? the reason I wanted to look at these because they're the fairy tale. You know, yes. the fantasy, the fairy tale. So for me, when you're building up your beautiful fairy tale world, yes. um, these are absolutely perfect to go with them. And yeah, that saving is amazing. And obviously, you can pop them into your flexi as well yeah, if you're, you're getting it's your like flexi three basket. Three pounds but and yeah, I just, something. yeah. yeah. That's yeah. It. It's a few quid, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, but a very useful little set. Look you can see that. on this one here, I mean, this is lovely. Janet has um, actually decoupaged it up so you can see a nice, simple show. You get the little fairy silhouette. Um, included alongside this one and fairy wishes being your oh, sorry magical wishes being your sentiment with this one the little flowers the heart-shaped flowers there they come courtesy of the other set that you're going to get alongside it but you're getting two stamp sets for 9.98 a very useful set and because you kind of got that quirky fairy tale feel with the one day special, do you like that? That's me, little quirky fairy tale dance <laughs> then. Then it's definitely worth adding in alongside your one day special. Um, a 390160, if you like the look of those. Let's face it, what's not to like? They're going to be a useful set to go for. Um, they've been flying out. You have been loving these so much so that a quarter of the stock has gone. Um, and bear in mind, we have had sellouts during the one day special shows. Um, so, uh, yeah, I think I might be showing you that set a little bit later on that's back on extended delivery. But let's talk pick and mix. Leonie was talking about this, and this is a really useful way for you to fill in gaps that you might have, or maybe you're brand new to um, the range. Obviously, you've got lots of new view uh, viewers joining us. Well, All and Create and the lovely Janet brings us these most incredible characters, and they're quite a back catalogue with these. So if this is the first time that you've seen them, then the pick and mix is the perfect way to go. Now, there's lots of choices, way more than I can show you in the flesh here. But what we've given you here is kind of a little idea of what your set of eight could look like. So it might be that you're going for some of these characters. Um, again, they're all sized very well to work alongside each other. So it might be that you choose any one of these to be your Goldilocks. Maybe she's having a cup of tea alongside a porridge. Not a bad mm -hmm. way to start the day. Um, all of these fabulous characters are available during, during that kind of picnic. Again, you might mix up your storybooks. Maybe get the scarecrow and the lion involved, as you can see here. It's your 
your story. And this, with this one, you're going to choose any eight. Now, they don't have to be the eight that we've chosen and popped out on the counter. They can be your own choice. And the details are on your screen there. So two flexi buys of £15.96. There are absolutely loads of them on the website. I'm going to sit down because it's going to take us ages <laughs> to get through these. You've got all Feet sorts. Up. So whatever hobby, whatever theme, you will be sure to find something along those lines. Whether it's your bunnies that you're into there or you just want to make your wishes, then you can see there you've got some fabulous elements there, as you can see there. Um, so if you're wanting to get hold of those, then please do so. Pop them into your basket, but do check out your A6 um, stamp sets as well. Again, different prices, different item numbers, but loads and loads of choice. Absolutely loads of choice to go for. I love it. So there you go. That's how, and you just add them to your basket. I should have told you really how to take advantage. You just kind of click on add to basket. Pretty much a nice and easy, <laughs> isn't it? Um, yeah, uh, click the plus, add them to your basket, check your order out. That's the way that it works. But we have got a bundle. Now, this bundle is a fabulous one. Leonie was working with this one during the last hour as well at 8 a.m. this morning. Um, a really nice set. So all four of these coming to you with a huge saving. You're saving £12 on these. £15.96. Now, they're really nice because you've kind of got fluid edges to these, and you've loved these. I mean, Leonie, you were working with these in the oh, last yeah. hour. I love them. And you've got, I mean, you've got four different stencils here. Um, the thing is with these, you've got a lot, a lot of choice. You know, so... Obviously, you've got the art. Sorry, I'm talking about. I mean, you can't. Shall I point? Um, so, uh, yeah, the top okay. one has got the the art in that. I love that because. Um, uh, because you can pick out the words um, obviously with that mm -hmm. one you've got so many different elements and I love that because for different backgrounds you've got so many different ones um, available the I next one the big one. chunky yeah. flowers they're a really good one for printing with not yeah. just for, for obviously stenciling through uh, your next two now in the last hour you see I was love using them yeah, that's I was the one you used this. wasn't it in the last hour it's yeah. amazing is this because you've got them open edges so it's not a solid um, stenciling that you haven't got solid lines around yeah. the edge you've got an open edge um, and that means I wonder if we could actually show the stencil there yeah, Haley. is it actually it? there because be. if you don't know what I mean you can see those open edges so it means that um, just Sorry, take probably segments. these black cards. You have, you got, have you got your card that you made earlier on? You, uh, it's on the front of the counter oh, somewhere. Oh, is it? Oh, I okay. do believe. <gasps> but but you can see you've got those wonderful um, and that those edges you see allow you to use it in so many different ways. Yeah. Because you can create borders. Because you can literally um, lift out those fantastic elements. I love that one. It's a strong stencil. Um, the next one along again. Absolutely beautiful. There's so many elements in that. And another, that's another one. Thank you, our lovely Ayla. Um, that's another one where you're using those edges. Isn't it cool? There's and, so much kind of, You know, yeah. I've just looked at that and seen a pair of googly eyes. Yes, kind yeah, like definitely. One, one on the cooker, one on the fridge. You know what I mean? Yeah, Going yeah, in opposite yeah. directions. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Always a cooker on the fridge. <laughs> um, the wonderful, it's, all, it's funny what you can see, because I can almost, um, I can see a surfboard. You know the triangles? Oh, there. See, do you know what? I've just seen va-va-va. Ah, uh -huh, yeah, va-va-va. <laughs> Go with car one. <laughs> Isn't it? I love, love, love these. So, yeah, really good, strong stencils and a great price I as well it. for those so affordable you're actually going to get all four of those i've jumbled up all the packaging um but i think that was that one wasn't it um and i don't know where the pack what i've lost I've, I've only stood here standing oh there you go there it is <laughs> I thought I'd lost it. Um, so there you go. If you're wanting to get hold of those, in fact, let's show you a picture of them. It's probably easier to show you this, isn't it? So with this, you are going to get all of those fabulous stencil contents, all four of them coming together. Brilliant saving, as you can see with this one as well. £12 saving, bringing it right the way down to just £15.96. There are loads of other stencils on the website as well. Might even be a pick and mix with those, so do check them out. You will find absolutely loads, absolutely loads there. Now, um, talking of pick and mixes, we have got another pick and mix to share with you spoke of the a7 a few moments ago but we've actually got an a6 set as well so if you want to erase it again we've just given you a selection now you've got options with these again it could be that you're going for two it could be that you're going for a set of five there's loads of different ways they're the same content the same within the pick and mix it just depends on how many actual stamps you want to get hold of so details on the side of your screen if you're choosing any two then you're just paying 17 pounds and 98 pence we've just given you a little selection we've actually kind of gone 
one down the route of choosing five for you. So if you wanted to go for five, there could be the selection that we've chosen, or there can be whichever selection you so choose yourself. There is a lot of choice there. The funky chicken, I love these chickens. I just think the they're so much are fun. Rare, and these will work so well alongside those characters that we've just been with I the one day you what, special. Your chickens would look good, and I'm going to pass you this. Okay. Have a look at a chicken in a barrel. Chicken in a barrel. <laughs> Chicken, hold on, let's get the package in. Let's get the package in and show you. Which, um, oh, no, hold on, I picked up the wrong one. Wrong side. Hold on, you've left me in control here, Leo, and it could be the biggest mistake of your life with this You're one. in control, Leila. <laughs> right, okay, chicken. Chicken in, chicken in a barrel. I just think, look at that. Uh, well, it's funny where we're you chatting about... You could do one of those slidey cards, couldn't oh, you? Yeah. <laughs> now you see me. Now you know. Or it could be that he's just kind of running around. He's got no clothes on. There you go. He's not, he's not a dressed chicken yet. <laughs> oh, I, re I think they're fabulous. See, your empty barrel. As soon as you just start putting it on that other characters. Is so I must admit, I do funny. like it with the little feet sticking out the bottom as or well. Or just his little bum sticking out, that one there. <laughs> It's like, what is going on? He's and bobbing in a barrel. If you did that, like, you had a little aperture card, so on the front, you just had the little barrel and the bum sticking out, and then when you opened it up, you, you could, could see, see the full chicken. I you it. could do it. I love that, because you can have, you can have such fun. I want to make fun. a slidey card now. Where That'd, be it. Yes. <laughs> That'd be it. That'd be it. And that, the barrel is obviously from your one-day special. It is, yeah. I love it. Now, that's just one of those options. Oh, my goodness, you can have so much fun with these, can you? There's absolutely loads. Now, um, if you wanted to get hold of your set of five, then, of course, jump onto the website, scroll through all the choices. You could be there quite a while. There's a lot there. But this is a perfect way for you to pick up that set that you're missing. You've got your chickens there, chicken dance, that one's called. Um, it could be that you're going for the road trip. And again, the road trip there, you could pop the characters in there, couldn't you? Um, or you could swap out the heads. You've got your head starts there. Maybe take some of those. Or have a seat. Maybe you can and take some of the characters and sit them down. It's entirely up to you. You've got loads and loads of choice there. And I have to say, you've got things like to the market there on Cloud9. We saw that one touched in. Um, and oh, incidentally, the transport one that we were looking at, if you're wanting that one, that is available there as well. Oh, they're brilliant, love it. So, and um, yeah, that's how you work with a pick and mix. Now, this is the set that I was telling you about earlier on that sold out. So, this is a trio. It's now back on extended delivery, 21st of February, and this is a brilliant one to go for. You will have so much fun with this because what you've actually got within here is where you've actually got the. Uh, can I just very quickly show you with this one here? If I turn that round, this will show you the scenario that you've got with these. So, you've got obviously on the packaging, it shows you as your characters with the faces on there, but the faces are actually separate so what that means is those can be separated up and used either with the little ghost there or maybe you want to use them just by themselves there or maybe you want to do as Leone did earlier on and actually introduce them with the one day special that is the beauty of this set it gives you the opportunity to play around with those characters and then you've got the fabulous cat as well the cat earlier on we were making it into grumpy cat grumpy oh, cat and yeah. in boots as well oh we were having such a laugh earlier on you have to go back and watch the show but so don't go now because we're having a laugh now um 210882 um, we're going to head back over to um, Leone. Everything else we've been chatting about is on the website. Individuals. And Leone, you were talking about the packaging. This time around, the packaging is a little different to what we used to. It is. Uh, Janet Stein we've and, and actually got uh, coloured packaging, which is brilliant because it inspires you. So sometimes when you're colouring these in, it can be a little bit like, oh, where do I start? What do I do? Yes. But yeah, the packaging this time, she's got that inspiration. So immediately you've got some idea of how to colour these in and I think that is really really handy funnily enough I've picked up Pussy, um, Puss in Boots there and that's oh, the one grumpy cat. Grumpy cat. so my story on this one is right <laughs> so normal cat I mean it's looking at this thing because this thing drops up <laughs> in his fancy costume and this Mr Normal Cat is like what on earth are you what are you doing what 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 are you doing in human clothes whereas Puss in Boots is looking at this cat going you're naked mate <laughs> Put some clothes on. What I, are you doing I with your pigeon the cat's on your head? Like, You're not from round here, are you? <laughs> <laughs> are you from the abroad? You've come from the big city, haven't you? <laughs> yes, it's come from the city. I, I really like that. It, it's just, and this is again, this is why I love these stamps. You're literally building your story, and it's 
fun. It is. I mean, uh, that, that to me, just sparks your imagination off. Sorry, I'm whipping it away. Sparks your imagination off and you're off. <laughs> okay, so I literally didn't get a bit of card out ready. Are we going to be prepared? I um, forgot to be prepared. That's all right. Oh, my Well, life. the thing is, with these, they come together so quickly, so it doesn't really matter, does it? It doesn't. Uh, right, nice big piece of card. Let's get crafting. So I think I picked up mixed media cards, so this could be interesting, but it's okay. So what I'm doing is, first of all, background. Now, Ooh. this stencil is the one that you get in the big bundle. Nice. Um, it's a lovely stencil because it, it's got all that sort of grassiness, if you will. Mm. Um, I'm using a card bigger than what I'm going to work on, but I will actually uh, cut this down in a little while. I, I love, love this stencil. Thank you, our lovely Hilly. Look at that card. That is that's beautiful. Fabulous. And, and I'm guessing, because of the relief on that, is that kind of like the, the twofer? That's what's been left on the stencil? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can spritz it and everything. Oh, well, get you. Yeah, get you it. can spritz it, do all your inking, and then clean it off. And then you're getting that beautiful, beautiful print. I really like that. Is that our Janet? Of course it is. She's good. That is just exquisite. And I love that she's put a highlight there. Yeah, it's nice really, that, really it? clever. Yeah. Stunning stencil. Obviously, in the big uh, uh, collection. But do check out stencils, I'm sure, um, on the web. When you shop by brand, um, I know Crate and Crate. Uh, Oh, create and craft. Oh, it's all right. I'm allowed to say it. Like oh. say it now. <laughs> My brain. I'm sure all and create have um, like when you shop by brand, you'll see everything on there. Isn't it funny? Once upon a time, it'd be like when you, you say create yourself. and craft, you stop yourself and almost look in horror. <laughs> now it's like, oh no. That's all right. <laughs> that, that, that's that? okay. I know how things change. Who knew that were occurring? So, <laughs> um, I'm creating. Now, when I do my stencils, <laughs> when I do my stenciling, I like to, and I did this last time, um, because I kind of like creating an open space. Okay. So, I like working around. I'm a lazy stenciler. I don't mat, um, pop them down with tape. Um, a, because I can't be bothered, but B, because I don't like wasting my tape. I'm only inking, so it's fine. So, doing it like this, okay. And then, when I pull this away, oh, I've created nice. the open space. I like well, that doing like that. like the forest there. Yeah, <laughs> and it gives it a real movement, mm, doesn't it? Yeah. And the thing is, with this stencil, if you just, say I just sort of flipped it, mm. and then worked, um, worked it again, but say with a darker green, okay. So if I bring this, I might have to oh mix up my colours on my sponge. So just do this like that. <laughs> and then pro this on. And what it does, and I like doing this, because now it builds up my, my layers, okay. but it really, really builds up the um the, the density of that yes. forest light look. And of course, using different colours of the green as well, that really helps because you you bring a different tone into it. So just doing that a couple of times, so oh, you don't that look, look pretty. I really, really oh, like that's that. Really it's nice. a lovely little stencil. Obviously, it's a versatile, aren't they? Stencil? Oh, stencils are just great, so. aren't they? Um, of course, you know I've got a lovely little old stencil there, full of goodness. I won't use that. I will just use water. So if I do a little spritzer, I'm doing my normal thing. Um, let's clean it on the paper. I'm spritzing first because you'll get the the ink moving, and then just bob it down on there and you'll get that gorgeous print. So it means, um, as usual, use a loo roll, as usual. It's, it's, a now, it's a, the latest cut down version of a kitchen roll. I know, stay classy. And then when Don't we... never change, Leon. <laughs> never change. And that's okay. Um, so you've got a lovely little print there. Keep that to one side because you'll absolutely use it. Um, okay, let's bring this back in again. So what we've got is... Um, that gorgeous little background. I will chop this down in a little while. Okay. Um, so then I'm going to bring in on this one. I'm just trying to remember what I'm doing. Um, I'm going to bring in. Let's bring in a little bit of um, a little bit of grass or surface. Oh, then again, a sentiment. There's quite a few little stamps in here. I mean, obviously, with the, the collection we're saying about that you're going to get the, the, bun, the bundles, we talk about kind of, was it nine sets of stamps? But you've got lots of content within there, so yeah. it's always useful to check those out, because sometimes when you get these stamps home, you'll do exactly as I did when I came into the studio. You'll see the characters. 
straight away you'll see those larger elements. But look at the little filler in as I like that. The supportive mm -hmm. stamps that are going to help you build your story and help you kind of extend your design almost as if you're making your own stamps with these. There's the barrel. We saw how useful that one was earlier. Can't get a chicken in a barrel out in the And then, of course, you've got fabulous little sen sentiments like that. I, Captain. I, I. And there's one hey. there that's a, a Ooar, I think. Or, no, no, that's a farmer, isn't it? What was the other one? <laughs> You've got, you've got R, R. R. yeah, that R. and you've got I, I, and I, Captain, and a hi, matey. There you go. See, you did so much better. Right? Um, Beauty <laughs> and the Beast, obviously featuring with these. Oh, okay, and he's not a scary beast at all, is he? Just wants to be a friend. Mm -hmm. um, and there you can see all the fabulous characters there, um, including that very scary, not so scary wolf. Adorable. <laughs> Just a cute wolf. He's very cute. Yeah, really cute. cute wolf. Okay, <laughs> so what I'm going to use is um, mixing it up. Big bundle. In your big bundle, um, you've got this. Now, this is part of the transport one on the big bundle. Okay. You've got this, which works as a border. It always works as. It also works as grass. These, which work as borders, even though they're part of the fabulous lollipop trees. And then on cloud nine. Now. I'm going to use, because I think this will look kind of cool, I'm going to use my On Cloud 9, first of all, and bear with, it will make sense. So, bringing this on here, you have got as part of that bundle a little Cloud 9. Yeah, oh, literally. It's got the number on it. Little Cloud 9. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I looked at yeah, On Cloud, cloud 6. Cloud 6, yeah, that, yeah, yeah. that's. Yeah, that is absolutely. Much, I, that would I, actually happen, wouldn't it? You'd be sat there yeah. thinking, "Where is everybody?" Yeah, I'm, I'm not. I'm not on cloud nine. Why am I not? Why have I got off on the wrong cloud? <laughs> so I've got my little on cloud nine there. I'm then going to use these ones as my little borders. Okay. So I love stamps like this because they they do again. They allow you to play. So oh, using that just one part of it, right. as my little border. Like so. See how cool is that? Just bringing this like this. Again, I'll be cutting this down, so I'm not bothered about it going off the in, off the uh, thingy. What's it do, that? In look fact, at it because because <laughs> that's gone off. This is going to go off as well. So when I cut it down, how nice, good will that look yeah. already? Beautiful. I love it all. Oh, very quickly, can I just give everybody yes. a bit of an update? Um, obviously, um, Leonie's working with a stencil that comes from the big bundle, but obviously what she's doing, you can kind of use with other um, stencils. Um, the bundle that we've got where you've got your four stencils coming together, it works at just £3.99 each. So this is a phenomenal deal for some very, very useful um, stencils. I love working with stencils because you can use them in so many different ways. Go through your die cutting machine, use them on your gel presses, get all sorts of different results, and of course you can flip them over as well if you want into £15.96 but you need to be quick with these if you are wanting them the details are on your screen but 60% of the stock has gone so be quick do not miss out on this £12 saving on those phenomenal deal that there is aren't mm. they I might use them on this one as well depending how um, carried away I get and what how much stuff <laughs> I throw at it okay so I like this I like this border normally in real life I'd take time to colour this in I'm not going to do in this one but if I just colour a tiny bit in, I love it because it really changes it. As soon as you add that pop of colour. Um, I'm working with um, the lovely pencil gel pens that we had on the other day. Oh, and these, these are of course, quite mm, stir, haven't they, these These pens? are really quite nice. The energy gel ones. Did you, are these the ones you got, Lottie? Well, I Oh, I know I asked, I asked so. you about them because I think there was a set that was in the presenters line. I was like, Ooh, yeah, what are they, these? they are lovely. They're so <laughs> rich, they're gorgeous. See, and I'm getting carried away again. But isn't it funny? A little bit of colour. Yeah. It really, really, really makes them come to life. There's also I use these as well. These are delicious. Um, oh, these are your this? dual markers. So okay. you have to give them a shake. Right. But but once you put these on, and these have got glittering. And they're absolutely Ooh. delicious. So it's adding that little bit of colour, but it will add a beautiful bit of shine there as nice. well. Oh, I'm getting really carried away with just the base. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I love doing things like this because, again, you've already, it's already created a lovely border. Anyway, moving on. So that's my base. Let's then bring in um, some flowers and things. Again, 
check out your pick and mix. This is in your pick and mix. You've got lovely little flowers. When you look at your pick and mix, there are a lot of different flowers um, on there. So it's always, always worth having a little perusal. Is there a little character on there? I thought that there's a little girl, but I couldn't yes. quite see. Look. Look. What's um, at the bottom there? This is little curly girl. And I do believe yeah, it's little curly girl. She looks a little bit I think um she looks I like Oh it's a ladybird. Oh, oh the little ladybird. Cute. The ladybird's lovely. I think she looks a little bit like Tracy. Yeah, she does actually. Yeah, she could be like Tracy. Tracy. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna pop a little flower on there. Oh, I might have double stamped it. Oh, I didn't. Isn't that pretty straight away? <laughs> what, do you nice know flower, what? Yeah. Oh, I, I, I do. And that's I, almost like a bit of a bonus, isn't it? Because the main character is the, the main yes. focus of the stamp, so that's yes. it, almost like a bonus. But it, it, uh, yeah, because it's like, okay, that that's tiny little flower, but it absolutely works. Before I build this up into the scene, okay. I'll cut this down so you can start seeing it coming together. Because when it's a full card, you don't see it coming together properly. As soon as you cut it down, it's like, oh yeah, all right then. Let's see where you're going with that. Um, and this is just like when you look at that stencil. When I cut that down, cracking stencil. Oh, this looks nice. See, isn't that I a good love stencil? That. Such a good stencil. I'm going to chop it down a little bit more. But that could be different colours, a kind of glitter elements, if you wanted, or yeah. different um, embossing powders, or different. Well, all sorts, to be honest. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Loads. Love it, love it, love it. Now, where I'm going to go with this, and I've already got these cut out and ready to go. So, I've used our lovely Jack and the Beanstalk. Because the Jack and the Beanstalk is marvellous. So, what we're going to have is little Jack and the Beanstalk, but I'm hiding to get some depth, uh, to get some height, I'm going to pop a little gate in front of him, a little fence. That's on ah. one of your pick and mixers, okay? So it's going to be a lovely little fence there. So it means that we can raise that up a little bit. He's on cloud nine because he's climbing up a beanstalk see, and he's having a lovely time. I think that looked fabulous as well, coming out the side of the card like he's kind of gone to climbing up a tree and he can't get down. What, he's rotated, like that? Yeah, 90 degrees over the other side. Like that? Well, yeah, I was thinking about... Round again, one eight. No, turn it round, 180. There and then against the edge of the card, almost. Oh so it's God. like he's stuck on the branch of a tree. Oh, yeah, I like and that. And he's like, I'm hanging on. I'm That's hanging on. Because if I don't hang on idea. tight, I'm going to fall. That's <laughs> fabulous. I love that idea. That's it. <laughs> Sorry. No, you that's really I love that. These. I love that. It took me ages to work out you're 180 <laughs> degrees, though, didn't it? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm terrible. I were listening, but not listening. I were listening, but not taking the words in. That's right. I get that um, a lot. So, honestly, I'm terrible for that. So, I've got the little hill, and I'm going to put the little look. That's oh, in the distance. It's yeah. far away. In the distance is the little um, the little barn. We've then got, and this again is from that pick and mix. So, it's... Um, the the those that can also be little borders nice. however they could be a lovely little edging so you could put it around there if you wanted to work on it like this i'm not going it down for us for speed now we've got a little cow like this i might have made this a bit small so i might have to do stick that over there a bit and that's going to go there a bit and then a little cow like this oh because the cows are ace. And it's okay with the cows. It can come in front of the barn because it's perspective. Yes. And that's there, and that's there. And then I have done another cow that I've coloured in. But with the cow, now, with your little cows, obviously oh. the eyes are already um, looking up at him as I'll say, oh, what are you up to, mate? <laughs> you can change the eyes, however. So what you can do, okay. if you just take your pencil. Oh, okay, clever. And then do it like this. Yeah, you, you need to. Oh, sorry, I'm holding that a bit wrong. You need to sort of hit the um, the little black dot like so. Yeah. And then put your little black dot in with your um, little pen. So now my little cow is looking at us as old set. Looks like oh. he's got a pair of glasses on as well. <laughs> Put like a bridge across his nose, couldn't you, if you wanted to? <laughs> yeah, you definitely could. <laughs> but then, Two. with a white gel pen, look, you oh, just do your little highlights. Nice. And again, that utterly changes it. Your white gel pen is absolutely... That is... It, it, it's re... <laughs> Dad joke. 
See, see, don't that Perfect. look cool? And, <laughs> and that's the lovely thing about these. Again, you are, look, see, he's doing that, like that, like that. Uh, you could, you could if you wanted. If I hadn't stamped my flower, I'd move this. So if I hadn't stamped my flower, I'd have them there and I'd move him over there like that to give it a bit of distance. Although I have covered up my nine. <laughs> You're getting a bit carried so, away. Yeah. I'm having to put that here like this. Oh, I'm really faffing. Oh, bless you. <laughs> the cows are flying now. It's going to be like this. Cow there. See, it's easy when you're sticking it down, to be fair. <laughs> Cow there. Okay. Born over here with the grass. And I'll do something so it's not flying, but I'm not going to do it on this show because I've spent a lot of time just <laughs> trying to do this. Just playing <laughs> about with cows. Play with cows. And then he's coming in like this, like that. Boom. And he's flying up it, ahead. The little gate, is that included in the stamps? Because that's a useful stamp. As What's well, that one? The, the gate. gate. Seeing your pick and mix, you're going to oh, have to rummage. You. It is, yeah, it's one of those fabulous pick and mixers. It's a and, useful and one to tell have you that. what, I, I would like to do as well. Could I put just a few bits and bobs? Obviously, you'll glue all that down, of course. And um, the stencil set, absolutely fabulous. But this is lovely for adding the extra little elements in. Okay. So, with this one, I want to add a little bit more black in. What I haven't got mm -hmm. is my um my black distress oxide which is annoying because that is the one i need but well, i'll shall have I to use show everybody the stencils and you can have a rummage around um, oh i'm not going to be rummaging for it but short stencils oh, okay <laughs> all right then um very quickly um you've got four of those stencils all within that set there um so these are brilliant um you're going to get four stencils for 15 pounds and 96 pence you've got a brilliant saving on these um lots of you taking advantage works out three pounds and 99 pence each so you've got these lovely ones there you kind of got those open edges. Leone showed us how we can maximise the use of those. This is the one that Leone is working with at the moment. It's got your straight edges but it's got all that arty content in there as you can see. Then you've got another couple where you have got those open areas and the open edges which I think is a really clever way to craft with them. I mean look at that. Isn't that brilliant, having that useful set? Nice one on your gel plates, that one. Um, and then the last one there, again, another one that's going to be perfect on your gel plates, but we saw Leone working with this one earlier on during the 8 a.m. show. So go back and check those out. 515085 if you wanted those. How are you getting on over there, Oh, you? fabulous. I'm really right, having a nice time. Um, so, with this stencil, now this is to bring, because I've got the black in there, it, I'm literally just picking some of these elements out. Now, you will find this stencil is super handy because you've got so many different bits so you can literally just create your little border with the stencil so just being super careful going around like that then can you see dead easy but I've created a fabulous little border there and um, which I love the really nice stencils for doing things like that of those and um, I'm not going to glue this one together I'll do that in break I'm going to start using other stamps instead but you can see where we're going with that one so you're creating aren't they fab it's those cows those cows make me laugh every single time. <laughs> yeah, I just think they? they're absolutely magnificent, aren't they? <laughs> magnificent. Oh, but I love, I love them. I love right. Um, so there you go. And those fabulous little characters, obviously all featuring within the one day special. The cows, Jack and the Beanstalk. And of course, you can add in those additional um, elements from your pick and mixes with, the, with these. Now, we've only got one more live hour with this one. Um, that's at four o'clock this afternoon. So your last chance, it's technically, um, or your last call, should I say. You've actually got up until six o'clock to take advantage of this one so that will be our last live hour and you see this one being demonstrated i love the different elements and the little treasure map i didn't notice that one before um but of course you've got all your different characters there nine stamp sets but of course lots of content within each and every one of those stamp sets bringing you brilliant um, savings and um, that six pound saving if you're going for the bumper bundle is carried forward as well so you're not missing out on that one and you'll get an additional saving if you choose to go for this within the big bundle um, it's all on the website there but the one day special details on your screen are we going back to the one day special again the only yes uh, would you do me a massive favor yeah. and pass me the uh, tracy evans stamps yeah, yeah both yes because these are so cute and yeah. i just thought with these two they work so well with this whole collection and mm -hmm. um, because again the magical and we are this is what we're talking about we're talking about magical uh, beautiful elements i might as well use that background ah. it's there and obviously it's it's perfect because because it's softer and it's a washier one, a washier outier one. I like it that. Done, yeah, 
I like that. It'll work really well with this because it'll give me a really nice soft element. So I'll cut it down so visually um, you can see it and it'll make uh, sense. Oh, when you're rushing. Always, isn't it, when you're rushing. Right, there we go. So we've got that beautiful little background, which is perfect. Um, and then I'll take, first of all, I'll take my lovely little mushroom house. And this, oh, this is just adorable. Absolutely adorable. It's one of those that allows you, again, to create so many different looks, but it's a really nice, um, it is a really, really nice quirky one. I mean, it is so Tracy, it's quirky and fabulous. So you've got your lovely little mushroom house. Obviously not colouring these in, so you're going to have to imagine these. So there's our little toadstool house, which is delicious. We've then got, or I've already done, a little mask. So bring in the little mask in. So like yeah, this so. is a useful one to have masks for, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. And it's easy nice to mask. Nice shape, yeah. Yeah. Oh, and the house. Mm. Now the house. This is lovely because Cute. it's so magical and whimsical and just, just marvellous is this one. So you bring in the little magical house now this has been a very popular bundle you can understand why I mean, it's so affordable at less than a tenner now we started this hour with a quarter of the stock having gone but nearly half of the stock has gone obviously we're going to be closing this hour just before um, we get to what time are we one o'clock i think for a minute then um, and of course we will get busy with this one when we come to the end of the demonstration so i would suggest you get in as early as you can because when we're seeing savings like this and a price you're getting two all and create stamp sets for 9.98, that is a phenomenal deal. Take advantage while you've got the chance. And they're just really useful. I and mean, even the little toadstool with the little silhouette as well. I mean, it looks beautiful, just those two yeah. together. And of course, it only works out as an extra fiver on your Flexi if you're going for your one day special. So it makes sense. See, I think um, I'm going to pop in the, the little, so this is my magical little like like village okay. so there's our lovely little magical village nice. which does look super yeah. super magical and in the lovely magical village our lovely little red riding hood you need to find a name for these little these little um, villages um, my little creates. villagers your little story yeah yeah because that's it it is it is one of them isn't it because you oh see she is off to the woods yeah she is she is. The local this is when I could bring in my spooky <laughs> tree as well. Oh, yeah. So, I need a bigger piece of card now. This is why, folks, I don't normally cut my card stock down. Because I get carried away, and before I know it, I needed a full A4 piece of card stock. <laughs> but then you see what I was thinking. Where's my little fairy gone? So, she's got, she's got the little fairy, you see. So, I think the little fairy from the village is actually showing her the way. Oh, a little fairy guide. Yeah, she's got Aww. a little fairy guide, which is falling off the car stop because I cut my car down. But look, look, she's got a little fairy gu guide. Um, that's, yeah, that's showing other way. And the and little fairy guy could almost be like a little Tinkerbell star character. Yes. Couldn't she with the Peter Pan and the Captain Hook? Yes, yeah, she One could. One day special. There you go. I forgot about that. How perfect. You've got magical wishes. Oh, do you know, isn't that just fabulous? And then, and then, all you do, ground it as usual. So just put your little line like this. So you're grounding it. You do your little paths. Oh. So your little paths are zooming off like so. So you've got your tiny little paths there. And on this one, um, it's really pretty because it's also got these little hearts. And these little hearts, oh, and you see, you know, you've got all your different flowers and stuff yes, yeah. on all your, your other little stamp sets. But the little hearts oh, work beautifully as little oh, flowers. Aren't they cute? Aren't they cute? Oh, aren't I love they cute? That. And again, because you're creating your own magical, fantastic little world, this this is is yours. You know, oh, look, look, and then a random pigeon. No, <laughs> Leone, not Step the random away from pigeon. The pigeon. <laughs> well, you can have a little bunny rabbit. I must admit, I did think a little bunny rabbit might look cute there. <laughs> um, I very quickly uh, managed to grab hold of one of the cards that's got Peter Pan in there, because of course the little fairy, as we said, the perfect as a little guide for Peter Pan as well. Um, maybe um, you never know. 
all those different ways you could work with these. Um, two thirds of the one day special have gone now. Leonie, thank you so oh, much. I want to do pin, Peter Pan now. I think it's just itching to get going again. Like, literally. Like, oh, oh my it. gosh, do Peter Pan, take a minute. See you at four o'clock. Thank you. See um, you at four. Yeah. Uh, now, of course, you've still got the opportunity to take advantage of your one day special or the bigger bundle. It's up to you. You decide. But do make sure you're adding those extras that you've seen throughout the show because, as you see, they're all incredibly versatile. They work well together. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. So, yes, yeah, sweet poppy stencils coming up. Oh, I love Lucy's shows. Looking forward to that one. Then we're back with the lovely Amanda and Paper Shop. And then we've got the most incredible quilt projects. Did you know you can continue watching the craft store 24 hours a day, seven days a week for free using your smart TV? It's just like watching us on your computer or tablet, only now we'll be on your large screen smart TV. Follow these easy steps to get your smart TV set up. Firstly, make sure your smart TV is connected to the internet, either through a wireless connection if your TV supports it, or via the ethernet port on the back of your TV. If it's not already connected, use your remote control and select network settings through your TV's menu and follow the instructions to set this up. Remember, you will need your router's password at hand whether you are on a wired or a wireless connection. This should be on the side or bottom of your router. You can always refer to your TV's help menu or instruction booklet for more information. Once you are set up, press the Smart Hub dedicated button on your remote. This will vary between brands, but it's usually located at the center of the remote. This is where you'll find your internet web browser app. Select this to open and then type the craftstore.com into the search bar. And this will take you to our website homepage, which includes our live broadcasts and access to previous shows. Now you can watch, purchase and catch up with your favorite TV shows 24 hours a day, seven days a week on your TV whenever you feel crafty. Hi, I'm Abs from Orange Create. I've been crafting for over 10 years now and I love stamping, stenciling, creating layers, colors, textures and creating depth and dimension. Orange Create was established in October 2016, collaborating with a group of designers and artists from all over the world, bringing different designs and products in different styles. We proud ourselves of high quality photopolymer clear stamp sets, dyes, stencils, washi tapes and acrylic blocks, all in different sizes and formats. I hope to bring you inspiration and different ways of using your craft products. Make sure you don't miss the Orland Create shows. Very good afternoon to you. You join me for the second of two shows today with the fabulous Sweet Poppy stencils and our gorgeous Lucy. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Hello. We had a very busy morning, didn't it was, we? Yeah, it was lovely. Oh my goodness, we had two sellouts. Yeah. We're already 80% gone of the Lotus Blossom. Wow. Okay. I know. Um, lotus flower, not that I've just combined the cherry blossom and the lotus flower. I've just made, made them one. I agree um, with you. <laughs> yes, yeah. Uh, just very, very popular. You have brought us all brand new, beautiful, we have, beautiful products. Yeah. yeah. Our first um, 2022 releases. Yes, and we've not yeah. seen you since November, have we? No, you haven't. No, no it feels no. longer. It does feel longer. Welcome back. I don't know where the months are gone. I know. And I will say as well, once it's gone, it's gone. And I don't mm. know when she's back with us. I don't. I keep pressing her, but we just don't know. <laughs> So all I can advise you is to get it now. So let's start with the cherry blossom, which is brand new today. 60% of the stock's already gone. This is absolutely stunning. And of course, because, Sweet Poppy, you deal with the finest materials, these are very different because these are stainless steel, aren't they? Yeah, see? we're a little bit different from the Mylar companies. Um, I love Mylar stencils, but for us, we wanted the best quality um, and 
uh, something that wasn't going to stretch or bend or distort the beautiful designs we get. Absolutely, really important. and you do get those crisp, beautiful designs. Mm. This is Susan's and Eileen's. I love that blue. And over here we're using, this sold out earlier, the lace aperture. Did, but yeah. we do have... Um, we have the blooms. Uh, it's Emily's, isn't it? Yeah, the blooms. Um, Emma's, yeah. Emma, sorry, Emma yeah. Cronin. We do have Emma. So this will also, we've got the lovely as well, um, the... the, the paste something yes. maybe, yeah uh, yeah so that. that is using a translucent paste Ooh. and embossing powders on top that's <gasps> by O'Leary she's um, someone that's joined our company um, back in November oh. and she's a brand new crafter brand brand new brand and that new. was her Look first attempt I know. oh my word first I know. attempt get out of town Look at this Julia beautiful oh, gorgeous, and, and we've got the black paste we mentioned this because this is an end of call it is. Um, this is Ooh, that's Tracy's, Tracy. yes. Yeah. Um, end of call, simply a smaller pot because you, you said probably don't need as much. As you? much, yeah. no, you're not going to use as much as you will a white or translucent. Yeah. Um, so it's, and it's a consider purchase. Yeah. Um, so you want something that you're going to get the best out of. Absolutely. So we, we did the blacks in the small pot to make we it did. more achievable. Beautiful. I mean, this is just gorgeous. We I have got it. those beautiful texture paste, not texture paste, we don't have those beautiful paste. They're mm -hmm. on a pick and mix at the bottom of the screen, and you've got the choice of the gold, the translucent, as you just mentioned, the pearlized, pearlescent, which you used earlier, yep. root colouring, and the glossy white. So uh, we love Janet painting her glossy white. 10.99 for the cherry blossom stencil there, 590522. 60% has gone of that beautiful cherry blossom, just to highlight that to you. Now let's have a look at the lotus. 80% uh, has gone. This is Eileen's here. I mean, this is exquisite. And again, framed with the, the lace aperture, but we've got the, the beautiful bloom aperture. It is exquisite. It, it's, why, why do you think this is so popular, Lucy? I think because everybody loves flowers. Yeah. Um, and when you look at a stencil and you think, right, what am I going to get the most value out of? It'll always be flowers. Um, and I just think it's so, it's simple but elegant. Very. And it means you can get <gasps> with one stencil by just using a bit of ink or a medium or spraying through it, you get so many different looks. Linda's there, Julie's we've just seen. Uh, gosh, sorry for not name checking everybody because they're so fabulous. There's another one of Julie's there. I mean, on the black card as well, there's Linda's again, the isn't drama. It, it and, is drama, isn't it? It's oh, beautiful, so this, elegant. Look at that lovely Susan's, how gorgeous. Is it? I mean, it's just absolutely so. And one of my favourites is coming up now. We were discussing this morning, if you missed it, Leanne. Yeah, and I checked with Leanne, bless her, and she Aww. said yes. She mixes a little bit of the um, the flakes, yeah, in, gold, gold flakes in a yeah. small uh, scoop of medium, spreads it over. She doesn't do lots because they go a bit um, mushy. Ah, yeah, just so a little, just little a sprinkle. And then I was astounded by yeah. a Susan's... Checkerboard one. I mean, it's just, that was a stencil upon a stencil. You explain yeah, that one to that me. A stencil. So layering your stencils beautiful. on top. And the one that's in yeah. the shop now as well, the vibrant one, is by Eileen. And what she's done is she's applied the colour. She's been very vibrant. Yeah. And then she's used the translucent medium. Oh. So the translucent medium has got a glue quality. They've all got glue content inside them. Right. And she's applied very fine clear beads on top. <gasps> and it's given the most beautiful oh, yeah, texture, texture, a real depth to it. I see that at home? Oh, yeah. my word. Beautiful. We are approaching limited. I better get straight to right. you, Lucy, okay. while we still got it. We'll do a nice, quick, simple one then. So we're going to do the lotus blossom and show that you don't need to have loads and loads and loads of different mediums and things. Just a couple of colours and you're away. So magnetic sheet, pop him on. And why is that? It hugs it tighter. Yeah. So it's like your invisible hands are holding it nice and tight for you. Stainless steel stencil, yeah. yeah. So I'm still going to mask off because yeah. I want to protect my cardstock. Now I could put the damask on the back of it, yeah. but Ooh, I'm yeah. aware of how quick it's selling out. So it's a nice, quick, simple one for us. We've got the just... stencil tape on our um, the essential tool kit there as well. And it comes with a spare mag it comes with a magnetic sheet yeah. and it also comes yeah with the spreader, which I'm sure we're going to use at some point, which is invaluable with this. So we're nicely, mm -hmm. not sticking it down to the map, we don't need to, because we're going to move it about. Right. So we're going to apply some colour. So I want a little bit of red, a little bit of green, and I'm going to probably go with a little bit of blue. So some inks. 
And you're using your lovely blending brushes. We've got those on the show Fab. today as well. Uh, yeah. Got a set of three, one, two, and three sizes. And we we took a long time to source our brushes. Yes, you were telling us earlier yeah. about the manufacturing. Um, oh. Yeah. Does your head in? They do my head worth in. Worth it because the quality of the goods. You, you persevere. I persevere with this lady <laughs> so much. It's all to do with quality for us, yeah. quality products. Before we'll put anything, um, before we put our brand to put your name to it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah we we you won't know. just put our brand, our no. name to. Really, um, no, no. It's really important to us. You know, we've taken too long. Building to build it up, it up and caring yeah. about it yeah. And, yeah and i do i'm i'm very passionate about mm. um you know the sweet poppy brand what is done with the stencils how it's how it's received by the customers yeah. uh, customer um relationship as well mm -hmm. that's really important to us we're a family business at the end of the day and Absolutely. you know we we it's our baby yeah you yeah. care care about it probably more passionate than my um my children <laughs> <laughs> well, perhaps we won't tell them that but uh, forget it. <laughs> so we're just taking up on a brush and yeah. we're just dragging it in yes you can use your smoothies but what yeah. i wouldn't do with my smoothies oh, i wouldn't I rub start it. slicing it because yeah. they are stainless steel that's it notes. exactly that's why your brushes are so good so we're just taking it in trying not to get mud Lester, Eileen keeps saying to me, go vibrant, Lou, go vibrant, don't get mud. Oh, is that when yeah. you blend your colours together? Well, yeah, or, years, yeah, years ago, I'd, and I, I'd be quite proud of my mud, but <laughs> no, it's not Eileen the right way. Eileen says otherwise, <laughs> we just do as Eileen says. Yeah, she is amazing with her colour. I've learnt so much during lockdown and everything, and I'm still learning as a crafter. You know, I am learning the same as everybody else. I know a lot about the stencils. I don't know everything. So we're just building, and it is just so easy to do. You get such a beautiful image. Yeah. Because they don't stretch or no. distort. You, you don't get that getting... bleed if you've no, fixed it nicely. that's it. Um, and if you get a little bit of the bleed, that's where your white pens come in. Yeah. You know, you can touch up with a white pen. Yeah. So easy. So and it's longevity as well. You're investing in something that's really yeah. going to last. With yeah. the flowers, we were saying earlier, they're so popular because it's every sense of occasion. Yeah, it? it's never going to date that. No. It's never going to date. And the amount of people that um, show on our Facebook pages stencils that are 10, 11 years old, and it's like, Perfect. I remember that one. Oh, that's so lovely. We are limited now on the lotus flower. Just so you know, once it's gone, it's gone. So please so. don't start. Do check out your baskets. So you take off, and oh, you've got a beautiful so image. Beautiful. We just so. wash them in. Yep, bit of soapy water. Warm don't soapy put them in water. any machines or anything. Just yeah, warm just... soapy water and a nail brush. Yeah, nail brush. Because you said don't, don't, don't use your hands to. No, you're bit... going to cut your hands yeah, if you're going to. Yeah. So if you're going to, if you were going to use your paste, clean your stencil, mm -hmm. lay it back over, nice dry stencil, translucent. If you leave it dry, you'd have a glossy finish. If you wanted to sprinkle your glitters, you'd have a sparkly finish because oh. it's got the glue content inside it. So oh, it's, yes. it's just perfect. So Crafty Devil Glue, because nice and quick and simple. And it is good glue. Yeah, we'll have that on the web, definitely. Yeah, uh, definitely. I brand I, Crafty Devils. Yeah. I'm really impressed with it. Mel, bless her. She gave me some at the show because I'd forgotten mine. And... It was a game changer, was it? Oh gosh, yeah, because it, it doesn't <laughs> clog. Um, the no, amount of glues that I've had that have clogged up, and that one just does not clog. Um, it's it's and it sticks. It does what it says on the pot. There we go. So it'll be a little bit crooked, but we'll be fine. So there we go. That one. Beautiful. And when we get home. It's getting all the samples back out, looking at them and getting them up on the boards for the displays. And that's a bit I yeah, love looking at them and yeah. seeing how they'll all work on the display boards. The girls have done me absolutely Oh, pride. I mean, the samples are stunning. You, you heard me waxing lyrical earlier about them. They're just beautiful. So a huge well done to the team. But then, you know, they're obviously inspired by the stencils and stamps. But, you know, they're obviously inspired. Well, the thing is, as well, is they're all different. They've all been brought mm. on the team for what they produce and how they produce and how they work. Yeah. And we didn't want, I think it's about 18 of them, we didn't want 18 all the same. Yeah. We wanted them all to be different. 
and all to be so someone could look at it and say I can do that I'm, yeah. I'm able to do that you know and not get scared or put off by it so I don't and look at the simplicity got. and the beauty of that just with so your three if color I blending. had if I had some pearls I put probably some little pearls say threes yeah. up there and that's all you need you don't Isn't need anything stunning? else no absolutely gorgeous I'll yeah. thank you Lucy yeah you had your pearls early I think you've tidied them away or something yeah I've early. done the tidy I'm getting ready to go on <laughs> <laughs> well if you, want, if you could just stay till two that'd be lovely darling I mean I said I don't know where she's going but if she could just stay till two uh, the Lotus is incredibly busy we are now limited please don't miss out 403462 as I said this morning we had two sellouts very early on um, we are now limited and the cherry blossom was already 60% gone as well so I wouldn't want you to miss out on that quality. You've seen the elegant simplicity. I mean, again, here's another beautiful sample um, from Susan. I mean, they're all beautiful. So any one to hold up is an absolute doozy. Just gorgeous. Look at that overlay in that. And then you've got that layered a bit in the middle. This is Eileen's. I mean, isn't that gorgeous? That's the And that's with the, the blossom, blooms. Uh, the the blossoms. blooms. Yeah, yeah the, blooms, the blooms, isn't it? The blooms, yeah. rectangular. I'm renaming it again. <laughs> yeah, we're renaming them all. Oh, look at this one. This is lovely. It's just the, look at that the simplicity of that, the different colours. Oh, Putting lovely. another... Yeah, four zero three four six two for your lotus flower. So please don't miss out. That's gorgeous Eileen's there. Um, let's introduce you to those apertures because again, once these are gone, they are gone. That's what happened this morning. So we have our bloom aperture in the circle. So this is Linda's, and it's the detail. This is what you kind of get because this is what you're telling me, Lucy, wasn't it? It's the detail you can achieve with the stainless steel. You, you don't have to bridge gaps if you want the gap. You don't have to do fill-ins. No. It was uh, so important. When Emma or Tracy from Lavinia, we, uh, Lavinia Stance, we work closely with them as well. When they both give us a design, if we have to compromise the design and you start changing a leaf, looking from a leaf to just a shape, it doesn't happen. No. We will not produce it. It's so important that the girls are happy when we send the design back after it's been um, redrawn, that they can see their, their beautiful artwork in it. Talking of which, look at this. I mean, I hadn't seen this one earlier. Isn't that a lot of that? It's beautiful. Is that using one of your lovely pastes as it's, well? That's so using lovely. paints. paints. So, oh. yeah, we, um, you can use any acrylic paint, take it up on a stencil brush and stipple through the stencil. Oh. And that's um, Sharon Everett, and she's one of our guest designers um, that has oh, joined Sharon. us for six months. Beautiful work. Isn't that gorgeous? And that is your Bloom's Aperture Circle, yeah. 1099. 411975, over half the stock has gone. Just before I move on, the lotus flower has now gone. Good job we got that demo in quick, isn't it? It is, isn't it? Yeah. Technical sellout. If any bob back, I will let you know, but please check out your baskets because you clearly love it. It is now technically sold out. So let's talk about the square, the Blooms Square. And again, absolutely exquisite. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, I love it. It really is beautiful. They, they are... Um, they're like tools of your crafts, craft box, all the apertures. Any aperture is worthwhile getting because it is going to frame your words. If you want a simple yeah. card, quick splash of ink over, stamp, you've got it. You've got your, your quick card made. Um, they're, they're really useful tools. We just saw it there, you know, that, that full one with the cherry blossom there. And then this one with just uh, the, the, the lovely lotus, if you were quick enough to get that. And again, as, as Lu, uh, uh, Lucy was just saying, just that simplicity of the, of the message here. And another one of the stencils there from days days gone by uh, with Bobby, sweet Bobby stencils. Days gone by, I don't know where I'm going with that. Um, lovely Liz, isn't that fantastic? I mean, it's just utterly gorgeous. Um, yeah, just beautiful. They are a staple, aren't they? 60% uh, of the Bloom's Aperture Square gone. 10.99.717.825. Okay, let's talk about the, the back plates now. Uh, tropical flowers, yes, um, big favourite of mine. Tropical leaves, I should say, isn't it? Tropical, the tropical back plate. So this really is full on. I mean, it is absolutely gorgeous. It's bold it's beautiful and that's what i loved about that card earlier when you did the stencil over the back yeah i mean that's such a clever technique it's it's so, it's so simple but it's so effective so effective i think people that's just genius. see it and see leaves what can they do but it can be the backdrop <sighs> of your artwork or it can be the focal point of a card yeah. i just think it's so beautiful and it can be so male female depending on what you use isn't that fabulous and we've got the daisies this one is lovely debbie's 
Isn't that fantastic? Got the daisy stamp. Now, you know my favorite, one of my favorites is coming up, Janet. Yeah. Janet, you and your colouring. Would you have thought to do it pink? I no. would never have thought, but now I see it, it works. It's just so dynamic, yeah. isn't it? That is the tropical back plate. That is 1299 Absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Uh, stunning. Oh, stunning. Um, let's move on to the next one. Yes. Now, we will be demonstrating these with Lucy. We've got the, the um, damask there as well. So, again, another beautiful. But you, this can be very subtle, can't it? Yeah, definitely. Incredible in intricacy. I'm just going to move that forward like that. If I mean, you want the, the softness um, to be... Imagine you've got a bold flower, like yeah. a lotus or your cherry blossom, but you want something to ground it or do your layering. It's perfect, absolutely perfect for it. Beautiful. You need your magnetic uh, sheet for that, don't you? To Definitely. grab that. Definitely. I mean, it, but it's crisp. Every single bit on it is crisp that you get. And you imagine if you're going to do a bit of lace work, say invitations, wedding invitations, and you just want the backdrop of it, just doing using that would be beautiful. Love this idea of putting that on the angle there. Or should it be, should it be like that? I don't know. I, I just wish it was upwards. But it I is. do like it. Yes. Um, so why not? The jaunty angle. Isn't that beautiful? That's I love the, the daisies. Is that just again in the smile. purple? Isn't that electric? Mm. And that lovely little circular damask at the background there. And then beautiful. Oh, you see, this is why you were lucky to get that lotus. You see, singing to you, isn't it? And then and just making it, you know, with with your dye, your shapes. Yeah, isn't that beautiful. Isn't it a good idea. Beautiful. Twelve ninety nine. Brand new today. Remember, seven six three nine two seven. Really beautiful. Um, we have got the stamps as well on the show, and the one you're looking at there is lovely Linda's there, absolutely gorgeous. So we're seeing some of these beautiful poppies, and we're seeing some of these lovely daisies. So let's have a little look at them now. So this is um, the, the pop, is it the poppies? Yes, the poppy yeah. and the dragonfly now. Dragonfly blooms. Oh, dragonfly blooms. Look at this now. What is going on here? Because it is absolutely breathtaking. It's gilded on um, acetate by Martine. It's beautiful, oh, isn't Martine. it? She does very dimensional cards. That is, that is gorgeous. We're going to get to that now in a second. Look at this. So this is gilded on acetate. I know. Wow. Isn't that beautiful? And then embossed. Never wait for the perfect moment. Take the moment and make it perfect. And here, this was on the that's vellum. on vellum, yeah. <gasps> Isn't that and again beautiful. by Martine, and that's using Martine anybody again. that's got the lace um, square, yes. you know, using it as your backdrop. But there's no reason why you couldn't do it with the blooms. Absolutely, yeah. Aperture that like you said it was the go-to, and again with the dragonfly. Isn't it beautiful? That's got to be Martine's there. Yeah. Absolutely. Isn't that beautiful? Ah, oh, and this one you see, you've got your lovely tropical in the background there. Just a little hint. Makes a big difference, doesn't and it? On acetate, and it's using your <gasps> glitters on acetate. Ooh. It's beautiful, isn't, isn't it? Isn't it? It's just stunning. Seventeen ninety nine. You get four stamps. Over half the stock has gone. Two nine nine eight five one. Really, utterly gorgeous. So seventeen ninety nine. So I mentioned the daisies. So let's have a little look at our daisies. Yeah, and again, exquisitely beautiful. We've got our daisy. And uh, again, we've got some lovely sentiments. So we've got our daisy, two different shapes that you did one earlier, yeah. didn't you? With us? So these are designed by designs by Amelia. Um, she's a new designer to us, and she's one we discovered just by chance by one of my ladies. It's her daughter-in-law, and I, I saw the work that she'd done on Facebook and said. Who is this? Yes. She said, my daughter-in-law. I went, oh, my gosh, where have you hidden her? Absolutely. Um, after a little bit of chatting, she, this is the third collection that she's <gasps> done for us. Um, and she's amazing. She does like to put her gems with flowers, making it a little bit different. But you don't have to have the gems. If you see the gems, yes. they're easily masked off. Or you could easily, with a knife, cut them off the stamps. Yeah. She didn't like them. Which is rather you know, beautiful. We're not offended if you didn't. But yeah. Um, we like them. <laughs> and again, we said for any occasion, look how pretty that card is with, yeah, the, with the colour in there, isn't Julie. It? And look at this one. Oh, with the white embossing. Oh, Mixing just, up the stamps. Just gorgeous. 60% has gone now as well. Then oh, so big, beautiful. Big, bold stamps as well. Beautiful. You know, we could have done them smaller, put them on a little A6 um, set, but no. we like big and bold. Big and bold. Yeah. Something oh, that's beautiful. a statement on a card. Beautiful. Uh, so that is also available there, those four gorgeous stamps. Uh, let's just look to the website while we regain our graphics there for you. And uh, you can see all the products there, including those beautiful blending tools, including...
including the uh, the tools. I think it's Eunice. I'm going to blame Eunice because she's the reason everything's <laughs> gone down today. Do you know what? I couldn't even get a pack of crisps out of the machine. Uh, yeah. Just wanted to subsidise the awful salad I was eating. So we've got the Sweet Poppy Blending Ink brush set there. Three of them. One, two and three. We've got those lovely, lovely uh, pick and mix fantastic uh, paste as well. The translucent, the gold, um, the beautiful pearlescent. Uh, you've got the stencils individually there as well. We've got the glossy white, which I know Janet likes to use, and then colour. Oh, it's a fantastic technique. So do shop ahead. Now, the lace apertures have sold out. We do have some still remaining of the blooms. Uh, the lovely Emily Cronin's. Um, Emma. Emma. Oh, I keep Emma. Emily. I'm sorry, I renamed her. <laughs> Emma. And then other beautiful st stamps as well. So uh, shop ahead by brand. And there is the essential tool. Now, that spreader is essential to go with your mm. stainless steel um, stencil. D take it from me. It genuinely is twelve ninety nine. So um, we shouldn't be using our knives, should we? No, don't no. use your knives. We'll you know, spread. It will go. If you bread and butter it, it's going to go under. But it's if you under. use a spreader, like screen it's printing, much more it's going to work, yeah. Much more effective. Right. Okay, let's come back and see our Lucy. I've changed up a little bit because we've used inks already. And yeah. we've already, in the earlier show, we already showed you how to colour the paste. Yeah. Um, we were going to do that one, show you how Ooh. to do the colours on. But all it is, is pasting on. Once it's bone dry, you would re-slot your stencil back over and you would slap your inks on. Oh. Literally slap your inks on. <laughs> okay. So we're going to show you a different technique yeah, but with embossing powders. Yeah, lovely. So all I've done is I'm masking off all the way around because okay. I only want a frame of it. Okay. I don't want all of it. Lovely. So you could do a square, you could do whatever shape you wanted. So you're just going straight up to the end with your stencil tape. And it is, I can't stress it enough, it's stencil tape, it's not masking tape. Big difference. Masking tape has too much glue. Yes. So every time you warm it up like that, yeah. you end up getting glue content Residue. onto your card. Yeah. yeah. And then you'll tear your cardstock mm. as well. It won't work for your dies, it's not strong enough. It won't work for your decorating, it's not strong enough. Right. It is stencil Properly tape. Properly developed for yeah. your stencil. I yeah. should say, if you're having an issue with the payment, if you can, if I can convert you to the, the website, if you have access, simply because Eunice is, is she's, she's playing devil and havoc here <laughs> with everything happening. It's the wind. It's the wind. <laughs> right, so all I'm doing is I'm trying to centralise. So you've got two squares here and I'm trying to get them central. Oh, okay. If oh, you yes, don't, see, yeah. yeah, if you don't, what's going to happen is it's going to look a bit off you know off. squiffy right okay. so i'm just making sure i'm sort of roughly lined up and then pop it down perfect okay. see, so how easy was that onto the sheet yeah. Brilliant. so we're going to spread our mediums now for me personally when i'm using embossing powders you can sprinkle anything that's a powder oh, okay so micas glitters embossing powders brushes over the paste Anything that is a dust, you would sprinkle over whilst it's wet. Oh, yeah. If you physically want to touch it, then you have to do it whilst it's dry. So inks, waxes, you would do it whilst it's dry. Okay. Okay. So in its wet form, it's got a glue content. Gotcha. Good rules on there. It's stencils came first for Sweet Poppy um, about 11 years ago. We've been going about 11 years. And then we wanted to work with our stencils. We worked with mediums. And when we were doing the shows, we'd do 40-odd shows a year. Mm. And I'd use mediums, and I'd find I was allergic to them because oh, of certain content in oh, them and right. use them day in, day out, yeah, and I'd come out in a rush. Gonna, yeah, an irritant. So yeah. I needed something that worked for me. Oh. So I found that there were certain things that irritated me about other people's mediums. Okay, that's so ours got formulated, and I wanted the... Um, the glitters to be able to sprinkle on them mm -hmm. and for them to stay on the boards and when you looked you didn't have patches on our display boards so hence working with a manufacturer for about two years oh, we got it just right yeah we have tweaked it the last six years yeah. so it dries a little bit quicker so you do have to be quick with your glitters right. so you have everything ready mm -hmm. and then as soon as you've pasted Go. Yeah, go yeah. straight with your glitters. And it's water-based, isn't it? It's cleaning, all water-based, non-toxic, yeah. yeah. So it looks like it's set in a pot. Yes. Do not make the mistake of mixing it. What happens is you loosen up the formula and it drips everywhere. So about three or four times, um, use it like this, and then you can mix it. Always make sure you keep the top of your pot nice and clean after you've finished, because otherwise you'll get bits in your pot. 
Okay. Oh, very generous splodges. Very generous, but it's all coming off. So you think you're using a lot more than what you need to. Right. So pop that to one side. So with your spreader, hands together, not at the ends. Otherwise, this you're not key, putting the pressure. Yeah. yeah, you need equal pressure, and you're not pushing it down. No, you're pulling no. it. Yeah. So Pull, you're on. Pulling towards. Yourself. And up. So I've missed some little bits. Yeah. So all I'm doing is I'm splodging. Okay. Just checking that I'm all covered. Yeah. And splodging. Just so that you can redo. Yeah. So back on. Mm -hmm. So once on, once off. Maximum swipes are three. Ah, right. After Ooh. that, you'll find that it'll creep under. Okay. So if you can see your silver, you're perfect to go. Oh. Okay. Yeah. And you should really see your silver because if you've left your stencil and your spreader contact and glide against each other, you should see the image, the stencil. If you haven't, then you you're doing it too too much. Yeah. Too much. Um, yeah. You medium. need that contact down on it. Yeah. So don't don't get stressy about no. it. So this is why the spread is so good. Oh, you get that definitely. Yeah. Coverage of these stencils. Yeah, definitely. And there is no pressure, so don't don't get stressed about it. At the end of the day, it's a bit of card. <laughs> what can go wrong? In the bin, start again. So straight off. So you've got your body. That goes straight into your water yeah. and completely cover it. That's yeah. really important. Okay. If you find that you've still got residue, say you haven't cleaned it properly, warm soapy water mm -hmm. and leave it soak and then get into all the areas with a nail brush. Nail brush yeah. Yeah. Never with your fingers. Yeah. They are, I can't stress enough, they are like knives. Well, yes, because they're stainless steel with, with yeah. edges. Yeah. The amount of times I've cut myself because I don't, your own do, advice. Yeah, do as I say. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Don't do as I do, yeah. do as I say. So we're taking off our tape. Ah, okay. Lovely. Um, just making sure you don't put your fingers in it. Uh -huh. Just trying to get a little. Fantastic, hook. I can already see. So you've got your the frame. Of the intricacy, yeah. yeah you've got everything that is on the stencil. So when you've got your stencils, wow. um, let me see if I've got it. So with the cherry blossom, mm. when we say follow a stencil down, if you've got a channel, okay. So if you've got channels and stems, follow it downwards. Don't go against Don't it. Go right. Yeah. So. I would not go that way because I would hit this ridge here and it would creep under. Oh. So turn it and follow it down. Doesn't gotcha. matter if it's upside down, you've got to follow your channels. Over 80% of the cherry blossom was gone. I'm just nicking this one earlier that uh, Lucy did because it was so beautiful. This was the technique. Um, yeah, you can catch this on rewind. What, what, day, what time did we work together? What day um, did we do? Nine o'clock, wasn't nine it? Nine o'clock. Gosh, it was, was early for me. Painting over the white. I don't do early. It's gorgeous, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> I love the cherry blossom. 80% of the cherry blossom has gone. So, what so, we're doing now, we're putting so all our glitters. You these said you are, have to do that quick, didn't you? These are actually beautiful wow embossing wow powders. Embossing glitters, yeah. yeah. They are just gorgeous. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to heat it. So, we're just sprinkling all over. So, you would have at home a pot to put all your mix in because mm. you would create your own mix. Mm. So you could do this with, um, if you've got your golds and your pearl whites, I would say your gold and your pearl white are the better ones because that's personally my choice. Of um, mediums to, to do this of with. Of mediums to right. do with mica powders. Yeah. So yeah. you can do this with mica powders mm -hmm. um, and you get a beautiful metallic effect. If is, I'm, that, is that how this one was done, Janet's there? Jerry no, Bobbin. that's glitters. Oh, that's just good old glitter. So, oh. did I have, I did have, there it is, so you would get that effect Ooh, that sprinkle. so that is heating it with mica powders and that's with the gold mediums and it gives you the most beautiful dimension wow look at that look at that raised See and that's what that's this is what I'm saying is you want one stencil but you want a whole range of different techniques Isn't that amazing? so if you're not sure of something if you've because um, I think you can do the catch-up can't you for the rewind for 60 yeah, days then, isn't yes, it exactly um, if you don't see it on there then you go on YouTube and we've done all the tutorials of all the techniques and things um, so you know, and if you're not sure, then send me an email and I'll oh. run it through you yes you, you know. explained to us earlier Definitely, you've got your two yeah. Facebook pages there yeah obviously 
the sweet poppy stencils and then what was it all? Um, uh, simply sweet poppy and simply, simply, simply sweet sweets. poppy stencils yeah. and uh, sweet poppy stencils. The simply one is more for the challenges and yes. the interaction from all members. You know, yeah. whether you're a DT member or member of the public, you know, we want everybody to share. And it is, it's fabulous seeing all the beautiful creations from all the customers. So we're just moving all our colors so this is translucent medium right the reason I've used translucent is I do not want it to bubble too much ah, I want okay. it to show the beautifulness of the embossing powders so we're we'll just, just the pick and flick mix. them off make sure we've got all the because embossing powder if it's on your card it's gonna stick so we're just making sure we've got all our residue that would go in a mix pot mm -hmm. so heat gun so anti-static your card first before yeah. you put your paste on. So we go in with heat gun. So it's a noisy one, so sorry, that's okay. But it's the quick hot one, so. Yeah. Okay. So you're waiting for your embossing powders to melt, mm -hmm. but also melt into your medium. Ooh. So cook it, move on. Yeah. Try not to burn your fingers. <laughs> can you see it starting to yeah. twinkle and melt? Yeah. You can use the hairdryer heat to, um, heat tool. That will work for you. It just takes a little bit longer to, oh, okay. to cook That's it. it. Yeah, I can see that now from the side. You've got so many different techniques, you know, sprinkling your glitters, doing your inks. With the mediums, what you can do is you could, I could put a foil on that just by putting a heat foil on, oh. sandwich between copy paper and put it through a laminator. It will reactivate the glue Ooh. content. Oh, fantastic. So many different techniques. And that's what we want, you know. It's the girls that find out all these fabulous techniques yeah. and say, well, try this and try that. Yeah, it's fantastic, isn't it? They were never designed for it. It's when you start seeing what customers or the girls have done. What they come up go, with. Oh. Ingenious, yes. You think, oh, we'll give that a go. That's so so we're just useful. moving it. And the wow powders are amazing for this. Again, you're working with a good quality product that you know is going to do. Do it's just this, yeah. Just making sure you catch everything. Is there a point there when you know it's, it's sort of done? You can just see it's all Yeah, you, you don't see the powder residue on yeah. there anymore. It, it definitely does turn. And you can overcook it. Yeah. It's the same with, you know, with your powders when you're embossing. You, you do overcook it. Mmm. The so, sharpness of the, the image is still prevalent, isn't it? Oh, and definitely, yeah. So all you would do is a bit of matting and layering onto your card, pop your little sentiment on, and there you go. Absolutely beautiful. But it's such an effective technique. Very. And mm. that is the damask. I'll let you set up and uh, have a recap there. That is the sweet poppy uh, stencil in the damask and we've also got the lovely tropical which we're going to come to but let me just mention the uh, the lovely cherry blossom it is now limited this is the one I was just saying to Lucy earlier uh, about oh what did Janet do here was that uh, that was just the glitters she said that's just, just glitters yeah. just the glitters I mean look at it it's so effective it's I so say beautiful. just the glitters I, know, I make it sound so simple but it's not it's not to take it away it's so beautiful and we were talking earlier about the dollop of dots gold and the black and then the the brinning down so you get that two-tone effect isn't that isn't that beautiful so that's the gold medium that you can get in the pick and mix you, you get any two there for 18.99 so do have a look and then this is genius the, the the you know using that stencil tape isn't that lovely i just sometimes you look at them and you think how just beautiful 
really gorgeous. So we are limited now on the cherry blossom. So please, 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 please don't miss out. And that's just using the, the wonderful element, which you said, Lucy, reminded you of your favourite flower there. Sweet peas. Sweet peas, yeah. Mm. 10 99, limited stock, 590-522. Once it's gone, it's gone. So please don't, please, please, please don't miss out. It's every bit as beautiful as we've been describing. Uh, we're down to what we're doing now. Carry on. Uh, yes, the Bloom's Aperture in the circle, we have the square as well. So, again, brand new today, proving very popular there. Um, oh, we're moving. Uh, the Bloom's Aperture oh, in the circle. Oh, I yeah. am. Ah, it is because we've had a sellout. I know the circle now in the Bloom's, absolutely gorgeous. Remind yourself there, I'll bring it in, how pretty that looks. And if you were lucky enough there to get that fabulous lotus earlier. 1099 411975. And then. Next to it, we have the square. Oh, I brought in the square, didn't I? I'm so sorry, Charlotte. Shall I show you a circle just to make everybody feel better? There we go. There's a circle. It's very simple, Fiona. It's been a long day since 3 o'clock. I had a very stressful journey down. Lucy understands. Oh, totally, totally. I had a very stressful journey down in Eunice. She was playing havoc with me. Uh, there we go. There's a square, everybody. Fortunately, you can see that. Yay! 10.99.717.285. Please don't miss that, because that is every bit as beautiful as the lace one, which sold out earlier. And there you can see it with... There we go. A circle and a square. I've been, I've been no good on the... What was that frozen with the square window and the round... The Humpty Dumpty. Oh, what's that? What was it called? Was it Jack and Ori? Let's look through the square. Oh, we're showing our age now. Aren't we? I know, I know. <laughs> Moving on. Moving on. <laughs> the BBC were mentioning it recently because they were celebrating 100 years, weren't they? Uh, let's move on to the tropical stencil. Yes, the black paint, because this is what Lucy's going to be looking at now in a moment. And again, look at this with, with the paste through it, the medium, I should say. Um, just simply masking off, as Lucy did with the stencil tape there. Um, so, 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 so beautiful, so simple. And then just the happy birthday, matte and layering. Isn't, isn't that exquisite? And then again, look at that with the stamps and the dragonflies there. This one is uh, um, Dax. And then here with, you know, the same similar sort of effect. And again, just the simplicity. Isn't that beautiful? Now look at this with the gold, the gold paste, Janet. Oh, isn't that, I know. And that's just, and a, and a bono sentiment. It's really quite beautiful, isn't it? Gorgeous. 1299 Really beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Then let's move along. And we have got the damask that Lucy's just been using. 1299 Exquisite with your poppies. Absolutely exquisite and beautifully put to use as well with our uh, Easter looming. There we go. You're just having a little look at Linda's there and the lovely multicolours. Isn't that beautiful? And then there's our Debbie's Easter with an Easter theme. I know, think about your other, your other dies. And I love this one, just the aperture, just cutting through. Yeah, die cutting through. So you see the, the rays. Isn't that lovely? Twelve ninety nine. the damask back page stencil, 763927. And let's move on to our lovely, lovely, lovely poppies and our beautiful dragonfly. So let's show you a card with both. Susan's, it's just beautiful. And you've got a lovely sentiment there as well. Just never wait for the perfect moment, take the moment and make it perfect. 60% gone now. Both of these are Susan's. Oh, there we go. Isn't that lovely? Let's all just show you another one. This one is, oh, this one's Susan's as well. <laughs> I'm not biased. I just keep picking up Susan's. I think Susan's love this. Uh, we love it as well, Susan. 1799 for all four of those stamps. And then we move to the lovely Daisy. And again, another fabulous, big, bold, beautiful. We can remove the jewels, as Lucy was explaining. They, we can have fun with the colouring, uh, the embossing, the stamping. I mean, just gorgeous. Shrink plastic on this one as well. Two thirds of the stock gone on this one. Isn't that lovely? I'll show you the shrink plastic one. Isn't that beautiful? I just love the black car because I think it's underused. I do, I do. I think it's, a, it's very dramatic, isn't it? Yeah. I know these stamps are not coming back, not no. for a while. We, we don't know when you're coming back, do we? And that's not no. a sinister <laughs> threat. I had me by it because I was trying to get out. We're working she doesn't out know at the, the moment. Just doesn't yeah. know. This yeah. is the shrink plastic. So, yeah. So, do you know what? It's been ages since we've seen lovely Lucy, so don't, don't be resting on your laurels is all I'm saying, you lovely, lovely viewers. And besides, you don't want to go anywhere else because Eunice will just play havoc with you. 1799 <laughs> 566491. Right, let's go back to our lovely Lucy. 
okay. and our tropical stuff. We're going to play with um, the tropical. I keep calling it palm. It's not. It's tropical. Mm -hmm. um, and we're going to do an aperture square, nice and simple, um, quick birthday card or mm. sentiment card, whatever you fancy. So again, as always, I haven't brought the apertures with me, the plain apertures. So to show you how to get an aperture, all we've done, again, is with our stencil tape. Because we know it's going to, oh, see, I'm setting myself up for a fall. We know it's not going to tear the card. <laughs> so I'm going in with my beautiful blending brushes. Mm -hmm. And I'm going with my lightest colour first. Okay. So applying your colour and getting a good old dollop of colour on there. <laughs> you can't beat a good old dollop, can you? <laughs> you can't. <laughs> so getting a nice, even blend over with your distress ink or whatever your chosen ink is. And the tape's not going to lift or anything like that. I do find if I spray, yeah. then it will lift. It seems oh. to over soak it. Yeah, right. Yeah. Okay. So um, just, with just the bl uh, blending brushes, when you're blending it, then it doesn't. And that's what you want is you, you want nice crisp, you know, square edges. Yeah. So, with um, the blending brushes, they come in a beautiful box as well, so they're perfect for, um, you know, giving as a gift or anything like that. Oh yes, they are lovely. Let me grab them. They're, they're, they're so stylish. They're like some beautiful every eyebrow single, makeup sets. Well, every they? single so one lovely. is checked before it goes into the boxes. So oh, that wow. they don't come with boxes. We, we have the boxes Gorgeous. manufactured so that it looks like, you know, a qu it's a quality product. Yes. I want it to look quality to look as good. well, and I want someone to be able to gift it. Yeah, you know, and it look lovely. The side. So you've got three, uh, and, and obviously the 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 it's so tightly packed yeah. with those bristles that you get that beautiful smooth blend, and it feels so soft to the touch. But so too many were splayed. So yeah. when you applied the colour, the, the out. yeah, the brush is sort of splayed out, so mm. it went like you got little spider legs under the mm. stencil. So, I hate that. It's you like paint brushes, is it? That's, that's it. You buy it cheap, you end up having to buy. So no, it just ruins oh, your work. Yeah, yeah, definitely. But having said that, eleven ninety nine for three is very, very good value. And I'm still working with the ones that I got two years ago. Wow. Now you gave us a good yeah. tip earlier about the cleaning, because I hadn't realised right. what you can do to do cleaning. So, on them. especially with your oxides. Now these have not been cleaned. These are my general dye, dye, permanent inks yeah my oxides did need a clean yeah so what you need to do it seems to with the oxides because they they're a hybrid ink it seems like the chalk chalkiness of them seems to clog the bristles ah. after and i'm saying 18 months oh on my gosh. so um i had to wash out one of them and all i did was i cleaned it on a baby wipe hmm. and it got most of the ink but not all of the ink out ideally Warm soapy water. Mm -hmm. I possibly would use shampoo. That's what my daughter uses for mm. her makeup brushes. Yeah. So give it a good rinse, and then it's so important get your tea towel down and you let them rest downwards. Yeah. yeah. If you rest them upwards, what's going to happen eventually is the bristles are going to come out of the yeah, glue. The water's going to get into the glue. Yeah. So make sure, and it's not drying just for a day. It's pro possibly about three or four days mm, that you need so to. Densely packed. Yeah, yeah, that's it. So that's really important. But again, you know, you don't have to wash them after each no. use. If I'm going to clean them off, say if I've used different blues, then all I would do is I just get my kitchen roll yeah, I love this and just yeah. clean it off yeah, on there. So we're going in with magnetic sheet, mm. always magnetic sheet, choosing what section of my stencil I want. And there's no right or wrong way with oh, your stencils. Okay. That's a good point. I hadn't thought yeah. that. Yeah. Only when there's a word is there a right oh, or a wrong way. Yeah. yeah, okay. So we've got the most beautiful, um, and I will bring them, beautiful fairies coming. Ooh. So when we're, nec when we're next on, Which I will bring them. We don't know them. when that is. She's <laughs> not <laughs> telling me anything. Don't I'm ever play poker anywhere. with us. She won't give anything away. Oh dear. We're, we're chatting at the moment. Um, <laughs> when's, when's the best yeah, time sure. to come on? Well, we've had to um, wait quite a few months for it to come today, so I that's know. why I keep saying please don't miss out. It's so scary. I don't know where the time has mm. gone. It's, you know, it's. someone said, oh, Happy New Year, and I thought, 
is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the first time I've seen anybody since uh, the new year. So, yeah. So oh, with your with your stencils, you can change them around. You can move them around. We're, that's what they're there for. So you get different designs as well. Yeah. So we're going in with green. Mm -hmm and up on your brush if you're not sure if you've got a real juicy pad then take off mm. okay and then you start applying so we're going over our color and again so you're better to build up thin layers bit by bit yeah. than flood it right okay and i would never go direct in with the pad start from the outside yeah, yeah okay. that's it just building up bit by bit And I'm not one that does butterflies, you know. People say, oh, well, I stick a butterfly. I don't do butterflies. She I don't, don't do butterflies. No, don't do butterfly. Don't stick a butterfly on them. <laughs> Just bit by bit. <laughs> stick this, a sentiment. This stencil would work lovely uh, with the Janie's show earlier, with all the lovely animals oh. and the zebras. And do you the know what I thought that when I saw that? I thought, oh, that would perfect be match beautiful. If got that earlier. Yeah. yeah, the lovely books. It'd be beautiful with it. Although you wouldn't like the butterflies. There's a few well, butterflies I, I do about. love butterflies, but I don't necessarily stick them you just don't want on the cotton. No. <laughs> That's fair enough. I do love them. Yeah. At one stage, we had too many butterfly stencils, and yeah, my husband said, no more butterflies. No, That's overkill. it. Yeah. We have to have a rest. <laughs> so we're taking on, and we're building up until you're really happy that you've got your colour. So pop your lid on. So we're taking off. So just remember your lightest colour on first and then your dark colour on top. Doesn't work the other way around. So off it comes. And then you're going to take off your back in. This is the satisfying bit. This is where I set myself up for a fall, isn't it? Where I said it won't tear. Not at all. <laughs> I'm still careful because there is always that chance, chance that yeah. I've got um, my guillotine is an old, old guillotine. It's 16 years old. Um, but you know, when you fall in love with something, you're just yeah. not swapping it. No. Um, and I get fluffy edges on my card, so it can catch sometimes. So you've got your, your body. Isn't that okay? fabulous? So one already matted mm -hmm. and layered. So no different I've just popped a little bit of layering so I didn't set myself up for that's a good old Mel I must thank her when I see her <laughs> she's really saved me this week so we're layering you could use your 3d if you want to yeah simple but effective very and much so you know if you've got that quick um, I'm really sorry but I hate making men's cards I really do I just I I am a flower person I love flowers oh, and things like I that like flowers as well. oh, they do hey, you but like flower totally Harry likes flowers he does oh bless you totally with it <laughs> <laughs> well he's got to say that hasn't he he's outnumbered yeah of course he has <laughs> I'll be otherwise aren't I <laughs> <laughs> so we're going in with we're going with happy birthday love it. we could do great art picks up when nature ends oh beautiful <laughs> so we're just going off center yep yeah. and then here's where i ruin it i'm terrible for getting a bit of jewelage going on here yeah so oh a little few pear drops so these are little accents. Ah. Mm. How lovely. Just to... Uh, and obviously you do your odds. Yes, rule. Rule of three. Oops. There we go. Nice and simple. There Beautiful. you go. Beautiful. Would you indulge me and just show me a bit of your cher cherry blossom? Mm. That sounded really wrong. <laughs> I'm trying to work out what you want me to do there. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here first. Uh, what would you like me to do with cherry blossoms? I don't know, just show me something gorgeous with it, because uh, we are uh, we we don't want anyone to miss out, and I'm aware it might not be around for much longer. So, okay. and we've got we've got about five. I've got about five minutes, Shay. 
Yeah, and look okay. at it. It's exquisite. Look at that six minutes. Look how beautiful it is. This is exquisite. And again, it's on the end of... Uh, actually, was this done with the map? The black paste there? How beautiful. Look at the simpleness of that. That is just the simple stencil. I believe it's the end of call, black glossy. And do you remember the other glossies we were saying earlier, you know, that the translucent, uh, you can put over the top, the glossy white Janet loves color in, we were saying, we did that earlier in the earlier show. We, we, we did that lovely pink one. Let me show you that again, I'll grab it now. So you can actually, with your mediums, color it. What was your favorite, uh, your pens that you like using? You can call it really good. Oh, use my clean pen. colors. Yes, absolutely that's it. adore clean color. Yeah, um, beautiful pens. That's your gold yeah. as well. So, oh, look at this one. Oh, then yeah, there's, there, there you go. This is an example colors. of Janet and the color in through the over the paste. Isn't that amazing? That was the laced aperture. We've still got the blooms aperture, but uh, that was the lace one. And then that's the gold medium through the cherry blossom. So really, really beautiful. I mean, look, just taking an element of it. Gorgeous. Right, let's go see our okay. Lucy. She's preparing the lovely cherry blossom so for me. We're winging it here. So we're going to pop on. Oops. Pop him on if he wants to stick. So again, one, two. Mm -hmm. So I've got all embossing powder. So, good tip for cleaning your mats mm -hmm. is. Um, Spray it with antibacterial spray or clean it with antibacterial. Oh. It gets rid of all the grease okay. that can get so build up. Your yeah. baby wipes, things like that. Yeah. You get grease on. Oh. Yeah, they've got moisturizer, things like yeah, that. Yeah, not lots of th things in there. Nightmare for mats. Oh. So excuse the OTT with the tape. But use because we haven't got any anti back right. Not well we have, but not right next to you. And I've got the spray. Yeah. Do you mind if I quickly squirt? No, no, go ahead. Otherwise it'll end oh, well, up in my, my lap. You can carry on the rest of the studio later if you want to lose. Just give us all, give us all wipe there. Well, it is lovely and clean now as well. Yeah. I've taken all the muck off the mat, so it's lovely, lovely. and clean. Top tip. <laughs> so, there we go. And I'm going to put one. It is really OTT with my tapes, but we're winging it. I've put her on the spot. You have. Well, we have five minutes, so we might as well look at our beautiful cherry blossom. But it's no different from well, three and a half now, show. loose. Oh, God, have we? Right, OK. So which paste are you going for there? The white glossy? A translucent. Translucent. Yeah. So Lovely. we're on. Remember four serious dollops. I might have to spread this single air, uh, single handed if it keeps moving. Ooh. So we're on. Yeah. Ooh. And we're up. So satisfying. Isn't and it? we're back in. And I'm going to give that one more swipe. One more swipe. Maximum and again, of three. Maximum of three. three. And again, I normally do it with two hands, but my mat is yeah. greasy. So chuck that in. Or you can, be, you know, clean off with a cloth if you've got it. Mm -hmm. And then we're just taking off. I adore this. So you can, obviously, once it's bone dry, you could go over with waxes, patinas. Yeah. Um, whilst it's wet, you can use your glitters, your mica yeah. powders. Whatever's good Very for you. Very versatile. Definitely. <gasps> so oh, we've beautiful. got that. So pop in there. Gorgeous? So how many minutes have we got? Two and a half. The white on white is so classy. So. Well, if you used um, the pearl white, it's even better. Mm. Really looks beautiful because it's an off white. Oh, not a, so not a white white. It would just show up even more, the white yeah. on white. So the difference between your pastes is your pearl white is an off white. Yeah. Your glossy white is titanium white, bright mm, white. Bright white. So if you're oh, going yes. to glitter, obviously we've got the old aircon. <laughs> <laughs> That's doing whatever it wants. It does. It's fierce so in this corner. It is. It's like, it's like Eunice is in the building. <laughs> That's what we're having to contend yeah. with, Luce. It's, it's just, just this corner, isn't it? It's going right that way, isn't it? So yeah. we're just sprinkling yeah. it anywhere. We have no control over the glitter. <laughs> and then we're going over the top with the green. Not stressing too much about where colours go. No. Because... Ah. Uh, got 90 seconds. So pretty. And then once it's bone dry, you get oh. a brush, 
and you brush over and because you, it looks heavy because you've got glitter stuck to the glue but then you've got the static glitter yeah. so you when it's dry you brush off and you've got that beautiful smoothness that is beautiful are you able to hold that up a little bit for me there thank you lucy isn't that gorgeous? So that was the, like the technique earlier. You know, I just said, "How did she do that?" You said, "Just glitter, didn't she?" Yeah, Jenny. just glitter. Isn't that beautiful? Was that this, where is this? Right at the bottom now, because I showed it, and it's just there, there we go. It is. This one. So it's just so glitter. Soft. Yeah, it's just glitter. Single figures now on the lovely cherry blossom. Thank you so much for You're indulging welcome. me. Thank You're you. Thank you, and thank you so much. We don't know when she's back. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully she's coming. She's coming back with fairies. Um, but it's just going to be a while. And, and again, once these are gone, that's it. So please, please, please don't miss out. Check out your baskets. I think there's a few more still remaining of our lovely cherry blossom. I wouldn't want you to miss out. Oh, just gone. All in oh. baskets. So well done, you. Uh, well done. Don't forget to check out because that really is every bit as beautiful as, as you can see. Thank you so much, Lucy. It's been an absolute oh, pleasure. Thank you for the, the, you today. Much. Yeah, and safe drive home. Yes. If you've battled that bit of wind, you'll be fine. Oh, God. You've, co <laughs> you've coped with their con. You'll be fine with Eunice. Yeah. She'll be a breeze. She will be. Be lovely and warm out there. <laughs> Safe home, my darling. Thank oh, you for thank watching. You. Let's have a catch up and see what else we've got today on the craft store. Yes, it's our paper shop pastel paper weekend. Wow! Then we've got green acre quilts. The whole bit of soft finishing. And then they all and create one day special with our Leone. Hi, I'm Katrina from Rowan Dean. We're a small family business that design embroidery kits. Embroidery has always been my passion and I'd love to show you how to do some of the stitches and some of the kits. We're based in Derbyshire and I'm really inspired by the landscape and flora of Derbyshire and I think other people will be too. Don't forget to join me on my Rowan Dean shows. I'm Jenny Mays from Hobby Art. Hobby Art's a family-run company and we've been designing and manufacturing stamps for over 28 years now. Whatever your style, there's always something that will interest you with Hobby Art stamps. Flexi order. When you place an item on FlexiBuy in your basket, you qualify for Flexi order, which means any other items you add to your basket will also be included in your FlexiBuy payments. So you can spread the cost over multiple monthly payments. After your first payment is made, your entire order will be dispatched. When you add at least £60 worth of any items to your shopping basket, either online or on the phone, you'll qualify for our Flexi Order offer. This means you can spread the cost of your order over equal monthly Flexi Buy payments, offering you extra flexibility when you shop with us. Flexi Order, making your shopping experience with the craft store easier. afternoon. Hello, how are you? I hope you are very well. Uh, now we have got a brand new company or now brand new brand uh, here to the craft store which was launched at 10 o'clock I believe today uh, here at the craft store or oh, well the soon to be create and craft. So remember uh, we are becoming one big channel uh, next week but uh, let me introduce you to maybe somebody who you haven't seen if you didn't tune in at 10 o'clock. Uh, Amanda is joining us for the paper shop. Uh, 
Picasso collection. How are you, Amanda? I'm well, thank you, Paolo. Yeah, it's it's fabulous. It's a beautiful collection. It is, it is. <laughs> now, Amanda, for those ones who didn't tune in at 10 o'clock, tell us a little bit more about yourself. Um, I started crafting really teeny weeny. My it was through my mum, like lots Let's, of us daughters yeah. are. Um, she was into a soft crafting, and then um, I started with the paper crafting, and that created a real monster. Mm. So it's it, yeah, that it, it started really young, and it's all, all, all on always. and off throughout the years. But now yeah. it's 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 a bit of a. Um, like I say, I'm a bit of a paper monster now. Well, paper monster, I, I like that expression, especially for this, um, you know, the new brand that we are celebrating or introducing today, right? Yes. Because it's a paper shop, right? It is, paper shop, yeah, brand new, exclusive, nowhere else yet seen. So if it's the, it's the only place we can get it is here now. In here, and this is a, well the, uh, exclusive, so you can say that that takes one of the boxes. We are also talking about a weekend wow, which means an amazing saving of thirty pounds. But we are going to break it down what you are getting because uh, we have got uh, here the complete collection or the crafting collection that we have got like three different paper ways of uh, well. You are getting all of them, right? The all of them, yeah. You're getting all three. In the whole collection, you're getting all three paperways, and you're then getting your USB and a fabulous Zoom class. Now, so not only you are getting, like I would call it, the consumable collection, but yes. you are getting the forever shop yes absolutely forever shop because even though you've got the three paper packs that will be your consumable and they have got the luxury um, element of the uh, foiling on there they are also still included in your US USB so once you've used what your actual um, physical paper are you've still got them forever on your USB. And that is a great thing because like any crafter will know is that having paper printer is beautiful because this one is also foil some of them aren't some they? Of, yeah it's, uh, it's beautiful but then it's like you want to have extras of those papers that you want to die cut and so much more right we have got a collection remember you are getting the paper craft printed collection in those three colorways the blue the purple and the pink there uh, so we can see look at that and then you are getting the USB now the USB on its own it has a five pound saving the details bottom of the screen for that one uh, that five pound saving carries over to the weekend well so each the paper um, kids have a three pound saving and those ones carry over so that we are talking about nine pounds saving so nine pounds saving plus five pounds saving that's 14 pounds saving and then the workshop that has got a 10 pound saving so that would be at 19 uh, so that's a 24 pounds exactly carried over and additionally you have got a 30 pounds saving it would be oh wow 54 pounds 54 pounds in total saving so you are actually spending way less than you are saving incredible value for money but also those beautiful uh, papers there in those three color ways the pink perfection the stylish spring and the cool breeze now the usb you mentioned amanda that you are getting is it how many colorways 14 extra there's 14 colorways in the whole collection wow. so you're getting on the actual usb the same format that you're getting in the paper kit let me just pull yes this in. if you can show it that would be perfect now I've, I've printed these off on thumbnails because if i was to print all this yes. off and bring it in it would be like that, this to yeah. actually show it you and it is absolutely fabulous yeah. so as you get the format in your actual um, paper kit it's going to be exactly the same so you've got fabulous fabulous toppers which are also similar to what you would find in a rice paper yes so you've got layer upon layer of, of actual print so it's building up that those effects so if you have got some sort of like mulberry paper or even rice paper you could print it off with your absolutely. computer yeah absolutely so create your own rice you, paper yeah yeah so we're giving you the actual prints and you can then print it on any medium that you want to use well I've got some printed on vellum that I'll show you <gasps> as oh, well because yeah. they are beautiful yeah. so these are some of the colorways and it's just like 
a library of a rainbow. It's it's a full rainbow. So yeah, it's because you beautiful. can see even the more muted colours. Yeah, from your brights to your pastels, you're going to get everything. But it's not just everything that you, you're going to get it again and again and again. So if you have an absolute favourite colourway that you like, yeah. or there's a there's a favourite sheet yeah. within the collect in the actual card pack. You don't have to save it now. So, if you are wanted to do maybe, for instance, a workshop, could we uh, would we absolutely. be able to use it? Yes, absolutely. So, again, doing your uh, make and takes, doing your workshops, uh, making to sell, going, you know, for charities, and it, but it's again. It's, look at all of this on this. Look how easy it is to store. Absolutely, and how I love that it comes that? with a case because that way it's not only it's easy to store, but also it's it's, it's harder to lose if it was just a, a single USB. The other thing I love about this collection is the fact that, and you mentioned it in the meeting as well. Like kind of, I just love the way that it's not specific for just one type of paper craft, right? No, absolutely not. Um, I'm a big, I love, my, my thing that I love at the moment is journals. Yeah. I love to do um, junk journaling and paper journaling. But I don't just do the, the, the I like to make them from yes. scratch. So I like yeah, to create my pages and yeah. things. So this is going to be fabulous for when because, I do. Because also, I guess if you have a USB, you can print both sides, for instance, with yeah. different papers if you wanted so to. So you've got the double-sided option. Exactly. Ac uh, absolutely. Yeah. I so it, yeah, the, it, it, oh, it's just stunning. I just absolutely yeah. love yeah. it. Love it. Lo yeah. Just because in the versatility is massive. It is massive yeah. And what sort of, because you mentioned vellums, and we, uh, so what are the cards or paper you like to print on? If it will go through, if you know your actual printer, and you know what weight the car stock it can go through. You can start off with your rice papers, your vellums, mm. your photocopy paper, right the way through to whatever your printer can take. Yeah. So if your printer can actually take the thicker heavy wood card stock, yeah. you can print on anything to your heart's yeah. content. Uh, right, and uh, we have got a lot of different options for you, including the vellum that Amanda has mentioned on the website, uh, thecraftstore.com. There you will find a craft master pure print and you have got 140 GSM paper, 250 GSM, 300 and GSM. Uh, of course, depending on what print you have got, I would recommend 240 is a kind of a good um, ballpoint if you want to add a ballpark for uh, card making and for uh, printing. But there is vellum as well, these the adhesive sheets as well. Now, am I right thinking, Amanda, that the adhesive is great to create stickers with it and toppers? Absolutely for stickers. So I've already got some printed. Let me bring these in. So these are the fabulous sticker sheets so Ooh, you go in this nice wonder sheen. Uh, yeah absolutely but the thing about having a sticker sheet is when you're working with acetate there's no mess on the back <gasps> Oh, so you can create an acetate card and there's nothing showing nice, on the back. Yes. Now, I know that our viewers, some of our viewers are like me, uh, you know, they, are, they can be computer savvy, they can, but when it comes to crafting with a USB, they are afraid a little bit of how easy it is to, or how difficult it's going to be to, yeah. to use it. Is it what, how it works? You know? It's really easy. I am not a techie person at all. I steer away but from that. My boys will actually say, my mum's rubbish. They, mm. they, yeah, every now and then, phones, anything, I give it to them, they sort it out and they give it me back. So I don't do technology. But this is super easy. You open your box, you slot it into your USB yeah. port on your computer, it comes up on your screen, you click open, and all your little icons, toppers, your backing papers, you just click on it and it opens it up and it's all there on your screen. That sounds very easy. It's the easiest thing ever. The hard thing is choosing which one you want to craft with. No. Yeah, it would be really uh, right. Now, one of the things that we, what we, I mean, we also want to try to show you on the computer if we can that, but uh, there's uh, something to do when my producer Ross needs to sort it out. Uh, but what I love about the idea is the stickers that you have printed because I kind of thought that I would never buy a sticker sheet that is uh, an A4 because I would think, well, I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be able to part with it in a way. Mm -hmm. But being a, a, a USB, I can is that I can print exactly the same design as many times as I want. Yeah, absolutely. And it's the, it's the versatility, isn't it? Yeah. Um, but also, these are all in um, squares and we've got the like ribbon strips. 
but we've got the fundamentals. Now, just because it is a square or it's a rectangle, the fundamentals, if you put one of the fundamentals on here that's an oval, yeah. you can still use all of your fundamentals. So not just your squares and your rectangles, you can still use your ovals and your circles to cut out other elements as well. Perfect. Yeah, and then look at these. And look at these. Oh, I love this. This is the vellum. Can I just, if I pass you one of those, uh, yes. Paolo, would you like to have one of yeah, those? Yeah, I'll, I'll show you them, because look at that, look at this one. It's just absolutely stunning. Doesn't it feel lovely? It does. And I have to say that it's, it's just the way that it's been printed is absolutely stunning. But, of course, um, I also love the way that you could print it through the thicker um, vellum if you wanted to. Or even printable acetates. I know oh. that there are some printable acetates out there. Yeah. Printable acetate would be gorgeous. And then also you can do all of your techniques on that as well. Yeah. So if you do like oh, your oh, foiling. behind it. Yeah. You can, oh, it's just, it's just never ending. You can just keep going and going and going. And it's always because you've got the USB. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. Now, if you want to go for this, uh, the beautiful collection of vellum, but the, not the vellums, uh, they, are, they are actually images that your USB will contain, and you can print them time and time again. This is the beautiful thing about a collection like this, that you don't have to choose whether you want the vellums, whether you want the blues, whether you want the, the, uh, the beautiful pinks or the purples. This is a collection in which you will have everything because it comes in a USB. You will decide whether you wanted to print into white uh, or you want to maybe to print into cream maybe you want to paint it into a printable acetate or maybe you just want it ready to go uh, because you also are getting the printed pre-printed pre-foiled elements now some of you have got a foiling machine some of you may have got a collider and then of course you can recreate that even onto the vellum but don't be afraid if like for instance you are like myself that you i don't have a, a kind of a collider uh, collider machine so i cannot foil at home i already will get these printed pre-foil pieces of card which are a4 absolutely stunning i mean i see look at this and i see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve toppers that i can see just in one uh, a4 this is one piece out of how many do we get in the pink option get in, um on all of them, it's the same format, so you're getting 24 sheets, so across all of it, you're getting 72, so if you get all three packs, you're getting 72 pieces of card. Wow. If you get them as single items, it's 36 pence a sheet, wow. but if you're going to buy the collection, it comes down to just 24 pence a sheet. 24 pence. Foiled. Foiled. Uh, you know, so we've got luxury, so Absolutely. they are beautiful card stock. Indeed. I mean, this for, also I was thinking for, uh, you mentioned our journaling. The, the quality of the card means that the back of it, you can use it as a stamping surface. Absolutely. It's beautiful. It's so smooth. It's, it really is stunning. That's what I mean. Is that sometimes you have got, it's like, oh, it's single-sided, so in the back I need to put something else. In this case, I wouldn't because you can, I, I, I straight away I would, or maybe you use the USB and print on the back so it's double-sided. Uh, £44.95. Uh, now, this is the weekend. Wow. And that's not all. You are also getting templates and you are getting as the you know uh, included the, the the zoom workshop which will be is it the 11th of april yes it is yeah two hours with two yourself hours with myself yeah and my all my lovely crafty friends out there so if they they come and join me but also it's um will be recorded so as and when the zoom workshop finishes if you can't make it or you've got because you've got other alternative plans or um, you want to go back you'll get sent a little code you'll log on there and you'll be able to access the zoom and watch it perfect so uh, now the zoom workshop is worth a 19 pounds and 99 pence that means that if you add at the 24 pounds and 99 pence for the uh, USB it means that you are getting all those beautiful printable car uh, for a free you are not paying any extra when you go for the weekend Wow you also are getting the templates as well. Templates and there's also 29 pages of sentiments.
Wow. Let's have a look at those, uh, that USB because uh, many of you are thinking, how can it be, uh, you know, how can it be that simple? Let's have a look at that weekend well USB because, oh, we have got it. There it is, the pastel, uh, pastel perfections. And once you put it in, it kind of comes out of a window and it has got all the uh, folders. You click and basically choose it and there they are. Love that you're also getting the, the thumbprints as well because the thumbprints will give you the ability to see, uh, to print them out like Amanda has got them and then have them there like, like a guide, an index there. But look at the sheer quantity of pages. I'm not surprised, like Amanda says, the difficult I thing print it all out. <laughs> is just like also the choice there. Uh, right, there are all there here, those gorgeous colors and those, all those different uh, options in there. Now, of course, the weekend well is the USB. It's those beautiful pear printed cards with the foil in three different options. The cool breeze, the stylish, uh, the, oh sorry, the stylish uh, spring and then the pink perfection. And it includes that Zoom workshop with Amanda herself. Now the saving, if you consider everything that carries forward, it goes to £54. You're just paying £44.95. Uh, 074929 is your item. Number. Excuse me. They're cleaning something, and then I, it's gone right into my my throat. Um, uh, zero seven four nine two nine is your item number. Sorry, I forgot. Apologies for that. Uh, now we have got also uh, beautiful alphabets in there. And uh, we didn't see them earlier, but they are absolutely perfect because for that journaling, um, you know, that journaling that we were talking. Now, Amanda. I love this one because it's I kind of a perfect one for any gender, any yeah. age as well. Absolutely. But it's fabulous that you're getting across all three, you're actually going to get 71 die cuts. For 1495, which is incredible. You're not only getting your uppercase, but your lowercase and the numbers. But adding into the numbers, you're going to get your ampersand, so you're going to get your your third um First, uh, you know, so you've got your, your ordinals that will go in with that. And then with the lowercase, you've even got some of um, your punctuation. So yeah. you've got your um, exclamation mark, your question mark, and also your um, and, and, and sign. And percent, yeah. So, yeah, it's, it's fabulous. So it will do everything that you need. To, to, I'm going to show you as well because there is not losing it's little does. No, is there? how wonderful is that? The amount of times I've bought an alphabet set and ended up losing that. And it's always an A or an E, oh, the one that you need. Yeah. But yeah, they're swift, so also, they are fabulous. Yeah, and also what I kind of also love the idea is that they could be made into like a stencils like this. Because yes. it's, it's, it's the composition, I like it too. You know, Which, and again, oh, that's exact. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, if you show it to camera six, can, yeah, yeah. You can, oh, there it is. So there we go. If I lay oh, yeah, that there. down, yeah, I've actually then. done exactly that, turned it into a stencil. So if you can imagine, because they will cut through mylar and all your other, so you can actually create tools with this. Yes. So how wonderful would this to be for your journaling, again, to put this in the background and use all your fabulous texture paste and things like that with it as well. But then I've, I've actually cut them all out, so let me bring them in. So oh, you're getting perfect. this is yeah. just wonderful. So you're getting all of these pieces. So you're getting 71 die cuts just for 14, is it 14.95? Yeah. Look at this. 14.96, sorry. 96. Six. Including your wow, end. That's a half price deal, better than half it's, price. It's fabulous, yeah, yeah, absolutely fabulous. But the thing that excites it's a yeah. swift option. So you're never going to lose any of your little pieces. It's yeah. going to be there all the time. I, so, I could see um, I, Rose a name right there because I, that's my nickname for our producer, Ross. I, I always call him Rose. Yeah, there is him. Yeah, so, uh, so I think those birthdays in fact you could even do this so if you were to go to um, uh, a craft fair have all of these cut yeah. already you can then personalize the cards for somebody yeah absolutely so if they, if they yeah. want to put on their uh, happy birthday or if it's a you know a big 21st or a, a you know a lovely fabulous ruby anniversary 
take Perfect. all these with you, cut yeah. them all out and ready to personalise yeah. your cards. Absolutely. I mean, this is a fabulous price. I think this is an incredible... I love the font. I mean, I'm very particular about my fonts and I adore this one. You are getting uppercase, lowercase and numbers for... And it's not a choice for better than half price and already the full price would be amazing but you are paying 14 pounds and 96 pence for all three of them uh, it's basically it's four pounds 98 pence per set which is less than a five or four five pounds and this is brand new today as well and the other thing of those ones are that this is a set that no matter whether like like Amanda was saying car making sometimes people have got different ways of spelling things so, you know for instance is it Molly with a Y or is it Molly with an I and E uh, you know that sort of element in there or is it nicknames as well or destinations if you are doing memory albums or you are doing art journals and you want to have so for instance you want to spell a word that means a lot to you and doesn't mean anything to other other people that you will be able to do this time and time again the fact that this one single die in each for each it means that you can build your sash quickly you can make a stickers if you uh, of course if you use a double-sided adhesive or single-sided adhesive or you could do foil letters if you are using double-sided and then you spot it some gilding flakes the possibilities are endless but also very very busy for this one it should be a happy hour deal this shouldn't it without price I mean half price brand new today it makes sense to go for it six nine four one five four I just love the font as well really it's just one of those ones that I just want it because it's just even this even if it was full price I would still want it you can get it better than half price do check out those baskets tonight six nine four one five four for all three of them right Amanda I know you have are eager to show us uh, another demonstration so take it away so We've, we've gone through that we can make our cards and things with them, but my, my passion at the moment has got to be my journaling and creating these beautiful little memory books. So having all of this stash to work with, and then also if you include in, in your dies, your, your actual alphabet dies, putting it all together, it would be a fabulous gift. You know, if you've got that crafty person, yes buy this and the alphabet and they will be they they can craft on forever and ever it would be beautiful gift to give somebody so yeah, i'll pop this true. together well, yeah for a mother's a mother's day a crafty mother's yeah. day present that would be wonderful wouldn't and it also would be great to to have like print you can print out the same amount exactly the same projects like kind of so you can craft along and see what you do come up with and I love it's, that yeah I, I, that's where I get my inspiration from I'll start in one way and then that will then trigger ah oh, I could do this yeah. let's do this and I don't have to worry now because of having all of this to yeah. hand I don't have to think oh well I can only use this much I can only use this much it's going to give me a wealth of everything there for me to be able to play yeah. with so first of all it's a really simple um, uh, little uh, booklet to do so I've folded over scored and folded over and created this little uh, card blank but I've also created an extra little piece so if I slide that in there you can see that I've now got three surfaces that I can actually create and build on so it's like three individual toppers so on the back of this one I've already placed on my finger lift tape and I'm using my crafty tools oh. these are wonderful I love them I know these are on the show uh, so this is my can you show it again because I haven't seen it yet that so oh. it is absolutely gorgeous it comes with some fabulous tweezers yeah. and it's got three it's so it's it's a twist so you twist the end ah. off it's a pokey tool a knife and also it's got styluses in there as a ball tool as oh. well right because it's a sharp this is a why it's only over 18s only obviously that's this uh, kind of a uh, thing that we need to do for legal reasons because it's a knife considered a knife so so but 17 pounds and 99 pence is your price uh 239 is your item number That's so i can number. say when these came into the office there was a lot of ooing and ahhing over these that went on we all wanted <laughs> we must have it so yeah they are fabulous so they're actually so I've done my card blank I've opened it up I've put finger lift tape across the back 
and using my tool that's what I've taken my backing away right I'm going to make line that up against that fold and then that is now creating my three pages perfect okay so I'm going to fold that back out right. of the way and work on this one first. So I've got all my elements ready. So I've chosen to work with the beautiful cool blue. Yeah. And so that's the, from the cool breeze uh, paper, isn't it? It is, yeah. So first of all, this again, I'm loving this paper kit. It's going to make me use my stash, Paolo. It's going to make me get out the ribbons that I only get out yep. and look at and stroke. It's going to get me to use my buttons exactly. that are overtaking yeah. my house. And I love that it's a color orientated because a lot of us organize things by colors. So therefore we can just go like, oh, I have got a lot of green buttons, for instance. Yeah, I don't know why I have got tons of them. Uh, and then you're thinking, I'm going to select and print the green from the USB. So I'm not going to make sure that everything kind of coordinates with what I have, right? And it's, it's just a great way to like Amanda you were saying to use what you have already. Use your stash yeah get it, yeah because we we as crafters I am also terribly guilty of doing this I will buy something and I don't use it mm. I just sit and look at it. We are collectors. We, yes that oh do you know that is wonderful way of putting we are collectors. Collectors of beauty. Yes we do we collect we are we are very much collectors but with this this is also something that you've got to collect yeah. because, and it's going to give and give and give time yeah. and time again, which is the wonderful thing about it. And I keep putting my tape down and I can't see it. Yeah. So now this is building up the, the back of my little journal. So nice. I've done this in mind of thinking it's coming up to Mother's Day. Yeah. So this is, this is like a little keepsake. So you can pop it through the post. It will all be flat, fold flat. Right, yeah. So it is something you can pop in the post, but it's also a gift element as well. So we're not just creating um, keepsakes and things. We're also creating those gifts to, that we like to do because that's what us crafters are, aren't we? We give, give everything away. So that is my back page. Well, I mean, I, would, I mean, I guess I am a very mean one because I don't give. Mm, we make to give, some. don't we? We make to give, but we sometimes keep them for ourselves. Yeah, that's yeah, that's why we we mustn't do that. We've got I've I've I made I made a pact with myself this year uh, at that I'm not going to do that anymore. I am going to actually use what I buy, and I'm going to get into my stash. And I'm going to make the most of it and yeah. actually start I using think that's it. A good but idea. This is just going to make me do that because I've got all these beautiful colourways to yeah. work with. It's not that I've just bought a uh, well. I've got no purple buttons and I've got no pur. You have got all of the, the colourways. All of the colourways. So again, in the USB. Yeah. The three paper packs that you get in are included. So yeah. once you've used your paper kits they're there again for you to yeah. print out. Yeah. And I was thinking as well, um, you know, I love scrapbooking, our mini albums and how my with it, right? And I was, like, with the USB means that if we, for instance, go to a trip, say, you know, now that we can travel again, but maybe Venice or maybe you go on a holiday. So if you go on a holiday, maybe say in the Caribbean or maybe you go to Mallorca where, you know, my family lives, the blue waters, you know, that kind of, so you oh. kind of choose the blue background papers. If you're thinking of Venice, you're thinking more browns, you are going to maybe Edinburgh and you want a more greyish kind of natural, you go to Northumberland and you want us to maybe a little bit of the sandy colours, you know. Do you have got this, this those colourways? Absolutely, it's just wonderful and also it's going to make you get out your stash of dyes that you've probably put away and you're not using anymore. You've got all these papers now to reinfuse that yeah. that that energy back into your crafting. So I've done my back my back page. Yeah. Now one of the techniques that you just saw me doing, I love doing this yeah. because of several reasons. One, if you don't cut very straight, it hides. <laughs> Yeah, it I hides any wonkiness. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> but it's not it a mistake, it's a deliberate option. Yes, <laughs> you yeah. know, I mean, a little bit wonky. But it also adds that wonderful shabby technique. It's super easy to do. So, all I'm doing is I'm pinching my cardstock, so I'm keeping it nice and sturdy in my hand, and I'm using my scissors and just rubbing across the edge. Now, by doing this, all I'm doing is taking away that printed top piece 
but by doing that I'm exposing all yeah. these lovely That's fluffy nice. fibers and inside the middle as you can see on the back it's beautiful snow white yeah. so now when you bring your inks in to ink this of it's course. going to be a pure color yeah. so that is another one of the advantages of this so and also all your scoring techniques and things so let's just take that back and again I'm going to go, like you say, cool, it covers a multitude of sins, but I, it, I just, I, this is my favourite technique. Yeah. I love the shabby look. And also, it adds, uh, do, do you find that it feels the paper then it picks thicker than it was? Yes. It, feels, it gives like, some rigidity that suddenly is like, what kind of sorcery this is that has roughened the edges and just suddenly the car goes from 200 GSM to 300 GSM, you know? So, it does feel like that. It does, yeah, it does. I love that. What sorcery. So to pop this on, I've already taken all of my... I want to show you a couple of ways how I do this. There's a few tricks that I use. Sometimes I'll take some of right, my backing yeah. away. But to line this up, I'm going to trap it in between my fingers. And that's going to let me pivot it. Yeah. So now when I lay that down, I can move it to make sure I've got it lined up before I commit to sticking. Okay, yeah. And then the next one, again, this is again where you can play with your different mats and layers and your different mediums. Right. So if you like your super thick foam tape yeah. or you like to use your... Um, is that foam tape? This is foam tape. And you're just tearing it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, are you super strong or is it um, very weak? Like, what sorcery uh, is our mama? It's, ju it's just a technique that I've always done. Can you not normally normally tear foam tape? Is that not a normal thing? No. Oh, right, okay. I don't think that way. I mean, not with that ease. I think I'm it just means that I've just done it that, that that much. I don't I don't use you know when you've got your foil and things at home. I don't use. I just tear it as well. Do, do you tear the red liner tape too? Uh, no. Oh. Okay. No. 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 Oof, no. I'm no not. I was going like <laughs> she's kind of do the red liner tape. Yeah, I'm can't done. do I'm the red liner like, tape. You know. <laughs> oh, by the way, can I mention very quickly uh, the dyes? The just in case they are flying out. I'm not surprised. You are uh, you know getting both the lowercase, the uppercase and the numbers with the ampersand as well and the ordinals all in one single die in each of the dies you can see in there so it's three dies but the multitude of words basically you can spell any words in English and many other languages as well uh, 694 and 154 is the item number for what it should be a really happy hour because it's better than half price uh, because you are saving 15 pounds and just paying 14 pounds and this expense love the font a uh, very very busy it's one of those um, alphabets that you know you can never go wrong with an alphabet that is so how do I say it so easy to use you know it's, it's, that, it's, it's not gender specific it's not age specific is it is neutral but it could be for a vintage retro card or it could be for a brand modern spanking kind of card it is perfect also I love one of the things I love is how the R, uh, the dot in the I and in the J is attached. So yeah, no you're not, fiddling. You're not going to lose anything and no fiddling. So when you cut it all out, when you do multi cuts like I've just done, batch cutting yeah. and have it all ready, yeah. you haven't then got to go and look for the little dot for the I or the little dot for the J because it's already attached. It makes it super, super easy. Yes. It's, uh, I just, it's, I think it's all, it's just fabulous. I think as a gift, to buy the, the actual alphabet and this together, as I've said, would be lovely. I think you would make any crafty mum yeah. or uh, sister, they would just adore oh, this. Absolutely. And by the way, if you add it with the collection, the uh, the paper shop collection, the pastel, uh, you know, you can then spread the cost in interest-free payments. So oh, just gosh. pay half of it today. That's even better. Yeah, absolutely. Because of course, because it will be twenty nine pounds and ninety five uh, ninety nine pence. Uh, one at the payment today, and then the same amount next month. And then you will get the USB. You will get the printed car stock, the workshop, and the templates all. And of course, the uh, upper and lower case alphabet. That's a different item number, but then it means that you can flexify. So, in actual fact, if you want to go for the pastel perfection paper crafting collection but you don't want to pay the full amount today, there is that way of getting the alphabets as well. That's incredible. That, is, is. that is really incredible. It is. And, and remember that the, the saving, if you go for both, 
it will be 54 pounds from the weekend wow plus uh, 15 pounds from for uh, the alphabet so that means that you have got a 69 pound saving really yeah that that is that. <laughs> I'm like, really? not speechless very no, no, often, I, but that know, has made me if you, speechless. If you ever hear me saying maths, as as long as I say the producer it has uh, it is uh, you know it's telling me this, that's correct. Like if I do my life on it, some most of the times could be a little bit dodgy, but when I have the confirmation from the the other producer that that's correct, then that's correct. Uh, Sixty nine pounds saving if you go for the weekend well and those alphabets. That is like a why not then, isn't exactly. it? Exactly. That is that is definitely a why absolutely. not. Absolutely. Treat yourself. Yeah, treat yourself. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Why wouldn't um, you for that that value? Um, absolutely. But it's oh, I just I just love it. It's the case of when you get into your crafty zone as well, because I, I actually do this. I'll start off on one direction and go off on another. But one project will give me the inspiration yeah. for the next project and the next project. Now, if I'm working with a paper kit and I run, it's like oh well, I'm I'm. I'm focused on not using yep. everything I've got to save that piece for that I've got to save that piece for that but the ease of being able to use it and having the library that we've got available Absolutely. that's on the USB means that I can then just keep recreating and recreating but also we've got half term at the moment some of us have had half term already yeah. and it's, it's on the flow or it's coming next week to have something like this to print it out you don't have to be precious get everybody crafting yes it keeps everybody busy Absolutely. so that is another it's, it's, like I say it's not just for card crafting you can use it for your scrapbooking mm -hmm. and everything. everything right so where are you up to then? so I did my half fold and yep. popped my page in I've done my back page and used some of my stash and this is going to be I went out for a day out with my boys so it'll be a little keepsake then on my middle piece again I've used my beautiful luxury card and this is when I've made a focal of this flower I want this to be the focal point because also we've got this beautiful foiling and that is the bit that's the wow piece for me so that is just I just loved it so I've kept that in there and then my front piece is where I'm going to create a pocket and as you can see the papers die cut beautifully and these are from the toppers so I've also die cut these out ready so I'm then going to do my own little bit of journaling on this Perfect. and then I can keep this as yes. a gift because that's the other thing uh, like when we look at the USB con contents or the papers they are A4 but then perfect to die cut into tags or journal pages or you know like you were saying use your stash use whatever you have got this is almost like kind of the foundation for all those things all that you the, already have oh I like that Paolo yeah it mm. is it really is your starting it gets you out the block and yeah. gets you going and also you know sometimes and it happens quite a lot with me I lose my crafty mojo and I don't quite yes. know what to do mm -hmm. So if I was to pop the USB in, some of this might be, oh, do you know, I've not worked with that colour for ages. I'm going to have a day of yellow or I'm going to have a day of pink. Just because I've got it with me, this will then spark that interest and then away we go again. So I just, it's just, it's going to be, and it's going to be built on. Yeah. So this is, this is not the only one that's coming. There's going to be more and more. And also, we've also got all of the... Um, stash on here but remember we've got the templates we have yeah. got the uh, sentiments on here as well yeah, so the templates are also on the USB yes so then if it, because I was going to ask if we could re uh, photocopy them but we don't need to because we have got them there. included printed Fun. out so we've got envelopes and card blanks so we've got envelope um, images and also all your little so if it needs to be a tag it's already been designed yeah. for you we've got all these lovely little pockets and tags as well so all of that is included so it's um, it gets you off the ground and running it gives yeah. you all that inspiration but also to have 29 sheets of sentiments yeah I so again the sentiments you can print them on anything that you've got so you can do these on your sticker sheets 
Ah, I see. So if you print these on your sticker sheets, yeah. use your fundamentals and cut around them, then you're creating your stickers for your toppers. So then, again, doing this as thinking that you may be going to um, a craft fair, yeah. print all these out and have them ready, take your little die cutting machine ah, with you, yeah. cut out the sentiment that they yeah. want on the card, and it's a quick, easy, simple sticker to pop on. Yeah. It's just, it just keeps giving and giving and giving. It is fabulous. So I'm just going to finish this off, Paolo. I've yeah. done a little pocket on the front. So yeah. to create the pocket, I've popped some finger litter, some foam tape yeah. just around three sides. The one that you tear. The one that you can tear with your bare hands. <laughs> it's going to be Amanda tearing. Yeah. Is oh, that a me thing now? Is yeah, that it's like... going to be, yeah. Uh, Amanda can tear tape. How can we say bare hands tearing? You know? I don't know. So hey. I've gone, I like this, I like the effect of building up layers. Yeah. I like this offsetting and making things that you can see what's yeah. underneath. It, it, it's one of my favourite things to do. So now I'm going to stick on my pocket on the front and then I've created these two little tags and again the stash that we have at home I have promised myself that I am actually going to use it so I've popped done two little tags a little bit of ribbon yeah. I've already gone round the eggs edges with that little uh, with my scissors to make that shabby technique and then popped two little holes through so these what I'm creating now are my little journaling pages so I can write on here what happened on yeah. the day and then I'm going to tuck that inside on that one and then this one is a little bit bigger so I can do the same thing again so I can hide away maybe a little message yeah. or remember when we did but then I can then take those die cut alphabets yeah. it's been tricky, it's not playing fair let me line those up properly, that might help. There we go. Yeah. It might also help if I put my glasses on Paolo and I've got them on top of my head, but as of yet, I've not actually used yeah. them. <laughs> Well, it's, it's sometimes it's just... Um, I forgot that they were there. Yeah, they are. So that's going to it's tuck in there so as a lovely little gift. And yeah. then we can that's bring fab. in... Aren't they sweet? Yeah. They really are sweet. And just to finish off... And now that's, of course, the, the, the fact is um, you, you, it's easy to find in your stash things that coordinate because they are one colour sort of hue. So therefore you can find things that, whether it are flowers, paper flowers, paper buttons, or you can create your own as well with the papers. I mean, you could print like with rice paper and then shape it. Well, if you're printing on rice paper, you've got all the other techniques of putting yeah. that rice paper onto candles, Absolutely. onto your jars, yeah. um, because I've also got a little bit of a, a fetish of keeping every jar that we ever yeah. have in the house. Oh, well, um, because I um, might need it, yeah. Yeah, I might absolutely. need it, I might need that you. jar. I mean, I had a tin of biscuits for about 15 years, never used it until suddenly I had the brilliant idea for something and it worked a treat. See, See don't I could, you know, yeah, 15 no. years carrying might, on three, four house moves, it. you know. I just yeah. might need that, that bit, of, bit of something that was going to go in the, into the recycling. So now Absolutely. we're upcycling as Absolutely. well. Absolutely. And by so. the way, the biscuits were eaten at the time of purchase <laughs> of 15 years ago. They were more, they were, I wouldn't let them go to waste, you know, the biscuits. So now let's move, let's have maybe, it was somebody's big birthday. So if we finish off and we were to put uh, our yeah. actual alphabet right, and yeah. our numbers on there, they are Perfect. super, super cute. Yeah. They really are. It's fabulous. So that is a great, I, I love that. I love the way that, you know, the papers has been die cut. It has been a little bit, uh, you know, distressed in the edges. There is so many possibilities. Now, uh, this is a full bundle. This is the weekend wow. This is an incredible saving. The, I'm going to go ahead and say, when you consider all the savings, it's 54, uh, is it a total of 54 pounds? Why? Because, let's break it down now if you go for the zoom workshop it's 19 pounds and 99 pence it's two hours uh, that Amanda's going to teach you on the 11th of April now if you cannot make that particular day Amanda's going to make sure that you have got access to it after the, uh, the workshop has uh, done uh, so you can do on catch up so 19 pounds and 99 pence of course it has no PMP because it's um, it's kind of an online thing so remember that saving of 10 pounds 7038 
666 is your item number. Then you have got the USB, which it kind of has 14 different colorways and all the different kind of patterns included in the backing patterns out here. So that has, an, I mean, I'm not going to even do the math, but it is an incredible amount of uh, elements that you are going to have. I mean, you are going to have four texture colors per colorway, two backing papers, two chopper sheets, three of each, so as many as of each design you want. And of course, that in 14 color ways. Then you have got the templates, not just the ones that are printed here, but even more so. Look at those 14 different color ways. Those amazing amount of patterns there as well. And then the templates, let's have a look. Because you have got JPEGs and PDFs. Now, if you are somebody who, um, if I would recommend always to print from a PDF, uh, just it's a little bit easier. Why is because then if you want to make it smaller or bigger, so for instance, if you have got an A3 printer, you can take an A3, uh, an A4, if it's a PDF and print it on an A4 because it kind of expands the sizes. So, so sometimes it does worth a knowing. Uh, and you can download uh, the uh, Cravat uh, Adobe Reader for free and you can then just see all the PDFs. But you have got the backing colors, the emblem, the plain colors. You have got all the sentiments as well there. I mean, we are talking about 200, I believe, 200 sentiments in there. Uh, yes, um, so that is an incredible amount of variations. Then you have those stoppers, those kind of, imagine printing them onto stickers. Imagine printing them into vellum, into acetate. Imagine into rice paper. I mean, these ones with rice paper, they're gonna look as stunning. And the variation of colors are so amazing. Now that is Pastel Perfection, the USB from Paper Shop, a brand new brand uh, here at uh, the craft store. Now that has a five pound saving. So the craft workshop on Zoom has a 10 pound saving. So this is 15, takes us to 15 pounds saving. If you want the USB, 24 pounds and 99 pence is your price. 426395. And then we have got the paper pack. We are gonna start with the cool breeze of the gorgeous blues. Now, this one has 26 uh, pieces of A4 paper um, included there. You have got the pattern paper, you have got the backing paper, the solid uh, texture color, and then you have got the topper sheet. So, and you are getting three of each design. So plenty to go around with the cool breeze. That is the blue option. Uh, it has a three pound saving. So that means that if we went for that one and everything we have seen will be an 18 pound saving. 9.99 the price for them. Three, four, seven, four, two, eight. Then we have got the stylish uh, spring, which is the beautiful sort of, I would say it's kind of almost lavender purple. Um, yeah, sort of lilac lavender with those topper sheets as well as the backing papers and the four te textured uh, colors. They are not textured as in texture, the paper has got texture, but as in texture, it printed on. So it has got the perfect quality to, uh, to die cut. It has got a three pound saving, and 9.99 is your price. That brings your total saving, if you print that one as well, with alongside everything else, to 21 pounds. Uh, 227075 is your item number. But then we have got the pink perfection, which is the, as the name suggests, the colorway of the beautiful roses. And there you have got those intense color corals as well as pinks in their softer blush pinks. And that again has a three pound saving. So that means that you have got a 24 pound saving if you were going to put all those bundles individually into your basket. 003386. So 24 pound savings is great until you realize that if you use another item number and it includes everything that we have to be talking about, an additional another 30 pound saving. So that means that your actual saving is 54 pounds. Pounds. You are paying less than that. You are saving way more than you are spending. You are just spending 44 pounds and 95 pence. And it has got flexi, which means that you could be paying today just 22 pounds and 48 pence. The same amount next month means that the, your budgeting for this collection is much easier. 074929 is your item number. And remember, it has all that saving.
included. But then you have also the collection of dice in here, the alphabet, the numbers as well. This is an incredible collection because you are saving 15 pounds less than, um, than that you, is what you are paying. Add them to your uh, pastel perfection because then you can f flexibize it and that means that you would be only paying about 29 pounds today if you put these ones with your pastel perfections and flexibize. 694154 is your item number. I really love this. Guys. Anyway, uh, back to Amanda and we have got only about seven minutes left or six super, minutes. Super, super quick, lovely Perfect. little quick demo. And again, so now we're going to be using focusing on using the actual dies oh, and perfect. what we can create with that. So super little, it, it just, it's a boy. Oh, because we boy. do need those kind of cards, don't we? So again, like I say, it's going to be for any occasion. Yeah. So if we do marry it up with the actual alphabet, you are covering all bases. So whether it be a birthday, an anniversary, yeah. a get well soon, wish you were here, your journaling, your scrapbooking, this in total for all of it is so versatile yeah. and it's going to open up yeah. and give you the opportunity Absolutely. of doing all those fabulous things that we like to do. Yeah. And it's not expensive. It's, this is not yeah. expensive yeah. crafting, is it? But no, you're going absolutely. to get quality. So I've just created a little card blank, and this is where I'm just going to use white cardstock and I'm picking out the solid colours right. from the actual yeah. craft kit. I'm going to bring in my foam tape again. Right. And so I'm adding depth and dimension by popping the foam yeah. tape on. So I'm adding interest to my card. Right just by using different techniques um, and different mediums. So then, this cra this tool is amazing. Yeah, yeah it, looks, it looks very that's That's now that's yeah. mine. <laughs> shall we show, I mean, if you want to go for the tool, it's the craft knife and toolkit. Uh, you can, do, as Amanda explained, is the handle, then you can untwist it, and it has uh, inside here the pocket tool. I probably would keep the pocket tool all the time in here, and then use the refills of the uh, craft knife for another of my craft knives. And then it has got a reverse angle tweezers as well, very handy. Seventeen pounds and ninety-nine pence uh, on, only for both of them. Uh, let's head back to Amanda. We have got about five minutes left, Amanda. So. I'm just going to pop this ribbon across here. Now, these colourways have worked beautifully together yeah. because all the work has been done exactly, for me. Yeah. I haven't got to think about it. I know that the tones that I'm using with my solid colours are all going to work. Okay. Now, all I have to do now is bring in this fabulous alphabet and I really do oh. love this alphabet. I'm not surprised. I love that this one single die so you can just you know, yeah. it's like cut it twice. Uh, uh, yeah, no, uh, uh, what I would do is I would sit of an evening, yeah. because they're only quite small, I would cut out several of them and I'd have little pots and I'd put all my A's in together. Yeah. But this again is quick crafting yeah, absolutely. because it's on um, an actual swift mechanism. Right, yeah. You only put it through, you, cut, you put it through the dye machine once and you get in yeah. all of your cuts in one go. You're not having to find yeah. that, that letter that you're looking for that has gone missing and wandered off your desk and you're searching for it, you're going to cut it all in one go. So that again is making it really, really easy, like I said, for your, your um, crafty retreats and things like yeah. that, to actually have everything cut out ready i will find my little exclamation it's, oh i it, see no, it's, it's on here somewhere i've cut it out so again you can have everything prepared and everything ready to go so i've cut this out of our gold of this gold yeah. card stock but again think about those sticker sheets so if you print it out of yeah. that beautiful florals then cut it out so you've got floral letters yeah. That would Absolutely. be wonderful. And the stickers. So you're literally just peeling the backs off Absolutely. and using them and sticking them down. Yeah. So I know it's a really easy, quick oh. card. Yeah, I, I, do, I love that. The way that, you know, the papers, they have got that elegance because they have been designed together, so they work together. The font is not... How can I say it? It's, it's, it's the simplicity means that it will go with an array of For different stuff. For everybody, it doesn't matter yeah. whether you're it's a boy and you've just arrived, yeah. or you've got that granddad that's turning a hundred. Absolutely, 
yep. it will be for everybody so awesome. again just a really quick quick card it's Perfect. a boy but the font is just magical it is indeed now of course if you want those dies please make sure to check out your baskets it's not a happy hour but it is almost like feels like one because you are getting them for just 14 pounds and 96 pence you are getting all three dies with all those like cuts in there uh, now you are saving 15 pounds in a better than half price grab yours this is one of those days that time and time and time again you are going to be using 694 uh, is your item number and of course the weekend well now we launch it at well Romanta launch it at 10 a.m. today and it is a wow pack why because you're getting the full pastel perfection collection which means that you're getting printed papers and cards into already straight away open the box there they are the cool breeze, the stylish spring, and the pink perfection. All three gorgeous colorways. Then your each of them comes in with two different templates. So you have got six templates in there. Then you are getting that USB, which includes everything that already comes pre-printed, but then you get the ability to print it in different colorways, 14 different colorways. That means that if you want like a particular colorway and particular design, you can keep printing them printing and printing it's a shop that you have got there a paper shop that you have forever and then you can print onto vellum then let me grab it because it's like printed into printable vellum which by the way we have on the show on rice paper on card on paper on adhesive sheets as well that we have got on the show remember to check out your baskets because on top of that you also are getting that zoom workshop that Amanda is going to teach on the 11th of April for two hours and if you cannot make it you will still have got access to watch at a later date 074929 is your item number and remember the total saving is 54 pounds and you can flexibly now Amanda this is a weekend well so we will see you tomorrow right tomorrow and again on Sunday so what time tomorrow tomorrow we are at seven. Oh, it's an early one. Oh, uh, it will be fine. It's, it's 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 actually great to get up, get ready, and start crafting. Thank you so much. It's been an absolute pleasure. Uh, do check out your baskets and stay tuned for lots more here at the craft store. I'll see you later. Well, it is Green Acre Quilts, and uh, then we have got Ala Create One Day Special up for. Oh, it's Leonie the Mustang. How exciting! Exciting news! For the fifth year in a row, the craft store has been awarded the top accolade of the Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences, as rated by you, our customers, and we are honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence, based on the reviews from over 60,000 the craft store customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. Tickets are on sale now for Crafting Live at Sandown Racecourse. Featuring exclusive offers and competitions. Over 800 make and takes. Stock up from over 50 exhibitors. And meet and greet our craft presenters. Plus, craft members save 25% off their tickets. Book your tickets now at creatingcraft.com and search for Crafting Live. Hello there, my name is Stephanie Waitman. I'm going right back to my grassroots where I started with fabric. We're going to be manufacturing not just fabric by the meter, but also beautiful fabric kits. It's printed in Derbyshire. It's designed by our team of in-house designers. So you are going to get some amazing exclusive designs. Imagine being able to cover everything from apparel to home decor. That's what it's about. So watch out for the individually designed exclusive fabrics that we're going to be bringing to you. And gosh, it's going to be an exciting journey. So please join me and watch out for the shows.
Good afternoon, everybody, and have we got a show for you. The most beautiful quilts brought to us by Green Acres Quilts. Uh, they are absolutely stunning, the most engaging fabrics, beautiful designs. There is something for everybody, but these are your heirloom quilts. These are your showstoppers. They will be an absolute joy to make. Because as crafters, we all know that half the joy is in the journey. So quilting these up, watching them come to life will be an absolute joy. And then obviously you get the further enjoyment of displaying them, gifting them if you want, but just displaying them in your home. They are stunning, stunning quilts. And I know that you're going to have a great hour. So do stick around. We've got lots of demonstrations for you as well. I'm not alone. Uh, we are going to be speaking live on Skype uh, to the lovely Stephanie. Stephanie, hello. Hello, how are you, Dave? I, I am very well, Stephanie. I'm really pleased I'm getting to present this show. It's been a long time. It has, it has. I think you did my very first show. I did. I, I, know, I remember it well, actually. I think you bring us such beautiful designs. And I, I kind of get the sense, and you can answer, answer this question for me, Stephanie. Where I think you're so good is marrying up the right fabrics with the right designs. You're very good at that. Oh, thank you very much. I appreciate it. We try real hard. Yeah. You, you find these designs that just kind of inspire you into making certain, certain quilts. Yeah, well, that's it, and you want to be inspired. Uh, now, tell us, just for anyone who might, have, might not have seen uh, your previous show, Stephanie, tell us a little bit about yourself, your journey uh, into crafting Green Acres. How did it all come about? Well, I'm originally from the Boston area, as you yeah. can tell from my accent. Yes. Married a freshman over there who brought me over here to Donegal 20 years ago. Uh -huh. And I originally was in emergency room nursing and then left and had the opportunity to open my own quilt shop um, in 2009 oh. and haven't looked back since. Amazing. Now, the big question I've got to ask you as a big, is Bostonian a word? I don't know. I'll go with it. But as someone from Boston, are you missing your proper pizzas over there in Donegal? Um, yeah. <laughs> it, it's the one thing, right? I because Boston's yeah, known, the, known for its pizzas. Is it, uh, and uh, again, I'm not sure if I'm going to say the right thing here, because in Boston, is it the deep dish pizza that you guys like? Well, yeah, there's deep dish pizza, there's, there's the sourdough pizza, there's all kinds of different ones, but more of a variety, and yeah. especially where I am out here in the country, we're not close to any real, I think the closest place we have is like a Domino's and like okay. Wow. Hey. But, at least look, you can satisfy, I mean, you might not be satisfying your pizza thirst, but you can definitely satisfy your sewing thirst with all these beautiful kits. So should we start getting into it? Because we have got some great kits here. Uh, the first one is Flowers in My Garden Quilt. Uh, this one, we're just going to have a look at, actually. We've got uh, this beautiful image here. This is a stunning quilt. So Flowers in My Garden, uh, we're just looking at it here. Firstly, I think that price is very good, considering the size of the quilt. And this is, um, you're, only, you're not even seeing all of it here. I will actually show it to you. Uh, so forty-seven fifty. Now, Stephanie, we're getting all the fabric to make, uh, to make the front. Yes, all the fabric for the entire front of the quilt is there. Incredible. Um, almost all of the kits that you buy pretty much anywhere will only have the materials to do the front of the yeah. quilt and your binding. Yeah, well, um, it's, it's standard. We're, we're familiar with that. Uh, and then, because I know that it's very personal choice with the backing and the wadding. I'm going to hold this up properly. I'm going to need to get some help. So, Ben, Ben, can, do you mind helping me, buddy? We can do this because it's a very big quilt. So, Ben, our floor manager, our floor manager extraordinaire, he's going to come in because we'll hold this out. And the reason why I want to do this is I think the size of this quilt is exceptional. Come on in. It's all right, Ben. We're all friends here. There you go. I mean, look at that. That is 71 inches. Uh, I think it's stunning. We, we get that over a double bed, do you reckon, Stephanie? Yes, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Most <laughs> quilts are, are basically made to lie yeah. on the top of the bed. They're not okay. necessarily to be bed spreads that go over the, the side yeah. of the bed. No, they're just Although displays. Although a lot of people like that size as well. But beautiful fabrics. Really, really nice. 
Love this. I love, got... I love that whole line of fabric. Mauda's done a beautiful job oh, with yeah. it. Really, is beautiful. It's one of my favorites. It's a lovely. It's a great price for a lovely, lovely quilt. Uh, eight. Uh, sorry, zero six six nine four five. Your item number there. Ben, you've done a great job. Do you want to give any, everyone a wave? Give a little wave. There's Ben. There's Ben. Thank you, Ben. Uh, okay, so that's our first offering, and we've got something, as I said, for everybody on the show today. Cheers, buddy. Um, so this is your first one. It is our flowers in our garden or in my garden. 71-inch quilt. You're getting all the fabric, everything you need, obviously your instructions as well. Can we just pause for a moment and just say, Stephanie, your instructions are very good too. Thank Full you. Thank you. We try hard to be very detailed with them so yeah. that people don't have any problems step by step as you're going along. I mean, very, very good full color pictures. So you get a whole booklet on obviously constructing your quilt. That's excellent. Having the color pictures and very clear as well. I know a lot of um, sewers out there will really appreciate that when they get that home. So if you do want to go for your Green Acres, beautiful quilt here, 47.50. That's your first flexi payment. We get everything out to you. You get crafting. 066-945, your item number. Okay, now, next, we're gonna look at the quilt behind me. So this, I'll say it, Stephanie, is breathtakingly good. This is a stunning, oh. stunning quilt. Thank you, thank you, that's what we'd like to hear. Well, it, it's beautiful, and what I like about this, it's got a nod to traditional elements. You've got your flying geese, which I do believe is something we might be taking a look at in our demonstrations today. But what I also like, is there is a, an element of something a bit more modern and contemporary too, so it really balances nicely. It does, especially out here in the rural part of the country. Yeah. People like like traditional quilts, um, yeah. so even though we try to to bring in some of the more modern things, the the basic traditional type quilts really just do well here. Yeah, I can imagine. So a stunning quilt, a huge quilt as well, 96 by 96. So what a joy yeah. to make this. Now this we have got three flex, that. three flexi payments of 60 pounds. I have to say though, considering the size of this quilt. Now I'm six foot one, just to give you a sense of scale. So the size of the quilt, why are you laughing, Ben? I'm six foot one. Uh, the size of the quilt uh, that you're getting there and um, the value for money as well is very, very good. Uh, 178581, your item number. So three flexi payments, so 60 pounds today, and then you're spreading the other two payments across three months. Uh, oh, now this is a big point too, I haven't mentioned this, but once anything sells out on the show today, once it's gone, it's gone, we're not bringing it back on extended delivery today, okay? So uh, just let you know that. Right, we're gonna move on. Awful lot of fabric there as well, it's huge. Mm. All right, now, when I said that there is something for everyone, if your budget can't stretch, uh, quite stretch to maybe one of the big on quilts, uh, or maybe you're a beginner and you just wanna dip your toe into the world that is uh, a four quilting patchwork let's just show you this because this is a lovely little piece so uh, center of a table piece Stephanie Stephanie you still there so my scan yeah it's a center piece for the center of your table yeah. or a coffee table or a little end table it's just an unusual piece that we had seen um, from a book that was in Sweden or Scandinavia or someplace um, had seen a similar item Oh, I love so that. We. There's lovely attention to detail, that radiation of the design coming out from the center. Beautiful fabrics in there too. Really nice choice of fabrics. The punch of red contrasting against your grayer tones. Lovely piece. You can imagine this on a table and just showing you there all that beautiful uh, quilting that you can enjoy. Would you ever free motion over that as well, Stephanie? You or, could. Yeah. Yeah, you could. I, I didn't. I, I stitched in the ditch along the edges. But the nice part about getting any of these different patterns yeah. is once you've made it up, you have the pattern so you can make it again in all the colors that would go in your own home or, or as gifts. Oh, that's now that's a great point. Okay, let's just think about that for a moment because how much would you pay for a pattern? How much have you paid for a pattern in the past? The fact that you're not only getting the pattern, but all the fabric in here as well. And as Stephanie said, and this is a really important point, once you've made it, the once, then you've got the opportunity to dip into your own stash, try different fabrics, different colorways, uh, and breathe new inter interpretation to it. You can make, oh, I can uh, ask a question. Can we make to sell if we did do that? 
Could you what? Could we make to sell? If we if we made it ourselves uh, in our own fabrics, would it be okay to sell what we our finished makes? Absolutely. I love that. It's definitely like, yes. Uh, $24.99 your price there. 737-660, your item number. Uh, now we've got another uh, beautiful piece for you. I'm um, out of interest, Stephanie. What's the weather like in Donegal? Because obviously we've got the big storm well, hitting us. We have the big storm here as well, although oh. we're getting the tail end of it now. But we woke up this morning to about three inches of snow Stop. and no electricity. What? So I was real nervous about this afternoon. <laughs> Well, yeah, I was, I was thinking exactly the same thing with the store. The weather outside shocking, but the fact we've got such a good signal, please let it continue. Uh, okay, so going to hold this one up too. This is pretty. So this is our star table centerpiece. That is very, very pretty. Come on, for twenty-four ninety-nine? Are you kidding me? You're getting all the fabric. Obviously, you'll then just put the backing, uh, your, your choice of backing and wadding, but. I think that for twenty four ninety nine is exceptional. Beautiful. Really like that. And especially in blue as well, Stephanie. That's very pretty. I do like that. We we do it here in the shop in multiple yeah. different colours, but to do it online at shows like this, yeah. um, I try to do it all in one particular colour that I think most people will like. But mm -hmm. once again, once you have your pattern, you can make it up in any colours at all that you like. Yeah. Well, very good point. Now, I love this blue. What I like about this, you've got the beautiful floral aspect in here. So this is all year round, but I think at Christmas time especially, having this on the table, and depending on what you put on top, so uh, any ornaments on top of that, it could look very Christmassy too, but it's absolutely not a Christmassy make, because obviously you've got the flowers nestled in there. So it's one for all, all year round, but would look lovely at Christmas too. Well, yeah, again, come Christmas time, you could make the same pattern up in Christmas fabrics yes. and have it as a, as a, um, you know, as a present, as a Christmas present, uh, or for your own home. You're saying all the right things, Stephanie. I love it. Okay, so twenty-four <laughs> ninety-nine is your price there, uh, Two eight eight one five nine. your item number. Now, next we have got a quilt kit uh, table runner that I know a lot of you have been shopping ahead for. It is beautiful. Actually, the fabrics here are really nice. If I just show you, look at these fabrics. These are stunning mm -hmm. fabrics. They've, it's kind of got a very, oh, it's, 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 should I just open up this panel and show you? A very traditional feel to it, Stephanie. W would I be right in saying that? It does. It's another mode of fabric, and it's called oh. Maryland, and it's more of a, almost a Pennsylvania Dutch, yeah. type design. Yeah. Um, so it's, it's unusual, certainly for, for this part of the world. Yeah. Um, you'd see it probably more in the States, but it's just such a beautiful, the cream and the black together work so well together. They really do. This is, this is nice. And when you're saying motor as well, oh, come on. For 20, wait a second. All right, what, Stephanie, we need to talk. Are you telling me <laughs> I'm going to hold this up. Moda fabric, you can make this table runner $25.99. Front, and let me show you this, and back. So we're making the front. Am I right in saying we're making front and back? No, no. Not, no, the back's not included. The oh, front okay. and the border. Well, I so apologize. I apologize. Do you know what it it's was? Because I, I saw border. the design the same, so that was my mistake. But even still, just making the top, obviously, the front of this, for Moda, $25.99, that is exceptional value for money. And it is. You've got, you've got, Moda fabric is just so beautiful. You can always yeah. count on it being a quality fabric. You really can. Now, uh, let me just uh, drop that down for a second. So, say you are getting a lot of fabric there, and I apologize for saying the back. That was my mistake. It's not the back. The only reason I said that is because you're getting such a generous piece of decorative fabric here. And would that be also Moda? Yes, it so, is. The whole thing is Moda. Oh, it's nice, and it's busy. I will just show you uh, again. Look at that. And you're seeing it as a whole. So pretty. So pretty. Now, being a panel, would you say this is slightly, well, it's a good access point for beginners and obviously more experienced sewers? Absolutely. Yeah. So for beginners, it's terrific because it's, it's strictly the panel, you're trimming the panel up and then you're adding the borders to it. Um, for the more advanced ones, it's a quick um, 
present for somebody. It's a quick present for your own home. Yeah. Um, you know, it's, it's essentially an afternoon of fun. Yeah, lovely. It is an afternoon of fun, and it, it's something that I think is going to take pride of place in your home. That is a great shout. If we, um, I mean, anything like Moda, Stephanie, or any of the fabrics, uh, do feel free to tell me the, um, you know, when, which specific fabrics, because I know to sewers it makes a big difference when we're saying sort of it, it's Moda or, or we, you've chosen brilliant fabrics on the show. So do feel free to uh, mention any big names that we come across, okay? Here we go. Let me just fold that back up. All right, so that's our Maryland Table Runner kit. Uh, it's twenty-five ninety-nine, and it's very busy already. Nearly twenty percent of the stock's gone. And remember, when anything sells out for today, we're not bringing it back on extended delivery. So you have been warned. This is very nice. Uh, so slightly different take. We've gone from Moda, we're very traditional. This is a beautiful, beautiful floral fabric. So it is a panel, which I'll open up. This is our Hammingbird uh, Heaven Quilt Kit. Let me just, let me open this up. You're good at picking the panel, Stephanie. These are really nice. Thank you. Yeah. So um, this fabric, do you, who, who made this fabric? Do we have a name for this these one? From, these are from Studio Fabrics, which is another company Big very name. similar to Moda. Yeah. And they come up with some very unusual um, well, as you can see from the, the wow. panel, the design, um, wow. the colors are just so bright and vibrant. That's a so that is a work of art in itself. You're having a look at those beautiful florals, the hummingbirds, it's just such a nice image in itself. That, you wouldn't need to do a lot to that to make it look special. I will show you the completed uh, piece, but for thirty-seven ninety-nine, and you are getting an awful lot included in here. It's big too. It's 43 by 53 inches. So yeah, love that panel in itself. So it's nice lap size quilt. Yeah. Oh, perfect lap size quilt. All right, let me just, uh, I'll fold that up in a second and I'll show you the completed one. Here we go. I do like the fact that you've kind of bordered um, the beautiful panel with the, um, with the dark dark fabric so it, it's it's strong choice and it absolutely works that's nice yeah the black just kind of really brings it out and then when you add the floral um border to it it just it's so beautiful i love it like, this is a good size like you say this is a really generous size lap quilt for 37 pounds and 99 pence wow i've got to tell you we're busy here nearly 20 percent of the stock's gone Oh, I'm not surprised. Stephanie has brought us some absolutely stunning, stunning kits. Stephanie, you really have. I have to applaud you because everything here, I mean, just as a presenter, it's an absolute joy getting to showcase these. You've done so well with it. Okay, now we're going to stick with it. Help me again. It was Studio... It's Studio Fabrics. Studio Fabrics, thank you. So Studio Fabrics. Now we're having a look at this. So this is your Studio Fabrics, bring up the details. Uh, squares, 44 by 48 inches. I mean, come on. Look at that. Now, look at the price as well. So uh, nearly a quarter of stock's gone here. As a presenter, we get to see beautiful quilts, beautiful kits, beautiful brands. So I know value when I see it, and I know beautiful fabric. And I have to say the that is a huge quilt for the price. Absolutely huge. And it's stunning though. Stephanie, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a big fan. I've missed working with you, Stephanie. It's been a long time, but I do remember it, like the, when we worked with each other in the past, I remember you stood out with the kits and, that you're bringing us. This is stunning. This is really nice. Well, we try to find the unusual kinds of things. I mean, everybody has the traditional stuff, so it's nice to be able to come up with some unusual different things that people wouldn't yeah. ordinarily be able to see. Yeah. Well, here, just from that, that print, because you've got beautiful detail within here, so we've got the center, we've got the center piece. All that, that looks that you've already created your own blocks effectively. The panel's giving you that illusion and then you're just creating the border. Thirty-seven ninety-nine for that, 44 by 48 inches. But look at the design, look at the colour palette. It looks like a beautiful, beautiful watercolour painting. You've got the bright, vibrant hummingbirds and there's a dynamic uh, nature to the hummingbirds 
a dynamism and the way it, it, it's hovering. A uh, little fact for you, I don't know if you know this, Stephanie, I'm, I'm guessing you probably do. Hummingbirds, the only birds that can fly backwards. They are. Yeah, I knew you'd know that, <laughs> Stephanie. I knew you'd know that. They're stationary. <laughs> yeah. uh, they can hover. They, they can hover, yeah, that's right. 37.99 your price here, 220669 your item number. Nearly a third of the stock's gone. Can I just show you something again? Look at that. The nice it's, part it's with that one is that you can quilt individually, yeah. you can quilt each block individually, you yeah. can do free motion quilting over the whole quilt. Yeah. So it's a nice one, it gives you a lot of options for your yeah. quilting as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah, uh, very good point, actually, when you start thinking about that. This is what I like, and I, I know we mentioned it with the previous uh, panels as well. So panels, if you're just starting out, that is very achievable. You're not going to feel daunted by the skill set and level uh, to take this on. But equally, and I know how many talented quilters watch us here at the craft store, so you imagine taking it to that next level. Maybe you want to lift each individual block, or if you want a free motion over the top, I mean, you can create something absolutely spectacular. Okay, uh, well, we jumped now to nearly 60% of the stock. 60% of the stock? That's a big leap. All right, thirty-seven ninety-nine. your price there, 220-669. Uh, remember, and I'm sorry to sound like a broken record, but if anything sells out, it looks like this will be selling out, we have not got uh, any more stock to give you. Wait a second. Stephanie, can I just double check this with you? Have you got another hour at seven? Yes, I do. Ooh. <laughs> Stephanie, be in trouble. <laughs> I I'll be honest. I don't know how much stock we're going to have left at seven. Uh, now, we're going to have a look at the bunny. So. We've gone from beautiful florals, we've gone from very traditional fabric uh, to just cute. I mean, seriously, seriously cute little characters. Come on, look <laughs> at that. <laughs> Stephanie, I love this. Yeah. So I will, I will just, uh, I'm gonna open this up in just a moment, but that's sweet. It, it looks to me, Stephanie, this is, got the feel of like a beautifully illustrated storybook to it. It does, it, you know, it's, it's like, see, you know, your Peter oh. Rabbit storybook. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. So let me, I'm sorry, I just, I just knocked over everything on the counter. Let me just, because I want to hold up the full quilt and I think it's worth seeing this. And then think to yourself, who would you be gifting this to? So equally in your home, just as, forget giving it to anyone else, gift to yourself how stunning. <laughs> The characters are so endearing, and they really do tell a story. So this could be your quilt for Easter. Imagine if you've got friends, family coming around for Easter. It is a time when hopefully we'll all be getting together with those that we love. So what a beautiful thing to be displaying just to get in the mood for Easter. Or equally, I would see it, it would look great in a nursery. Can you imagine this in a nursery? But do not fall into the trap. The characters are wonderfully illustrated. This is for all ages. This isn't just for little members of your family. It's got a timeless essence to it. But real char uh, characters here that I think you will fall in love with, the colors, the tone, the theme, everything about this, it is just a lovely, lovely, lovely quilt. Really nice. Where's the, um, the panel from, Stephanie? Um, Do you know brand? I don't. Okay, Remember that's okay. Oh, sorry, I don't <laughs> want to put you on the spot. I know, it, in Stephanie's defense, we have got a lot on the counter. There are a lot of different fabrics. So sorry, I don't want to put you on the spot there, Stephanie. But it's beautiful, really, really, really nice. So if you do want to go for this option, this is the Bunny uh, Quilt Kit. It's 40 by 50 inches, so it's a really good size. And I think uh, lovely for any home, any home there. Okay, so let's carry on down our journey. Now, Bountiful quilt, we're going back to very traditional. I'm going to go out on a limb and say this looks very <laughs> similar to the Moda Fabric uh, panel kit that we had, our, we featured just a few moments ago, the Maryland table. Is it, is it Moda here? It is indeed, ah. and it's Maryland panel again, and yep. this time I've incorporated it, mixed it with uh, log cabin blocks. Lovely. Are you so getting... again, to keep our traditional in, um, with a log cabin, but yeah. again, adds the the Maryland blocks in with it. That is a really classy quilt. 
beautiful quilt. Now, look at what you're getting here. So the, the mode of fabric, the designs with that mode of fabric, and I love the touches of red too. It's kind of like, and I absolutely know it's not red work. I know the, what red work is, but to me, there's something very elegant at that, int that little t subtle touch of red. So it's kind of got that feel of red work. Again, I know it's not red work, but that was my first thought when I was looking at this because it's such a tuttle, uh, a tuttle? subtle little flash <laughs> of uh, red work, uh, red in there. And then you've got these beautiful designs from Moda as well. That is an heirloom quill. You make that up. It's going to be a statement piece. People are going to remember this. If you have this in your home, have a vista, and then you don't see them for years to come. They will remember this quilt. And look at the price as well. Uh, 35 pounds, your first flexi payment, 074687, your item number there. Beautiful. Nearly a quarter of the stock's gone there. We're very busy, Stephanie. Um, That's great. Well, good it, it's great, but I'm slightly worried for your next show. Uh, next, <laughs> we've got this is nice this is frozen in time so again you've got I'm just going to show you actually I've got the completed one and it's nice that we have got all the completed quilts for you let me just put this around so Stephanie this is the big question did you did you quilt all the inspirations that we have on the show or uh, did you get help um, I quilted everything except um, Bucci, the big, the big quilt. The big quilt yeah. hanging up behind you was was professionally quilted by our long arm quilter Nicola Doherty. Okay. Well, I I applaud you. My goodness, I the amount of machine <laughs> the amount of hours you must have uh, spent creating everything for the show, but worth it. This is beautiful. So this is frozen in time. It's got a wintry feel to it, obviously, with the nature, a little snow and the snow drops in there. But it's, again, another quilt that I think we would be happy to display all year round. Two flexi pants of £25.50. It tells a story. It's so inviting. It's got that homely feel, Stephanie. Yes, it's kind of like today in Donegal anyways with the snow all over and the birds what? all all I wish filling my bird feeder <laughs> I'd love, if anyone is watching in Donegal right now, if you could send us in pictures or anyone, if you've, if you've had any snow today, send in pictures. We'd love to see it because uh, it's just been blustery here where we're based. It's been very, very windy, very blustery, uh, but no snow. I, I no snow. I, I kind of like a little splash of snow. Uh, okay, now we've got something a little bit different. So we're looking at all the uh, kits that we have on the show. Here, Stephanie has just brought us a selection of beautiful fat quarters. So come in sets of three. How pretty is this? So this is, uh, you've got two different options. This is your whites. Come on, look at that with the hummingbirds. So they are fat quarters. Uh, Stephanie, just to ask the question, so UK fat quarters? Or U.S.? I carried, yes, I carried loads of fat quarters and all different kinds of things. Mm -hmm. But these particular uh, group came from Swan Lake. And they uh, come with, um, there is a panel that comes with it. There are, are some meters of material that come with it. And yeah. then there are four fat quarters in each package. Oh, okay. So it's... Lovely. Uh, just to clarify, like, with the size of the fat quarter, Stephanie, because I know that American fat quarter is different to uh, the UK fat quarter. So is it, um, would they be meters or yards? Here, 20, 20 by 21, 22. So UK. Yeah, okay. Perfect. Thank yes, you for that. UK. In the US, I know they do, what, 18 by 18, I think yeah. it is, which is Because you guys work cheating. in the yards. It is cheating. <laughs> we, want, we want the UK, so well done. Yeah, we like that. Brilliant. Okay, showing that. So that was a blue option that I've just shared with you. So in each option, we're getting four fat quarters. You're just choosing between your blues or your whites. Fifteen ninety nine is your price. Seven nine one one six zero your item number. Now we did have a Swan Lake panel, but it's all in baskets. We didn't get to it in time, so I'm sorry. It's all in baskets. Nine ninety nine. Wait till you, that, okay, I can see why that's gone so quickly. And it works perfectly with the fat quarters. So uh, it's a cautionary tale. If you do like what you see, w well worth getting into your basket sooner rather than later. We're just looking at it live now. This is that beautiful panel live in the studio.
374152, uh, item number. It's sold out. If any bounce back, I will let you know. Okay, so we've got some fabrics for you as well. When I say some fabrics, sorry, we've got some meter fabrics uh, for you. This is from the same range, Swan Lake. These are very pretty. So that is your blue. Very, we're going to get a good look. I mean, lovely fabrics. I really like this, Stephanie. Nothing unusual, but pretty. Yeah, very pretty. Very, very pretty. Each of the flowers and the, it's almost a jewel tone. Yeah, yeah and you do see that. And actually both work very well. So you're picking, but I have to say, if you did go for both, so there's the blue. And let me just show you the purple. Now, purple's already limited. Purple is my favorite, and I'll tell you why. Look at these butterflies on there. They're stunning. They are absolutely stunning. So you are getting a lovely mix of floral with butterflies. There's a magical nature to this as well, Stephanie. There is, like, like I said, with the, almost the jewel tones with yeah. the, the way the butterflies are all, all split up with, and the hummingbirds, the flowers, the... Yeah. Well, they're very nice. Stephanie, I'm conscious of time, and obviously we're going to have a bit of a play. So uh, do you need a few moments to turn your camera around? Or are you all um, set? Oh, yes. Yep, just yep. for a minute. Okay, we'll, we'll just let uh, Stephanie get set up and then we're going to go to a demonstration. So while Stephanie's doing that, we're going to jump onto our website. <coughs> Have a little look because the website is your friend. There's lots to explore, lots of goodies. What would you be popping into your basket? I'm curious. Producer Lottie, who is obviously an incredible crafter. Lottie, let's just say you were going to put something in your basket from the show. I'm curious, what would you be putting in your basket? Uh -huh. Stephanie, um, Stephanie, Lottie was going for the uh, big quilt that we're going to share with you in just a moment, the one we saw earlier on. But, uh, but she says she's a little bit daunted because she is a beginner. So, um, oh, that's a good question, actually. I will ask Stephanie when we uh, go back to Stephanie if the larger quilt is something maybe a beginner could uh, take on. But the, the beauty of quilting is, and if we have a look at this, I'll just show you. It is a big quilt, and I, I get this. It's, it's a very large quilt. But the joy of quilting is you do not take everything on at once. It's not like buying a pizza and then shoving it all in your mouth in one go. What you do is you break it down into bite-sized chunks. So you take on individual blocks, you're putting it together. So I think that is achievable. It's learning the different techniques. So I think we're going to be looking at flying geese today. So that's an aspect. I think you could do this, Lottie. I think you could. Anyway, Stephanie, how are you getting on? Have you managed to flip your, uh, flip your camera? Yep, I yeah, I think we're good. all set. Okay, so what are we going to take a look at, Stephanie? Well, we're going to take a look at flying geese, which is what you were talking about. Yeah. Especially looking at boutique quilt. There are so many flying geese in it that I think it scares people and it kind of puts them off. And mm -hmm. as you say, if you do it kind of step by step, you find suddenly it's very easy. Yeah. Most people, when they're doing flying geese, would take a, a two or three inch square, put it on the corner of a rectangle and stitch it and fold it open, put one on the other side, and then you would end up cutting all this material off here and here and throwing it out. So to me, there's an awful lot of waste that goes with making flying geese like that. Yeah. And if you do it one at a time, and for that particular quilt, I think there were like 244. You don't want to do one at a time. No. So what we do is the quick flying geese method, which um, people can look it up on YouTube. It's all around. But it's such a lovely way to make flying geese. With that particular um, quilt, you do a five and a quarter inch square. Yeah. And then you do five three inch um, squares, three and a half inch squares, I take it back. And you draw a line on the back of your light colored square and you center it on your corner of your large square. Yeah. And then you take your other piece and you put it on the opposite corner. So the lines that you've drawn have suddenly lined up and they're fine. Okay. You're going to put a small pin in on the side just to hold everything in place. And 
and with your quarter inch foot. Now I'm going to sew this in a dark color so that it shows up mm -hmm. better. But with your, you're going to sew a quarter of an inch to the line on the yeah. So not directly on the line, a quarter of an inch away. Yeah. Okay. Again, when you're doing these, you can do strip sewing, so I can have 20 or 30 of these all made up, all ready to go, and simply put my next set in. Oh, that's If you good. want to do one at a time, yeah. you can do one at a time, uh -huh. but then turn it around and you line it up on the other end, again, with the quarter inch on the line. Mm -hmm. So, Stephanie, I've, I've been presenting here at the craft store for uh, around six years. I don't think I've ever seen flying geese made up this way. And it seems like this is a, a very clever technique if you want to make a lot of flying geese very, very quickly. So it's, it's saving you a lot of time. Because, well, again, you can strip sew and you could just keep on going yeah. and doing this all at once. Then you take these and either with your rotary cutter or your scissors, either way. Yeah. You're going okay, to cut the on the line that you drew. Okay. So when you are doing your strip sewing, do you ever use a donkey to sort of uh, traverse from piece to piece? I do. Yeah. I do. When Good you're time. doing it like this, you don't need to do it immediately yeah. because you're just going from one to the next to the next. Yeah. So then you take your iron and you iron these open. Nice. That's very clever, Stephanie. Uh, very clever. My fingers will be my iron for today. It's okay. <laughs> and then you're going to take your next square uh -huh. and you're going to lay that square on your open pieces. Okay, now again, you still have your line that's drawn. You line this up right on your corner. Again, you pin it. And again, you're going to stitch on the quarter inch side a quarter nice. of an inch from the line that you drew. Yeah. Now, Stephanie, you have to tell us, who's doing the fantastic camera work back at base where you are? My, my co-worker, Penny Arts, is, is behind the scenes. Is it Penny? She's doing a great... Penny, you're doing a great job. Penny. Very, Penny. H-E-N-N-Y. Yeah. -E oh, Penny, Penny, I Arts. say it. Penny, I apologize. Penny, you're doing a fantastic job with the camera work. We're oh, all very, you. very impressed. Yeah. <laughs> Couldn't manage without her, <laughs> let me tell you. Oh. Do you know, it's been too long, Stephanie, since I've been uh, back to Ireland. You know, I'm half Irish, so I've got a lot of, uh, a lot of family in Ireland, so I think I'm going to have to pay a visit. Where, whereabouts are they? Ballinar. Ah. Yeah, oh. it's in not, not right. too not too far away from uh, Dublin. So, again, you're going to cut down that line that you drew mm -hmm. okay. and you're going to open that up yeah and you're going to open this up so now i have two of them done and on the other half piece you do it exactly the same thing mm -hmm. nice Perfect. Now, as I said, you can keep on going if you have 30 or 40 of these all ready to go at once. Yeah. You just keep on sewing so that you're doing all of these at one time. And with this particular and quilt design, that's a good way to go. Yeah, and with the bouquet, there's, there's two or three different colorways on the quilts yeah. on the flying geese, so they're all different colors. Nice. So once you have them all done, you again, you press them all open yeah. and you trim them all up. So for this particular one, they are two and a half by four and a half. Yeah. 
And Who's I now that? have uh, four fine beats. Stephanie, you are good. One, you two, are good. Two and a half. Yeah, so that's... it makes it life much easier. I think that's really, really clever. I've, I've, I've seen flying geese before. I haven't seen flying geese made quite that easily. So, uh, and you can see how many flying geese are incorporated within this quilt. So, as Stephanie was saying, look, if you're going to be doing that, batch make, uh, string, string sew a lot together, and you're saving yourself a lot of time and hassle in building up. But it is achievable. This is a statement quilt. Look at the size of this quilt. Now, look. The fabric that we've got here, um, in just I'm talking from my own experience as a presenter on a craft channel, when we have quilts this kind of size, you're paying a lot more than we have on the show. I mean, three payments of £60, so what, £200 in total for this quilt. You could pay, well, actually, I say to 180 I'm so sorry, my maths. Uh, look, you would, the reason why I was uh, focusing on the 200 because a quilt this size and nature what, 250, 300? You know, this is the kind of money you should be paying. So whenever Green Acres come to visit us, we get great value for money, but also beautiful fabrics, beautiful designs. This would be an absolute joy. If you are looking for your next project, if you're looking for an absolute statement quilt to make, you can see it here. I mean, it's stunning. And I know I mentioned it to um, Stephanie a bit earlier on when we started the show. But this, to me, is such a, a well-designed quilt because it's got very traditional elements that we can all relate to. But equally, with the colorways and the nature of the design, it also balances a modern contemporary twist to it. So I feel that this would work in every household. So if you've got quite a modern house, home, fine. If you've got very traditional home, fine again. So as quilts go, I think it's very, very, very well designed and such a good price. $179.99, your first flexi payment, £60. Look at the amount of fabric that you are getting. A huge amount. Oh, there's not one. This one. There we go. Sorry. This is even better. Look at the amount of fabric that you are getting. A huge... That's actually, that's better. There's a huge amount. Look at it. You're getting an awful lot. I mean, yeah, I haven't even folded out all that fabric. So, and beautiful fabric at that. And, uh, and the thing that's nice is that it's such a large quilt that yeah. for those people, either who have a king size bed mm -hmm. or for the ones who like their quilts to go over the sides of the yeah, bed, yeah. Um, this one fits perfect. Oh, that'd be lovely. And also, I just wanted to point out in the instruction booklet that comes with it yeah. are all the instructions for the fast flying geese. I so do. your instructions are all right there for you. Well, you can see, I mean, with the this is a novel when it comes to making it up. Uh, and I mean that in the very best sense of the word, because you've got detailed instructions. That's all I'm saying by this. You know, sometimes you get a pattern and it might be quilt as desired. You don't want that. You want color pictures, step by step, full instructions every step of the way. So you've got all of that to work through methodically. Uh, we're going to do a uh, quick recap of everything on the show. Stephanie, it's, it's bothering me. I love your accent. Who's the actor? Goodwill Hunting. There were two actors. It was Ben Affleck and... What was his name? Oh, 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 oh I'm terrible. <laughs> Marcus, I'm help terrible. me out here. Ben Affleck <laughs> and Will... Matt Damon. Matt Damon, thank you. Every time I hear you Will speak, Aiden. yeah, I love your accent. I really do love your accent, Stephanie. I hear it. Uh, okay, so we're going to have a quick recap of everything on the show. Uh, there is a lot to get through here, so we will get through it. Don't worry, we've got time. Uh, this is your flowers in your garden. So you are getting a beautiful quilt. I'm going to need a bit of help. Ben, if you come back in. Now, the reason why I may mention uh, Matt Damon, because Ben is considered the Matt Damon of the craft store. There we go. Uh -huh. You can give. Good. Just by his looks, he's, he's, you look a bit like Matt Damon. Okay, so just going to hold this up, and you can see it is a beautiful quilt, great size, 71 by 71, a lovely floral sprays in the fabric, beautiful designs and techniques that you're going to learn. Actually, it's a point, Stephanie, I kind of feel with a lot of your, your uh, quilts, we're going to learn different techniques. So it's something then you can go on, you're adding to your repertoire, and you can explore in your own, way, on, own terms. Well, it is. It's one of the things that we try to do, certainly, in all of our classes. Every class that we have, we have um, different techniques for each class. Brilliant. So that you, like you say, you're learning as you go, but yeah. we all do. Every time I pick up a new pattern, I'm learning as I go along as, as well. Yeah. 
I like that. Uh, it's 40, two flexi payments of 47.50. Uh, Not quite quick enough there, Ben. Uh, 47.50.066.945, your item number. Okay, we're going to move on to our statement quilt, the large one we're having a look at here. We've already had a good look at it, so I will be quick because I know we've got uh, other items to show. Uh, Price-wise, though, 179.99. Two, when you look at this, two, well, sorry, three flexi payments of £60. It's a good size quilt as well. It's 96 by 96, 178581, your item number there. Okay, we're going to move on. Um, we've tried to work, and Stephanie, I've got to applaud Stephanie and Greenacre as well, because the kits they brought onto the show, it's a lovely mix of your sort of larger projects, which I know lots of uh, crafters and so are search for, but also your smaller ones. So if your budget can't stretch to $179.99, $24.99, or maybe you just want a quick project to make, this is a lovely project you could do in an afternoon uh, or in a morning, maybe at the weekend. $24.99 your price here. This is your Scandi table centerpiece. You're going to get the fabric, everything to do the front here, beautiful contrast. And what I like about this is you've got that wonderful punch of red contrasting with those lovely grey tones in there through. Uh, you are going to get the template within this to create all the... I mean, that's great. So we've got the template that we can go on and use in other projects too. All you need to do is uh, use your own batting and wadding. $24.99 your price, 737660 your item number. All right, now another one. I really like this, really like this. Two thirds of the stock has gone. Look at this. I mean, instantly when I hold it up, how can you not like that? Isn't it stunning as a centerpiece? So you imagine that it, on a table. I mean, this, if you have got a large table, it would look fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I uh, love the way it radiates out as well. $24.99 your price here for your Green Acres Star Table Center uh, piece quilt. Your item number is 288159. So now we're going to move on to a little bit of Moda. Been very busy here. This is your Maryland Table Runner. It's two thirds of the stock's gone. It's been immensely busy. And when I open this up and show you what you were getting, come on. Look at that. Isn't it beautiful? So because you've got that large panel you're working with, this is fantastic if you are a beginner, but equally if you are a more experienced sewer, you want to explore free motion, you want to explore different techniques, you can absolutely, oh, I'm just trying to see what's going on there. You can absolutely, do, that was very awkward timing for my, I look like a nosy neighbor. Hello, <laughs> just, hello, hello. Uh, okay, so. There we go. You've got your Maryland Table Runner quilt, uh, quilt kit, 853201, your item number. And it is Moda. It's Moda fabric. Now, this is where life gets very serious because we've got our beautiful hummingbird coming up next. We're nearly 70% of the stock. It's your heaven, uh, hummingbird heaven quilt kit. I'm going to jump straight to the actual finished quilt because you have to see this. Beautiful pattern. Be I mean... Beautiful panel. I'm not even, I don't even think I'm, I haven't overused that word because when you see this, come on. As a centerpiece, it, it is a work of art in itself. I love the theme of the hummingbirds, the colors, it's so fresh. It's modern, but not too modern and out there because I think the floral aspect obviously give it a bit more of a traditional feel. But those hummingbirds are stunning and I do love the color. So as we're all struggling, well in the UK, uh, we're, we're struggling with the uh, storm at the moment. It's windy, it's blustery, it's gray. You know, we're all ready I think for a bit of spring, a bit of sunshine. Isn't that stunning? I really like that. I, I have to say, Stephanie, welcome, I've, sorry, go on. welcome to bring in yeah. Yeah, I absolutely agree. Let, uh, let's welcome Spring in. Stephanie, I've got to applaud you because you have picked some beautiful fabrics and panels to bring us. That is stunning. Absolutely stunning. And there's no other word for it. And thirty-seven ninety-nine your price. Got to tell you, though, busy. Really busy. Um, oh, no. The squares behind, they've gone. So if you do like the hummingbirds, this is it. This is the only option we have left. Were well, we approaching 80% or did I make that up? Sorry, 70% uh, of the stock uh, there. But we have sold out of the larger square, well, I say larger, the, uh, the square option. But OK, we're going to move on to our bunnies. This is where we inject a little bit of uh, Easter, 
Easter spring cuteness into your life. It's a, a lovely, playful quilt kit. So you've got your main, you've got your panel. Now nearly 20% of the stock's gone here. Yeah, I like this. It is, it is Easter. And this is one, the, if you're looking for something to decorate your home. So at Christmas, how many projects have you made up for Christmas that you bring out year after year after year. This is your Easter project, your Easter quilt that you can get out, you can lay on display, uh, maybe hang up if you wanted. Gift if, yeah, we, we could gift, but I think keep it for yourself. The, <laughs> I, I, would, I would, Stephanie, I'm being selfish, but I mean, such a beautiful panel. <laughs> Lovely characters, there is, a, I, I know I mentioned it before, but it's got the feel of a beautiful storybook. You know, illustrated storybook yeah. in there. Yeah. And what I like about this, Stephanie, is for all ages, like sometimes we feature fabric and we're conscious to say it, it really is for younger members of your family. Here, this is for everybody, young or old, from 18 months to 80, you'll enjoy this quilt. Lovely colors, beautiful designs, just a thing of joy to be displaying in your home. You've done really well with this, and I think coming up to Easter, would we, I mean, we've got enough time to make this in time for Easter. Sure. Yeah. Sure. 46.99 is your price, 608 373 item number. Um, sorry, Stephanie, I talked over you there. Were you going to say something? No, I was going to say yes, plenty of time to make yeah. it in time for Easter. Again, yeah. it's panels and squares and, and borders, so it's, it's, it's not achievable. a complicated quilt. Yeah, lovely. Okay. Uh, and also, let's just take a moment to savor that first flexi payment. Twenty-three pounds and fifty pence. This is not going to break the bank. That's a really good price. All right, now we're back to Moda, to Maryland. It's another one. This is the Bountiful. Uh, been exceptionally busy for this. We're nearly half the stock. And do remember, Stephanie has got another show later on at seven p.m. <laughs> We've already had sellouts, and we're going to have more. We can't. If something does sell out, we're not going to be bringing it back on extended delivery at seven because we don't have any. So today is your only chance, maybe in the future if Stephanie comes back, but certainly today we won't be. So talk us through again, Stephanie, this uh, quilt, because it, it, it's a stunning quilt. It's done with the Maryland panel, but yeah. then I've added, like you said, the uh, trim each one of the panels with a little trim of red, yeah. and then I've added a log cabin in coordinating fabrics that go along with, with the Maryland collection. And I, I love log cabins. I think everybody who's done any quilting just loves log cabins. Yeah. So by putting the log cabin together yeah. with the, the traditional, to me it's almost a Pennsylvania Dutch design. Yeah. No, I can see that. I, it's that lovely, I love it. it's the lovely um, balance between the log cabin and obviously that beautiful Moda uh, design that we're seeing. And again, I'm sorry, Stephanie, it's because of Skype. I was talking over you, so I interrupted you. Uh, were you going to say something? No, that's it. <laughs> okay. All right. I've got, it's, it's that awkward time with Skype. There's just a slight delay, so I'm so sorry. I wasn't being rude talking over you. Uh, two flexi payments of £35. If you do want to pop this into your basket, 074687, your item number. Uh, next, we got Frozen in Time. So we're saying, well, Stephanie was saying, this is what Donny Gall looks like right now. Let's just show you here. I'm going to be quick with the next few because I am very conscious of time and we've still got a couple more things to share. But beautiful, it's got a lovely large statement panel. And I have to say, what a charming image. So you've got those wonderful, uh, nearly a quarter of the stock has gone here. So you've got those beautiful birds nestled in in their birdhouse, the snowy banks behind them, the red cardinal on top, that wonderful home in there as well, so inviting. Look at the color tones as well. The snowdrops surrounding the border, everything about this quilt's absolutely first rate, including the flexi payment. Twenty-five fifty, your first flexi payment there, uh, and your item number is three five two one five four. Now, I'm so sorry we sold out of the Swan Lake panels, but we do have the fat quarters that complement. So, two different options here. You're going to get four uh, fat quarters. You either go for your white or your blue. Let's just have a look at the white option with the hummingbird stunning, right? So, you're getting hummingbirds in there. That's a beautiful piece. So, they are UK fat quarters. If you're just wondering, because obviously there is either UK or a US. So, that's the white option. And then I will just show you the blue option. And there we have the blue option going through. Uh, nearly a quarter of both 
have gone there. Uh, and we've got some fabric just to finish off on. So um, with these metre pieces, we are limited for both those. So these are not going to be around the next hour. Look at that. And I have, oh, actually, can I just fold these out? Stephanie, is, yeah. I say, these are, that's a lovely design. And you're getting a lot of, I know we're saying metre pieces, but there's a lot we could do with that. Yeah, they were all 40 by 42, 44 inches is yeah. pretty much what a meat runs here. So there, it's nice because you yeah. can use it for backings. You can use it to cut it up to put it with your back borders. You can use it for a load of different things. But yeah. again, it's unusual material. Yeah. It isn't something that you're going to see every day. Mm. Fifteen ninety nine your price there if you do want to go for the purple limited stock I doubt it's going to be here at seven o'clock and then I'll just hold this up I won't open it out then we have our blue in there as well I also I, I do feel that both fabrics would work wonderfully together because you've got the purples coming in with the flowers there so you could marry both together uh, if you do want to jump onto oh sorry Stephanie what were you going to say I said absolutely they yeah. all look uh, coordinated together yeah. so it's yeah. just kind of easier to sell them as four fat quarters people what? what people are used to yeah of course uh, okay so we're going to jump onto the website there is a lot more to discover you can shop by brand so having a little look at you've got uh, rotary cutters if you need to get hold of rotary cutters good uh, ratings on those as well so five star reviews on there as well um, and then there's a lot more to discover so have a little look on our website, shop by brand, and you'll be able to see everything. And we've also got the seven-day savers, don't forget. Uh, now, I've got to tell you, with regard to the hummingbird options, so uh, the quilt behind me, the squares went, and I'm afraid that the other hummingbird option has gone as well with that large panel. So uh, well done if you managed to get a hold of the hummingbirds. Won't be here at 7. Anything that sells out, oh, it, well, it's a technical sellout. So if anything jumps out of your basket, uh, then obviously someone else can nab it. But don't let that happen to you. Stephanie, I'll see you at 7. Thank you very much, Yanni. I appreciate it. Well, been... Hopefully, we'll have something left to sell at service. Fingers <laughs> crossed. You're an absolute star. Thank you so much, Stephanie. I've really enjoyed this hour. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. I've enjoyed it. Bye-bye. special with Leone. It is the fabulous All End Create. After that, Cool Cats Crafts here with Karen. And then we've got Craft Yourself Silly launching their one day special. Hi, I'm Julie. And I'm Paula. And together we are Julie Hickey Designs. We formed our partnership after many years of friendship, after both of us being in the craft industry for well over 20 years. The thing I love to do most is to share my ideas, hints and tips with you, the viewers, so I can inspire you to pick up a stamp and get creating. Hello, my name's Stuart and I'm the Managing Director of Oakwood Archer. We specialise in high quality items brought into the UK from all over the world, including brands like Kaisercraft, Stampendous and Impression Obsession. Our products include stamps, dies, papers, buttons, trimmings, ribbons and album making kits. Just about everything you need to be a good crafter. heard of Freedom. Did you know that as a Freedom member you could be making savings on every order you place? For just £7.97 a month you will benefit from selected Freedom member discounts and complimentary standard delivery on every order you place. 
You will also receive our exclusive Freedom Members badge, giveaways and crafty updates. If you shop with a craft store more than twice a month, then Freedom is for you. Don't forget, your Freedom membership is flexible, so you can pause if you're going away or you can cancel at any time you decide. So what are you waiting for? Give us a call or go to our website, quoting the item number 888888 and join Freedom today. Hello, good afternoon. Now, just the day I managed to visit Ups in Allen Create Headquarters, and let me tell you, it's really wonderful. It's like a wonderful place full of, you know, incredible stamps and incredible stencils and very organized. <laughs> and of course, those stamps that the brand new delivery are part of that one day special. Now today, what well, or this hour is the final live hour in which you have a chance to look at the one day special, to watch the wonderful demonstrations by none other that the multi-talented, always exceptional, uh, Leone Pujol. <laughs> and not organized. organized, yeah, probably say not, not organized. organized. Yeah. Not organized, yeah. but that's okay. Yeah. Last hour. Um, do you know what? I've really loved these hours because yeah. I've just had a right nice play. Well, that's what been, we like. It's been right nice. I've right, oh. right, had a right nice yeah. um, thing is with Janet Klein, it, I think she really allows you to spark your imagination. Yes. Because obviously this collection is just, it is all about imagination imagination because it's all about stories um, but then when you mix and match it with all the other um, Janet Klein stamps that she's brought to us more of course but specifically Janet you start seeing other things and I love that because it's like oh wow you can do this you can use this yeah. and I must admit I did dig out and people who follow Janet will know uh, she did the the grandpa and Nana one the grandma uh, yeah. and granddad one so obviously in this one we've got little red riding hood and the wolf so you can make so I'm trying to put the wolf head on the Nana head but it didn't quite work. Nana's got too big a head I'm oh, afraid to swap heads with the wolf. Oh. But, but, but that one might not work but all the other playing that I've done has but so you could it's still, experimental. You could still use Nana's uh, stamp with the wolf that meeting yeah, together. Yes, 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 yes. You know, yeah because she could be going no Mr. Wolf you've exactly. changed your reformed character remember? Exactly. Yeah. Here's, um, yeah, here's yeah. a bread can, roll can, instead. You can, uh, yeah you are, you are a vegan wolf now. <laughs> you can uh, you know. Anyway. Here's so a we vegan have, sausage roll. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> Nothing of eating grandmas here. Anyway, let's have a look at the one day special. Now, it is a fabulous collection, as mentioned by Janet Klein for Alan Create. Beautiful stamps, nine stamp sets. It is the February 2022 uh, collection here. And here you have got the A6 stamp set with the mama bear, the papa bear, the baby bear as well. Some day, somebody has been sitting in my chair. Mm -hmm. Then you have got the tree in there as well then you have got I mean my favorite has to be the Puss in Boots mm -hmm. uh, absolutely and then <laughs> you have been on my mind as well Jack in there and then I uh, look at that one uh, then you have got the pirate there the Captain Hook and then we have of course Captain Hook nails a Peter Pan, doesn't it? Neverland. And then what do the bears need? They need a Goldilocks, don't they? So they have got that one as well. And then you cannot have beauty without having the beast. And you cannot have a wolf without having Red Riding Hood. So uh, there you have it. You have the whole collection that you can see it for with a saving of six pounds and a, a and also you can flexi buy it as well. So uh, 69 pounds and 91 pence is your one-off payment, but of course if you flexi buy it, you pay just half of that today. 34 pounds and 96 pence, uh, 883 906 is your item number. And we will be seeing inspiration by Leone and a gorgeous uh, samples of by the design team. Can I show a couple? Because I really think that this collection is just delightful. There's one of the samples which I really love. Uh, well, I love them all, obviously. But one of them, Goldilocks has smashed up the chair. <laughs> and it's like, Is that whoa, one? Is the one she, that I'm holding? She's having a bad day. Yeah. It's like... It's like and just, she looks quite proud of herself. She, she looks like, if you come near me, 
Yeah, yeah just, just walk away. Yeah, exactly. Don't she? She's having, we, ladies, we know those days. Those days. <laughs> She's okay. like, I'm having a really yeah. bad day. Go away. Ah, oh, and let's go to Neverland and never come back until tomorrow never ends. Oh, this is, Isn't this that is, fabulous? I love that. And no. do you know what? Um, I Haley points that, uh, it out in the last hour. We've got a lovely stamp on the show that's by our Tracy Evans that's got um, the little toadstool house that's got a little ah, fairy in it yeah. that could be the perfect Tinkerbell. Oh, and, yeah, of And course. again, it's when you start looking at all your other stamps, it's like, oh, my gosh, that will work so well with it. You know, it's, yeah. I love it. I love that you can get so much out of these. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, absolutely gorgeous. Indeed, they are. I'm trying to find out the stamps, but I don't know where I put them, so that's my problem. The what, what uh, where are the underneath stamp? it? Uh, uh, the, not the stamps of the toadstool. Those ones were the ones that I was looking for. But the toadstool know. stamps? Yeah. They're yeah. further on camera. Oh, right they, no, they are here. Ah. Thank you, Harry. Is, and, uh, these ones are the ones. So that's the one that you wanted. Do you mean that it was Tinkerbell? Right? That's the one. That's what I wanted to show you yeah, that's the one so that you could isn't have that good? yeah absolutely it's, and it's ace in it because like obviously when tracy designed these she weren't thinking janet klein will someday bring yeah. out um you know a peter pan but and yet boom we've got to think it. about already uh, well that's a fabulous uh, saving a uh, six pound saving for these two stamps uh, by tracy evans nine pounds and 98 pence is your price three nine zero one six zero is your uh, number thank you to, uh, um harry for that uh right uh, so we have a look at the transport collection because I uh, did something about planes. Uh, is it kind of a planes, it, trains, and automobiles? Mm -hmm, that's the one. <laughs> Other films are available, mm -hmm. uh, but um, this is really kind of fun, isn't it? Because I think this one works as also very much on its own as yeah. well. Oh, I love this collection. It's it's just super quirky, super cool, um, and it's one of those that I think yeah you can absolutely use it on its own. It definitely does not need to be used with the characters, um, and there's so much in this one you know there's so many elements i love the buildings i think there is and some of the samples you know where you've got like the little um or the little convoy uh, of uh, cars just reminds me of glastonbury oh, so some yeah. amazing samples with these but yeah it's um it's a fabulous collection is this one love it that that looks like a uh, glastonbury the the, the vip yeah. is flying in yes, there yes. you know you can see in there as well the, oh, but oh you can see the building buildings as well. Oh, isn't there's, that beautiful? There's so many possibilities as well. Right, uh, now this co 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 collection, the A6 transport, you're getting four A6 uh, stamp sets. And uh, now it's, and with this stencil as well, there's no pints. Now you can get it on its own with a £10 saving, or you can flexify £22.48 paying today, and the same amount next month. However, if you wanted to go for this collection as well as a the one day special, we have got a one, we call a complete collection now that has got an additional seven pound saving it, am i right thinking that there was a six pound saving here and then there is a set is it seven or ten ten pounds so that's a 16 pound saving plus an additional seven seven pounds so that means a 23 pound saving and if you flexibly uh, means that you can uh, you can flexibly into three interest-free payments not into two the one day special it has but into three interest-free payments the third Thirty-five pounds and ninety-five pence, which means automatically you open a basket of a flexi payment into three, so you can add other th elements into it and have to pay just one third today. Four four one three five three is your item number. Now, Janet Klein's collections for Alan Create are kind of something that many of us love and admire and we have been maybe buying some one or two or three or maybe the complete collections <laughs> or maybe sometimes we have gone and like we are missing a few of them if that's your case we have got a pick and mix and this one you are you have got two options you can go for a set of three and then you choose whichever three are your favorites or you can go for a set of eight however if you go for a set of three you have got a saving 
if you go for a set of eight, basically it's better than half price because you are saving 32 pounds, just paying 31 pounds and 92 pence. It's the perfect opportunity to complete your collection, to make sure that those ones that maybe, maybe it happens, there's a release and then you're thinking, I like four of them, but not the other four, so you don't get it. And then you're thinking, ah, oh, but I really wanted it. Now is the time because you not only you are kind of complete your collection, but you also can do it so at a ha better than half price. And we don't have all of them in the counter, for instance, I have got Dali in here as well. I mean, I'm mm. not a strange. I'm just not normal. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to say that. Next time my mother says that I'm a strange, stranger than a green dog, I'll say that. I'm not a strange. I'm just not normal. Yes, and uh, thank goodness. This is really, I like that one. Uh, if only I had a heart. That one statement, I, you know, tells so applies to me. Anyway, so you can see them on the website. I'm joking. I do have a heart. They're cold hearted. Mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, Cat Love, Little Magic, New Day, Pineapple Queen, Tremendous Friend, The Giving Heart. Oh, see, you could go into a collection that you build yourself up, that you choose. Maybe you want. Also, wouldn't it be great to do little presents for Christmas? This could be a, ma a perfect birthday no. present. You kind of choose whichever kind of remind you of a character. For instance, um, bunny and bunnies so if somebody has got bunnies that would be the perfect present for them frida i love that one frida could be for mm. rachel rachel yeah. loves our rachel uh, your rachel loves um rapunzel that could be for somebody who has got very very long hair the crafter well you know All that's uh, yeah that's absolutely uh coffee time all that would be us. beautiful. Yeah, <laughs> all of us. Yeah, <laughs> moonlight. Yeah, I could be oh. a good book. That would be me. That absolutely would be a good book for me. Or Holly as well. Uh, sugar cookies would be our Emily. So this is what I mean. You can buy them for people that you know. Obviously, you may not know our Emily. You may, uh, but uh, you could uh, maybe game changer for our Harry. Maybe we we'll, we'll put let's put the. Uh, wing it. Oh, he would be winging it. Yeah, that's what that would be. Yeah, that's that's the one. Yeah, absolutely. I would be also cut away. That's that's also one of my ones. Yeah, absolutely. Or little love. Yeah, that could be as well. Material girl. That would be Hailier. Haley. Um. Uh, our Charlotte. We need to say find a Charlotte somewhere. Uh, shall we say which one is? <laughs> Not too ill, that definite. The gold, the lion. She, I think she was a little bit of a lioness in you know, the best possible way. The golden girls in there as well. For instance, for, for Pat and Mark uh, from Totally Patch, the cookout, that's definitely her. Mm. Nana and Papa, oh, they're so cute. Anyway, there is loads. So this is the thing. They are such a great characters. Every single time when we look at them, I put a smile on my face. I'm sure it puts a smile on your face. Mm. And then, of course, it means that you can have a lot of fun choosing those characters and, of course, relay them to whoever in your life inspired those uh, feelings in there. Right, and, of course, remember there is the set of three or you can pick and choose three or pick and choose eight. But then we have got the eight. A6, that was for the A7s. Now the A6 are a larger size. You pick and choose any two with a six pound saving. And then, of course, you have got lots of different options. However, you can go, uh, you can choose five of them and then uh, the saving is not six pounds, but it's 30 pounds, which means again, better than half price. So go for five, get that saving there. 907-998 is your item number. And you have got the kind of the rag dolls, uh, teddy uh, bunnies as well. You have got the chickens, you have got the numbers, you have got the pets. You have got so many options in this one as well, uh, but grab them when it's a half price deal. So let's have a look on the website, the craftstore.com. Hub, there you will find them all the different options and then you can pick five of them so you can p p uh, choose maybe puppy dolls, toys bacon windows color theory background noise um, that's sometimes what I see in my head sometimes there is background noise in my head uh, uh, gnomes uh, rescue puppies visual ingredients for the birds now one of my favorites is the housewives and the gentlemen those ones mm. I absolutely adore and I know that is one of the favorites of Leone now that road trip taken the road trip is also one of my favorites and I think Leon is going to be using the car or maybe she was thinking the gentlemen they are my favorite that's just so good and sweet auto cat as well see I will have to go for two sets of five 
There's the diners. And I would go for two sets of uh, five because then I would have, basically, I would pay for full set, but I would get two sets for the price of one. This is how I look at it. Um, there is the city living, there is the transportation, the Indian stars, Gemini, uh, and let it snow. I like the Gemini one as well. It's really lovely. Anyway, all those options on the website. Did you notice that my voice, I was kind of doing my shopping list there. I was like, well, I like that, I like that. And I'm thinking, ooh, I will. this is when I go into my... Anyway, uh, 907-998 is your item number. Uh, and of course, then you build your own collection of five. And remember, a half price deal, better than half price, in fact. And then we have got a set of three A6 stamps. A meow, Beast Friend, and a Spokes. 33 stamps in total in here. Sold out this morning but I believe we have got him back on extended delivery um, right and it will be the special on Monday so not long to wait considering that today is Friday and tomorrow is Saturday and then is Sunday so not long to wait <laughs> now with these ones there is because um, you've got those blank uh, faces so you can see that these are my favorite favorites for sure um, and you can see the the little faces will fit into the blank so with the cat um, you've obviously got the little happy face the kind of shock face and the really grumpy face um, you've got the back of the cat the front of the cat I absolutely adore these you've then got going down we have got the um, the the uh, wonderful pumpkin and the ghost and again they are blank so even though the packaging is filled in the actual stamp is blank so the actual face is blank for you to fill in the faces love these they are so so cool and it's exactly the same with the monsters so with the monsters again the blank and you're filling these in now obviously you use them for for these wonderful little elements however um earlier on on whatever show it was can't remember anymore uh, but i use one of the faces to stamp onto the tree so ah. it means was that this morning or charlotte it was 8 a.m um so it means you can make a really spooky yeah. tree honestly love these they are so cool and I just think they're, they're utterly unique really really different and the samples are terrific aren't they fabulous they are absolutely oh, love stunning them, love them. but I do love the way I can use them with my Janet collection as well and completely change the look of my Janet collection there there is you need these in Ooh, your life that's amazing these isn't ones. that fabulous what a oh. clever card in it and that, I love um, the other the sentiments. I think it's the sentiments on that one. Oh my God, that's that's amazing. I love that. Uh, you are getting monster hugs. I love monster hugs. Absolutely the beast weirdo. I mean, oh, I, I need that center that is stamp set in my life. Oh my God, spooky! You have got happy. Um, Hunting, oh, uh, haunting, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's just like I read it. I mean, you know how I read things, uh, you know. I think my dyslexia comes into place. I read it very differently. This one, but now it's clearly haunting. Hunt, hunting uh, and then anyway anyway you, you know how to say that word better than I do so I'm not gonna uh, present it uh, and of course we have got the meow in for the cats uh, now 210882 is your item number you are saving 12 pounds 23 pounds and 97 pounds is your price for it and then we have got the stencils uh, as well now Leona, we always say that Arlen Create make stencils like they take them to another level. Yeah, and uh, these are so cool. They are. Aren't they fabulous? Now, I like the um, open end of these because yes. it allows you to use them in so many different ways. You know, you're using these um, to create incredible borders. You know, there's so many elements in there um, that obviously you can pick out. We did have a bit of black card, but I might have brought it back again. Sorry, I did, yeah. But, um, it's absolutely beautiful designs and I like them because they're kind of they're a bit funky aren't they you know those yeah. designs are a little bit cool I love the big florals because you could actually cut those out but yeah really really superb designs and let's face it stencil stamps so you're yeah. they're your tools aren't they absolutely. you're going to use them again and again and again absolutely this and I'm kind of showing kind of I was trying to put this stencil through so you could see how it has been used in the background in there uh, one of Janet it's like, of course, I knew that was Janet. That's such a beautiful work. Uh, 515085 is your item.
return number. Uh, you are saving £12, £15 and £96 is your price. You can shop ahead on the website and uh, there's lots of more there on thecraftstore.com and you can see one of my all-time favorites has to be Totally Dotty uh, stencil there. I got two, no, I got four new stencils last yesterday. Did anyway, you? Yes. Oh, yeah, completely my collection of the Totally, you know, Thing, the yeah. totally dotty. I got the crosses and the um, pluses. Amazing. Anyway, yeah, I was like, yeah, I mm -hmm. was very lucky, very <laughs> lucky. Uh, anyway, moving on from that, uh, let's have a look at, oh, of course, the magical house and a heart at home, and then the washi pick and mix. Can I, oh, and you know what? Is, uh, there is, of course, the clear one or the blank one, which then you can stamp on whichever way you want to and that's when I know that's something you Leone that you have been wanting forever I have love the plain, the plain one yeah it's but I must admit with a washi um I look there's so many of those I love because mm. I really like the the big yes. uh, black and white ones as well yeah. they are the so artsy cool. and crafty yeah oh. and the ones with the sentiments on mm -hmm. it, it's one of them we wash it's funny actually because you can get super carried away with yeah. washi tape um but it does look cool even if you want to put a little bit on but if you're upcycling something say you want to redecorate a box yeah washi tape is the best for it boxes is. they're Absolutely. amazing but yeah, yeah cracking deal is yeah. that um, brilliant by the way we have got here i mean harry is on air today i mean well he's always on air but look at uh we have got those those ones that you kind of see there i mean i love the size of it Look yeah. at this. Aren't they fabulous? I love fabulous. that. And it's just one of those that, because it's grungy, because it's yeah. like really cool, you could use it with so many things. Absolutely. But just covering a background, it looks absolutely phenomenal. And then the clear one is perfect because you can stamp and colorize it and do so much in there. Uh, right, of course, you can choose any five, and it could be five of the same one if you wanted to, but there is plenty of options there that you want to have. Uh, for, uh, the, uh, yeah, the price, let me put my teeth in. And nine pounds and ninety five pence is your price. You're saving five pounds and the item number four seven eight zero one three. Right. Have we done all right? Giving you plenty of time to prep. Oh yeah, I were right because I knew where I were going. It were one of them. It was like, oh yeah, I forgot that one. <laughs> um, so yeah, I were I were ready and waiting to go. So what we have got? Um, so the big bundle where you've got the um, the little buildings and the cars and all that malarkey. Um, I wanted to use this because I thought um, we're going to have some of our fantastic little characters coming into the city. Um, so oh. let's build up a little bit of cityscape on this one so I've got some with where I've got some mass already done so I'm just gonna build up a little kind of city scene yeah. in the background there obviously having a look at which ones I've got the mask for because I know I didn't mask all of them but I've done quite a few so start with these I love these they're the kind of houses that they, they already look like something you recognise. Right, yeah. Do, I, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. it, it looks like it could be um, Amsterdam or, you know, something yeah, like that. Because yeah. they're quirky and... Oh, yeah. <laughs> they're quirky and fabulous. So I'm just going to randomly stamp a few of these initially just to build it up. I should have really started on a smaller page because I've given myself quite a big page to work on here, um, which isn't a good idea because it could take forever. Uh, but I'll, I'll build it up so you can see where I'm going with it. So stamp a few, first of all. That gives me um, my base. Let's take my mask now. Then my little old mask can go there, first of all. So that one can go there. And then let's pull one of these other ones. And again, I love these because they're dead easy to colour in. They're really cool to colour in. They're, again, you can really go for it. So if you're adding loads of, of fabulous colours to them, do you know what I mean? You can get them really funky and, and fab. Yeah. We, we really bright, um, sort of out there colours, I think, with these, because they do look quirky, don't they? I mean, they don't all have to overlap, so some of them I'm not going to overlap. I'm going to pop another one here. Now, because I'm obviously stamping in my book, I never take my page out because I can't be bothered. So I do have to think about where I load this on my, my little old acrylic block. Is so that so the acrylic block doesn't... Yeah, because otherwise yeah. you can't get in there. In fact, even now I might be pushing my look a little bit. But you can't quite get into the spine. Done oh, it. Oh, done it. Boom. Even Even on the one that is touching the, the hole. Yeah, I'd really see that. That 
That's just been a bit forceful, I must admit. It will, it will be stamped there. Mm. Now, Bob, that there like so. I and mean, again, it, it's let's almost build. like you don't have a Spanish blood in you. You know, like you're, you're always like, yeah. it will go it will in there. Go in it there. will. Yeah. Oh, yes, it will. I know, right? Yeah. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> I certainly have a little bit of Spanish blood. <laughs> running through the veins. Absolutely. And now, Absolutely. Bob that there like so, like this, and then stick this one in here, like that. <laughs> And you can see, start me using them so they're all they're all wibbly wobbly. Do you know what I mean? Don't try and get even even roofs. You want all your roofs at different angles, like so. So it creates that really nice um, that really nice little fantastic big. Um, uh, I, I can't think of words. They're all gone. Oh, oh I don't know. Oh, that didn't work so well. That didn't work so well. Sorry. Sorry. I just Sorry. Out. That I'm didn't like, work so well. I'm so... I know. I'm all distracted. You can say that, that, that we are kind of wide. Hey, you know, that didn't work well either. I wonder what's going on there. Yeah, so Let's try that again. Somebody's thinking of you. Hey? Somebody's thinking of you. Why? Because it's not stamping proper. Yeah, because when <laughs> when you are uh, when something is unusually clumsy or unusually not going the right way, yeah. in Mallorca we say that somebody's thinking of you. Good grief! That means someone's thinking of me all the time. I'm always unusually clumsy. <laughs> somebody's in love with you, and I haven't I tell you. It's more like they're they're whinging about me at all. <laughs> I don't think so. No, no, no. It's in a good way. They are thinking of you in oh, a good way. Nice. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. However, it probably is. Uh, it's like probably. Can I do know more of the people who are whinging. Uh, no, no, no. But anyway, Bob, that little one there. I love that one. The little house is fabulous. Because that is. Yeah. I love the. Oh, I've ripped my little mat. Because that one. Oh, yeah, I mean, it's something. Yeah. Uh, uh, that's, that's a good point. Somebody's overthinking. Overthinking. Yeah. Oh making it all very difficult. Oh. Right, so we've got our little timescape. Now, I want to build it up, but so now we want it further away. So I'm going to go in the grey. If I go in the grey, then it's not as intense okay, in the foreground. Yeah. So obviously, this will give it a different look entirely. So if I put that there. Right, yeah. And then the lovely. And even with this one, oh, with this one, <laughs> move it there. Like so. Um, with this one, it's still a, quite a sharp grey, so it's yeah. not going to look um, like it's really, really distant. It's not ah, a really right, light yeah. grey. But see, so you get that really bit nice that, variation. Um, what do you call it? It's called con uh, not contamination. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Contaminated. <laughs> you, know, you know what With I mean? A bit of fog. The fog of, <laughs> of what is it called? The. No, not condensation, no. Mist, yeah, no, but do you know what it is? The fumes from... No, it's just lots of fumes. <laughs> no. Oh, Are you just talking? I don't know what. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, it's that, love. Yeah, it's you know, in a city, that there is always that smog. kind of... Smog. Smog, yeah. So the so city really smog. Well. Yeah. That's, that's covering everything. We make it really romantic, pal. It does, we do. <laughs> uh, it sounds great, does it's, this city? I like the cities. I love oh, London. I, love I absolutely love that London. I love cities. It could be Barcelona, it could be Paris, it could be New York. Yeah. It could be also Amsterdam, maybe? It could. Um, well, this is it. I think I like that, that it's left to the imagination because they are so quirky. Berlin, I maybe? think that's quite fabulous. Yeah, so. Actually, it could even be, I, you know, so I go completely in a tangent, but have you ever seen a city, like the cities in Yemen, that they have got these kind of incredible structures, although they are not modern skyscrapers, they are actually kind of really high, tall buildings, made of almost like terracotta sort of I think buildings. I do know what you mean. You saw those, yeah. Um, so uh, this is the thing: is this or or the prehistoric? It. Well, well, or this, the old <laughs> ancient cities, like in the I think it's the east sort of side of Turkey or Persia, that sort of. Uh, they also had like the excavations, and they had like these sort of buildings like that. Anyway, that I'm going in a big tangent. The people in my ear are just like the people you know. The girls and in I'm my just ear. letting you. I'm just letting you. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> but no, but uh, the thing is, is, this is the thing, it's like these stamps are 
wherever your imagination takes you. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And that is the thing, they can be whatever you want them to be. I mean, this one, have you seen all my fingerprints? Yes. How, how ridiculous is I mean, that? It's smoggy yeah. and full of fingerprints in my little city. I mean, it's ridiculous. I mean, they might have, got, they might have a little kind of a factory of something <laughs> that they have got lots of smoke. Oh, they might have, have the chimneys. They They've have the chimneys, chimneys. Oh, maybe it's, it's cold. It's just up north, isn't it? It's up yeah. north. <laughs> Look at that, there is chimneys there, so they probably are on. Look at it. Yeah, the, exactly. But the nice thing <laughs> is with this, because we're, we're building it up, yeah. uh, the, the lovely smoggy chimney fingerprints will just fade into it. Yeah. It'll look gorgeous. Now I'm moving that one there like that. The reason I'm being worse than ever is because <laughs> every time I move these, they've yeah. got ink on, so it means it's even worse yeah. than ever. Would you but consider, it's fine. if you're using maybe a stay zone, would that dry quicker? Yeah, it would dry quicker. It's funny, I don't, I, I don't use stays on as much as I used to, yeah. though. No, but I, also, also you still think that it might still take some time to yeah, dry. Yeah, probably. So and it doesn't matter. Because you're working over at top, it's absolutely fine. See, now look, look. I do love that because when you remove it, look how cool that looks. Uh, yeah. All them fantastic little buildings. I, I love that. And now, what you can do with this one, I won't stamp anymore because I kind of like it as it is. Um, I think that looks cool. But what I am going to do is just put some of these masks away so I don't lose any of my lovely masks. Um, and then what I will do. Um, it's just had a little bit of ink onto it. Let's add some more smog. Yeah. <laughs> um, but <laughs> uh, just with the fingers, or <laughs> yeah. No, I'll actually use ink this time. Oh. Um, with a little oh, bit of ink pad. Oh, cool. So um, I won't have more smog. I will add a little bit of blue so it doesn't look all too, too. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit of blue so it doesn't look too smoggy. Um, and this again, you don't really need to add tons of colour. You could do. I mean, it would look beautiful with loads of different colours there. But I do think with a little bit of blue just to to brighten that lovely smoggy sky. They'll look quite fabulous. So bring in that in like so, like that. And that's all I want with my lovely little city scene, which that's I think good, is yeah. fab. I love that. But then, okay, now quick and easy because Beauty and the Beast, I've already <gasps> coloured them in. Oh. So your Beauty and the Beast. Dee, 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 dee. Come be coming at so the visit in the city now. See, I kind of wanted them to literally just be on oh. the front of it like that. But then I thought, well, I wonder if that looks a bit too sort of just plonked on. Because I thought, hmm, might be a little bit. So if you just take a little bit of card. So scrap a card and then get one of our lovely little stencils. Now, the stencils, obviously, you've got loads of little bits and bobs in these stencils. The heart bit, absolutely perfect. I better, before I do this, I better get rid of that black on there because I know what I'll do. I'll end up <laughs> more smog. <laughs> Oh, come on. Been up north, haven't I? Been up north. Yeah. All the smog. So, pop a little bit of um, that down, and then we'll get a cheeky band door. I do believe. I love all these colours. And a bit my... That one. Yes, the barn door is the ink pad. Yeah, I forgot about that bit. If you, yeah, if you don't know what the ink pad is, it yeah. is called barn door. Barn door yeah. So... Bring in this in like so. And this will create our lovely little background. Oh, yeah. So when you have a little look, look. Oh. Oh. And we'll bring <laughs> I mean. Beauty and the Beast. She were a good egg. She were very patient, weren't she? Yeah. I mean, I don't know if I'd have been that patient. No, I'd absolutely not. <laughs> I mean, so maybe, maybe that's where we go wrong. Maybe. maybe. Or maybe we haven't, we just met a beast who hasn't had a really nice house or anything. Yeah, actually, absolutely. Or, or any manners. Or, or, exactly, or they are not actually, you know, there is nothing inside. They're just an empty, just an empty shell. Empty shell. Like, an, an ugly empty Soulless shell. Soulless empty shell. Yeah. <laughs> or sometimes we, it's the other way around. They are beautiful empty shells. Empty shells. But, yeah, still. <laughs> uh, anyway. So, let's have a little look-see. 
Oh, oh, they're oh. really cute. So, um, let's just chop this down. Now, obviously, you could die cut it if you wanted it um, chopped down properly. I, I don't. I, yeah. I don't. And actually, funnily enough, I don't actually want it really straight. Let's mm -hmm. let's put a bit of a wobble on it because I think that'll look kind of cute. So, cheeky bit of wobble on. Like that, and then same again here. Really subtle, a subtle wobble. Subtle. And then we'll pop it there, because otherwise, if I make this too big, all the stamping that I did, I'm going to cover it all up with my beauty in the piece, and that will be annoying. <laughs> so, oh, all my smock yeah. covered okay. up with my beauty in oh, the beast. That sounds really nice. Actually, I have to say, it looks proper nice, that, oh, those pretty, edges. They pretty. do. And then, you should make a die like that. Yeah. There must be a die like there that. There must somewhere. be, but do you, I want a Leone Pujol oh. one that is like that. That would be an easy one, that and all, wouldn't yeah, it? Absolutely. It won't take me three years to design. I mean, yeah, by the way, I mean, like, can we talk about that one day? Well, well I am. I'm on it now. I'm on it. Oh, I've done good. some papers. And oh. I want some collage papers because I really like collage papers. So I've designed some. Mm, um, exciting. And what else have I done? I've done some things. When are they going to be out? Uh, Mate, I haven't finished yet. <laughs> oh, three years from now? <laughs> Maybe. No. Do I no, need to be the, be the heart as master? No, if she can try, kid, I but you try. know me. I will fail, I'm telling you. <laughs> uh, no, one day, one day. One day. Uh, Prince will come for me and all that business. Yeah. There we go. A little, a few dodgy little lines. Yeah. because they always work. Now, I'm popping little line on because I don't want to matten layer it. So rather than matten yeah. layering it, but I wanted to create um, a border. Yeah. So rather than matten layering it, popping that like show, which I like, pop a little bit of uh, tape. I'm only popping tape on this because my glue bottle's nearly empty. Yeah. Um, so that'll just be a little bit quicker. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm very honest. Very honest. See, gutted now because all that stamping. Yeah. Oh, let's put it there where it's not quite as as stamped. Could you do if 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 you do something like this? Could you do? Would you ever consider to put like um, an acetate overhang so therefore the you could always lift it off? Yeah, you what like a little um. Yeah, something like this. Yeah, so, so you so could see the city plops, underneath. Yeah. That'd be nice. Yeah. Yeah, so it won't be covering it all the time. Yeah. I could have done that with that, easy. Yeah. I could have put a little hinge on it. Hinge, that's the thing. A cheeky little like, hinge, like, rather than a flip flop. <laughs> yeah, but I knew what you meant by flip flops. She didn't mean flip flops on her. <laughs> I mean, if she's comfortable, maybe she, she prefers to wear flip flops. flip flops. No one can see under me dress. Can you imagine if in Cinderella, instead of uh, having a glass of slipper, it was flip flops? I think it should be that it way. It should be, yeah. I think modern day Cinderella. No, but then it wouldn't work as well with the ugly step sisters because a flip flop, let's be honest, almost everybody can fit into one. Yeah, I suppose. I suppose. Yeah, that won't be. Yeah, as, no, it's not as mm, rigid as a glass. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe we'd have to, we'll have to think of something else then, other than the flip flop. But I do think modern day. I think that would be ace. Yeah. yeah, or or uh, the the docks kind of one. Yeah. You know. Now there. I oh, love that. I like and that. And then all I would do now to finish this, do you know what? I wouldn't really do anything else to that because I really quite like yeah. it. I probably, the only thing I'd probably do yeah. is bring some of the background right, into here. Yeah. So just bring in a little bit of my, my, um, my hearts and just bring them over here so it actually sort of flows back into the, the main um, elements and the main sort of scene. Look. So you've got your little yeah. hearts. See, they look really cute. And you know what we were talking about with that stencil before the open, the open edges on the stencil. See, with these, these are cracking for creating borders. So if you do want to bring in the uh, the colour to create some beautiful See. borders, you can easily do that. So if I just get a little bit of blue, and I won't do too many because I am faffing now. I'm just playing now. But <clears throat> bring in a bit okay. of ink on here let me just get that spin that round and i did this in the last one but i okay. really liked it because it's just so ridiculously effective just bringing those lovely yeah. little borders in like so 
See how cute is that? Oh, I prefer lovely. it on the plain paper, actually. But because because that's quite a busy background, you mm. don't see the um, the border quite as yeah. well. But in fact, I'm going to leave it. I'm not going to faff because I think that's enough. But I like the hearts. I guess. And the, with yeah, the hearts, like so, yeah. And then I would be faffing more, obviously. You know what I feel? Obviously. They are they are in a magic carpet flying across the city, oh. and wherever they go, they get leave that that kind of dust of little hearts. Oh. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful, Paula. The See. flying around over the city. There's a scattering love. Scattering over love over the city. <laughs> and oh, trying to put So romantic. <laughs> I mean, somebody has to put the romance in, anyway. <laughs> No, no, not you. She could try. No, no, I'm not meaning you. It's like, oh, I don't you. know. I'm absolutely like. Bitter. No, you are not. <laughs> <laughs> Twisted. Oh, Neither I'm, of us are really. We are absolutely joking. Yeah, we are We're joking. All fabulous. I mean, we are all both. Both of us are bitter and both romantic. Both and, bitter you know. and twisted. Anyway, and crafting. Anyway, I'm just let's... twisted, not really bitter. Okay. <laughs> I'm not bitter, to be honest, actually. Uh, not bitter. Anyway, obviously, you yeah, know. How can you be better when you have got such a glorious images? Eh? You have got <laughs> beautiful golden logs in here, beautiful the three bears. Now these, of course, are part of the one day special. And I love the way that because the sizes coordinate with everything across, you can create your own wild stories. I mean, like if you, like, like I was kind of saying, yeah, beauty and the base flying across the city, scattering in love. Or what about the vegan uh, wolf? But then she is not vegan. Okay, so that could be a, another story. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, better not. Sorry, to do it. Wolf. I was saying the vegan, uh, anyway, oh, the vegan wolf. Uh, anyway, so we have got, of course, uh, the Peter Pan, and uh, we have got the Captain Hook as well in here. Uh, kind of like really characterful with that look into each other's eyes, that friendliness. You kind of. I, was, I think it would be lovely as well to use glossy accents in the eyeballs to have that glossiness in there. Look at the jaw, kind of trying to go, kind of go up and up and up. And the sentiment, you have been on my mind. And then look at that, the same image, but how different do they look? And this is the thing, you have got the images that you can switch around. And of course, Leonie loves this one, making a, you know, just right. This product is just right. I mean, imagine if it wasn't right, what would she would have done? I mean, she smashed the table or the chair when it was <laughs> just right. Imagine if it hadn't been right. I mean, they would be running across. But this is the kind of thing that you can do. This is the kind of stories you can tell. You can elaborate further. You can. I love the way that you can bring those stamps, all that detail in here This book that you have got in the photopolymer stamps. All the different, oh, my favorite, it has to be him, isn't it? Just Perfect. An attitude such as mine can only be taught, not inherit. Look at that. It's just gorgeous. And of course, then you can create other characters uh, by mixing and matching, by creating them into different uh, situations. Maybe you are a collector of Janet Klein's stamps, and this is, of course, needs, you need to get it because it's the latest collection. Or maybe you are a brand new person to the whole all and create a world universe. Because I it feels like a universe of characters in which you can build your own collection and can you imagine it would be amazing to create like a doll's house but which the characters are janet klein's uh oh. cut out yeah that'd be well and, and then of course you can do what Jan, uh, uh, leone does that is cut heads <laughs> Sorry, yeah. cut in the in the characters. <laughs> you know, no, 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 she doesn't cut. It. She's not somebody who goes out on Friday night. It's like I'm gonna cut a few heads. <laughs> no, no. What I mean is, is the actual characters. She switch around heads, swaps heads. That's, that's so much better. Uh, but um, you know what I mean with the characters, the stamp images. So then you can then do different outfits, and you can create like, and that would be so amazing, like doing a full uh, house, uh, doll's house sort of thing. Anyway, this is the latest collection, the February, uh, February 2022, and you have got a six pound saving, a 69 pounds and 91 pounds is your price. Remember that six pound saving will disappear at 6 p.m. and also the interest-free payments ability to split it in two interest-free payments of £34.96, 883906. Now, if you go want to go for the full collection, which includes not only all the stands that we have looked at, but also 
the transport ones, which uh, that means that you are getting January and February in, uh, as well as the stencil. Now you have got an additional seven, saving, seven pound saving. Considering that the transport had the 10 pound saving and the, um, uh, the uh, fairy tale, the storytelling uh, stance has got a six pounds, that means that your saving is actually uh, 23 pounds. Uh, there it is. Um, 107 pounds and 86 pounds is your, it's like 86 pence is <laughs> your price if you flexi buy is 35 pounds and 95 pence and of course that is three payments which means that you can add other elements into it as well and flexibize into three payments 441 353 is your item number now, the stencils that we have got on the show, I mean, of course, if you go for the complete, it includes one stencil, but we have got more stencils, uh, which is the Art, the Trefiori uh, tre Petals and Pots on Saturday morning. Uh, with a £12 saving, you are just paying £15.96. 515-085 is your item number. And, uh, ooh, Totally Dotty is uh, definitely, I think probably, that would be my desert island stencil, the totally dotty, because that's the A41 and it has all the little ones and the big opening ones. So it's one of, if not, in my opinion, the most versatile of the stencils. Ten pounds and ninety-nine pence is your price. Four one six eight three one is your item number. And also we have the uh, this uh, stamp set with the meow, the beast uh, friend, and the spokes. Thirty-three stamps, saving twelve pounds. Uh, 23 uh, pounds and 97 pence is your price. It's uh, back on extended. Just still uh, will be the 21st, which is Monday. 210882 is your item number. Can I show as well, since since uh, Harry went and got mm -hmm. the total leader? It's just such a cool, I mean, look at this. And it's such a cool stencil. If you don't have this one, please get it. 1099 is your price. Because you can see they are tiny in one side, big in here. There is so many possibilities. Absolutely one of the best stencils ever in my own humble opinion. Uh, right, uh, back to you, uh, Leona. Could you, you love do me a favor? Yes. Um, over near, um, over near, I think it will be the A6 stamps. There's a little barrel. Yes. Um, and it, if I could have that, please, I cut it out, but I didn't. Um, I didn't get it back again because Haley was showing the chickens with the little oh, barrel. Okay. But, but I don't know where it got put, and I, I thought, oh, that would be good to use. Okay. If we'll not, look. If we we'll don't turn up, I'll stamp it. I out will again. have a look. I'll, I'll re-stamp it. It's not a big deal. It'll only take a second to cut out. But but so just thinking about that lovely totally dotty stencil. So if we put ink on this side, so let's do a fabulous little print with it. Okay, like a dish. Okay. And then, and this is just, again, playing with the stamps, showing how you can use them, showing how you can mix them up with all the other goodies in the collection. So if I take this, spritz it with water, like this, it might have got put with the actual cards because it was right over there where, um, where the yeah. A6 stamps are. Which ones? These ones? The, yeah. yeah, the um, A7, sorry. Oh, A7. A7, not A6. It was the A7 because it were the That's chicken why, one. That's why, because we have been looking in the wrong place. So No, Harry's looking in right place, I oh. thought. But anyway, it don't matter. I'll re-stamp it. Right, so, um, stamping this one out, first of all. Right, so, now the stencil, obviously, um, as our Miss P was saying, there's loads you can do with this. It's absolutely fabulous. Now, what would be rather fab is cutting these out... I'll cut one or two out. I won't cut them all out, but I'll cut one or two out. Um, obviously, you'll take your time with this. You'll cut them out properly. But what you could do with this is then create some fabulous little apertures with this. So, of course, you're going to take a little bit longer. I have gone off piece. This isn't what I was going to do. I was going to do the windows one, but I might do that as well. Same kind of idea. But how many minutes have I got? I okay. Nine minutes. Oh, nah. oh, that's okay. I'll get a couple. So, so, see, you could bring in this in like so. Yeah. Bring in this in like so. I've got, now, these are one of the A7 stamps with the chickens on. Absolutely love these. I think they're hilarious. And these are the kind of stamps that, again, you can do so much with. They are, they're quite ridiculous and oh, quite fabulous. So, with something like this, 
you could have your fabulous little chicken. Let's have a fabulous little chicken. Mm -hmm. So, um, these will absolutely, well, I think they're in the pick and mix. They are one of, this is one of the A7, no, no it isn't. This is one of the A6s. I get me the A6s and my A7s mixed up. This That's is one of your little A7s. Oh, is it? I'm sorry, A6. A6. Oh, oh, yeah, I, A6 I'll yeah. say it and then correct myself. Yeah. And, oh, there we go. So, look, so we oh. could be in the lovely little aperture like this. That. But then I'm going to take our little barrel. Now, the barrel is from our wonderful one day special and he is from our fantastic um, hook, um, our Captain Hook. So we're taking our lovely Captain Hook. We're taking our fantastic little barrel. Pop it on there here. There is a barrel over there. Right. Did you not, there is a barrel. Just yeah, a, that's a mask. Oh, I, I cut it out and cut the lid off oh. so we could put the chicken in it. So we had the chicken in the barrel, you see. And it looked really, really cool. So if I just do this like so. Sorry, we have been looking everywhere. It'll be find... under something safe. It don't matter. It only takes a second to cut out. So this is your little barrel. Now, the barrels are fab because with the barrels, you can create lots of fantastic backgrounds. If you create a mask, you can layer them up. So you've got a really, really cool um, little um, a collection of barrels but if you cut this bit off it means you can put things inside the barrel so you could put your little characters ah, inside the barrel yeah. see what i mean yeah you could put look at your little pigeon it um, ridiculously yeah oh. whatever you put in the barrel just kind of looks funny it's one of those things that uh, it just yeah. looks daft coming out of the barrel do you know what i mean it just it just sort of oh, makes you get I love, that's my favorite <laughs> <laughs> I love these. It's one of those. It's one, yeah, he would really be stuck in the barrel. It'd be like he has got way too much going on. Yeah. I was saying as well, um, the the Captain Hook one. It reminds me of Lawrence Llewellyn Bowen. Oh yes, you but, did but say that. Hook. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah. I think it looks quite fabulous. Yeah. And I think you will see so many other characters within yeah. the characters. Do, do you remember that time that we taught at um, Olympia, and then it was you, then it was me, then it was Andrew Llewellyn Bowen. Oh, oh my gosh, yeah, he was there, wasn't Yeah, it? something like that, I yeah. I forgot about yeah. that. Oh my gosh, he was there. Yeah. We, we probably met him then, did we? Did Not we really. I, he, well, anyway. No, no I didn't we didn't talk. We didn't, actually, we didn't. <laughs> Yeah. So, we've got one little chicken there, which is there, I tell you, I forgot more than I remember in life. And obviously, if you raise it up on 3D form, you're going to have that wonderful little chicken. He looks quite, look, he looks quite sad, doesn't he? Um, and then, and then we'll get another one. See, what I was saying, though, is if you made this into a card, oh, no, I wanted to, look, if I change this, I'm swapping it around and changing my mind because this is what I was chatting about with our uh, Haley earlier on. So with this one, if you add your little chicken, so this time we're having his little bum. Oh, that's the wrong chicken. Bear with. I've put ink on him, don't matter. Five minutes. Mm. Quickly on it, quick, quick, quick. Look, your little chicken. And he's got this. Like that, because he's looking through his legs. Oh! But oh. if you made this into a car, yeah, like so, so it were opening up, <laughs> and at the front you just had a barrel. Oh! It'd be like, I love that. Oh yeah, that's so cute. So then when you opened it up, it'd be your little chicken inside. <laughs> It looks like it's, it's the head, the hair of somebody. Yeah, I, I, I love that. I think that's quite fabulous. That anyway, cool. moving on. That was Leonie really, really playing with chickens because I wanted to do it for an half a minute. That's how it kind of oh, works with these stamps. You what, what, what? It works like you play Absolutely. with the characters, you play with the different... And this is why I love them. them, because you have so many elements, you have so many fantastic little bits that will work together. And that's why yeah. they, oh, they, there's so much you can do with them the windows now you have to have the windows because with the windows and these are another you can create so many different looks with these ah, now with your wonderful little window so if i bring this in here like so you could either oh i'm bet i'm doing this and i might not have a mask for it yes i have yeah. so we've got our little window like this now, you would actually, when I first did these, in fact, look, the circle one. Sorry, I am changing my mind again. Doing a lot of that in this hour. 
three and a half minutes, I can do this. So, look, little window, like this. Don't hold your breath. <laughs> I say I can do it, but I might be lying. But look, look, look. It's because I've got the little mask here. Yeah. Like, so I'm not breathing. Just pop that down, because I did it wrong. Bear with two and a half minutes. Okay. 20 yeah, seconds. Yeah. Right, popping that there. Popping that here. Like so. You want your outer frame, because otherwise when you stamp your elements, you're going to see it, you see. So that's why you want your outer frame. I'm then going to put, I'm going to go for one of the bears, just because I can. Oh, okay, I should yeah. do the wolf. Oh, the wolf. The big bag wolf. Quick, quick, quick. So we're going to do the little wolf. Yeah. Because he can be looking in. I'll be careful where I ink him up. Because we sort of want his little face, don't we? Yeah. Like that. Didn't ink it. Yeah, I didn't ink it at all. Hey, didn't ink it. I was were, I were thinking. I was thinking. So then we've got the little look at him. Look at him walking past the window. Yeah. And then, look how inky I am today. Yeah, absolutely. Honestly, this is no, the worst I've ever been. That's the background. That? You're adding texture to the background. But where yeah. have I actually got that from? Your fingers? That's ridiculous. It might be this. <gasps> I think I might this. have dipped that into yeah. my ink pad. But yeah. anyway, look. So, she's inside. Getting yeah. ready to go out oh. and look, he's he's wandering past like, the window. Go Maybe out. she likes Hello, it well. hello, <laughs> little lady. <laughs> and actually, but it's okay. It's not a scary wolf. He's just a friend. Oh. So he's just oh, saying, "Are you ready always. yet? Are you ready yet to are go ready? out?" Yeah. That's that's all that is. Or it's just like, are you coming in? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that sounds even more dodgy, love. <laughs> Uh, especially what big eyes you have. <laughs> Fabulous, <laughs> isn't it? Um, oh. But I love that. So the windows ones, again, they are part of that pick and mix. They are in the A6 uh, Actually, collection. So please make sure you check your baskets out absolutely. with those Absolutely. Check out your baskets and, and remember that there is that flag C and that means that you can split the cost into interest-free payments. Also remember that you have got a complete collection and you can get it with the transports as well. Because maybe what it is, is the Red Riding Hood is just waiting for the bus and then the wolf comes alongside or vice versa. Hmm? Is that the bus? Bus, yeah. And he's waiting for a bus. Oh, yeah. so it's in the bus train. station. Or the train, you know, it's kind of or, uh, waiting for, you know, it's just kind of, a, yeah. They're in bus station. Uh, bus station. <laughs> The station. It might be waiting for a bus. Just waiting for two and, and then train. you yeah. could quite easily, like you know, on the outside, you could have all your little cars. Oh, absolutely. I mean, yeah. What <laughs> big body you have? <laughs> you cannot fit in that car. Anyway, remember to check out your baskets. <laughs> remember that this is the last final call uh, for the one day special. There is no more live hours of the one day special, so make sure to do that. I'll see you. We'll see you tomorrow. Won't I'll we? see you. I'm on Crate and Craft tomorrow with Art Inspiration. So some silly quarter past six. Some random time. Uh, we cannot wait until everything is very nice and organized. Cool Cats Crafts with Karen after the break. Crab yourself silly one day special and then Green Acre Quilts at 7. I'll see you later on. I'm Trisha from So Totally Trisha. I've been sewing since I was about eight years old. I carried on through my teens, and when I had children, I've sewn for them. And now I love nothing more than to design fabric-based kits for patchwork, for bags and home decor. Make sure you don't miss the Sew Totally Trisha shows. I'm John Lockwood from John Next Door and Crafts 2. 
My crafting journey has taken me through all different types of crafting, from stamping and die cutting to colouring and inking, and loads of different things. I designed the brand myself to make sure that every product that comes out to you is the best quality, has an individual design and also is versatile. I like everything to match, so if you've got a product from the very beginning of the John Nextdoor brand, it will match with something that you buy right up to the minute. Everything working together, which makes things more versatile and easier for everyone. I really hope you can join me and continue your crafting journey with me and we can see all the new ideas, tips and techniques that we can do together. Shopping online with the Craft Store has just got easier with PayPal's Pay in 3 plan. Spread the cost of your basket, whether there is one item or many, with three interest-free payments. Simply choose Pay in 3 at checkout and pay for purchases between £30 and £2,000 over three equal instalments for the next three months. No fees and no interest. Spread the cost of your shopping with PayPal's Pay in 3 plan at the Craft Store. Well, hello everybody and a warm welcome. So we have got a fantastic show with Cool Cat Crafts. Maggie and Kay usually here, but I tell you what, they couldn't make it. Which is obviously, we love seeing Maggie and Kay, but they've got a great standing because we've got the lovely Karen, who played a big factor in this, because this is all of your your, your inspiration behind it. It is my ideas. I've been a chit chat with Maggie and Kay, and it was like, oh, I'd love to do this, because I want to do that, and I'd like to do this, and next thing, oh, we've done this, we've done that, we've done the other, and wham, bam, you know, Kay, super, uh, Maggie, uh, Kay Superstar on that uh, design front, and, and uh, Maggie, Superstar on getting yeah. everything organised, yeah. Love even that. look at that. Even, yeah. Look, look, look. <laughs> You've even got the cool cats. Uh, I've even you? got the cool cats. Oh, Maggie, by the way, I can tie this round from. <laughs> okay. Well, was that a. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's just a little well, joke. Okay. Uh, now, let's just say this is brand new, what I'm about to share with you. Mm -hmm. Now, if you just glance to your left, uh, apologies to the team, put you on the spot, but. This is where it began, and we brought this to you before, and we'll just flash details very quickly. This was immensely busy last time we brought it to you. So this is Karen's ATC MDF box with the stamp, and that stamp is such a useful stamp. So you get to make your boxes for your ATCs. It's something that Karen is extremely passionate about. So that was a starting point. That's where the conversation began. And this is what I love about Maggie and Kay. Maggie and Kay are true crafters. Karen's a true crafter. They're friends. I mean, here at the craft store, guests are friends. You know, we you are chat. definitely, yes. So you, yeah. you had a little bit of a chat. Maggie and was the first lady that ever spoke to me three years ago when I came on the craft store. Oh. And we've become very, very She's good lovely. friends. Yeah, I mean, Absolutely. Maggie and Kay are both and, lovely. And Kay as well. Yeah. So tell us, we're going to get back to the original bundle in a moment, but let's talk about the new today. You are passionate about your ATCs. I'm loving doing them, yes. And yes. a lot of people are doing the ATCs. I know you've actually given yourself a challenge at the moment. You're doing an ATC a day? I, um, I, I've got Carolyn, Carolyn Donnelly, uh, mm -hmm. one of my design team that was on when I worked for mm -hmm. a previous company. Uh, she emailed in and said, I'm going to challenge myself to one a day. And I went, oh, all right, Caroline, I'll, Caroline, I'll do that too. Yeah. So we've got 365 to do. Wow. <laughs> one a day. Carolyn's doing a lot better than okay. I am. Just lately, I'm having to do two in one day to try and catch, catch up. up. It's like writing in a diary. Life's just taking over at the moment. Yeah. Well, yeah, fair but, enough. You're busy. Uh, Carolyn, the, yeah. the one that she's done lots of samples for us, one of oh. us as well, that one as well, with Look the Harlequin and all hers there. Absolutely amazing crafters. And all the cool cat scales that have been doing uh, doing the, uh, the boxes as well. Yeah, so this one came from... We're doing 365 on, on a Facebook group that I've yeah. started, uh, Karen's okay. design, Karen's ATC design and swap. Swap spelt with an SWOP because it was remembered from Swap Shop years yeah. and years ago. Okay. And someone said, well, what are we going to put them in? 
So I said to Maggie and Kay, well, what are we going to put them in? Are we going to get one of these folders that are like, you know, a, a trading card folders? And Maggie says, let's think about it. Next thing, Kay's come up with this. And it's a fantastic box that comes with it. Very clever box. OK, so talk us through. What are we getting as part of this bundle? And just to point out, there is a freedom discount on this as well. What are we getting? Right, so I've got one here that's decorated. Mm -hmm. And it's an eight, it's it's a storage box. It has two two little parts there that divide it down. Mm -hmm. However, if you're a bit like me and if I move you over just past the L, if I bring that there, I've not used the storage part and I'm using it as a desk tidy. Oh, nice. So you can use it as a desk tidy. It's really, really sturdy. I will just show here because obviously you, you, you've got Mine yours full of ATCs. Mine full so of stuff, yeah. If you have a look at this beautiful inspiration. So obviously how you decorate it is totally up to you. But there you can see the compartment. So whether it is just a desk tidy, a tidy or a way to store your ATCs, Fantastic. Okay, so we're getting our uh, MDF box. Yep, and these can come in and out depending whether you st stick them in or not. Yeah. They yeah. they click in, and as long as you don't put anything on the side when you when yeah. you're popping them together, because you don't want it to swell, um, you will also get ten two millimeter ATCs. Mm -hmm. They are made of grey board and uh, very very sturdy. Yeah. In this box, one. One portion. So you actually, you know what, you're getting two more. You're going to get 12 ATCs. Oh, you're going to get 12. 12. Just showing you down here. So these are your ATCs. Really good thickness to that. So you're going to get 12 of those. Just showing you those. So you're going to get 12 of those. I got swizzled. I got 10. Well, it's okay. That's... <laughs> I was swizzled. <laughs> so I have your other two. <laughs> um, and each one of that compartment will take 42 of them that are not decorated. Okay. So the ATC challenge that we are doing, we we said that each one would give you a month. However, looking at the small bits, the small ones, this is January and February so far. All right. So I can say, without doing the thick ATCs, the thin ones, I'm going to get six months worth of, uh, of ATCs in there. These are the big nice. ones, and you can see you can fit loads and loads. I've got ones that have got paper on, mm. I've got ones that have got paper decorated on them, so all my yeah. used ATCs, the ones that I'm, I'm collecting, we're doing an ATC swap, so I'm going to have one of these for all mm. my swaps, for all my people. No, I've got to stop you there for a moment because I know that your previous set was busy. I know when you first yeah. bought this. Well, unfortunately, this isn't as busy. No, I'm only kidding. Of course it is. 20% oh. of the stock has gone with it. That would be really awkward. I certainly would have said it on air. I've even got halfway there yet. 20% no, of the stock's already gone. We're only like a few minutes into the show. Just really quickly, because I am worried about time and we don't want this to sell out. So here's, well, we want it to sell out, but we obviously want to get through everything before it does. So here's the thing. You're going to get your storage for your ATCs. You're going to get also the ATCs to put inside, so 12 of those. And these little cuts as well. So these are great for stamping on it with your alphabets, adding these to projects, or maybe onto your MC bo uh, um, your ATC box. But then you're getting stamps as well. Absolutely chocker block full of words. I will. I've actually got a couple of boards to show you. So this is when we talked about the alphabet. So the little. I'll just show you here the little MDF circles designed to fit perfectly with your alphabet. So I'll just show you there, you can see little alphabet bits. So suddenly now we can start using the, uh, the little circle MDF and um, creating our own verses, words, sentiments, whatever it might be. Or equally love this is you've got the months and you can put your own dates on there. So that's cool. That's one stamp set that you're getting. And there's the other stamp set. And this will say really nice words in here. So uh, 59 stamps in total. Look at this one. Get in touch. Whoa, there we go. Get in touch. I'll always be there. And you've got um, stamp to your heart's content, serendipity, always look forward, dreamer, sunshine, be brave, my cup is always full, always look on the bright side, so positive, yep. uh, one step at a time, happy days. Um, and do you know what I love about this? So you're getting 50, well, originally, Karen, um, when she designed this, 58 stamps. 
And then she was told, look, you can add, uh, you can have a duplicate of any word here. What would you like? Because there was just a little bit more space, and Cool Cats want to make the most of every bit. So Karen was like, we're going to add in another happy, because I know you like to, you like to put, like, happy, happy days happy, on. Happy, happy, yeah. You've got to be happy, happy, happy. You yeah. can, and uh, Karen was genius with her reply, because she said you can never have enough happiness in your life. So you will have two happies in there. So if you don't want to carry on stamping, if you want to actually spell out um, certain things or add another happy onto it, you can. So happy is the only word duplicate. That is for a reason, and everything else that you're getting on there. Now that by itself is fifteen ninety nine, and it's at the bottom of your screen. The thing is, fifteen ninety nine just for that stamp, or you can get it as part of the bundle. Other stamp set, your MDF, your ATCs, all of that in one bundle. We are very, very busy. So my question to you is: Do you like your ATCs? Is this something that you could see yourself making? Have you got beautiful papers at home and you're thinking, okay, I want, you, you love stroking them, you love sniffing them, but now you actually want to display them. Display them for yourself to enjoy and the world to see. And this is such a great opportunity to do that. It's a good bundle. And whenever Cool Cats uh, come in, they bring us something special. The fact that you've got Cool Cats with Karen as well, uh, Karen's ideas, that's always going to be good. And Cool Cats, I like the fact, UK-based company, we've seen it from the start, obviously evolving, made in the UK, you know, good stuff. Here. Ab absolutely paramount on making yeah. sure things fit. They will cancel yeah. They will cancel TV shows if things yeah. aren't right, if things are not, are not yeah. there. Um, to be totally honest, totally micromanaged. Yeah micromanage they are such a stickler and I get yeah. really really nervous because I'm not as uh, as keen on having everything there I will put together yeah. and make it fit yeah. for a lot of things however Maggie and Kay are absolutely regimentally it has to it has to work. work I got the stamps on the alphabet stamps I think I got them on Thursday because they didn't work and they didn't yeah. work and they kept coming back and things Getting didn't work right. That's good. and they Until got it, it right perfect. and I got the set on Thursday and the design has been changed that um, it's done been done like a, a John Bull a John Bull one, you know, the printing set. Yeah. So you have a line at the strip. bottom, stri a strip, and then you cut into them, but you will yeah. always have the level there to be able to, to do them. But yeah. that is how yeah. stringent they are with, with their... Quality control. Quality control. Yeah. And you're never going to lose stamps well. Well designed. Now, I've got to tell you, we have got an email in from Kay herself. Hi, Kay. So, Kay's saying, lovely to see us both. That's very kind of you, Kay. And she's saying, I'm sorry, Karen, we owe you two blanks. I know what's happened. So uh, Kay <laughs> and Maggie, they've held one each, yoink, we give, we give Karen ten. Uh, they're going to give you two, don't worry. And uh, they're also saying, very impressed that you can tie the apron in front. Yeah. Even after all the pizza you've been having. What? Have oh, you been enjoying pizza? today, walked in and this pizza, I can't say the brand, but it was yeah. a very, very expensive brand. Mm. And we had lunch and we had coffee and tea and... Oh, that sounds lovely. My last little bits that I needed to do and every, oh, it was wonderful. Making lovely. me hungry. I know, uh, it was great. Uh, we are well over a third of the stock for this bundle and we're going to be playing with it. It is genuinely a great bundle, so anybody who does uh, love their ATCs, this is definitely one for you. Uh, freedom price on here, saving £16, 761-725, your item number busy here. Uh, we've also got the original now. This is where it began. Can I just show you something? Because I think this is genius. So having a look here, you're getting a stamp with this bundle and then you get the AC box. I'm going to get into all of that in a moment, but just focus on the stamp you're seeing here. That in itself, if you love making your ATCs, is an absolute must. And I don't often say that, but really, it is a must. And if you have a look here, so uh, we've got a beautiful ATC. You can see here, now we can do any design. But this is Carolyn, right? It's Carolyn, yeah. yeah. So, Carolyn, that, can I say, that really is a stunning ATC. I love what you've done here. It's beautiful background, really nice. Put in a word. So, we've got a good ATC. But then, when I turn this around, that's where the stamp really comes into its own. Because now we've got who it's made by. Obviously, it's left blank. So, Carolyn, why haven't you filled this out? You've got Carolyn, and then Carolyn can put the date in there. Uh, what I was thinking when I made this, that is such a nice personal touch. And then you could put your uh, phone number on there as well if uh, you'd like someone to get in touch with you. And the whole point of ATC, so artist trading cards, they were designed to share. And that's the whole point share techniques, share inspiration. So, Having that stamp is fantastic. So the stamp alone, 
I love it. But then if we look at the ATC, so this is your ATC uh, MDF box kit. You get everything um, to make this beautiful box kit to house your ATCs. Uh, and you're also going to get 10 grey board ATCs in the mix as well. And your templates. Oh, Lennis, to speak about this. This is really nifty. So, how would we be using this, Karen? That is to do your envelope, your little envelope to keep them in. So, if we want to make a little envelope. Oh, okay, there thank you. There we go. You say envelope. Envelope, envelope, envelope. I don't know, it just depends how it comes out. It's like you sounded very posh there. Making my, my envelope. mum says I'm a perfect lady till I open my mouth. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so you can make your little envelopes or envelopes, depending on how you say it. So having a look here. Yeah, pretty. Really nice. By the way, I wasn't making fun there, Karen. No, it's <laughs> all right. You can no, always make fun. I, I make fun of my accent. But I wasn't as it making is. fun. I was saying I really wasn't making fun. I was just thinking that was a nice Could way to pronounce it. Could that be my telephone voice? Yeah, it just sounded very <laughs> posh. That's all I was thinking. Uh, so there we go. So you've got the template to make those. Now I've got a couple of other elements in here as well. So we have got the 10 ATC blanks. So talk to me about this, <laughs> Karen. Talk to me about these two. Those two, right, so you've got the, the archetype, it's a, the, that's the material tape, that's a construction tape yeah. that Maggie and, you, Maggie and Kay used to put the books they together. Love their it goes really, yeah, really well. Yeah. So uh, what they have done is they've put you enough to make the, make the box and put the archetype on the back yeah. so that that's the it. lids... You've got that hinge. Got that inch, yeah. so okay. you've got that inch to be able to go, and it will, and it will stay. It won't, well, it won't break. It's durable. Yes, and this, very how do we be using this? And that is for the inside. So mm -hmm. you rem uh, to stop uh, if you don't have that on, mm -hmm. you will have a box that will just flap. Let's have a look. I've got one in there, mm -hmm. so it will just flap because it's oh, got okay. nothing to hold it into place. So that just, if that is the insert uh, that allows this to slip round and yeah. hold tight. Perfect. So we can make our envelopes for our ATCs. We've got our ATC blanks, 10 of those, and you've got the box that you're going to be making. And look at the variety, because the beauty of an artist trading card and the boxes here is you're only limited by your own imagination. So is it going to be uh, vintage? Are you going to maybe go gritty, steampunk, grungy? beautiful florals, modern, have you got any wonderful papers? So, I mean, we feature such lovely papers here at the craft store, so you can go in any direction you like. Tell you what, to prove the point, we've got a beautiful uh, video illustrating all the wonderful inspirations and ways you can take this bundle. First time we brought it to you, it was immensely busy. Sold out, right? Had to have sold out the first time. He we sold did. out twice, yeah. I uh, think. Well, okay, sold out <laughs> twice. And there's a good chance it could be selling out today, both options, so you have been warned. If you're wondering what all the hype is about, take a look at this. Lovely inspirations. Uh, now, the storage box, uh, just out of interest, because we are noticing a few of you are doubling up and putting the storage box into your basket as well. When you're considering the, um, Karen was saying, not the, the hard blanks or the thick blanks, but just the uh, thinner uh, paper blanks or cardstock blanks that you're making, um, Karen has got, so she said she can squeeze in about three months worth in each one of these compartments. So with that in mind, say six months here, we've noticed that a few of you are adding an additional storage box into your basket. That's $9.99. Details are on your screen there. All right, you ready to have a play, Karen? I am. So what I'm going to do is going to show you how quick and easy it all go together. Okay. Uh, you've got a base, you've got two sides, two for a front and a back, and you've got two little centre parts. Nice. Now, what I'm going to be using is our laser cut kit glue, which is a really, really fast, fast and, and stable glue. Mm. Um, I, I did use this on Facebook at once, but it, it, what you have to do is uh, is designed specifically for the rapid construction of wooden things. Okay. So I've got a little cup and I've got a damp sponge in there keeping it upside down in there so it doesn't dry up.
because if that dries up in your nozzle, it's really gonna, it sets hard. Yeah, no one likes a dry nozzle. No one likes a, a dried up nozzle, definitely no. not. <laughs> Bernie's laughing. <laughs> and then I'm just gonna get part of our Tiger Tape bundle yeah. and cut a few pieces off ready to stick things down because what's the point of standing there holding right. it? when you've got tape like this nice. that you can use. This, once I've used it on here and I've taken it off, I will keep it because then it's okay. fabulous nice. uh, low-tack tape. Nice. And in Bernie's defence, our floor manager, the reason why she was laughing is she has experienced dry nozzle pain in the past. So it's a good little tip. <laughs> There's nothing while worse crafting, than dry nozzle crafting, pain. Yeah, so it's a good little tip to say, putting it into yep, the sponge. And you yeah. can see there, I've put far too much in. I won't wipe it on, to, on yep. Penny. I would do if I was if it if if it wasn't a cool cat's penny, but no, this is uh, I won't do it. And you can see how little I'm actually popping in. Now I came in over two hours ago, and I set this up two hours ago, so that nozzle has been in there two hours, wow. upside down. Yeah. And I bob that into there, mm -hmm. and as if I move that, it, you can see how it fits. It's and lovely. it's just fits in really, really well. Yeah. If I'd have thought on, I should have put the tape underneath it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, one thing to point out, because Cool Cats, whenever they bring the MTF, it's so beautifully cut and it, it fits perfectly. If you were to paint this, it would affect the fit, obviously, because the parameters are so fine. They with are. The, it all slotting into place. So if you're using a paint, it can affect it. So don't paint over your uh, tabs. Don't paint, paint your tabs. If you're going to paint, then what do you do is, is, is paint it after you've popped it together. Or if you are going to paint it, leave the tabs very, very loose. What you can yeah. see there, that's gone in straight away. I mean, worst case scenario, if you're ever in that situation, you can sand back, but it is a faff, so uh, just follow Karen's advice yes. and paint it once yeah. it's all, all constructed. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this side as well, because I, I, I don't want the bit, personally, I don't want it to like sag into the middle and dry sagged into the middle. Right. So I'm putting the size on, but this is my per prefer pre preferential way of doing okay. it. Your I'm bobbing that one into there and as you can see it just fits in beautifully Perfectly, yeah and i'm going to do the other side good as quality well quality mdf i'm looking at it as well it's a good thickness to the mdf it's a very very good quality if Kay can email in and tell me what what the 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 compass of I would be tempted to say it's low formaldehyde, but I'm possibly wrong. Okay. I always get that bit wrong. So okay. if for, if Kay can just email in and confirm. Okay. Now what that bit you've added off. there is that the end bit because that looks like it's got a little bit. It's got a little bit at the front yeah. just oh, there. Okay. You can see there that that's just gone in nicely, nice. and then I'm going to pop this bit and just. A, can you see how tiny bits of this glue? I think this this is definitely. Oh, Do we not sell that this glue? It's on end of call. Oh, okay, yeah. It's on end of call. It's one that they've just uh, they took. Well, you know they've been in, they've been doing it three years. Yeah. It's took them three years to actually source yeah. this glue and be able to get it for for oh. their MDF. So. Yeah, well, we'll just show you actually end of call. So what that means when you're checking out, now you can do this online yourself or if you're speaking to our call center, they can add it to your order. Any item that's end of call, if you add it to your basket, you're not charged any additional shipping. Uh, we've got some good things. Oh, by the way, the Cool Cats Crafts Pebio markers, super thick chisel tip, 8 mil. I'm going to show you these because they are chunky. Uh, but there you've got the inks in there as well. I know you are a massive fan of the uh, pens, so we will show you all of those end of calls, and you can only access those deals as an end of call, so when you're checking out, look at these for a chunky um, Pebio marker. And there's no extra postage on end of call, is there? No, there is not. Look at you, you, you're a true craft store fan. <laughs> so uh, these are individual items, end of call, you can either go for your gold or your silver, but they are lovely, and I do love these. I will be getting mine out to play with, yeah. I've got okay. mine here. Definitely. Oh, so I've put the glue on there, and as you can see, uh, I'm just going to. All I'm going to do is just. So you caught up with Maggie and Kay today, then? I did. Yeah. Enjoyed some pizza, some fancy Enjoyed pizza. some pizzas, yes. And as you can see, mm. that is how that's gone together. Okay. There, like that. Put some tape onto it nice. to hold it. I'm 
myself by putting those sides on made sure I didn't squeeze it in too yeah. too much at the front and I didn't have it going like going like right. that these little bits now you can glue them in or you can just put slide them, them in, in and slot them in so and See, I'd be tempted just to slot them in because then you've always got the ability to take them out to take them yeah. out and have them as a whole but as you can see there I mean that's great storage great storage just needs to dry uh -huh. and I would say that will be dry in five or ten minutes that goes in and out as you want to mm. and there we go so that's that's popped up to there yeah do you want me to carry on Please do. Because yeah. now that that's just got a few minutes to dry, by the time I've decorated this one, then mm. you will see that it will that it will have dried. Okay. So here's one that I've put together. 40% of the stock has gone here, wow, just to let you know. 40% of the stock. And if you are a Freedom member, you get an additional discount as well. So well worth looking at Freedom membership. And of course, a Freedom member, you're saving on your PMP too because it's included. Uh, if you do want to go for the storage just by itself individually, uh, details at the bottom of your screen, $9.99 your price there. Uh, Maggie saying, oh, it makes sense. Don't know what you mean about micromanaging. <laughs> She's denying it all. <laughs> Deniable plausibility. I'm sorry, Maggie. Really am. Really, <laughs> really. <laughs> They're really funny. Yeah. We have some laughs. We have some laughs. So, one of the pens, I'm uh -huh. going to use the gold one on this one because what I think I will do is I'm going to use a black and gold onto this to decorate this. Nice. I've taken a little part of the thing outside. While this is still wet, show you what we use these uh, these for. So, if you can see here, you know when you hate painting. Yeah. Whoa. Done. Done. Oh, Look yeah. That. And straight down that curve bit. Oh yeah. All the way. Look how quickly that's done. Yeah. Oh, that's not. And they look great. That they gold look amazing. These go around my ATCs. I even use them in my card making. So what you can also do as well, if I was doing it like that, instead of painting it, I'm going to just take it round the sides. Oh yeah. Here, like such. And what you will see is that. Such a usable chisel and tip. And that's the black one. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's the black one. If I just show you here, this is the exact effect that you saw being demonstrated by Karen. But see how you've got that wonderful gilding on your MDF. That's all with that pen. So it is an end of call. When you're checking out, you can add it to your basket. Okay. And it does all these little bits here. All these, just keep shaking it. Obviously, you have to... Uh, you can see that's well worn, mm. definitely well worn. Yeah. And I can also, if I want to, as I have done with this one, is if you work it well, you can col completely colour your MDF with it. Oh, yeah. So we have the black one as well, but also the silver and the gold. And There's something I, about metallic so that's such a, a good finish yeah, to that too. Very absolutely beautiful. Finish. And you once it's dry, you can second coat it, definitely. Yeah. This one is well worn, as you can see, and probably ready for a new one. Enjoying but it. it will colour in, and once it's completely dry, it's permanent. Yeah, it takes a few minutes right. to, to dry, but we've got one there in black with the black black pen okay. oh and i'll finish this one off to show right. you okay so this is a, a black one yeah a good no, shake I, I, a lot of these are getting added into baskets yeah, yeah and definitely don't blame you. yeah there yeah, we go that's so going. that's that's done so we've got Ready silver and call as your end of call end we of call got black, yes uh if black's not on the website then it will be they will bring it back okay to you and because i don't want to color them so i am going to pop this one in and this one that i have decorated just making it, you can see here where I have put the paper in and yeah. used my knife to cut it, but I'll do the outside of that for it there. Nice. So I'm going to bob that one in and it goes down into the little nook. Just squeeze that in and push down. Click of confidence. And click, click of okay. confidence. The rest, you can see what I, I've just made sure that I've blacked it. Yeah. I've measured this and took a piece of paper and popped it on exactly where I want uh, it pretty. and from behind. I'm just going to flip it while the camera's there yeah. and just drawn from behind. Lovely floor. Now if I, if I cut that out straight away, mm -hmm. it's, it's not going to give me an edge because I've cut this as an edge. Nice. So I'm just going to cut round as such. 
following the line, giving myself a little bit of a border. Mm -hmm. So that's going to be that. Give and then we're going to get, so we can use either our speed bond, which has got a screw lid on, uh -huh. she says. Opens up. And if you get anything on it, it just pulls out. Let's see if I can get this speed bond going. Mm -hmm. Right, need to play with that one. I've not uh, got back to your trusty, yeah. That's great for putting paper onto MDF, but yeah. obviously I've uh, done a rookie mistake and not not looked at it before I've... Uh, always got to clean your nozzle. You've always got to clean your nozzle and have a look at it before a show. Well, it's something I keep telling Ross, our producer. What, clean your nozzle? Always like with glues, because <laughs> if your glue gets clogged up... Yeah. I very rarely have a clog up in glue. Really? I very rarely had one, yeah. yeah. So that's going to go onto there, yeah. and making sure that it's the right way... Well, it's got to be the right way around now. Yeah. This one onto here, and I always like to put the glue right to the edge. Nice. I don't like little bits of paper sticking up. Mm -hmm. You're going to see how quickly, once you've done a bit of prep, yeah. how quickly this one will go together. I haven't even decided to put anything on top of it, just, you know, any embellishments or anything mm. else as such. Okay. Has, the, um, has it gold dried? Gold? Yeah. Can you give that just a little wiggle to camera? Can we have a, just a little look at that? So that's Where your gold Pebio uh, marker pen. Yeah. The gold has dried. Nice. This one here, it's got silver. Yeah. So I've done that one with silver Pebio. Great for your MDF. Though. Oh, absolutely. And that large and chisel too. Oh, and look, too. look, 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 large chisel all the way around your MT MDFs. Mm. Your, yeah. Uh, ATCs. ATCs with the MD with Perfect. the grey board. So it goes on grey board beautifully. So are these all of yours? These are everything that I've been playing with, yeah, definitely. Wow. These are the ones I've made in, in January and February. Yep. So I'm going to get a good six months in this one. Nice. Okay. Uh, anything that I do with, with glue that's wrong. Mm. So we've got two bits here to stick now, I've got to tell you, we are approaching yep. half the stock for this wow. bundle. So please don't miss out because what you are getting, it is a really good bundle. So just to let you know if you have tuned in, we've got a storage for our ATCs. I'll, I'll show you one actually that's made and... It sells uh, to there as well. Yeah, thank you all. So that is what you're going to get. So that's what you're going to construct. You can see that there, your storage. Uh, then, if you do want to get additional, we've got the bottom of your screen, so if you do want to add another one into your basket, you can. So there is a freedom price on this, but where the true joy is, it's when you do start crafting. So think about those papers that you have in your stash, those beautiful papers. I mean, we've got Stamperia, Graphic 45. We had um, Craft O'Clock on yesterday with Joe Shannon, which was stunning too. So, you know, lots of beautiful papers out there. Uh, then pop, pop this down. But if you do want to decorate, we've also got stamps for you. Now, I'm going to show you both stamp sets because you're getting an awful lot of stamps. What I love about this, Karen was so conscious of it being a, a very positive, empowering collection of phrases and sentiments. So I will always be there. Get in touch soon. Time is precious. Use it well. Just to say I care. Take time out for yourself. Uh, cute as a button. Chin up. Tell, where are we? Feeling fine. You are important. That's nice. You know, sense that you are important. Live your dream. Daydreams. Let the sun shine. One step at a time. Happy days. Never give up. Out of this world. Waste nothing. Lazy days. Uh, so you see there, and that's there is still more that I haven't read. And then you have your other stamp set with your alphabet. You've got your uppercase and your lowercase. All your ordinals in there as well. And you've got your dates too. So if you wanted to use these for your scrapbooking, fantastic to personalize, incredible. And again with the bundle, you're going to be receiving your ATC. So you're going to get 12 of the ATC blanks, which I'm showing you here. So you're going to be receiving 12 of these ATC blanks, really good quality ATC blanks. And you're going to get your little circles that will go perfectly with your alphabet too. So all of that for 3147 if you are a freedom member and just imagine let me uh, if I, actually I'm going to show you here so we make beautiful ATCs if I just start lifting these up you make them being able to house them present them got hearts in there 
there's cog. So look, this is the thing. ATCs are meant to be shared. And we'll show you how you can create your wallets for those as well. So share them, house them, store them, enjoy them. Uh, it's a great bundle and it always is. Whatever Kay and Maggie and Karen bring you, it's been designed by crafters. There is something that they've had on their mind and they thought, oh, as a crafter, I wish we had. And that's how everything they produce is born. Uh, 761, 75 item number, brand, brand new today and really busy. We are approaching half the stock for this brand new bundle. And we're not even halfway, well, we're just over halfway through the show. Okay, now this next bundle, oh, we're limited stock uh, for, it sold out twice before. It's about to sell out again, less than 10% of the stock remaining. So what I will say, what a fantastic addition, this stamp set is so important. Having this stamp, and again, I'm going to show you the stamp because, uh, yeah, well, I'll show you here. Thank this you, is Karen. the original. Yeah. <laughs> Garrett has got the original. Look at being able to put this on the back of your ATCs so you can date it, you can say who it's made by, what you um, were thinking when you made this. That's really nice. Say your thoughts. What mood were you in? What did you want to reflect? What period uh, of time in your life? And then it's how to get in touch. It's actually technically sold out, so the set's sold out. Now, good news. We already spoke to Maggie and Kay because we knew this was going to be busy. We are able to bring it back. It's going to be back on the 25th, so a week to wait for that. Worth the wait. Now, you're not just getting the stamp. You're getting the uh, ATC box that you can decorate. You're getting the template to create the envelopes for that as well. There's Archi-Tape in there as well, So, uh, and you're going to get 10 of the ATC blanks, all of that for 19, uh, 19 .99. So 10 of the ATC blanks, the stamp that you put on the back of your ATC, your ATC box, and your template. If I just show you one of the wallets, see this is the thing, this is what you're gonna be making with this bundle. Have a look at that beautiful wallet. You've got the template to make those effectively time and time again. Then you make your stunning ATC, Cool Cat, in all their glory. And then you can say who made it, You've got the stamp to say the date, what you were thinking, and how to get in touch. Well, really with, nice. With the with the saying uh, yeah. this this stamp set, what we wanted to do was mm -hmm. uh, there are there are stamp sets out there that have got an ATC stamp, and yeah. it'll say the title of it. Yeah, yeah. But the title doesn't tell anybody anything. No. So we wanted to put it. So what was I thinking when I'm making this? Mm -hmm. And you are sharing part of the creative. Even if it's to say, I just wanted to explore this technique, or I, yeah. I saw this on yeah. the craft store, it's not and I wanted just to try a title, it. and somebody's got to work yeah. out what what does it mean. Mm -hmm. if if you send them to people that, that don't know what, that don't swap ATCs, but you're, you're having part of yourself in there, that's making it more personal. Ross, our producer, um, just reflecting, he said he had some thoughts. So how about this? He's saying what he'd like to write on here, it's made by, we have a look, Ross, date, obviously, the date he made it. Now, this is interesting. He say, what was I thinking when I made this? He'd put you. And then he put his phone number. Yep. Nice. Valentine's be out. We are. I mean, to buy cards. Boy's got game. There you go. Oh, Ladies, boy's he's a got taken that man. Game. He's, a ta he's a taken man, though. Unfortunately, there they're the go. best ones that have got game. Not the taken ones. Yeah, he's got. He has got game. Yep, they're the best uh, ones. In Ross's defence, he says, "Don't blame the player. Blame the game." There you go. <laughs> uh, okay, so. <laughs> so I'll give you the list. So we got. Are you ready for me? Ready. Let's do it. What right, do we do now? This is the one that we put together. Uh -huh. And as you can see, it's glue. That glue has dried. Yeah. Now with an MD, with a, a, wet, a wet white glue, yeah. that doesn't happen. So that is completely. Uh -huh completely dry. That's yeah. the one we put together. But remember, mm -hmm. don't forget, it's not just about ATCs. What about... Oh, that's clever. Put your tags. Yeah, put your tags, the tags. In. So when you're doing demos and everything else, and we cut loads and loads mm. of tags, we can have different colours in. And when we're setting off to a show, we just pick all the tags up, but you can oh, put your tags right. in it as well. So it's of the size where you can get lots and yeah. lots of different things in. Clever. And... I hadn't even thought of tags. What oh, about... Oh, now this is... 
This is a game changer. A game changer. Game it changer. It doesn't take that one, but okay. it's... Does it take that one? I know it takes your... Uh, your oxides and the stress sinks. It takes your other ones, and then we've got these little ones here. We've got the Wendy so we Becker ones. all our inks in there as all well. All your inks in there. What about all your clean colour pencils? Yeah. So it's not just ATCs. I know but having it there. named as an ATC box, it, it's done to store ATCs. But I've got all sorts in here. I've got glues, I've got my glue ribbon, all this, I can put my, I can have it with, yeah. if I take those out, I can have it as a scissors, keep oh, putting yeah. all my scissors into it. We had a very good idea, and I know I've been teasing Ross a little bit this hour, and he's a good sport, but um, Ross actually had a very good idea earlier on, I've got to give him credit, because this was a genius idea. Do you know anyone, or have you got any anyone in your life, especially little ones, that are collecting sort of cards, so say football cards or Pokemon cards or anything yes. like that? If you were to decorate this, so this would be a gift to somebody, what I would do, so say they were football cards, you could find some papers to reflect the football theme, or it could be maybe uh, reflect the colours of their favourite football team, and then inside, what they can do is put all their football stickers and cards. Or I mean, there are other things. When they have duplicates, to do swaps. Well, before doing swaps, yeah. you have duplicates and you can cut the stickers out and cut the footballers out and have them all yeah. the way around. So a you've great, got duplicates. A great gift. You do, you're I using keep saying your football duplicates. cards. I'm sure there are other things to collect, but I'm just remember when I was a little boy, I loved collecting those sort of football cards and stickers in there as well. So, uh, yeah, that as a gift. For little ones, another way of using this genius idea, really clever idea there, Ross. Okay. Next one. Let's do it. What would you want to do? Have a look at the stamps. Yes. Let's yes. do the stamps. So these stamps, I these were things I'd like to do. They're 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 such a small small. Mm -hmm. Well, no, not small small, but they're readable, but they're very. ATC or small art, art decided, or right. when you don't want a big, a big saying. Mm. It's not a greeting that says happy birthday or anything else into it. Nice for it's albums, journaling, now scrapbooking. Albums, journaling, um, diary, not diaries. Planners. 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 Lovely and for very planners. positive. Now, was this a conscious decision when you were coming up with the inspiration for this release with the stamps? You wanted it to be quite positive? I wanted it to be very, very positive. Yeah. There are many times, as you know, I live on my own now because yeah, yeah. baby's gone. Wow. Yeah. How old's your baby now? He's 24 next month. I mean, it's about time. 24. No, we it's let not. Him go. I told him I only had him so he'd look after me in my old age. Oh. And then he has to meet a girl. Yeah, but you know what? He'll be back. He'll he be won't. Back. I've, yeah. got, I've got his bedroom. Oh. Packed out with He's not some more craft stuff. Back. No, I've got craft stuff in it. Bananas. <laughs> <laughs> you go to your bed, lad. You yeah. you can sleep on it. <laughs> so I sit on my own a lot. Hmm. I have my chat. I have my craft store on and everything else. But I like to look at things, and sometimes I do get low. Hmm. And I think positivity. Even if you only pick it up and stamp it, you know what I mean? I can be feeling tired one day and just get that and stink, start stamp, feeling fine. Yeah. yeah, I'm feeling fine. I'll do an oh, ATC. Nice. I'm doing a small little thing that's going to take me yeah. two minutes. I'm going to get everything out. Take a step in the right take direction. Take a step in the right that's direction. Think about yourself, Karen. Yeah. And as, as selfish as it is, it is about thinking of, about myself. Baby steps, life is wonderful, my cup is always full, sunshine, dreamer, stamp to your heart's content. That's yes. a nice one. Yeah. Colour like you've never coloured before. Yeah. Love every day like it's first. A journey starts with one tiny step. Yeah. I've been doing mixed media on my stuff and that's that's a big step for me. Yeah. I was doing mixed media on them. Face the wind. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Face the wind and you face anything, don't you? It's true. Definitely. Step into the I mean, unknown. Uh, it's little, <laughs> not, not a great one for today, Karen. Well, no, but we. we face if you... the wind today and you <laughs> end up 10 miles away. Well, I knew someone had just dampened it for me. <laughs> Hang on a minute, there's one here. My cup is always half full, you know. Oh, uh, good. <laughs> That's what we like. Oh, be fearless. That's for today, then. Be fearless. Be fearless. Right. Then you've got happy days. Well, then you've got happy, happy, happy days, days. when you uh, use all three. Nice. But then we've got the alphabet. Now, what you can see here is I've cut up the alphabet. Mm -hmm. I'm going to open one of these and show you this one. Now, if these were to be made individually, you've got 128 on these. Mm -hmm. And they, they were... They were made to be individual but putting them individual meant they were like 
even Easy a mouse use. couldn't read them. Yeah. They were that tiny. So what Maggie and Kay did, they've had it done on a strip. Now this is clever because not only are you not going to lose them, but you can line them up perfectly. But you cut them up. Yeah. You cut them up. So all these lines at the bottom, mm -hmm. everything is lined up fantastically there. As you'll not be able to see it on that, will you? Ooh, trying to think. Well, do you want to stamp one out? We can have a look. I will stamp a line we'll out. Let me, stamp get a a Let me get a, a thing and stamp I'll a stamp line a out. line out and show you. That's a great idea. Uh -huh. I'm glad somebody's thinking straight, Yannis. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm certainly not today, am I? <laughs> and then we'll stamp out some... Uh, we'll stamp a line out. Okay. So what have we got there? We've got the, the, the little letters. Nice. And this... But what you could do, if you wanted to, you can leave them as that, stamp all the alphabets out, and then you can write ransom notes, can't you? By cutting them up. We could now, uh, <laughs> let me say. <laughs> but um, don't ransom anybody. Yeah, not a proper ransom note. <laughs> not a note. Ransom, proper ransom note. It's just <laughs> yeah, that a, style. a ransom effect. Yeah, that style. Style note. Which is quite a cool yeah. style. <laughs> but that's that. Oh, yeah, I like so that. that's that one. But you, as long as you, you've got plenty of space in between to get in with your scissors to cut right up to the edges and you're cutting little bits out. So looking at them here, you can see that they're, they're cut out. Let me pop that yeah. one on there. And I can write anything that I want now. So I'm going to use my... I'm going to cover my stamp up. Watch, watch that. I'm going to impress you now, Yannis. Go on. You always impress me. I'm Karen. going to impress you. Really, really impress you. Mm. You'll have to tell me, remember, how to spell it. Okay. Why? Oh, uh, oh I thought you were going to write swap. Uh, Y-I-A. It's Y-I. Yeah. Y-I. Y-I. That I. sounds good, doesn't it? So Archer started to speak... Yeah. And my mum's over the moon because uh, grandma in Greek is yeah, yeah. And um, we said to him, and he got it the first time, I said, Archer, can you say yeah, yeah? I think it's just very easy for kids to say. He started saying yeah, yeah. So mum was he? chuffed, yeah. Oh, my little grandma one. Grandma he's struggling with, though. He hasn't got grandma yet. He hasn't got grandma yet. No. Oh, well, my dad said he would never be called granddad, so they called him Popsy. Oh. Pops. Pops. He wanted to be called Pops. That's a good one. Y I A. Y I A double N double N. I, you could, I would have happy. Uh, you could have called me Yan. No. Bit easier. No, no, no. I'm going to do a job properly. Oh. So when was, Jacob was little, there was only me with him. So he mm. was going mum, 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 mum. Yeah. You know as you do. No, dad, dad, dad. Mum, 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 and he just went popsy. Oh, he threw yeah. in a popsy. Yeah, yeah. Y I A N N I S. Oh look, we've even got two eyes. Two ends, mm -hmm. so you've got two of them possibly all in the same, and all I'm doing is just lining them up, having a little chat to you. So I'm going to tell you little stories. We're doing this. Yeah. I want you to imagine a little Greek boy with a bowl haircut, a fluff moustache. I look like a young Tom Selleck <laughs> at the age of seven, and we'd go on school trips. And you know, where at the end you thought. go to the you go to the gift shop. Every time, I wasn't a very bright kid. Every time I would go over to the keychains in the hope of finding a Yanis. And I'd, I'd whiz it around, go and try and find the Ys. Was there ever a Yanis? No, never a Yanis. So you, you are uh, effectively, you've come up with a solution that fixes my pain. There you go. No, oh, I'll stop it. I don't do what Kara's just oh, done. What was that? That would look good. No, it won't. I squished it. Oh, so remember, good. with them being very, very fine, don't yeah. do what Karen does, and I'll show you mistakes. I've pressed too hard. Oh, I thought that looked all right. He pressed too hard. Okay. Well, so you don't one. press too hard. I like this, Karen. Watch me know that. I'm shaking yeah. like a leaf now. I'm not going to do it right. Yay. <laughs> there you go, Yannis. Well, thank you. <laughs> It's like my, my, my own calling card. It's like your own calling card. There so if you cut my dad's two and, two and a half by three and a half and put yeah. Yanis in there, Perfect. you can be having, having your own uh, business card. Do I love that effect, though. I really do like Brilliant, that effect. Isn't it? That's it's nice. So being able to personalise, and it's a good point, having the alphabet, yeah. we can fully personalise, and you've got all those different elements. That's excellent. That's so excellent. You, you've, got like, you've got two A's, two E's, two C's, mm. two I's, two O's. Mm. All would, popular ones. Would you mind if we had a quick recap? Not, pot, not at okay? all. Okay. I'm having fun. All right, we are going to just have a quick recap. I really hope you're enjoying the uh, show. So, brand, brand new today. We've got this 
fabulous ATC storage uh, brought to you by Cool Cats Craft. So it gives you the opportunity to take your ATCs to that next level. Because here, actually, do you know what? I've got some ATCs down here that I wanted to share with you all. Let's just take a little look. So this is the thing. I know at home you've made some beautiful ATCs. So ATCs like this. That's stunning. Isn't that nice? Or how about, I'm just picking at random, this. I mean, you get the idea. ATCs are wonderfully original, and that's the whole point of an ATC. It is a nice space. But here, you've got the ability to personalize your storage. So getting those mediums out that we love, those stencils, those texture paste, uh, you can add additional embellishments onto your box, personalize the box on there as well. I hope, <laughs> Karen, I hope that was your chair. Uh, <laughs> yes, definitely. Made me laugh too. Yeah, I don't know if you heard, you wouldn't have heard it at home. <laughs> That was so funny. Uh, so you got just halfway through when I'm sharing this with everyone. I just <laughs> so you're getting the storage, but you're not just getting that storage. I'll just show you actually. This is how the storage. Obviously, once you've constructed it, it's your blank canvas. You've got the dividers. You can choose to use your dividers or not. And the storage. We say for ATC, but Karen was sharing. We can put tags in here. You can use it just as a uh, desk tidy if you want. That's your storage. But then. You're also getting the stamp sets that we were exploring. So you've got your alphabets in there, and you've also got your positive words. I've got them stamped out, so it might be easier to have a look here. So there's the alphabets, and they all come in strip stamps. You're not going to be losing them. So you've got the uh, uppercase, the lowercase, the uh, months of the year as well, which is great. Uh, and not only that, you've got positive words as well. So phone, uh, travel, journey, so great for your planners. That is a really good set for your planners. And here we are talking true positivity. It's something that I always consider Karen such a positive person and she's really infused that into the stamps that you're getting. So feeling fine, you are important, just to say I care. That's a great one. I mean, people in life, you give them a little ATC or an inspirational card just to say you care. Get in touch soon. I'll be there for you. Uh, the little things in life, giving, be brave, dreamer, sunshine, my cup is always full. You get the idea. Keep smiling. I'm really happy, right? So we're getting our stamps. Then you're getting 12 of your ATC blanks. Good quality, great thickness to those. So you're getting 12 ATC blanks just screaming to be used. You're also getting your little MDF circles as well. Your large circles, which you're seeing there, and your slightly smaller circles, which play so well with the alphabet. That is a bundle, 31.47. If you are a Freedom member, saving 16 pounds. We are busy for this collection. It is brand, brand new. 761-725, your item number. We have got another bundle. This is where it all began. It's a returning favorite. It's sold out. It's back on extended delivery. It's going to be dispatched on the 25th, so you have not got long to wait. Now, within this, for me, the starting point is the stamp. Because what you're able to do, and I keep showing this one, but I think it's an effective one. So um, you've created your ATC, the front. We've decorated it. You're very happy with it. But the whole point of the ATC is sharing. So if you do share it with somebody, and also it might get passed on from person to person. So here, everyone will know who made it, the date you made it. This is where it really distinguishes itself as a stamp. What I was thinking when I made this. So what were you thinking? What technique? You could write, I saw this uh, technique on the craft store and wanted to recreate it. I was feeling happy here. I was thinking of you here. And then finally, you've got get in touch. So you can put your email address or your telephone number, whatever it might be, your website. So you're getting that stamp. That is an exceptional stamp. We really need that in our lives if you love your ATCs. You're getting your ATC storage, your little matchbox storage in there as well. And you've got uh, in here your template too. And what this template allows you to do is to create little envelopes for your ATCs. So here, if I just show you, you've got the ability to create your envelope for your ATC. Fantastic bundle. No, um, oh, and oh, 
you're just going to get your blanks as well, I say, that's important. You're going to get 10 of your ATC blanks to get you started too. Quarter of the extended delivery has gone. It could, you never know, sell out for a second time. Is, is it just the one hour today, Karen? It's just the one hour, yes, okay. definitely. But what a great hour. So nineteen ninety nine your price there, eight two five nine seven seven your item number. Now just very quickly, because we haven't looked at these yet on the show and they're always popular whenever we bring them. Uh this yeah. 25 sheets. This is your artist tack. Uh, 25 sheets. So very quickly, Karen, tell us a little bit about this for anyone who's not used it before. Artist tack is a glue without using glue. Okay. It's dry glue. Yeah. It's like lots of little dots and you open up the sheets, you put your glue in, your what you want to glue inside, rub it and then take it off. I will use oh, it in a second. Okay. I'll demonstrate it in a second so you so, can see. But it's when you want to do, uh, do delicate things and yeah. you don't want to get loads of glue okay. all over. Get set up for that because time is running out. So we'll show that, that quickly. Now. So that's your Artist Tack 25 sheets, 19 your price, saving £3. Now we've got our Sticky Paws Pro Tape. This is a best seller. It took Maggie and Kay a long time perfecting this to bring it to you. And I remember when they did bring it, the minute they brought out the Sticky Paws, it flew. Twelve ninety nine is your price. You're getting a six mil and a fifty meters of your six mil and fifty meters of your nine mil. There, very, very, very good. Uh, One five four four eight nine your item number. We're going to move on to some more quality tape for you. Uh, this is your Tiger Tape. So with the Tiger Tape, we are getting both. We saw Kay using, um, Kay, Karen, sorry, using uh, this a little earlier on. So we're getting a great bundle, the 25 mil, 50 uh, meters, for your black frame tape as well. And then you've got your orange removable tape. So you've got your black frame tape and the orange removable tape. Uh, black's great for MDF projects, creating hinges, really, really good. And the orange is good for delicate surfaces because it is a removable tape. So here, this is your hinge, this is your uh, memory bookmaker, you know, all those little techniques. And over here, this is your removable tape stencils, working with MDF, anything delicate. 850-823 item number. And last, but certainly not least, this tool, and I cannot say enough about it. It's a Teflon tool from Cool Cats. Everybody, and I genuinely mean this, every crafter who comes into the studio who has this has raved about it. I know Leonie's got it, she absolutely loves it. Obviously, Karen works with it a lot as well. It is such a great tool. $15.99 your price, 382-305. Uh, all right, Karen, we've got, we haven't got long, we've got about two minutes. About two minutes. Can you show so us that? It's tack? an A4 yeah. sheet, we've got the tack tape. If I can get it in, I've got real dirty hands. So you can see one side is sticky. This side, the ad, that side is sticky. Yeah, we found it. You can find it. You can put all your embellishments onto it. So he is using the little round parts that are in the the yeah. the set. And I've got uh, my cup is always full. I will always stamp mine. I've got loads of them stamped out okay. and cut out, and I yeah. couldn't do them in different coloured inks as well. Nice. So you rub over. Give me a little rub. And rub over. So you what happens? Those little dots transfer those onto the back. Those little dots transfer onto there, yeah. And, and you, you would you go back in then and use more and more of the sheets? So just keep use more and more in. of the sheet as it goes on. Yeah. K. Okay. A. R. I can't get. I can't spell that wrong, can I? Hopefully. And then take that up, and then that's all got sticky dots on the back, and that's stuck there. Give it a, uh, 24 hours to dry. Obviously, glue, glue has to have time to dry, yeah. and it's stuck on there. Well, that's and even good. And on your little ones, delicates. you know those delicate little delicates things. Delicates yeah. for your um, parchment. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, parchment. Little bits in the corners. Yeah. You're not going to see much of it, but the little letters on nice. those round circles, that yeah. MDF circles, you just colour them up, but showing you all different things Karen's that you can do. ATCs. Uh, now, Karen, time's beaten us. Thank you so much. No problem. And thank, thank you to you. Cool Cats, Maggie thank and Kay cool as well. Really you know we love you guys. Hope you see you soon. Uh, we're going to see you soon. You're back, right? Uh, what day? I'm back on Monday. Monday back morning. On Monday, Ooh, Monday morning. Got, it's craft. Oh, yes. Yes, I get to play with good. some lovely stamps from uh, yeah. with from Leona. Yeah. Oh, brilliant. Okay, so make sure to tune back. It's going to be a great hour. Uh, that's on Mondays. So thank you so much, thank Karen. So I really much. enjoyed it. You're a star. I hope you've enjoyed it as well. As always here at the Craft Store, you can recap any show via the Rewind option on our website or the app. So well worth taking a look.
We're launching our brand new one day special, Craft Yourself Silly. It is an absolute blinder. Please don't miss that. Then Green Acre Quilts returns. And after that, we've got Craft Yourself Silly one day special. Hello, I'm Barbara. And I'm Julie. And together we're Scarlet Rose Crafts. We're a family run business and our aim is to bring new and innovative new products to the crafting industry. The Easy Mat Plate is our flagship product, uh, followed by our innovative Easy Shim product. Hello, my name's Stuart and I'm the Managing Director of Oakwood Archer. We specialise in high quality items brought into the UK from all over the world, including brands like Kaisercraft, Stampendous and Impression Obsession. Our products include stamps, dies, papers, buttons, trimmings, ribbons and album making kits. Just about everything you need to be a good crafter. Hi, I'm Lou from Studio Light. Studio Light has been around for about 40 years now. They're based in the Netherlands. It's a family run business with a great heritage. Over the 40 years, Studio Light have evolved. They listen to me, the demonstrator, and you, the customers, and really take our ideas on board. So make sure you don't miss the Studio Light shows. Good evening. Now, of course, 6 p.m. here in the craft store and it means the launch of a brand new one day special. And if you are new to us here at the craft store, well, welcome. It's great that you are joining us. The craft store and Create and Craft are one big family and this is going to be the home for crafting uh, on TV as well as online. Now, Cra the craft store has lunches the one day special at 6 p.m. and it's a time limited offer that lasts 24 hours in which you are um, able to purchase this incredible value for money, incredible brand new designs most of the time and today is brand new. It is a concept, it is a product that has been developed by Crab Yourself Silly and that means as well, well if you are brand new to, you, to, to us here at the craft store, let me introduce you the legend that is Haley Smith. Mm. Because she is a little bit of a legend, far. isn't it? <laughs> I don't go quite that far. <laughs> yeah, I would say yes. Uh, no, I would go with nuisance. Yeah. Uh, that's, I wouldn't that's say where that. I would put Why it. Nuisance. The well, nuisance that is Haley Smith. Well, if you say so, I'm not going to contradict the guests. <laughs> Uh, no, actually, no. Oh, come on. Uh, no, uh, you, you have been with us since day one, really, didn't yes, you? Yes, I was on the very, very first weekend that the craft store was here. Yeah, yes. And you have <laughs> been delighted us with lots of different easy to do soft crafts, uh, including quilting, including sewing, embroidery. You have taught us to craft along as well, the yeah, sew along. Absolutely. And what we try and do is we try and take something that, you know, could be quite complex and just simplify it 
and that's what we kind of you know do the best at. I Absolutely. think is, is and just taking things that you know give amazing results, but make them really simple to achieve. And that's exactly what the one day special is all about, right? Yep. Because we have got two options. That's all you need to know about uh, thinking about what you will ne need to choose is the basics, which is the whites and the grays and the black, or the brights, which is, of course, that rainbow of colors in here. Now, you have been shopping ahead already for the brights that is on in delete now. Now, it includes uh, six 12 meter rolls, right? Yes. So when we first brought out on a roll, we did did big 40 meter ones. Let me grab yes. one from over here. There we go. Right. Okay. So we did big 40 meter ones like yeah. this. And that is fantastic if you've got a large project in mind or if you, it's a color that you're going to use a lot of. So you're going to use it to bind a lot of things or something like that. However, what people were asking us for is smaller amounts of different colors so that they could, you know, do different types of projects. And that's exactly what we've brought you. We've brought you the, um, brights and the basics so the basics they're all of the colors that you know fantastic for a stash builder things that you're going to use in a lot of different possible projects so you've got put two blacks in there because we think that the black one really really useful i think there's a lot of projects that would that would go for so you've got two blacks you've got a lighter gray more like a silver gray and yeah. a mid gray in there you've also got a pearl jam which is a kind of creamy ivory color and yeah. then you've got a white pure white as well yeah so that is also so that would be great combinations for something very striking to create well, not necessarily the, these ones you're not necessarily thinking about using them all together oh, as one project you maybe split them up because 12 meters just to give you an idea um, if you had a, a quilt that was three meters by three meters yes there's enough on there to bind the whole quilt. Oh, I see. So you've got three meters across the top, three meters down the side, three meters mm. along the bottom, and three meters up the other side. Right. So it means that you've got either binding for six quilts there, that you don't have to spend the time, you know, yeah, cutting bind, it out yeah. and piecing it all together. It's one continuous strip. Or maybe you're putting sashing into a project. It's there, it's done, it's cut for you. You can just kind of steam straight ahead. So I would refer to this one not so much as a, as a project set, more as a stash builder set, one that you're going to be dipping into for all sorts of different all projects. Of and can you tell us a little bit about the pixel art pattern yes. booklet? So we did pixel art uh, probably about six months ago. Now I must apologize because I was given the task of printing this out and I did not do a good job. I'm going to be straight up with you. I, I failed miserably. Oh, that's much better to do it that way, yeah. That's how yeah. I look at the, it. Yeah, that's better. Um, <laughs> so, as you can see, each one of those, you've got a pattern, uh, you've got a design that the quilt will make, and in the front of the book, you have a little table which shows you how long to cut each of the pieces to, to fit in, because what we've done is we've broken it down and we've given each row a number. So you're not quilting in blocks, you're quilting by row for this. I see. So in the first row, it'll probably say, you know, like for the one that's more, uh, oh no, I don't know my left and my right, the, not the one that looks like a uh, uh, this one. checkerboard. Yep. That'll do. And that one, yep. right. So first row, it'll tell you how many squares you need in kind of black and then how many you need in white and then how many you need in black and how many you need in white. You can obviously swap these colors up. So if you wanted to make it more than two colors, you want to make it multiple colors, you absolutely can. And you've got the chart there that tells you, you know, if I need four squares and I'm working with a two and a half inch strip, it will tell me how big that strip needs to be. But what we've done this time is we've taken it that step further and we've given you the one to four templates because they're the Indeed. most commonly used sizes within this technique. So we've made acrylic templates, which are one block, two blocks, three blocks, four blocks, and they are all there ready for you to go. So you don't even have to measure them out now. You can literally just put the templates on and cut and away you go. And I'm showing you how they will come to you with white. Yes, they come to you with a protective um, film on there, but they are actually uh, completely clear. And so then you can remove it. We've kind of shown you both versions cut. there, so you can, you can see what will arrive in the post and what you'll end up with once you've peeled the film off. Perfect. Right, remember you have got two different options. The templates and the patterns will be the same, right? Uh, yes, the patterns, the patterns are the same within both of them Perfect. and the templates are the same within both of them. It's just the colour 
that you're changing. So you can either go for the brights or all those beautiful rainbow shades, or you can go for the basics. Um, you know, all those really useful ones, the ones that are going to be, you know, in your stash uh, just when you need them. Right. Uh, do you know what? I'm, I, I will be honest. I now I, that you explain how the pixel thing works, I'm like, that's such a genius. My brain now, I just want to have a go. It's a really easy way that. to to quilt as well and you can get some fantastic patterns by working this way and we've oh, I uh, love it there's something in my brain that suddenly it just, is it's engaged clicked, doesn't it? and you're like oh okay that, that's now easy I get enough it. I need a one then yeah, a two yeah. then a three and it's like a bit like knitting yeah it's a bit like a knitting pattern you need you know one of this two of that three of the other and you just build up a row at a time but it's also a really easy way to quilt because sometimes when you get blocks yeah. Um, when you start putting them together, obviously you're going to put them together into your rows and then you're going to put those rows together into to bigger pieces. It gets kind of bulkier and, and bulkier and harder to put those things together. With this, you're only working a row at a time, so the bulk of your um, fabric will be over there and you're just adding on that one little row every time. So it kind of is it's a nice, simple way to work as well. Perfect, right? If you want your uh, one day special, remember two different options. Uh, you can go for the basics, which is the greys and the white and the blacks, or you can go for the uh, brights, which is of course the ones. Now they work out that basically you are getting the patterns uh, and the templates half price. So basically you are paying for this full price and then you are getting a template and the patterns uh, for uh, the ha 10 pounds, which is a fabulous saving there. Uh, you can also flexify it, pay, spread the cost in two interest-free payments of 34 pounds and 99 pence. Now, now that I understand those, those patterns, I just want to go on and do it. Uh, 130871 is your item number. Now, once that you are going to get these templates and the patterns, you will want a lot more rolls, don't want you? Yes, so what we've done is we've Everything that we've had previously as a 40 meter roll yeah. is now available as a 12 meter roll. And then Perfect. on top of that, I think there's another four or five colors in. I think we started out with about nine or 10 when we first brought yeah. these, and I think we're up to about 20 odd colors now. And there is a full rainbow in here yeah. now. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. Wow, I just, I love a rainbow. <laughs> I love a rainbow and I love as well the fact that you can get it in continuous piece here. Uh, now, two and a half inch strip cotton, you're picking any three. Now, if we wanted to do one of your, the, the quilts that are the pattern, the pixel art kind yes. of patterns, would you recommend to go for three contrasting colors? Would you go for three analogous? Um, I think you, for the pixel ones, you definitely need a, 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 a level of contrast in there yeah. because I think that kind of makes it pop. Um, but what I'll probably do is I'd actually go and hunt out one of the bigger um, 40 meter rolls for whatever is going to be your background color yeah. and then pick your kind of ah. statement colors, the ones that are going to be more Perfect. in the foreground, pick yeah. those out of, of these ones that here. Makes sense. All right, well, it's the choice is yours. Uh, £29.97 is your prize. You're choosing any three. 861518 is your item number. So you will get in actual fact 36 you get, meters yes you get 36 meters obviously it, they come as three separate rolls yeah. um, the greys are in there as well and the black and the white and the cream is an option yeah. within that and as the well reds, so the you ready. have got your plain options as well uh, it's just my stick wasn't long enough well, I do like this a stick thing. It's, it's quite a long stick, but the stick yeah. was not long enough to get there. There's another six to go on there. Ah. Stick not long enough. Got a big, bigger stick enough. next time. Yeah, bigger, yeah, bigger, stick. bigger stick. Or being two <laughs> sticks and then you two can put... Two sticks, that's what I'll be. I'll two be Haley two sticks next two time. Sticks. I'm on it. Uh, <laughs> eight six one five one eight is your item number. Twenty nine pounds and ninety seven pounds is your prize. Now we have got more for you. The quail behind me, and it's just absolutely stunning, isn't it? Let's shall, shall I walk in I, here so I you can see? I think it's quite nice just to have you know, some stuff that's worked in planes yes. sometimes because I think it does create quite a statement piece. And then you're not too worried about the pattern that you've used maybe going out of fashion or out of style or anything. Planes, you can never, ever go wrong with. Um, it's a really, really simple one to do. Now, Heather's mixed up the kind of order that she's done her stripes in, but 
if you are wanting to do this um, with all the stripes being the same in each block, yeah. then you can literally quilt one huge long stripe oh, of course. and then cut Part it up of. into the squares. Right. So that would be, uh, yeah, that, I love that idea because then it's really easy. Like kind of you just, uh, you know, just, yeah, sewing, absolutely. just, just sewing, sewing long straight pieces. And this one here, the one that's up with power over there, that's actually a, a, a three by three block quilt. You get enough within the bundle to do uh, three by five. So you could yeah. add another two rows onto the bottom of this. So you wow. can make a whopper of a quilt from a this whopper. one. A whopper. whopper. Oh, I like that. I really, really like that. Uh, now, of course, you are getting not only the 12 meter rolls, but the yes, also the you're 42? getting four 12 meter rolls, and then you're getting one big 40 meter 40, in so. the grey as well, because obviously that's the the colour that kind of breaks solid. everything up and makes all of those other colours pop because it's got that kind of mid grey in the background. I love that, uh, and I love this grey. It's a really nice neutral grey. Then we are getting. Is it for the yeah, backing? you're going to get uh, some fabric for your back as well that's we've given you a, bit, a piece that's big enough to do the um, what would be the three block by five okay, block yeah. so we've given ah. you enough to, to do that if you want to make it into you know a couple of smaller quilts or you want to kind of play around with it then that's entirely up to you but we're going to give you enough to make the three by five block quilt mm -hmm. and you're also getting the same amount of batting as well and the batting so you have got all everything basically everything we need everything you need to make that quilt well a bigger quilt than that quilt even yeah Wow, for just, uh, well, with a saving of £21, our, our three payments of £33 and £33, £99 and £99 is your price, one off payment. So just under £100, everything you need, except, of course, your sewing machine and thread, to make one quilt that is significant size as well. Uh, 481-775 is your item number really want to do it and now i just all i want to do is kind of sit down and sew that's all i want I, to do know, and of course there is another the end. It, it, yeah. i can put you one on the end yeah i should do it's yeah, just gonna be all right it'll be all right wouldn't it <laughs> uh, because also this I'll is let you join in i don't mind yeah well let's craft along <laughs> eh? that's not it uh eight three so eight seven three uh nine two two is your item number for the uh charm roll with the sashing roll now charm roll i have never seen this before okay that's because we invented it well, so yes. let me just move this uh, machine out of the way. Yeah, Ooh, I've got too many wires. Is this like a roll of five inches that has got like yeah. printed so into it? Most of the all the other rolls that we've cut. Let me grab this one because yeah. it's open. There we go. All the rolls that we've previously kind of brought to you have been two and a half inches. Yeah. Okay, right. this one, as you can see, is double that width. It's five inches wide. So the, exactly the same principle as you see with the charm squares that are pre-cut. Let me take the sticker off the bottom of there because I've stuck it to the table. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah, and then that's and this, a bit problematic. Yeah. As you roll it off, it is charm ah, squares, but they're all on a roll. You've got 44 on here. So you can cut them off and use them as individual pieces or you've got the option to um, kind of use them as a strip as they are and just cheat. It's entirely up to you. You wow. can completely yeah. cheat with this if you want to. Yeah, and I love that. I love that it's, it's just kind of you can create your own choices. Like you don't have to choose right now. You can, well, you have to choose which option you want to uh, because you are getting one of them and there is different color options. Uh, but you are saving four pounds brand new today. 18 pounds and 98 pence is your price. And you can see it in the back. You are getting also the sashing, the matching sashing for it, which means that something like this you could be able to make um, incredibly easily. 873.92 is your item number. 18 pounds and 98 pence is your price. I mean, it's a lot of fabric, in fact. And you get 44 different charms on there. Wow. So that particular quilt does mix a couple of the two uh, different rolls together, but you could easily make quite a decent size quilt uh -huh. with this just using the, uh, the rolls because you've got so many different options in here. As I said, you've got 44 different patterns in here. I love if that, I just yeah. pull this back through, you'll be able to see some of the patterns coming through. There we go, let's go. Wow. But all the wow. same colours all work perfectly together, designed to work together with the same kind of, oh, oh, I thought it was going to just roll nicely all by itself. Yeah. <laughs> 
It's like the director just said, a conveyor belt of patterns. I'm not going to take credit, I'm Marcus, little little time I'm to never, now. never going to take credit for your idea, Marcus. Uh, 873-92 is your item number. So a spot one is the blue on the quarterly tones. Uh, then we have got the um, we have got the spots one as well, and then we have uh, then the pink tones as well. So we have got that a spots number two, and then a spots number three we have uh, also there, which is uh, this one in there. Uh, Eighteen pounds and ninety-eight pence is your price as you're saving. I think four with pounds. these. What I might do is um, I might actually chop a couple of these up so they actually are all separate pieces and then I'll be able to show you all of those different patterns a little bit more clearly because you've got 44 different ones here and obviously at the minute, as they are, you kind of can't see all of them. But if I start chopping all this up for you, then you'll be able to see all of those different patterns. They are quite retro, they're quite vintage, yeah. but I think the colours make them a little bit more modern because you've got some fantastic colours in their peaches and teals and all sorts in this one. Yeah. So there's some Perfect. nice blues in there. You can use them as individual squares if you want to, or you can you know, use them all together in one project. It's entirely up to you. Entirely. I love that, that we have got those possibilities. Uh, right, now those ones were the five, the, the charm rules, which I love the words, but it's hard to pronounce. <laughs> then we have got the rainbow uh, rules. Now, uh, 12 meters again, right? We are talking about yep, here. 12 meters. And uh, you've seen these as their individual ones before. So these are um, the, just the rolls in their own right. But we have actually got some little bundles on today to make quilt toppers so that is one of those rolls and the same amount in white as well and I've got two quilts that uh, you'll yeah. be able to show up there which um, these are I would say you're looking about a meter by a meter 20 ish um, I mean I, do you want me to measure it with my body <laughs> so this is I would this is a meter okay but I would, I would say that's about 120 there. Can I, can I put my Is this in? a good idea, Paula? It's about a meter and, yeah, 20. Yeah, meter a meter 20 by about a meter 20. Like and I'm uh, a meter and a half in height, <laughs> and I'm wearing hills, so that's when I say, I yeah. Okay. And from here to here, it's about a meter. So, so you've got two rolls here will make you that size quilt. So if you like that, but you want it to be a bigger quilt, then you could just pop a couple in your basket and make yourself a bigger Absolutely. one. Absolutely. <laughs> right, and now, of course, if you, I love these quilts. I really, really, there's something very, obviously, geometric, but also very pleasing with them. Uh, so if you want to go with the quilt topper kit with a 12 meter rainbow roll, the 12 meter white, and the pattern, it's just 19 pounds or 99 pence. You're saving five pounds. And I love how the easiness of it, but we also have got the rolls on their own, um, and then you're choosing which one you want. Uh, so therefore, you can see that uh, you're choosing one of them. Uh, there's three options here, uh, 12 99 for them, you're saving two pounds. And then uh, 070042 is your item number. We have got also happy hours, and you do have the happy I hours. I have happy hours, yes. Perfect. So these are 40 meter rolls. They're a really nice spot on here. It's not a, a, a perfectly round spot, and it's not one that's kind of laid out in a particular pattern. This is what we've called our raindrop spot, and we've got three different colors in this. So the top one is mangoes. Yep. This one is coral and then the one on the bottom is almost blue and I think these are beautiful especially if you're thinking about uh, you know putting a load of sashing or borders on something these are a great option the 40 meter rolls means that there's an awful lot there which you know for example if you were going to do a kind of even just take two of these together and alternate the colors and just make a kind of uh, yep. almost like a log cabin or even and, just oh, frames yeah. within frames within frames yep. then these are a great option there's an awful lot of fabric on here there's equivalent to about two and a half meters on oh. each of these rolls wow. and you have the choice you have got a choice i kind of i, got, kind of, I was thinking uh, as well um 
Maybe we should try to match them with other ones in here. I, I would say definitely go with a. Um, you can. You can't go wrong with a kind of white or a cream with these. Yeah. That's the. That's the easy win if you're going to go with one of those. Uh, but yes, absolutely. I can pass them over, and you can add and some. Then you can add some of the colours. Because then it would be nice to do a little bit of uh, shopping kind of a space. Uh, right. Uh, if you want to go for the happy hour, remember the price will go up at the end of the hour. It's not like the one day special that should last 24 hours. The happy hours are uh, our uh, show, uh, our shows and uh, offers. Uh, 19 pounds and 99 pounds is your price. Uh, so you're saving 13 pounds. 136413 is your item number. But let's have a look at um, Hayley, the, the one day special, right? Yes, I've got some, some bits from the one. Well, I might have added an extra pink in just because oh. I like the pink. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Absolutely. But you know, it's yeah. all right. What so, I'd kind of what I'd kind of done is I'd gone craft store colours, you oh, see. Oh yeah. <laughs> but then <coughs> that one and that one weren't in the, the thing. But uh, yeah, but it's fine. It's fine. You can get them as individuals as well, so it's absolutely fine. So uh, what I'm actually working on here, which I'm going to mention now, which is going to be an absolute mistake because it means I'll have none left for later. But this is our semi-stiff batting. So we have uh, four different battings within the, the Crafty Self Silly family. We have a super soft, a super stiff, a semi stiff, which is this one, and then we have the super slim. So the right. super slim is the one we usually do on a roll, but this is our semi stiff that we've done on a roll because can you see that for a bag, right? Yeah. It's absolutely perfect because it's got a bit of bit of body to it, but it's not kind of so rigid that it is you know going to be like a rock when you put it together yeah. but this is now available on a roll as well it's always been available just as a large piece but we have cut it as a roll now so it's a 47 centimeter width which is absolutely perfect so I'm making a bag with this one at the minute and as you can see once that goes together that's gonna be a really good size for a bag and I'm just using on it at the minute a quilt as you go technique so where I'm putting the, the rolls down one at a time and just lining them up with each other, lining up the straight edge from the previous one with the next one. And I'm just going to take that to the machine and stitch those two together. Once it's stitched together, I shall fold it back out. And then I'm just top stitching either side to add even more kind of, kind of mm, definition to okay. it. So right, yeah. I'll, what I'll do is I'll pop these together and I'll pin them and I'll quickly sew them because I know you want to give you have to do some numbers, you have to do a bit I of admin, don't you? I have to do you? the numbers uh, for the semi-stiff batting, 48 centimetres by 5 metres in, uh, if you're getting just 13 pounds or 99 pence, 569316 uh, is your item number. Quite a lot of uh, semi-stiff batting here. Yeah, it is. It, it works out to be just over a metre and a half square. So you've got quite a lot there, and I mean, I think really useful at that width because it's perfect for bags, it's perfect for cushions, it's perfect for, you know, anything that's a smaller yeah. project that you don't necessarily want to be unfolding yeah. a huge piece of batting just to take a corner out of it. Um, really, really useful size and really, really storable as well. It works out at two pounds. 80 per meter, which is a fabulous affordable price. 5690316 is your item number. Back to you, Hayley. Okay, so we're doing a kind of quilt as you go technique, and the beauty of this is can you <coughs> see how nice and neat the yes. back becomes on this? Because yeah. it's almost the same as a um, uh, like foundation piecing. But right. instead of having the paper on the back, which you would then remove, it's batting on the back, so you don't need to remove it. So. We're going to line this up, make sure I've got those two pieces lined up. And the most important bit to this is really keeping a constant seam allowance and then pressing properly as well, pressing each piece out as you go. Okay. So this is a, just a long straight piece, I'm just going to make sure they're, just tweak them along a little bit so they're lined up. I'm just going to take my stuff down all the way. And we're going to go all the way down, and then okay, we're yeah. going to, once we get to the bottom, we are going to take this to the ironing yeah. board, press it out, so we get that nice kind of flat look, oh, yeah. and there's no kind of lumps and bumps in here. Uh, I've made a, there we go, we'll go all the way to the bottom, 
Let's just take the pins out. There you go. And then we're going to take it over to that ironing board and just press this out. Down. So this is kind of all these projects today are very perfect for a qu beginner quilter, uh, somebody who is, just wants a quick well, and easy it's, project. It's kind of everybody this because it's it's for the beginner because it's going to um, you know you're going to get those accurate cuts yeah. that you may not initially get as a beginner. It's for the more advanced sewer because it's going to save you a whole bunch of time. Yeah. On, on cutting things out and also it's going to give you a more professional finish especially for your borders and your binding because yeah. you're not going to have all those joins in there so now that's pressed out I'm going to repeat that process again and again to get the whole thing covered because yeah. that's what we're aiming for him to cover the whole thing to be able to then kind of turn it into it's a, a bag and yeah. um, so you can do this just as a bag front you could just do you know maybe another half a dozen down there to make it into a square so there you go you could do it maybe down to there to make it a square, or we're going to do a, a like a square bottomed bag with this later, and we're just going to keep kind of adding strips on as we go. But I know that um, the rolls are what you want to see. <laughs> yeah. the, the charm rolls. Well, the charm oh, rolls. Oh, Paula. It, yes, I mean. What have you done? Well, I haven't done anything, but I'm just kind of just kind of hide behind them. Uh, these ones are three different options of the charm uh, the charm rolls, uh, which you can see that the five inch wide and a five inch um, pattern design. So basically, you will have all those different. Uh, you know, I, I should have kind of rolled them up, but it does a little bit. Too difficult. Twelve ninety nine each, or uh, with the sashing, uh, the sashing roll is eighteen pounds and ninety eight pence. So you can go for a spots one, a spots two, or spots three in there. So it means that you are getting the sashing for five and ninety nine, saving four pounds. So the sashing <coughs> is a two and a half. Uh, <coughs> you can see it in here. The two and a half inches wide. Uh, eight seven three nine two two is your item number. Uh, for the charm rolls, love I love this idea. I love the idea that comes in a roll because well the thing the thing is <laughs> it makes it quite easy and they do actually go quite nicely together. Especially I don't know which order they've put them in, um, but there's if you kind of move the purpley one out the way, these two will work really really well together in their own right because there's a lot of kind of similar colours that tie in between them. But beautiful, beautiful. And I think a lot of fun can be had with these as well. And I will show you a shortcut way that you can use these. Say you wanted to put them all together. Now, obviously, we, we do the bundle with the sashing, which means you've got a really, really easy quilt there, or a topper or a bag. Oh, these would make good bags. Oh, yes. Oh. And then the pockets. They're each each charm could be a pocket as well. Oh, you get, oh. Right. Uh, okay. Let's make a bag. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna go with What's this happening? one. Let's oh. make a bag. Oh. Let's make a bag. Okay. It was your so, idea. Don't don't. <laughs> then after don't say that I made you do a bag, please. <laughs> What's well, better than a quilt? <laughs> I still better have it. Do My cover. cats love it. My cats is well, I'm very glad love your cats love it. <laughs> so, okay, with these being five inch square, now if I was to use them as strips. That's fine, but what I need to factor in is I'm going to lose a quarter of an inch at the top and a quarter of an inch at the bottom in order to do that. So then I'd end up with five inches by four and a half inches, but there is a way around that. So if I fold this in half and line it up along that edge, if I sew down that edge, I put my machine down. So I sew a quarter inch, let me get that lined up just down there okay. then what has happened oh the things come out there we go this will give me the quarter inch off each side now I don't have to cut this seam necessarily oh, I yeah. unless I want to press it open yeah let me just get rid of that there we go so unless I want to press it open I could just kind of stitch down those as a roll yeah and cheat if I wanted to yeah. so let me just do the next one along as well, so I'll show you that again. I'm just going to make sure it's in half. Now, to make sure it's properly in half, I'm going to make sure that it's lined up top and bottom. Right. Yep. On there. And 
and make sure I just give that a quick press along that edge where the colour you can see where the colours change yeah. and then pop that back against the quarter inch again and straight down there and that will save you quite a lot of time piecing all these pieces together because they can't go anywhere they're joined together yeah. and that still gives you the quilted look but without having to kind of you know do them all separately now you can as I said you can cut this if you want to cut it you don't have to cut it you'll just as if you were pressing both to to one side you just press them absolutely. flat that way so shall we make a bag with this one yes absolutely okay. right change of plan we love it when we do change a plan right in the middle of the show. No, but I, I think it's, it's, it's very important to show that these products, yes, they had, they were designed for one purpose or one with one idea in mind, but they are so versatile in themselves that you can transform them up off the cuff, if you sort of mind, a sort of way. And I love that. I love products that kind of inspire you on the spot to do something a little bit different. Well, why not? I mean, they, they weren't a thing until like two weeks ago. So. <laughs> exactly, yeah. Love that. Love that. This is the problem, you see, with having the printer. We can just think of stuff and then do it, and yeah. then nobody can stop me. <laughs> exactly. It's, it's a blessing and a curse. <laughs> <laughs> by the way, if you uh, if you want the rolls uh, by the, uh, on their own, they you, they are available, which are uh, twelve ninety nine. Details on the bottom of the screen. But if you want to go for the one that comes with the sashim, so that uh, two and a half a meet, um, inch uh, roll, uh, that is of course eighteen pounds and ninety eight pounds. The details on the left hand side of the screen. There are three different options uh, for those ones. I suppose one, uh, which is the one that has got the coral and the bow. Uh, then Spots 2 is the most popular with the more lilac and the uh, sky blue. Uh, nearly a third of this option has gone Spots 2. And this one final one is Spots number 3, which is more of the pinky one, this coral. And this one is uh, nearly 20% uh, of the stock has gone. Remember, these are the options that come in with the um, saving of £4 because it comes with the sashing roll. If you just wanted to do uh, roll the charm roll you have got the details at the bottom of the screen and then you can select spots one spots two spots three however the saving is when you go for the sashing as well then of course you will find them on the website uh, thegraftstore.com you have got the pick and mix of those rolls so the, uh, this could be back and in black uh, you can go buddy holly or white wedding two and a half inches wide perfect for binding and sashing but also for pixel art uh, look at that purple rain they have got liming uh, pearl jam in there blue suede shoes silver lining walking on sunshine kiss from a rose green green grass of home mellow yellow blue jeans it's up to you which colors you go for you're choosing any three for just 29 pounds and 97 pence and then of course if you wanted to go for those rainbow options we have got the rainbow uh, roll uh, 12 meter wide roll and the pattern this is uh, the solid rainbow and it comes in with that gorgeous pattern and then you also have got the sky blue pink and and then the bar violet vibe uh, those ones are the options that you have got um, now you have got five pounds of 19 pounds and 99 pence is your price for the pattern and those rolls there 414725 is your item number shall we head back to Haley to oh I turned that up fast oh. <laughs> sorry my um, my bobbin ran out uh, every time that's all right that's why we are here every time I okay never had so heard that expression. let me just shuffle that out of the way for the minute so for this um now i'm going to take because you can see because they've got all those seams in i mean you would press them anyway if they've got seams in but i will then press all of these out i'll do another row that's the same okay. and we'll uh, we'll make ourselves a little bag oh, now i'm going to do a like a, an offset bag which will kind of when it goes together yeah 
it'll um, it'll have kind of quite a nice shape to it. Right. So don't worry, we're going to be fine. Uh, but first job is to just give this a quick press and get this get these seams pressed out, and you'll see that they press flat really really easily. So I'm going to do it from the front first. And you can press to whichever side you prefer. Because they will have pattern both sides, won't yes. they? Yes, yeah, they're, they're patterned both sides, and they're, they're kind of hidden both sides. So you're, you're not going to see through for this. Okay. So there's that first one. And they do press beautifully flat. Right, yeah. So I do, but all of these will all go the same direction, I think, just to make it easier. You can come across as well. It would help if there wasn't quite as much banana in this in the ironing board, but it's all right. It's all right. Okay. Yeah. Right. Now we're going to flip it over, do it from the other side as well, just to make sure we get everything super, super flat. Because you can see that one, that one towards the centre yeah. there. This next one along, that's still a little bit, little bit up. And then we're going to do exactly the same again. So I've got a row of five. I think I need, I think it's five, four, four and two twos. Okay. So there's my five. I'm going to start putting all these rows together. If we don't get it finished in this hour, we'll definitely get it finished in the next. But I just need to repeat that same process to keep joining those together. Yeah. Uh, so, of course, uh, you, uh, Haley will be back at 8 o'clock with Yana. So then that continuation of the project will, will uh, be taking place. Now, the one day special is an incredible, I love this. I am just, I just fallen in love with the pixel art uh, system for quilting. You have got two different options. Uh, basically, you are choosing the colors of your rolls, whether you are going for the basics or whether you are going for the bright. So there we can see the uh, basic on the screen then the brides are the ones coming up next the rest of the one day special is exactly the same you have got the patterns and I love this idea I love the fact that it comes with all the instructions but basically this is how it's gonna end up looking and then if you look at the bottom it tells you you need one which is the t using the template that it comes in one and then you need off the white, and then you need two out of the black one using the template that says two. So that's how it works. And then, of course, it goes to maybe sometimes three, sometimes four. You are getting those templates included in the one day special. The ones that I showed had this protective uh, element in their film. That then you can take them out and they go completely transparent. That is so you can fussy cut if you wanted to. It comes with the same allowance and also clearly labeled. Uh, many people leave their sticker or the, the film, protection film in the number because then it's a a little bit easier to see to find it out but you can see that it will match perfectly in here so it's basically putting in the template and then just cut either side you know Haley did say that if you went for the basics it's more kind of a stash builder because they can, I personally think that I would do a, a quilt with a, a black and grays and th because I think it will look absolutely stunning or maybe you have got beautiful rolls say for instance a two and a half inch roll but maybe as we are talking about maybe William Morris or other fabrics like I don't know um, Moda and things like that this could be the perfect session and binding for those ones or the accents for it because remember it's up to you how you use them. Having the brides means that you can do the pixel art um, in, in quilts without having to input anything from your stash. It's up to you how you do it. You have got a £10 saving which means that basically you are paying for the six rolls of 12 meters, a continuous length. There is no seams in here, which I, that's one of the things that makes it incredible. It's just one continuous length. It's not 42 inches or 44 inches and then another 44 inches. This is a continuous 12 meter, um, you know, 12 meter. It's just about, is it 40 inches? Sorry, no, so no, not 40, sorry, what they did. 12 meters would be um, 12 meters by inches. inches. 12 meters and two and a half inches wide. Yeah, yeah, no, so how much would be, no, I wanted to find out what, how what much 12 meters to? is in inches. Oh, in inches? Ooh, uh, ooh, one meter, no, hang on, half. Uh, well, uh, let's, let's move on, that is, I just kind of, so, mm, anyway. Mm. 
One. No, 12 meters in inches. 472 inches. Okay. That I'm is... I'm not sure where you're going with this. I'm a bit no, scared. No, because <laughs> usually a roll, I'm just saying that because usually a roll, you know, of two and a half inches, it usually has got... It's 44 inches in width. Each oh, is straight. Right. I'm so this is now. why it's one continuous. Okay. Just to give you an idea, like usually from salvage to salvage, it's about 42 inches, so 44 inches. This is like 10 of those ones in terms of continuous strip. Makes it sense. It's just like for me, like then kind of suddenly goes like all oh, this thing is just such, it's continuous. It's just incredible. 130871 is your item number. You can get the rolls on as a pick and mix if you prefer to do that, if you don't want to go for the templates. Personally, I would put a one day special in because I wanted templates and the patterns, and then I would go for the basics, and then I would add Buddy Holly for sure because then I can do a pick X I would do oh power to, mm, I'm gonna go extra I'm gonna go for that bright pink because I think that bright pink with the pink and then let's go down, 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 down. so mm, green grass gra green green grass at home I think those three colors I know the random but I think they would look great and then when you check out we have got I mean obviously it's not gonna be this here it's a buddy holly which is that sort of teal then a pink and then a green mossy green and then that with the basics I will put my the one day special yeah let's put the flex there oh that's nice I don't have to pay 29 pounds a night really it has got flexi hmm, interesting really good and then you how about these ones i would you know what i would put oh toy filling that's always good to have the extra filling uh then we have got the pay markers i definitely put the pay markers there as well mm, absolutely so you can and then you can flexify because of course it has opened a flexi order uh right once you do that you check out securely right i've done my shopping have you done yours <laughs> Check out those Is baskets. It ad admin complete. All right. Admin well. complete. Okay, so I'm putting this uh, bag together. <coughs> I've got one piece that's five squares, which is down the middle, and then I've put together two pieces that are four squares. Still needs ironing, but I'm hopefully going to get all the pieces kind of laid out in this hour, and then we'll construct it in the next hour. Because this was not a planned okay. demo. It's fine. It was planned demos, but they went out the window. <laughs> well, you are doing brilliant. <laughs> Okay, there we go. So, okay. right the bottom. And then that is going to go onto here. Perfect. And then I've got another one that's going to go onto there. And can you see the pattern that's giving me? So yeah. I've got two squares here and two squares here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to join them up and that will start creating our bag shape. So I've got to make my second one. With the smaller pieces, you may want to, you know, you know, cut the four or five off that you're going to use this just needs another two and all the patterns no um, kind of lines between them so they do go kind of straight into each other so if you're wanting to use it as and there's still loads on there I'll count up how many I've got left in a minute but then you'll be able to see all the all the different patterns I see and yeah. they're all different uh -huh. you've got no repeats in here so if you wanted repeats you'd have to you'd, you'd need a second roll for it um, but you can have so much fun with these because I quite like the kind of retro patterns within them as well. We have tried to pick quite modern colours for them though, so there's no, um, you know, it isn't it isn't too retro. It's still kind of usable as as modern designs. Let me just this last one, and then I'll quickly press all these out if you don't mind, Paula, and yeah. then we'll start joining them together. Perfect, and it's it's just such a easy project as well for somebody who doesn't yeah, know how to piece things together well, it's, or is afraid of patterns but also or, you if know, you're not sure what color coordination if you're not sure what goes together as well these are already kind of laid out for you so you don't have to worry about that you can just literally stitch them together and away you go absolutely so yes. let me just take that one out. And they are 100% cotton as well, they right? They are. Everything's 100% cotton and everything is printed here in the UK. Designed by us and printed by us. 
So we try and do as much as we can here. Indeed. You know, we're uh, very good. Absolutely, very we're good. Very. Uh, you're saving four pounds on that one, but also we want to give you another look at the options uh, spots. One, which I believe is this one. Uh, this one is a spot number one, I believe. This one is a spot number two, and that's a spot number three. I'm pretty sure that that's the right thing. Yeah. Uh, one is the one that has got more the greeny, and uh, shall I put them with them? I mean, that's kind of, sometimes this can be a little bit of, right, let's insert that one. And number two, and number one, that yeah. way. Number one, uh, you can see it here. So that is the one that has got more the greeny teal. 20% of the stock has gone off that one. Then uh, spot number two is the most popular. 40% uh, of the stock gone. And then we have got spot number three, nearly a third of the stock gone. Remember that this option that you have got on the left-hand side of the screen comes in uh, with the sashing option. Uh, so the, the sashing of blue, uh, 14 pound, uh, four pounds saving, 18 pounds and 98 pence is what you are paying. Then we have got the rainbow um, option as well for these gorgeous uh, um, quilts in here. And you can see in there all those kind of gorgeous elements in there. You have the lab quilt topper kit with a 12 meter rainbow roll and a 12 meter of white roll and the pattern to create this is stunning, absolutely stunning. I absolutely adore it. And I think many people shall I just twizzle, do it. Twizzle, oh, Paula, twizzle. I was stronger than I thought I was. Additional quilt. Heather's really outdone herself this time. Yeah, okay. She has done so many tires. So that, that's the exercise. That for one me. is Violet Vibes. Yeah. And then the one that was on the other side is Sky Blue Pink. I do have another sample for the rainbow one. That's Sky Blue Pink again. That's a it's just a little pillowcase to go match with the uh, the quilt. That's so um, cute. And then there's another little sample, and this uses the kind of pixel technique yeah. that we've discussed earlier, where you're doing kind of you know bits at a time. Yeah, absolutely. I love that. I love the pixel thing. It's just so clever. Uh, 19 pounds and 99 pence is your price for the rainbow roll uh, as well as the white uh, roll and you're getting the pattern you are getting three different options so you can choose whichever one is the one that you want so solid rainbow the sky blue pink and the violet vibes 19 pounds and 99 pence is your price you are saving five pounds uh right four one four seven two five right uh Hayley, how okay. are you doing so i'm just starting to put these panels together and what i'm trying to do is once i've put pieces together always kind of return them back to where i had them laid out because with this one you do need to remember you start with your five in the middle you put one four at the bottom one four at the top and two either side so it kind of makes a i mean it might quite make would make quite a nice table run of this as well yeah. but an unusual kind of shaped one so um i'm now going to join this one my five onto this one here so i will flip it over to where i want it to be spend a minute or so just lining up my um my seams now because i pressed these all in the same direction can you just see there that they kind of the seams are going yeah. away from each other so one's off to the, the left, one's off to the right, and that will give me kind of nicer joins by having that. And then I'm just going to pop in some pins just to hold everything together. And then line up the next one. And the most you'll ever have to line up on this is three. So it's pretty, it's pretty easy and it's pretty straightforward. So um, can I have, do you think, a minute or so? Because let me see, we've got, what, t five? six minutes before the end of the Seven show I Seven reckon minutes. I can at least get this together um, oh, to kind of show you the, the the basis of the bag and how it will go together so I might need a couple of minutes though because I'm going to sew really fast oh well okay. you know in the meantime shall I give uh, the one day special because the one day special is the one that you have got two different options the brights or the basics now the basics could be a perfect stylish builder because you are getting the perfect rolls to bind and sash most patterns that you may have most fabrics maybe you're like more mm, something that needs a little bit of black you have got the black you have got the very dark navy you have got in there as well dark grays and medium grays uh, but 
that. Uh, also, you could go for the brides and then have the pattern, create your own pattern with this fabulous brides. It's up to you which one of the options you want to. In any of the options, you are going to get the Pixel Art booklet, which is explains to you exactly what you can do with this uh, you know what these rolls you can create for instance this pattern and to follow it you know, know that you need uh, three and you think in three is it it's not three as in three uh, squares you need one of the three template so you put your template along to cut it and then you just cut your roll to the length of your number three and that is the piece that you use for that one and if I look in the map you can see in here that takes three squares so this is how simple it is and you have got all these different patterns in there as well they're a little bit of optical illusions as well but it is so much fun and so great you're getting the patterns and the templates as well with the all six of the 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 rolls now the set of brides we are a third of sorry Basics is a third of the stock, nearly a third, and nearly 20% of the brides option has done. And that is of the stock of the 24 hours. So remember that the 10 pound saving is, of course, is part of the one day special. It works out basically that you are getting the templates, uh, which is the four templates and the pattern booklet at half price. Um, now you can see them there individually at 19 pounds and 19 pounds. I love, I mean, I think this, you know, I'm going to say it, those templates are the fact that they have got with the whole drill in here. If I put them all together, you will be able to see how they work in there. So you have got one, two, three, and four. All of them are basically an extension of it. Because of the same allowance, the two is not twice the one because it has got included that same allowance that you don't need to if it's a continuous piece. But I do think this is a fabulous. I would use this for whenever you need uh, lots of different techniques that require that sizes. So remember, get yours. One three zero eight seven one is your item number. Ten pounds saving and also a flexi buy option of two payments of thirty four pounds and ninety nine pence. Now, Hayley, you're back yes. with Yanis at oh, okay. uh, eight, right? I haven't seen Yanis for ages. Well, you will, you, today is your lucky day. <laughs> okay. Gonna say but it. I'm nearly there, look. Can I just wow. fold that back out? Obviously, these have got pins in, so that one's yeah. uh, holding it together a bit more than it should. But can you see the, the patterns yeah. are already coming in there? And Absolutely. that is just one roll, and there's loads still left on here. What have I got? I've got uh, five and eight's 13 plus another four there's 17 pieces on here and you're actually getting 44 on the roll so that's enough to do at least two of these bags wow so of good. those bags for just um if you, well if you are getting the uh, the charming roll or charming should be charming roll okay uh, so next time i make one shall i call it a charming roll charming roll okay. yeah, no. You know, it's fine. We can do it. We can do what we like. Charming. Charming. You just stop well, me. Actually, you could do the charming roll. It could be the extra one or the smaller one or the little okay. charming roll. <laughs> I'm not going to say what my producer said, uh, but it's fine, it's fine. Um, she's completely right. Uh, 873 and 92 is the item number with the sashing roll as well. The sashing uh, works out at 599 because they are 1299 on their own, the charm roll. Uh, but of course, you are getting 44 uh, squares in total. And they are different ones. They, they, are, they get to be repeated, but you know, there are so so many of them and remember if you want to go for the option without the session roll you can however there is you have got the saving of four pounds uh, spots two is the most popular one which is the kind of lilac key and blue one and then and that's 40 percent of the stock gun and then we have got the spots three which is uh, the one that is uh, the, the you can see in there more pinky quarterly tons it's uh, seven three nine two two is your item number nearly a third of the skull